Yes, yes, yes. Good afternoon, good evening, good night to you, my viewers and subscribers. A blessed Sunday evening to you wherever in the world you are. I take this opportunity to welcome you to Jamaica, a topic where we bring you the hottest and latest news happening in and around Jamaica. As usual, it plans to be another exciting, entertaining and informing live stream. So please hit the like button. And if you would like a shout out, all you have to do is to type your name in the comments. Students, you need to hit the like button. To the class, I promise you that we're going to go on a journey. And I promise you... I promise you, Unitai promise, I promise you that we're going to be having some bombshell revelation over ya. My viewers and subscribers, tonight we're going to be unleashing some bombshell revelation. Tonight, what, what is happening in Jamaica? We've uncovered, my viewers and subscribers, a web, a dirty web that is happening in the water uh, uh, problems. The manufactured water crisis. We have uncovered a dirty web. And I promise you that you are going to be getting the full length of disclosure tonight over here on this program. We're going to be talking about the FLA. We're going to be hearing from one, from, from a gentleman who says that the FLA is, is sabotaging him and giving him problem with him gun license. And all kind of things. We're going to be talking about the big meeting up by JLP. Big meeting. Yes, it looks like so they're going to get out. Devon or some people are going to resign. And most importantly, we're going to be talking about the police in Jamaica. We're going to be talking about the police in Jamaica. Do you know your rights, my viewers and subscribers? I'm going to be showing you the Jamaican police. And I want you to look at them. This is the public court and we're going to be judging them today. I'm going to be assessing the police. And me hear say Mark Golden and the PNP are called for Delroy Chuck for resign. Me hear say Mark Golden and the and PNP are called for Delroy Chuck for resign. Students, welcome to our topic class. It's going to be exceptional. Please hit the like button. Make me fast forward the class because we're going to have a long, long class. Hit the like button, students. Welcome to the hot topic. Welcome. <laughs> I promise you, I say, I promise you, me teacher promise you no. I promise you, I say, we are going to release a bombshell on the type bombshell, a bombshell in here. We are going to release something where people would, Lord Jesus, make me shut my mouth, I don't want to get away too much. Lord Jesus, students, excitement. <laughs> Hit the like button, hit the like button, hit the like button, hit the like button. Class is going to be so exciting. Me no one going to enjoy this. Hit the like button. So 
Some of them want God now. Some of the labor rights, them up at 26 Belmont Road, want God in his Sunday, ya, Lord Jesus. Bangarang, bangarang, bangarang. Murder. Push up your hand over your head, son, you have a Bible. Say your Bible, your Bible. We say your Bible, I like your shield. Cover yourself with the word of God. Over your head, so. Over your head, so. Say your Bible, your Bible. We say your Bible, I like your shield. My viewers and subscribers, do you know your rights in Jamaica? Do you know your rights in Jamaica when the police stop you? Today we are going to assess the police them. Somebody type police. We are going to assess the police them. And we want to, let me say, the court of public opinion. The court of public opinion to the students in the work the like button. Work the like button. I'm going to start the class soon. Read and learn the word. Read Matthew and Mark. Luke and John. The Acts of the Apostle. Roman Corinthians. Read Revelation. Read Revelation. Read Revelation. For the Lord is your keeper. Has he been good to you? Has he been good to you? Has he been good to you tonight? Somebody give him a praise. Mandela Park, give God a praise. Give him a high praise. He has been good to us tonight. And we are to worship him. He's the same God yesterday. The same God today. The same God. Somebody say he's the same God. He's still delivering. He's still healing. He's still opening doors. Somebody say, God in the morning. What a God tonight in the Mandela Park is God in the evening. Somebody testify. Somebody testify. Master God. Class, I got start in a three minutes, student. May I ask you a question? Do you know your rights? Do you know your rights in a Jamaica as students who no want to hear the bombshell? Who no want to hear the bombshell a war go on in a Jamaica? Today, we're going to show you how money I go miss now where the money I go. Lord Jesus, students, hit the like button. 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 Oh, my God. 
Bring the likes at 250, I'ma start the class. Bring the likes at 250, I'ma start the class. Everybody press the like button. Today is Sunday, give God thanks, say alive and well. Big up all of the people them we are cook. Big up all of the people them we finish cook. Big up who have them rice and peas, them white rice, congo peas, stew peas, oxtail, curry goat, chicken bag, chicken, fish, anything you have, big up yourself. shepherd it doesn't matter what the demon say it doesn't matter what the devil said tonight Jehovah God is still our shepherd tonight somebody call his name somebody shout his name somebody shout his name somebody shout his name Yes, 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 students, a blessed good afternoon, a blessed good evening, good night to you wherever in the world you are. Welcome to Jamaica. A topic class is now in session. Please sit around your desk, 
please sit down with your pen and your pencils and your book in hand, ready to take in the lesson. My viewers and subscribers, let me mark the register and bless up everybody in the class. The first person in class is JC. Blessings to JC, Skinny Clark, Sonia Newman Smith, Anna Ferguson, Major Daps Rastafari, Raheem Gentles, Javan JD, Paula Hibbert, Laris Beckford, Ewart White, Audrey Cook. Althea Johnson, L Dog, Jem Ashley, Scarpy Scarpy, Ines Phillips, blessings, Ines, how you doing? Juliet Jackson, Junior Henry, Sonia Harvey, big up Sony, Noel Barr, blessings to you, Brenda Elson, Viv Chin, Carla Banks, Alison Mendes, Arlene Froome, Darren Daly, Darren Daly said JLP must go, yes, they must go. Big up Janet Marling, big up Nordy, big up uh, Patricia Williams, big up Evelyn Meekle, Lorado Patrick, Angela Palmer, Ian Yours, Annette Bennett, big up uh, True Loveless Unstoppable, Elaine Morgan, Juliet Jackson, big up Debbie White, Valerie Allen, Geraldine Bennett, Yvonne Sutherland, big up Kayleen, Pauline Francis, Winnie Mead, big up Yvonne Sutherland again, big up Nadelicious, Nadelicious, a good night, Jamaica, Atopic, and classmate watching from London, Essex. Big up all my people in London, England, big up those in the US, big up those in Canada, big up those in Dubai. Yes, we have people from Dubai watching us. We have people from Spain. Madrid, Spain watching us. Big up, we have students in China watching us. Big up all the students who are watching Jamaica Topic worldwide. Big up those in Barbados, St. Kitts and Navy, St. Lucia, Trinidad, Grenada. And most importantly, big up good, good Jamaican people. Love you all. What are we at Jamaica? We care about Jamaica. Big up Malone Parker, Marcia Sampson, uh, Jenny Stewart. Big up everybody else. Rosemary Robinson, Jem Ashley, Jack Wan. Big up Lana Silvera, Florence Brown, Tashana Barnett, Maisie Miller, Judith of Parks, Pat W, big up everybody else in the class, Florence Brown, Burville McKay, yes, 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 big up Tashana Barnett, As I Travel TV, Special, Jenny Stewart, yes, Biverna Miles, Blessing to Shining Star, my moderator, big up yourself, Shining Star, welcome, and big up all my moderators, Michelle Hutchinson, good night to you, Ian, you all say JLP, now nah, gone away, them done for, Lord Jesus, we are going to find out if them done for today, Yvonne McGregor, blessings to you, good night, Juliet Jackson, good night to you. Juliet Jackson, a prison, the whole of them forgot. Yes, a prison, them forgot for two, but slowly but surely, them getting there. Big up everybody in the class. Jean Royalty, Sona Newman Smith, yes. Big up uh, Georgia Anderson, Lady Bug. Big up all of my students in the class, man. Blessings to everybody. Everybody in the class. Leonie Miller, Roslyn Swaby, Michelle Hutchinson. Big up to Carla, yes. Big up to everybody in the class. Tony Wright, good night to you. Denise Kayas, African Jamaican girl. Sandra Bennett, big up yourself. Ronica Hamilton, a perfect timing teacher. Just finished dinner. Rosemary Robinson, big up yourself. Big up all of the students. Em. Cool Talks 576 said no. Him do one well, mark to become PM because him prefer the thief them. Show me a company, I tell you who you are. Lord Jesus, Raheem Gentle say, big up yourself. Big up yourself to everybody in the class. I realize that somebody in the class are behave bad. Precious Allen, blessings to you. Lady J, blessings to you. May I big up all of my students. Um, it wanna be Janet Brissett. Uh, good afternoon, teacher and classmates. It's a blessed Sunday. Hope all is doing fine. Teacher, talk up the things. Um, life is the greatest. Yes, life is the greatest. But may I go show on the bombshell. Well, our students, Maureen Cunningham, good night to you. Ivina Lewis, uh, big up my teacher and classmates. My day I cook and my ears are peep out of my eye. What a bang around. Big up on yourself. African girls a teacher dumpling and curry chicken foot a dweed. Big up yourself with the dumpling and curry chicken foot, my friend. When you hear that student a real Jamaica, big up dumpling and curry chicken foot, how them feel like? Yes. Shelly and Stevenson, big up yourself. <laughs> Marcia Samson, Melrose Higgins, Caroline Young, big up all of my students I'm in the class. Sharon Banton, Scarpy Scarpy, you know, teacher love all of you. All I want to know, my love, know. big up everybody. Global Prayer Connection, good evening to you. Angela Tucker, big up yourself. Big up all of my good, good students. Them, you see me, Melrose Higgins, good evening to you. Cynthia Campbell, Margaret Wilson, big up yourself. Charlene Banton, say one Marky G. Florence Brown, say all who don't like Marky G is easier to stay. I don't know how people cussing golden color, yet so much Jamaica, them bleaching, all man. Yes, how hypocrite, them hypocrite. Patricia Hutchins, big up yourself. Janet Riley, big up yourself. Ian, you are say Sunday dinner, fish for your Sunday dinner. Dwayne Carr, blessing, blessings to you. Unstoppable Elizabeth Wilson, big up yourself. One Dan, phone transfer, and it Logan, Paul, Henry, Tyreek, Antonio. 
Big up all of the students in the class. Me a big one up and make everybody worldwide here on the near. Yes, Sadie McGrowda, Andrea Burke, my moderator, Pamela McNeil, Hardware 101, Abigail, Daphne Neal, Minette Beery, big up yourself, big up everybody, Chanel Mitchell, Janet Linton, Ilian Jackson, Robert Honeywell, Danet Hamilton, big up everybody, everybody big up on yourself, everybody, Diana Wheatum, Guy Avery McCray, Leroy, uh, Richard Lee Green, Hope Anderson, you Bennett, Sandra Bennett, big up all of the Bennett, them in the class, Arlene Benbow, GC say, really enjoy the history lesson you gave us this morning. Oh, where you say you enjoy? Students who put on a history lesson this morning, if you never miss the class, at 3 o'clock the class done this morning. The class on about 3.40 Jamaican time at 4.40. We put on a history lesson this morning where body say, yes. Big up on yourself, man. Big up everybody. Sharon Bernard, Quinn Marx, Mardi. Big up everybody in the class. Khaled Vaz, Leone, Miller, Sassy, Sal, Egla Fletcher, Janet Monday, Janet Brissett, Ivan Johnson, Rennie Henlan, Errol Anglin, Anglin, Ronald Dixon, El Dog, Juliet Jackson, Ubuntu, Ivina Lewin. Big up all of the people in Merv Garden. Yes, big up everybody. Cynthia, Ayacinth, Thomas. Big up yourself. Colleen Barnes, Marcia, Papa Darkis. Ali, Newell, Alison White, everybody in the class, big up on yourself, on the normal love, you know, all right? Yeah, man, Loretta Williams, big up yourself, Sandra Watkins, Bailey, yes, George Brown, Carletta Turner, big up on yourself, Winston Daly, Ivan Bradford, Dubert Owens, everybody big up on yourself, Angelita Medley, on the no cause versus cause, on the no one love and respect, teach and love everybody in the class, all right? Big up on yourself, students. Let's get into the nation's business now. And the first topic me I go discuss. Yes, I'm ready for start the class. I'm warm up and ready for that Sunday class here. Students, the first thing, let me make sure I put this on my screen there, students. Good night and please remember to hit the like button. Class is now in session. We're going to get into the nation's business. The first thing I want to ask you, my viewers and subscribers, the Jamaican police in this country, who is supposed to serve, protect and reassure, are they serving, protecting, and reassuring you, my viewers and subscribers? Are they serving, protecting, and reassuring you? Are the Jamaican police serving, protecting, and reassuring you in this country? Please type yes or no, my viewers and subscribers. Because I have some video for play with some police this afternoon. And I know that lots of you are going to be shocked. Many of you are going to be shocked. And some of you are going to cuss out what's it not. So wait, make I play the video them students. Please remember to hit the like button and let me get directly into the class. I promise you, you're going to have a wonderful class this afternoon. It's going to be very educating. Yes, you're going to learn a lot. Let me see which one of them video I'm going to start from now. The first video I'm going to start from is an introduction to our police officers. Do you know the Jamaican police officers? Who are the Jamaican police officers, my viewers and subscribers? Well, all right. I am going to show you how the police introduce themselves to us, all right? And I want you to turn up your volume. I'm going to type turn up your volume for me. I want you to turn up your volume because the police are going to introduce themselves to us this evening. Yes, the police are going to give us an introduction to us and tell us who they are. The people who are served, protect and reassure you. The people in where your tax dollar, my tax dollar appear. Lord Jesus, students, get ready to be amazed. Get ready to be amazed. Remember to hit the like button, students. Get ready to be amazed. You don't know when teacher come good, him come good. Hold on there. All right, well, our students, the police is about to introduce themselves to us. Don't you want to know who are the people that are serving you in the country? Don't you want to know who the people that are serving you in the country? Listen to your police officers, them introduce themselves. Well, our students, come on, volume, behave yourself and work with me. Me have to start over the video, students. Me have to start over the video, students. The police are going to introduce themselves. I want to turn up for the volume to. Well, our students, I want to turn up on the volume to. Me, I turn up my volume. I want to turn up on the volume. Well, I'm going to get the volume right. I'm going to want to listen to the officers. Them, you know. 
students who want to put some ears comments. Put some ears emoji in the comments now, moderators. Put some age emojis so everybody can listen. Is a disgrace? Is a disgrace? I'm going to show you, say, sometimes people tell you who they are and you don't believe them. I'm going to show you, say, a disgrace. Moderators, put two age emojis in the comments. I want you to listen to the officers tell us who they are. Make me don't talk now. Listen carefully to the words of these people and tell me the system now are overall. Listen to this. Of course, everybody call me squaddy. I'm a police officer in Jamaica. Of course, may go skip the KFC lines. I'm a police officer. Of course, may go ask her for your number. I'm a police officer. Of course, criminal go and escape in your Bible too. I'm a police officer in Jamaica. Of course, can go get a ticket. I'm a police officer. Of course, may go wear my uniform and go embassy. I'm a police officer. Of course, we don't believe in corruption. <laughs> I'm a police officer. Of course, I'm going to use a siren to come out of traffic. I'm a police officer. Of course, people are going to ask me for direction. All right, let's go straight. Turn around. I'm a police officer. In of course, nobody will like me. But everybody who I'm police can do. Of course, we don't believe in corruption. Are you here there? Wanna hear that? Wanna hear that? Wanna hear the police I'm tell we? Wanna tell we say them a police officer and them a go use the siren for come out of traffic. Wanna tell we say them a police officer them a go use them uniform for getting a KFC line. Wanna wanna tell we say she's a police officer and of course criminal a go escape in a nearby bushes. Yeah, yeah, the police officer tell we say yes, of course, criminal go escape in a nearby bushes. I never me say it. This is our police introducing themselves to us. Yeah, yeah, what me say? This is our police introducing themselves to us. Let me repeat it one more time in case you never hear. No wonder we can't get crime and justice under control. No wonder crime can't get under control and we can't get good sense of justice. Students, when you hit the like button for me now. Everybody hit the like button if you appreciate the class. Hit the like button. Let me read some comments. Somebody said, them is a disgrace. Somebody else said, old crass might them. Somebody else said, madness. Somebody else says, this for real. Somebody else said, drunk or them. Somebody else said, corruption at its highest. Yes. Somebody said, Jesus Christ, is this for real? Yes, it is for real. Somebody else said, bright them bright. Somebody else said, then teacher, the country not safe. Somebody else said, don't need your friendship, JCF matters. Somebody else said, Lord help. Somebody said, ah, who them there? Ah, who really them? Yes, good evening, Melian. Somebody else said, no morals. Wicked for real. Them wicked for real. Somebody said, them said, them are going to give tickets to. Yes. So they might tell us that they might go give you a ticket too. Somebody said damn criminals themselves. No matter whether joke or not, you can't attack them something there. Me go play it back for you one more time. I'm want to tell me. And if anybody want to cuss, call and cuss, you know, put up my numbers them. Let me read some more comments. Sassy so said, those, those training, the who's training those clown. Somebody else said, that's why they said in my son's case. Somebody else said, corruption, print pan them. Somebody said, badness, them a defend, shame, shame, shame. Somebody said, they were they reprimanded for it. Well, we still are talking about it. It's a disgrace. Yes. It's a disgrace. Let me play it back one more time. One more time, may I play it back for you. Listen to the police force. Of course, everybody call me squaddy. I'm a police officer in Jamaica. Of course, may I go skip the KFC line. I'm a police officer. Of course, I'm not gonna ask her for your number. I'm a police officer. Of course, criminal are going to escape in your Bible too. You know what she said? Of course, she's a police and I'm, I'm bad and I'm, 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 I'm going to escape in a nearby bushes. You know what she said? You know what she said? You know what, you know what she tell you say? Of course, she's a police and I'm going to escape in a nearby bushes. You know what she said? Of course, she's a police, a man going to escape in nearby bushes. Yes, they're going to escape in nearby bushes. Somebody call me and talk to me now. Who want call me and spend one, two minutes and talk about it? Moderator put up my number. 
moderator put up my number there. I'm going to show you why we can't get no justice in the court. I'm going to show you the behavior of the police. You see, they introduced themselves to us. Listen to me. They've introduced themselves to us. Now, I'm going to show you them in the line of duty. I am going to show you them in the line of duty. So then so hit the like button and bring the likes to 500 for me now. This likes want everybody in a Jamaica and the world for hear this. You hear what she said? You hear what she, yes. Somebody said, what an example them are set. What an example them are set. Scarpy Scarpy said, the one where said KFC line. You call, tell she love our God. Yes. Remember, play it back. Listen to the rest of the something students. Can I go get a ticket? I'm a police officer. Of course, I'm going to wear my uniform for embassy. I'm a police officer. Of course, we don't believe in corruption. <laughs> I'm a police officer. Of course, I'm going to use a siren to come out of traffic. I'm a police officer. Of course, people are going to ask me for direction. Alright, just go straight, turn around. I'm a police officer. Of course, nobody going to like me. But everybody who police friend though. Well, yes, my viewers and subscribers, there you have it. Those are the people that is supposed to serve, protect, and reassure way. They have sworn to serve, protect, and reassure way. But they are assuring us they are going to skip KFC line pan way. They are sure we say they are going to turn on siren pan way to get through in a line and them are sure we say criminals are going to escape in a nearby bushes I never me says so I are not the one that says so and you know thinking about it let me put up the first poll now do you have faith and confidence in the Jamaican police let me put up that the first the first poll this is the first poll I'm going to put up my viewers and subscribers this is the first poll I'm going to put up do you have faith and confidence in the JCF. I'm not talking about the Jamaican police. I'm asking a question in the poll. Do you have faith and confidence in the JCF? Please type yes or no, my viewers and subscribers. Please participate in the poll and I'm going to show you the next thing. I want you to participate in the poll. Please click yes or no. Do you have faith and confidence in the JCF? Please click yes or no in the poll. So they just introduced themselves to you. All right. I'm going to show, them, show you them in the line of duty. I'm going to be show you them in the line of duty. Hold on, students. Hit the like button for me, students. Hit the like button, students. Come on. Today is a time where you're going to learn and we're going to have a discussion about this. Well, on, let me put up the other one on the screen. And well, on, let me students. And bear with teacher one second there. The, fo the, the, the screen is going to go blank, but bear with me one second, student. Bear with me one second. Bear with me a quick second. We have a whole heap to talk about, students. We're going to talk about politics, government, everything in a one we're going to talk about. Yes? No hold on my viewers and subscribers. Hold on a second, students. One second, my students. All right, so they just introduced themselves to us a while ago. They just introduced themselves to us a while ago and tell us who they are. They just introduced themselves to us a while ago and tell us who they are. We are going to see them in the line of duty. We are going to see them in action. We are going to get ready for see them in action. Come on, students. We are going to get ready for see them. And we are called for the overall of the justice system. The police, them need to behave better. They need to treat civilians better. And students, I want you to pay special attention in this video. Let me tell you why. I want you to tell me, were the residents vulgar in this situation? Was the ladies vulgar in this situation? Let me tell you, students, this is your first assignment. 
I want you to pay attention to the video that I'm about to play. And I want you to tell me if the ladies are vulgar in this situation. Tell me if you think the ladies them vulgar are the policeman bride. Listen carefully. You need to turn up your volume and listen. Listen to this. I want you to focus. I don't see nobody answering the comments yet, students. I don't see anybody answering to the assignment. Do you think that the people are vulgar or you think the policeman wrong? Please type in the comments and participate. It is important that you participate.
apartment paper. Apartment paper, fear. Then I'm going to say, I'm going You are the clear one. 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 You are the All right, my brothers and subscribers, I won't play any more of this video. I will not play any more of this video. And the phone lines are open, my brothers and subscribers. Hold on a second, let me see. The phone lines are open. You can give me a call and tell me what you think, my brothers and subscribers. The phone lines are open. Hold on, I was getting a call. I never realized. Hold on a second, my brothers and subscribers. The phone lines are open, students. You can give me a call. I'm going to show you how they deal with poor people. And I'm going to show you how they deal with other people. I'm going to show you how they deal with people in the garrison versus other people. I am going to show you this evening how they deal with poor people versus how they deal with other people. Yes, Carla, welcome to the program. You're live on Hot Topic. Good evening. Welcome, boss. I am hearing you know, my brother. Welcome. How are you doing, sir? Yes, yes, yes. What are what you hear going on now? No, but I, I, I did a video yesterday about Spanish town, you know, saying that uh, basically, but uh, your place, you should have known what I'm going to say, and them killing the people and block the road, man. No, but me ask, but me ask, they still. You say, people can't block the road for people there, so why they can't block the road for people coming to go on Repeat that question, sir. Me ask you, how they can't block the road for people there, and when the government is going to go on, you say, people can't block the road for people that is, that is a question that I asked last night, you know. How is it that people can come out and block road for the done, but they won't come out and block road for when the government give themselves... When the government give themselves 200% increase? It just goes to show that people block road for what is important to them. And that's basically what the argument is. Yes. Yes. So why do we can't know we go on the ground we go on the ground police? Too much things are going on. Man. Yes. People can't have more damn black people like this. Yes. And that means I'm about. I agree with you, my brother. They need I'm to. And I'm going to use the endorse them. Yes, they call. I'm going to use the endorse them. They come on. Well, it says when it's reached the doorstep, they decide to come out and 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 start talk. Exactly. I agree with you, my dear. And I agree with you, my brother. Sometimes people never talk till it reaches them doorstep. But, you know, we just wait to see what happens, my, my brother, because there's a lot happening in this country, you know. There's a lot happening in the country. Now the police, them behave. You see, the police, them telling us a while ago that them go use them siren for to get through traffic. Them are going to use them uniform for getting a KFC. And once she go, say, of course, she's a police and, and criminal are going to escape in a nearby bushes. That is the police. Yeah, that, 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 yeah. I don't look at the program for a while ago. When you escape in the near my bushes, yeah. I'm going to call it a while ago. Yes. So, what did you say about that now, about the nearby bushes? Talk to me, man. Yes. The car that's not right now. She has seen me as a rider. A female, I say something like that. I don't know. Maybe she's a maybe yeah. she's a kerosene or or she a bad girl. I don't know because that that not right. Police supposed to be role model for children. They are supposed to be respected, you know. And, and and it undermines the uniform. They didn't do well for the uniform, to say the least, you know. 
I don't know, you know, tomorrow we will if see if Paula Lowell in a go at work. Tomorrow we will see if at girl Paula, my ex lover, will go to work tomorrow. We will see. Because the labor right them decides that she must go in there. They'll write chuck everybody decides that she must go in there. But the PNP and the people them I in mean, the law and the judges them say no, but we will wait for see what go on tomorrow. Enough people not sleep tonight, you know. Enough people not sleep tonight. Me can't tell you that. When the M M M M M Paula will go in the office tomorrow, that means they have a body. And you know the country that is. Well, we, they've done it more than one time, you know, where the show says badness around the country. They going, they might show us tomorrow. Well, on a second, students remember you, well, on the, students remember you can bless up the cash up and the zeal. The shining star pin the information there. You can bless up the cash up and the zeal. Thank you for your support. Joshua Taylor, long time in a CNA class. Big up yourself, Joshua Taylor. Care big up yourself, Lisa Six, Wayne Evans, my moderator, Marcia All. Yes, my brother up here, judgment are going to bad, this it name. What a judgment tomorrow if Paula get up and go into the office, says she a DPP. That means that they will be with me in court, they will be with me at all in the country, then, if they can go into the office tomorrow. So we have a say, we say, Andrew, country man. Well, it soon become the Republic of Anjo. It soon become Devon Republic because at the end of the day, I put up something last night for sure. Say him still a pressure the Republic business, and him adamant. Him say under Jamaica watch it. Afi be under Fim watch. Jamaica Afi become a Republic. It must become a Republic under Fim watch. But big me no pa labor right. Me a bang around for bus later. You know me a big excitement for bus later. But me a draw the argument. Cause you know say me can't let it go early. Big bombshell me a for bus later. Big bombshell. Big bombshell bomb there for boss. Yeah, my mom, <laughs> well, I me and the head boy, me not go talk, you know, me not go talk, but big bombshell will come later, man. Later, big bombshell be in the class, man. Remember me telling you, big bombshell. All right, my brother. All right, blessings to you and thank you, my brother. Blessings to you, blessings to you. Is there anybody else who want to call? So much people in the class. Call me students, you know, for making a voice, be vocal, you know. Wally pa people in the class. Talk, call and talk about it. The police not do right. The government not do right. Who is doing right in this country? Now, I am going to show you, my viewers and subscribers, how they deal with people when people know their rights. Let me show you this, how they deal with people when people know their rights. Look at this now, students. I wanted to pay a special attention to this video. And I wanted to hit the like button specifically for this one. Because I am going to show you a little bit of your rights here. That most of you never know. And I'm going to let a gentleman show that to you. Hold on a second, my viewers and subscribers. You know, hold on one second there. Today. Bear with me one second, students. Just bear with me one second that I put this up there. I am going to show you how they deal with people when people know them rights. When they deal with certain people, once you're not from the ghetto, the police deal with you a whole lot different. Let me show you something here, students. And I want you to look at this. That's why it is important for you to know your rights, my viewers and subscribers. It is important for you to know the Constitution. Who know the Constitution and know what, what, what are your rights in the country? Do you know what are your rights and your constitution and all them something there? Enough I we not know that. Hold on a second, students. I am going to be putting up a video of somebody who know them rights. And when you know your rights, my viewers and subscribers, the police deal with you different. Let me show you how somebody who know them rights behave. And let me show you how the police behave with somebody who know them rights. Somebody type know your rights. Somebody type know your rights in the comments. Somebody type know your rights. When you know your rights, my viewers and subscribers, them can't trample up on you. Somebody type know your rights. Look at how they deal with people when they know their rights. Look at this. Yes, officer? 
No, I, and by the way, I'm recording. Yeah, let me see a vehicle document along with a driver's license. You see you're conducting people via safety check? Yes, sir. Do, th that is not a lawful reason to stop me, an officer. Listen, me, sir. Officer. Can I, can I have a vehicle document along Officer, with a that is not a lawful reason to stop me. If you order me, officer, this can be quick and we can be and we can go. And can you step outside the vehicle and ah. let me have a search of the vehicle as well? Oh, you want to search a vehicle? Yes. We're for what? Searching for illegal drugs, yes. Arm. Yes. Can I turn off the engine? Yeah, you can switch off the engine. Step out of the vehicle. Alright. All right. So you're going to you want to search my vehicle? Yes, sir. Oh, and you want to see my documents? Along with the vehicle documents. And again, would, are you willing to understand that that's not a lawful reason to stop me? Can, can I have a vehicle document? This the, are you ordering? Are you asking? You yes, I can. But if you order me, I'll give it to you. you give me a lawful order. Just say I'm ordering you, and I'll give it to you. Sir. Is that an order or is that a request, sir? Yeah, what I said, sir. Is that an order or a request? No. Okay. Simple question. Order or request. In fact, call a supervisor on the scene. So that's an order, officer? Simply yes or no? Why are you getting upset? Yes. The longer I'm here and the longer you waste my time, if you give me an order, breach my constitutional rights of freedom of movement without having a lawful reason, you didn't suspect me of committing any crime, you just want to look at my documents, then it's a half a million and counting lawsuits. So, so I'm getting. Are you ordering? You see this police, uh, this, this authority where this one has the power of police. Let me see a vehicle document along with the driver. So that's an order, officer? Simple. It's a request. And, I, and, I, and if you're requesting, sir, I'm saying no, I humbly decline. Let's your driver's license. I humbly decline that request, officer. Alright. Alright, yeah, call a supervisor, call somebody. Call somebody. This is not my first rodeo. It's, a, it's illegal random stops. I'm go read, man. Go and check the commission. I go check somebody. Cause them know, them know. Come on. I second this, no, no. We just like passed through one a while ago, don't listen. Come on, no. Don't them where we go. Come, we trailer come now in here. Come on. Come. Let's go down to Porto. You want to bring it that far? Lawsuit come faster. So you think I'm afraid of a lawsuit, sir? I'm not you sure. Duty. But you're not giving me a lawful order, officer. You're uh, you just say you're asking me uh, your request. I'm not, I'm humbly declining your request. But if you order me, then I want you to pay attention of the difference of knowing your rights. I want you to show you the importance of knowing your rights. You hear the man tell us, go and go read, go and go call the commissioner, go and go call somebody. You can't stop me just like that. The last thing so you must stop me. Look, my brother, you have to know your rights. You have to know your rights. Look how them deal with people when people know them rights and them sister you is not a dunce. Am I free to go? Am I free to go? Am I free to go, officer? I, I am not free to go? Officer, am, am I free to go? Them the vehicle you can stop randomly and taxi. Transport Authority Act. Not a private vehicle. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. You see, my brother subscribers, them treat you different when you know your rights. When you know your rights and you stand up for your rights, they have to treat you different. But who are telling you about your rights? Who is telling you about your rights? How can you find out about your rights in this country? You necessarily know, the country lack knowledge and lack public education. Who you necessarily know, the country lack knowledge and lack public education? Who you talk to me now? Yes, Carla, you're live on our topic. Good evening. Welcome to the program. We have 50 50 50 50 situation. You understand? 
And not only because of phone, we feel, we feel, we feel like, yeah, we, we have phone and we can go on, on live and Ray Ray. Sometimes we always be, we don't have to be like that. Even, even the police, you don't know, really understand certain things. You can't just simply say, no, say, me, me, me clean, I'm clean, clean, I'm straight. We know you, you don't understand, but see me documented. You can't check them out about what we're going to do with business. You understand what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Yeah, listen to you, When you turn up police, when you turn up police, you get no respect. And you get you, you get no respect. You're like you're not you're like a dog in Jamaica. When you, but once you have a police uniform, and uh, you, the thing is, we don't sometimes we sometimes we give the police them to be able to be like oh. Them be with the car. Furthermore, we disrespect them. We don't respect them. So you're saying, so sometimes you're saying, so you're saying that sometimes the attitude of the residents and citizens help to enrage the conversation and the situation and allowing it to get worse. That's what you're saying, right? Uh, of course, sir. Because look at it. If I'm, if I'm in, if I put into a pot check, and we all decent people and abiding citizens, and I'm not, I'm not a criminal. I'm in, even even if me arm um, me 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 carry insurance up, mm -hmm. and the police me just me just say me, first class myself officer me pay for insurance and me not have the money me not have the money if you go arm um, for it right now. I know the police will give you a blight. if you if you do your thing respectful. I know the police will give you a blight because I see it many times. But not all of them say no, my brother. Not all of them. You do have good police out there. No, no, that's, 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 that's what I'm saying. But what I'm saying is fifty fifty. You understand? That's why I'm saying it's 50 50. Because, all right, if you stop a man, if you're a police, you're a Patrick, and you stop a man, the, the passenger in the, in, in, in the bus or in the taxi or the, com, or the community, whatever, do not have to get involved in it. Once the man not trying to, like the police are trying to hurt the man, are trying to shoot the man, just stand by and watch what the police are doing. The funny talk is, who not talk the fuck? poor people this. Come on, no. 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 Sometimes, sometimes, not even the, the man with the police stop, now be like what the resident of BM. Now be like what the person of them are BM. So you say that so you say that people need to be better with the police and have respect for the police and stop and, and of course, Baba. Baba. remember you know without a police you know and be dead people dead people for the like a dog, you know. Don't matter how some of them bad and wicked without them. We still, so we have to still give them respect they are doing that job because for instance, take me out now and put me in a uniform and remember you know, put me in a uniform. Maybe me not gonna do worse with the police and I'm just I mean, just because the police, and then me turn police to my mom, me did me do worse, and the police when they when they cost yesterday with me having civilian. I hear what you say. So let me ask. Go ahead, go ahead. Sometimes we have to, we have to put our, our foot in the person's shoes. You understand what I'm saying? Yes. I hear what the police say. You have to see me why. Because I can't matter. We go hug you. Come on, man. What, what, what? what? So, so you say them, so you want to so you say them, them, them out tired of tell the police about him mother and tell him, say, ma, he's my fish, and them out tired of tell him, say, them are going to put him name on parchment paper, them out of order. Of course, Papa, that, that doesn't make no, 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 the, the man are, the man are doing duty, if the man say a robot, and the man are stopping your walls. So, so Papa, once you're clean, you know, you know, this is what the police want to do. All I do is have to watch the police, if he want to plant no gun. I ain't, I ain't, I ain't going to do anything way enough to do. Just watch what the man I do. Once you're clean and you're straight, you're straight like I went uniform high and you know, all I right, no, all right. have no problem. All right, hold on now. I listen to you and I ask you and I give you a pipe now. Let me, let me ask you a couple questions now. Don't you think that the police must be trained and taught how to de-escalate things and to be respectful to the citizens and they will in turn be given respect by the citizens don't you think that the police first must be respectful uh let me ask you a question yeah answer that first don't you think that the police 
first must start give respect to the citizens that they are protecting to serve, protect and reassure, and then the residents who have respect for them? One, one hundred percent, one hundred percent agree with you. A hundred percent. But most of the time when you check, most of the time when you check, you know, even the police, they must, they must, they, they, they must send in another thing. You hear, you hear more resident vice more, we over the, that's something that's what the police are saying. We don't go hear what they, when you see the video them, we don't go hear what people are cussing and quarreling and going. Sometimes we have to see which party start from first. Because them, sometimes, sometimes the video them, you know, you have to see what cause the argument, you know. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But but in the but video, even, but hold on a second now, Carl. In the in all the all humans. Yes. Repeat that. They are humans. But we have Wally Park criminal. They are humans. But some of them are criminal to and them equally oppress poor people. Because enough time we see police, well, uh -huh. and there. Enough time we see police are beat old man. We could have been them father and grandfather and a beat woman. I we say it no right. There must be other ways. You must can pepper spray them as much as people don't agree with pepper spray. You must have other legal things. A while ago, in at the beginning, at the start of the video, where the man and the woman and the police are everybody. I realize that night the policeman took out him back and said, I'm going to beat the woman. And I saw the people and get mad and say, You can't lick car, you can't lick car. Don't you think that the police really need to, 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 to be taught how to de escalate matters like this and deal with people better? Don't you think so too? Yes, I, yes, I agree with you. But we live in, we live in a society where once a police don't get no respect. But the police, they feel intimidated when they go up on the road and they see, they see the thing. They feel intimidated. So you said, so you said the police oh. intimidated by the citizens, by the residents them sometime. Of course, so they have to stand, they have to stand firm and be like them sometime too. If you come on their respect too, they have to stand firm and be like them. They have to stand firm and be like them. We get respect from them. They have to be like a hooligan. Even if they don't want to be like a hooligan, they have to be like a hooligan. We get respect from them, Papa. You know, Papa, look, if a police stop you right now, first, what if we are stopping for you? Know, you, know, you, know, you, know, you don't see the you know, see, you know, see, camera that just passing you know, on top of you. Make sure you stop me. You understand what I'm saying? Sometimes, with widows, Come out properly, and the, 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 oh, you put out yourself. The policeman will come back at you. You see me because if she feel intimidated, and he, 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 and all right, so let me understand what you mean. So let me ask you a question. You saw the video. Are you up to date in the video? Are you seeing the video where the where the policeman stopped the man? And uh, you see the video that you see that video that while ago when I'm asking for documents and yeah, what I'm saying. You can see that, that that is a young police. Right then, in just come out on a train. You can see that, that is a young police. So you well and there. So, so you, him, him, him. well and there. So you believe that the man in the video take advantage of the young police? Yeah, he must take advantage of the young police. Because the simple said, "Why am I being that as a bigger person?" I said, "Me understand that you're young." Yes. And but listen to me. I'm gonna teach you. Can you could be my son? Yes. This is the way, or you stop, and this is the way, or you, or you conduct, and this is the way you ask for papers. I'm saying that you are young, yes. and you know, and, and move on. Yes. Well, and well, and my brother, well, and well, and there, students. I want you to type in the comments and answer yes or no. Do you think that the man in the video? What were you saying that I do again to the to the policeman? In, you, do you think that the man in the video was intimidating the police? Do you think that the man what 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 was was? Do you think that the man was wrong for telling for behaving like that to the young police and tell him say you can't get the document? Do you believe that the driver was wrong for telling the police say nah give him documents? That is why may I ask the students and continue my brother. So you say me wrong for do that? Yeah, you could have, you could have, you could have teach him. You could have said, listen, you know, you could be my son. Are you, are you, are you? I'm not going to but you could be, you could, you could be my nephew. This is the way you're doing. I mean, I see that you're doing your job and you're out here and I respect a uniform, but I'm going to take you as my son. And you can teach, you can teach them to, you know. That's that true. That's but because true. everybody wants to pass, everybody wants to pass social, social media and, and everything. Listen. When you, when you put any comments on, once there's a police in Jamaica, nobody, nobody now have no good feeling about you. Yeah. He, so, when, 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 nobody, your, 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 your sergeant don't say, 
No, it is man not wrong. But why is that police in Jamaica? You is not. You're not loved and respected. Just like oh, just, just like oh, just like oh. No for them, no for them. Jamaica, um, and you only care wrong for nobody. For, for the labor right then. All when you man, all when you go there, you cannot run for the labor right. Let me tell you something. Our politics run Jamaica. Yes. You see, when a people, when somebody not like you, then just not like you. You no matter what you do, you could have, you could have walk, you could have clean like Jesus Christ. So you want to in our position, you cannot run. You, you, you know, you know, everything. I don't dance all the politics running. Football politics running. Yeah, but politics run Jamaica. So if you have a DJ and a person just not, just not, just not, not, not like you, yeah. he just don't like you. You can't do nothing good for him. He just don't like you. So you say Jamaica not just like, like So you say Jamaica not like police and in a situation that them make it worse. That them, them make it worse with the police yeah, or the police deal with them. Come on, we all live in Jamaica. We know Jamaica no like police. Just like cartel, cartel can't run for nobody. Every day they talk about cartel like cartel is God. Cartel can't run for nobody. Mm. And them out of the academy for respect. Cartel can't run for nobody. Both the killer can't run for nobody. And politics run Jamaica. Yes. Just like how, just like how Andrew Willis can't run for none of the GLP. They didn't care run. He yeah. cannot do nothing wrong. Everyone wants me to care do nothing wrong. To a man and the same people, them. You see, from black yard and from chop stop, they go vote for Andrew with the election call a man in. He cannot run a politics run to me, cop. Yes. He cannot, no, he cannot run. I hear you, my brother. You understand what I'm saying? Yes, I'm a bit fear. I hear you, my brother. Once you're police, you is nothing to Jamaican. No matter what you put on the uniform. You know, like police, police are this. Come on, I, it's 50-50, you have good police and you have bad police. So what well, right. right, so, are bad. All right, that is true. So you send the man wrong for talk to the police him out of order. Of course, he could have been as a big man for a professional level. He could have been, he must have been the order and he has the order. He must not be, he was young. And he was going to go out the road and just say, okay, I realize say. Yeah, you know what I'm rude, you know what you you want to be nice, are you yeah, you come from a Christian home that's are you wearing let me teach you the right way. You yeah, understand what I'm saying? So what time we can be the bigger person, you know? <laughs> I get you. So let me ask you one question now. Don't you think that the man was right for standing for standing up his for constitutional right, the driver? Don't you think that the driver right have a constitutional right where the, the police are supposed to just stop you so they must have a reason for stopping? Don't you believe that the man was correct in exercising his rights? Are you thinking still out of order? Him could have deal with it better. No, listen, 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 listen. He was in standing ground because, he, for instance, he knows the law. He knows the law. He knows the law, right? He knows the law and he was standing his ground. Yes, he knows the law. But you can be the bigger person, do what you got to do, and just move on. Move on. And in the situation where Jamaica they run right now, don't they dab a walk on the road and the police then tap. I don't have no reason to tap him. <laughs> Wait a second. Hey. Wait a second. Repeat that one. <laughs> We all do make that run right now. Don't let dad turn the road money police and tap. Even if they have no reason to tap him, tap it up. Can you have too much here so you can't have to the hide night? So you, so you say you said that the police them all the dog they must start stop a road because the dog might have something catch up underneath him a two two or a four four or a forty five. Of course, I get over our reality, you know? <laughs> it's reality, we live in a normal reality. Murder. Because it's called a speed of speed. What this is reality. What are they, my brother? Students, the man said right now, police must all stop the dog on the road. Because the dog could have all have something catch up and eat him. The dog could all have a gun and the... Hey, hey, murder. Look at reality, we live in a This is reality. Yeah. <laughs> look at, look at, right, look. Look, 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 we're going to Spanish to this day when they, when they say a so-called and police take him out. And you say the people ain't going? Yes. You see all the people ain't going? Them black road and go on bad enough and say them are going to shoot. You need them say them are going to shoot the police and them too. And then they don't nah, nah, go up at King's house. They don't nah, go up at King's house, go do that to have your wellness. Yeah. And say they might oppress the poor people them. They might go on too bad. Look what billion dollars and your wellness and in front of my teeth, a hospital need it. 
school needy for the people to give them better education. Yeah. We need hospital. We need some some place we need to have a bus park with the people of Panama when rain they fall. Yes. I don't know what's going Yes. And they have so many people that nobody now do that. Yeah, but but listen nobody to me. Now, but listen to me now. Nobody now. When they keep them, they they meet me. Nobody now. Black they get and say no meet now. Keep it. We want water. We want water. We want hospital. We want CT scan. We want MRI machine. Yes. But listen to me now, my, my brother. But listen to me. You know, I see the people in the comments are cost door. Cause they must say, they must say, you want police. And they must say, you, you, you not talk the truth. Can people for stand up for them, right? And that the people in the comments are saying, me just a teacher. And you know, you know me love the wall I would, you know, whether me agree with you or listen, not. Listen, listen, listen. You know I, me love I, the wall I would. I, 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 I tell you once, I tell you once you put on a uniform as police, you're hated by the Jamaican people. Once that once you put on a uniform, yeah. you're hated. Even if you go to do to work an honest bread. Yeah. Because you want freedom, your family want freedom, your sick mother and whatever. You're yeah. hated. And people people now realize the papa sometime the police are just are doing job. I true, me not lie, me not lie. Me me I go say this to you. You do have good police officers out there. You do have some of them who are good. Me can attest to that. But some of them are corruption and wicked them bad. That's why people not like police because sometimes some things when you say what are they? Yes. Go ahead. You know me can say you know me no say good police in the mean traffic already. And I'm and man man says officer, I don't know anything going on. Yeah. I guess I guess I'm a freak, I'm a fitness up and I'm gonna deal with it. I work on money if you go deal with it. I don't have any money, I don't have no lie, I'm gonna go to school. Yeah. I'm gonna see the police, the police pine to in 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 good man. Yeah. In good man. Give me check him out already. Some of them have a hard for two. Because you're dealing with things Some of them have a hard for two. Some of them have a hard for two. I'm not lying. I'm not going to talk about that boy. Of course, some of them have good, good hard. But sometimes when they come out, they're intimidated and they say, oh, when they go down and get to come into the residence, they're going to say, a dog for dog, no, pit bull against mongrel. <laughs> yeah. It's reality. Yeah. A pit bull against one girl, you know. And if they drop them guard, if they drop them guard, if they drop them guard. I get you, my brother. I get you. I so, want, I want thing we blame them for. Never you put your hand on your foot on a woman. Woman are queen. Woman are motherland. Never look at what woman. Woman them more than their strength. And I know that a police not nobody. We don't want nobody, no man, nobody, lit, no woman. Woman, they are more than their strength. When a woman attack you, just walk away. We can't go and get away to hurt you. Yes, yeah, so Tell you because that is their strength. So the police... The only thing I blame them for, do and if a police, like a woman, put your hand on a woman, or you foot on a woman, it's supposed to, if you lose the job immediately, do yeah. not you hit a woman. Because a woman more than strength, you're not going to fight the physical time of a man. So we want to fight you, you know, like a man, you know. Yeah. But they're more than their strength. Yes. Do not put your foot or your hand on a woman. Yes. The stand guard with that. All right. You understand? So you say, so you say that you, you, the, the police have nothing to put them hand on the woman. That is wrong. They're not supposed to do that. No, no, no. Me not, me not. Me no, me no, me no, me no can't deal at no time. Okay. No, 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 okay. no, no. That, okay. that, 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 no, no for me. No, okay. no. Once you put your foot on a woman, a woman and a dog. That is true. Once you put your foot on a woman, you just and kick a woman and you, 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 you back to a woman yeah. as a man. No, you feel the job immediately. Yes. All right, my brother. So that listen to me. I'm going to give you. I, I see the phone lines blazing up. You set the phone lines on fire. I see both. 30, how much is it? Must be 32 call in a little time. Listen to me, but a couple of people could have called back a number of time. But listen to me. I want you to take one minute and just give your closing arguments to Jamaica and the world. One minute and give your closing arguments. Papa, we can come together and make the things different. Yes. We don't have to behave like we are hooligans like that. If a police stop you, I, you know you're right. You don't have to behave like that. Making search, make giving your paper that you go on with your lawful business. Yes. Because when you stop, when, when you get do that now, you, our children 
hands when I go up and respect police. And they go say, oh, I used to tell me something that I want to be my father. Because I have them police, but my father is afraid of them, you know. <laughs> right. Because it's a big wine. I agree with you. All right, my brother. I hear you loud and clear. Thank you for voicing your opinion, all right? I I, I, really, I big, up, big up yourself and thank you for calling. I really appreciate you sharing your side of the story, even though most people don't agree, but I agree with, but I appreciate you. No, no, but, but, but listen to me, but we still love you, said we know you know a different of opinion people no, no, always have. But listen to me. I remember said this well, class. Well, 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 listen to me. Remember, remember that you're a student in Atopic class. And once you're a student in the class, we love one another, we appreciate one another, even though we do agree on the same point. I love and respect right to you. You hear me, brother? Yeah, man. Blessings, man. Blessings. Big up yourself. Big up. Yes, my viewers and subscribers. What a way the brother set the line for fire. Carla, welcome to our topic. You're live on the air. Good evening, our topic. And good evening to your listeners and viewers. Yes. Uh, I don't know where to start with this guy, but this guy is either he's a cop or a crazy bystander. Yes. Where? But I want first, I need to know where in that video he saw the the, 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 um, the call of disrespect the police officer at no time he did disrespect the police officer he did not he conducted himself in the right way the right way notice everything he did right you notice his car window mm -hmm. was closed he never opened his window just crack it and he have his constitution right to do that as long as the officer can hear him and he can hear the officer the officer can command him to turn down his window that's a, that's one thing now he, the office can ask him for his documents if there's a state of emergency he can pull him over and ask him for his documents running his plate or not that's mm -hmm. the only co condition he have you are only supposed to pull over a commercial vehicle under those and under those rights and ask for your documents. Mm. I can tell you a story. I know a guy going about his jolly business in the States one morning. Yes. And they have a road trek just the same way. And they ask the person. They pull, they've been checking everybody for IDs. And this person pulled up and they say no. And he said, no, I'm not showing my ID. There's no need for me to show my ID. You don't have a state of emergency. Mm -hmm. You don't have a checkpoint. Mm -hmm. So there's no need for me to identify myself. Mm -hmm. They decided that, yes, you have to. And you know what? They four person hand open the door, yank the person out of the car, and lock him up. Yes. The person stand his ground through all that. You know what the person do? What? Bring a lawsuit. He won them. And he got his money. And he go about his business. Yes. Because the law doesn't allow you to do that. And guess who that person is? Who? It's me. Oh, so you're giving us a personal story that happened to you. That was me. Do you understand? So there's no need. Now the caller said the driver should put himself in the in the officer's shoe. No. The officer is the one who chooses to be a servant. Yes. Not the driver. But the, but the driver has his constitutional a right. Can the, driver, so the, drive, not... the driver as a citizen of the country has his constitutional right. And we need to know our exactly. rights. Exactly. Because exactly. guess what? Listen to me. We have often known that police can stop you and pull you over when them want. A whole heap police do that and it's wrong. And that is what the man it is, is wrong. making it's known totally here. Wrong. Police is supposed to stop you and Only pull you until over. There's a state of emergency. They have that right. It is wrong. You can't do that. And you are the one who choose to be a servant. So you are not immune to any form of scrutiny or any form of even disrespect, which is not right for you to disrespect if you want. But you are not immune from that because you choose to be a servant. That's right. And the job is a stressful one. So you know that the, you know that the job. And they know that the job is a stressful one. This job is a very stressful exactly. job. And you know that. If you don't like it, leave it. Just like the Prime Minister, just like any other one of those, they are, you are all servant. You chose to do it. So you, so you are not immune. So you are saying... From any form of scrutiny. All right. So you are saying that the man was right for standing up to the police and not giving him him, 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 him documents. He did the right thing. He did 
everything the right way. Yes. Everything. All your commercial vehicle, they can pull over and question like that. Your private conveyor, they're not supposed to do that. Okay, my You're brother. You're not supposed to do that. Another thing, if you pull a man who drive a car and you see the passenger, they're not supposed to ask the passenger for ID neither if you wish to ask anyone. If there's a, if there's a um, violation. If the driver commit a violation, there's no need for the passenger to show the ID either. Yes, because it's the person, the driver is driving, the passenger did nothing. Exactly. <laughs> All right. Exactly. Well, guess so, what? You see, in Jamaica, a lot of people, the reason why they don't clean up is a lot of people doesn't doesn't go about and call, bring a lawsuit against them, and they don't have the kind of um where they where they hold them accountable, yes, the officers have a, a accountable, they up yes. for promotion, they would demote them if they start to do that with them then they will start to recognize that they are abusing their power yes all right my brother i hear you loud and clear thank you so much for calling i really appreciate it all right blessings to you thank you. thank you yes my brother subscribers call me and tell me what you think do you think that the, the man was wrong for for not giving the police him him him, him documents do you think that the man out of order like the first caller said that the man intimidate the police Yes, Carla, welcome to our topic. Do you think that the man was intimidating the police, the young police, and because it's a young police, him do it? What do you think? Um, you're talking about a man in a car that yes. got stopped? Yes, yes, yes. All right. Uh, first of all, well, that man, well, that man, he, he's a lawyer, right? Um, he's a lawyer. Mm -hmm. And, of course, he has done a couple of them already that I've seen. And... Of course, you know, to let Jamaican people know how you must really go about, right? So everything so far is correct. The caller that just spoke to you a while ago, who told about his experience, yes, right, yes, um, in the states, and you know, which is you know, it's although in the states, it, the law is similar, right? Same way in Jamaica, and of course, just like you always say, Jamaican people don't know the rights, right? Jamaican people don't make an effort to know their rights. But the caller, the, the caller before, the one that was saying that, you know, basically Jamaican people in, um, um, you know, this is like police, police yes. <laughs> right away, right? Yes. Which, Hantabi, you and I know how our Jamaicans are. Our yes. Jamaicans can be very disrespectful, yeah. right, to each other, right? And this is what I have to say. Police is nothing but a mere reflection of our Jamaican society. Our Jamaican police is a reflection of our society, right? It is, I mean, it, it's just so. We mm. must we must accept that, right? That goes for everything. Remember me saying man that telling about the Jamaican food and the nastiness that we're put up with? Yes. Right? Same way, same difference. <clears throat> right? Um in is 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 nothing. The police is a reflection of our Jamaican society. Yes. Right? We don't we, we as Jamaicans we must accept it. We don't like <laughs> to be nice. We don't like to be nice to each other, right? Let me, ask a question. The Let me ask a question now. I know you said we don't like to be nice to the other, but do they have a right to be nice to the police? Of, look here, what I'm saying is, is nothing but a mere reflection of our society. Mm -hmm. And I'm saying it, it's not just the police will have problem with, you know, you go inside a party shop. You go inside a restaurant. Yes. You ask. You ask him what's on the menu. Yes. The woman. A, a woman don't want it. Do, she think you you being you being bothersome to ask mm. what is on the menu. She take her mouth and shove it up towards the menu board. Yes. But because she's not a police, we tend to accept it. One of the things I hate is when I go to, if it's even Burger King, even American, the American restaurant in Jamaica, when you go inside it and, them, and, you, and you order your food and, they take, and when they call your number, they take your receipt and tear your receipt. 
Tell me why that should happen. I think that is one of the most disrespectful things. So you think that disrespectful when I'm tear the receipt? Of course it is disrespectful. Can I, I have my receipt. You call my number. Tell why, me why. Why should All right, you tear my hold receipt? Hold on a second. Hold on, call up. All right, I can I can do two things. I can offer explanation first, or ask you to what or ask you. There's why no you ex, there's so no hold explanation. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. All right, listen to me now. We are about discussion now. Can you know as a teacher have them discussion with yeah. the students? Well, on a second. Right. Would you like me to go ahead and allow you to tell me why you think it is disrespectful first, or you would like me to offer the logical reason as to why they do it? Offer the logical reason why they do it. All right. Now, we know that people in Jamaica are cunning for several ways, for, for several reasons and, and several examples. When you go into a fast food restaurant and they serve you your food and it is handed it to you, they tear the ticket so that you can't return with the ticket and say that you did not get your food. Because there are times when people will say, oh, I'm going to buy a food and the line did busy. I'm going to run across the road at the store. I'm going to lose the ticket or whatever. I'll come back with a different ticket and say, hey, send me a ticket. I'm going to forget my food. Now, when that ticket is torn, it, it, it shows and it is proof without an unequivocally doubt that the person at the counter had already served this ticket. And once it is served, they can't come back with the ticket. That is why they do it. Yeah, when I get my ticket, I can tear it. No, but let me tell you why they do it. it they do it. They accident. do it to protect themselves. I, I tell you exactly why they do it. Um, a topic, a topic, a topic. That's why I asked you to explain. Right, yes. and you go and talk to anybody, and you, I have, I have taken up this with even the money, the, the uh, human resources at TST. Yes. Right, it is not right. It is not right, and I'm just using that as an example. Right, what they need to do is to train the staff to to, to deal with customers, welcome customers inside the store. Right, but inside, uh, inside, inside, in, in, inside a party shop, you think when man, one man, man, one general, him going, him going, one, him, and if him no say, as him pull the door, everybody going welcome him. You think him going one general? Uh, no. Let me just make but this because clear. Because they don't. Let me we, make we it don't, clear. We don't do these things. Let, let, me make it, let me make we it. We are that lack of respect. Let me make it clear, and I agree with you, sir, that. Jamaica's customer service is below par. Students, let me make this clear to both you and the caller. Jamaica's customer service is below par. And if you want to see me upset, let me go into one of those government agencies or private establishment where I'm conducting business as a customer. And instead of you, you welcoming me and appreciating me and providing the service that deems me to return, that bids me to return, if you start giving me any bad fives or any bad feelings, I go and call you out. And it is a shame in a Jamaica. From you go to the government service, where they go passport office, driver's license office, Ministry of Health, Ministry of Education, no customer service. Where they go KFC, Burger King, wherever, no customer service. Where they go the party shop exactly. down the road, no customer service. Exactly. And, I am, and I are saying that exactly. people in Jamaica exactly. need to start up a service. They are true yata, they need to start offering service. Exactly. So the, going back to my point, what I'm saying, and that's why, and that is what that man is trying to say you now, right? It is nothing but a mere reflection of our society. Yes. How we deal with each other. Yes. Right. How we deal with, how we, deal with, we, we is a thing with us Jamaicans. We don't. It's like if you if you're nice, you're going like you're nice. Yeah. You're going like say you are you on the place. Right. If you want to, if you want to work at the, at the party shop and you want to be nice to the customers, they, you have some work. Some work we want to tell us. And all it takes is just one to say, "Oh, yeah, go on, like say, you want to play so." But but let me also say right? something. I'm not putting up defense for these people because if you remember, I said that it is one of the things that I've noticed. And it is one of the things that I hate the most because that is my field. It's customer service. For most of my life, in, in when I've worked in either corporate or wherever, it has always been either customer service or, or sales. And in any organization right. that I go to, I make it my point of duty to ensure that excellent customer service is always meted out to the staff. 
Uh, and not only to you, but to the guests and customers and even to the staff themselves. Because if you welcome people and treat them good, they will always return. But if you provide shitty, dirty right. coffee service to them, then they're going to turn away customers. They're going to drive down business. We're not going to make enough money. And you, in return, go and get lay off or get fired. You can't pay your bills. You understand? So I'm a go I've, I've been, I've been someone who has always been a champion for, 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 for people providing good service when it comes down to any kind of is service industry. You understand? And Jamaica lacks that. And one of the reasons, especially, that I noticed in the public sector, some of them are not paid well. Some of them do have no much supervisor, authority, or no, 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 no person in charge over them that you can make a complaint to. You know what needs to happen? In all of these businesses, government agencies, or wherever that people go to get service, there has to be a hotline where people can make a complaint because sometimes the boss and the manager and the owner for the business don't know to them employer treat them customers somebody know you know that enough time the boss and the managers don't know that them employees are treat them customers so bad so if it is not escalated to the manager or supervisor to resolve the matter no people will get turned turn away so i am saying to businesses you need to have an emergency line that people can report a complaint that is separate apart from all staff that you can get that for yourself let me explain this now you are a business owner you want abc party shop you don't work, you don't work in at the restaurant. You have managers, supervisors, people appoint there. Customer come there, staff treat, um, staff treat the people them bad. Manager treat your customers bad. Everybody treat them bad. You realize your business sales are going on. You don't know why. But if there's a number there that, that disgruntled staff can call and bring it to your attention, you understand how that would resolve the matter that you can call the staff and pull them up by their success and tell them you know what go on because enough time managers and supervisors hide disciplinary actions from the senior bosses in the company you understand what i mean so sometimes yeah. most of these bosses and people don't know that you understand bad services being meted out but on the other hand especially where the government sector is concerned some of them offer bad service because they're not being paid well but that does not give you any right to this out dirt to the people who are who you are being providing service to. If you don't like the job, leave it and go do something else. We understand that, right? And that, you know what they said makes a lot of sense. But at the same time, we as people, like the man was saying, put your shoe, put your put your foot in the in the policeman's shoes, so and the policeman must put him him foot in your shoes, so yes. right. But I can tell you, me as a Jamaican. Right, I don't have, I don't have problem with police. Why? Yeah. Because whenever a police want to stop me, the first thing that always break the ice, and I'm and I'm not afraid to share this with the whole of Jamaica, is say good afternoon, sir. Max is something. Yes, sir. Can I, um um whatever you know um you have a firearm? Absolutely not, sir. Right, and let me tell you something. I see many times they are amazed. The, the policeman, them, they are amazed. They yes. hear me refer to them as sir or ma'am, yes. right? Because they're not used to it. One actually admitted to me yes. one day, right? He was mumbling, and I said, "Excuse me, sir, you were saying uh, you were saying something." Yes. He said, um, "No, I'm just I say uh, the first man right here. Somebody has said sir to me, yes. right?" And I said, and you know what, and, and, and you know what I always use to tell him, officer, I learned it from Sunday school, simple manners and respect, right? And trust me, it always, for me, it always work, yes. right? Do, do, just do that for five minutes. But what happened to us as Jamaicans, as soon as a policeman stop we. Right? The first thing we want to do is screw up our face. Yes. No. Right? Don't screw up your face. Give yes. him a smile. Yes. Give him a smile. Yes. Right? Just, just for five minutes. Yes. Give him a smile. Yes. Right? Good morning, sir. All How right. are you doing? All right. And I hope brother. your family is okay. All right, my brother. Right? And you surprise.
nice to know the, the ice that they break. Yes. But we but we Jamaicans, we just love to be tough. Okay. And like I say, you, you go in the restaurant, even even in America, you, know, you go in some, some Jamaican restaurant, I don't news. want I go, to go to you. Know. I'm going into a breaking news. 30 right? seconds for you to wrap up the argument, my brother. Yes. Right? But all, 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 all I'm, all I have to say is that we Jamaicans yes. need to start learn, start showing respect to one and all. Yes, that is it. Yes, right, and that is our biggest problem. Yes, we Jamaicans, right? We need, we, we need to show that respect to one and all, yes. just like what we sing in our national all anthem. Right, my brother. And, we, and, uh, and when we do that, we'll have a better society. All right. Thank you so much, all my right. brother. Blessings to you, and thanks for calling. Blessings. Yeah. Blessings. Yes, my viewers and subscribers. So we just got news. We just got breaking news, my viewers and subscribers. We just got breaking news that the DPP is out. We just got breaking news that Justice Minister, and let me put up the information. I just got breaking news from Justice Minister. Hold on, my viewers and subscribers. I just got some news from the just, I just got some information and I'm going to be putting it up on the screen. Hold on a second, students. We just got breaking news coming in, students. Somebody type breaking news. Breaking news. Hold on, the student. I'm going to play one music phone or while I type breaking news. Somebody type breaking news. Let me break the news. Hold on, students. Let us breaking news, students. The DPP is out. Justice, Minis Justice Minister Delroy Chuck has just made a revelation that a new DPP or an appoint or a deputy DPP will be appointed. Justice Minister Delroy Chuck has just issued a press conference that the DPP is out and they're going to be appointing a deputy this week. Let me bring up the article for your students. Listen to some music, I rejoice. Paula, goodbye. Goodbye, Paula. Goodbye. Baby, you want to go up on the cruise now, honey love? Come at me, go up on the cruise, baby. Come, students. Listen to the music while I put up the article. Tell me the truth, students. Isn't it the hands of God? Tell me the truth, students. Isn't it the hands of God? Murder. Paula down. Devon and Shevan next. Somebody type Devon and Shevan next. Paula is out. Devon and Shevan next. Somebody type Devon and Shevan next. The hand of God is on the wall. Good night. Students in the ear. Students in the ear. Uno no ear. Uno no ear. Ask him if they're not ear. Murder. Delroy Chuck. You next. Delroy Chuck. Delroy Chuck. You next. Somebody type Delroy Chuck next. Delroy Chuck. You next. You 
Yes, students, all right, my viewers and subscribers. You know, well, I second, let me put up the, the something for my screen now. Well, on a second, let me put it up on my screen and read the article for now. And then we get back into the police business. Well, on a second, students. So, Devon, Devon, when you meet with Chuck this evening, you tell Chuck Sepala had to go. Devon, when you meet with Chuck this evening, you tell Chuck Sepala had to go. My viewers and subscribers, Devon, tell Chuck, say, Chuck, listen to me. Madam split teeth have to go because we're in a pressure. Devon tell Chuck at the meeting, say Chuck, Madam split teeth have to go or you have to go. Somebody say you have to go. Students in the world, I'm going to put up the excitement on the screen. Murder to rot it cup. The house is tumbling down. The house is tumbling down. Paula, my precious love. Paula, my precious love. My split teeth ex, ex lover. Lord, look at this, my viewers and subscribers. See ya. When you look on the screen, my viewers and subscribers, look on the screen. Look on the breaking news, my viewers and subscribers. See ya. See ya, my viewers and subscribers. Acting DPP to be appointed this week. Acting DPP to be appointed this week. Let me read the article for you. Let us read the article, students. Right here it says Justice Minister Delroy Chuck has confirmed that an acting director of public prosecution, DPP, will be appointed early this week. The minister confirmed the development following Friday's ruling by the Constitutional Court, striking down an attempt by the Holness Administration to extend the tenure of Paula Llewellyn. Miss Llewellyn has been DPP since 2008. Minister Chuck says the acting DPP is necessary following what he describes as the ambiguity arising from the court's ruling. It is understood the government still intends to appeal the ruling. So my viewers and subscribers, goodbye, Paula. Goodbye. Somebody said goodbye, Paula. Goodbye, Paula. Goodbye. Yes, my viewers and subscribers, I wanted to type in at the comments. Let me read some of the comments before we move in there. So, Tashana said, yes, so nice. Somebody said, they can appoint the toilet mouth lady, Lord Jesus. But say, all that one Mr. Chink must go. Somebody said, the old dragon has fallen. Somebody said, he said he would appeal. Ridiculous. Juliet said, watch him fierce. Wonder who them are going to do, are going to do them dirty work. Somebody's going to be doing the dirty work, but oh, yeah, yeah, open my viewers and subscribers. Oh, yeah, open. Oh, yeah, open my viewers and subscribers. Well done to Marky G. Well done to Mark Golden. As I talk about Delroy Chuck, my viewers and subscribers, Mark Golden put up a document said Chuck must resign. Mark Golden and the PNP said Chuck must resign. Somebody type Chuck must resign. Make a find the document, put up my viewers and subscribers. Mark Golden, Mark Golden has said. Well, under my viewers and subscribers, may I get some excitement for my phone here, sir? Lord Jesus, may I get some excitement. My phone has ring off. Peer message has come on my phone. Lord Jesus, so no well on the students. Well, on a second, they want to bear with teacher. What a whole heap of things for my phone. Well, on the students. What a whole heap of things for my phone. And the whole on students. Well, on a second. Breaking news, my viewers and subscribers. Breaking news. Mir say it is alleged. Somebody type it is alleged. Lord Jesus, students. Breaking news. Breaking news. Breaking news. Breaking news. It is alleged. Only type it is alleged. It is alleged. Only type it is alleged. It is alleged that Lord Jesus, students, only type it is alleged murder. Whoa! Devon House is falling down, falling down, falling down, and Chevron House is falling down, my fair lady. Students, it is alleged that Floyd Green, Nesta Morgan, and Nigel Clark were locked out from the meeting and was only allowed to enter when Andrew Olness arrived. Let me repeat it. It is alleged that Flight Green, Nesta Morgan and Nigel Clark were locked out from the meeting 
and was only allowed to enter when Andrew Owens arrived. Students, Lord Jesus, and what I'm put up this excitement on my screen. Murder to rot it, cup students. No, sir. What, what a weird class I gonna get nice. Students, when you hear me say, Flight Green, Mr. Morgan, and Nigel Clark. It is alleged that they were locked out of the meeting. It is alleged that they were locked out of the meeting. My Lord Jesus, students of Bangarang. Well, I'm a viewers and subscribers. A Bangarang students. Big, big Bangarang. Big, big Bangarang students. So the whole I'm going to put it up on the screen. The Lord Jesus students. I'm sorry for the excitement, but a big, big, big Bangarang. Big, big, big Bangarang as a student. So the whole I'm a second. The murder to rot it. Hit the like button, students. Breaking news, breaking news, breaking news. It is alleged on a type. It is alleged. It is alleged on a type. It is alleged. It is alleged, my viewers and subscribers. Lord Jesus, on the wall, I'm going to put up the excitement when I get a whole heap of excitement to come in from my phone. We had some people with their ears on the ground and the people them just start talking. Now, my viewers and subscribers, on the wall, I'm going to put it up on my screen. Lord Jesus, pure excitement. Students, on the wait for this, I bang around here. Hold on. Well, I see them, I put it up here, so on the whole on them, my viewers and subscribers, on the sorry. I'm sorry, my viewers and subscribers, on the whole on a second there. Students, on the hit the like button. I want the song say, vote out, leave vote out. Grab your neighbor, vote out, leave Students, you must vote out, leave vote out. Grab your neighbor, vote out, leave You're the potter, you're the potter. Me and me neighbor, bam bam, we are go vote out, leave Bam 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 bam. Me and me neighbor, bam bam, we are go pay rate. Students, you look on the screen. Look on the screen, right there, so. See it here? Breaking news. Breaking news. Nigel Flight Green. Nigel Clark and Robert Nesta Morgan are locked out from the meeting and was only allowed to enter when Andrew Olness arrived. Students, only tell me what really are going in at the Labour Party, students. I want to tell me what really are going in a Labour Party, students. What, re what kind of excitement, Lord Jesus, students, judgment on the land. Judgment on the land, you call me, my viewers and subscribers, you call teacher, me, me I search for the song, we say, vote out Labour. May I search for the song where say vote out Labour. Lord, you vote out Labour. Grab your neighbor, vote, Lord Jesus. We prayed and me say God delivered. Students, what the song there? What the song there was say vote out Labour. Lord Jesus, I can't find the song. And what the song there, students, was say vote out Labour. Students, you call me there. No, man, somebody send me the song where say vote out Labour. I want that song there, students. Where the song was said, vote out Labour, the Lord Jesus. So, no, all of my viewers and subscribers, the phone lines are ringing. Make a take a phone call, yes, sir. Make a take a phone call, yes, sir, students. Make a take a phone call. Make a. Well, on there. Welcome, Jacqueline Thomas. Students, Jackie. Well, on there. Well, on there. Naughty, Jacqueline Thomas is in class. Naughty, Jacqueline Thomas is in class. Students, Natalie, not, 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 what's your name that Thomas is in class? Where is Naughty? Nadi, somebody call Nadi for me there. Jesus Christ, Nadi, your friend Jacqueline Thomas is here. Nadi, your friend Jacqueline Thomas is in class. Labor right, Jacqueline Thomas, come over here, Nadi. Lord Jesus, students, you need the light button to 10,000. Nadi, Jacqueline Thomas is here in class. Jesus Christ, welcome to the program, Carly. Your life on a topic. Good night, good night, good night, good night. Good, 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 good night, good night, that topic. I was just calling you to tell you that Derek Morgan is out, and that's not college, that's a fact. So, so next time, breaking news, Nesta Morgan is out of the cabin. Hey, hey! Oh, yes, that's a fact, that's well, not no college. Well, and the sister, well, and the sister, I don't hear you good. I don't, Jamaica, turn up the volume. I don't, Nesta Morgan out of the cabinet? Yes. Devon, fire Nesta Morgan? Yes. Yes. I like you tell lady to write it up. Students, me wonder if you're not here right there, so. Man, me, me, listen to me. Listen to me. Me there knew you have, you have the links because I did drop my sister. Hit my sister dead me. Come direct. Straight. How oh, were the Rasta judge you yes, say? How oh, were the yes. precious memories you yes, say? So you mean to tell me the man from Clarendon is out? Nesta Morgan get fire? 
Devon, fi- I told you, you know, I told you that Devon was going to fire him, 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 him house boy. Because him talk and say that him now prof. Well, and you remember the other day I put up a video over here. I'm a talk it and say him. Well, and then, well, and let me shut my mouth. You know, sister, Lord Jesus, <laughs> breaking news to them. I can't believe it, sister. I can't believe it, sister. Yep. Yep, he's out. So, I heard the call two more names. I'm just now waiting for the confirmation. Yeah? And where the rotted cup, you says? And where the breadcrumbs, you says, sister? Tell them, man. All right, the my sister. The wall of them, the, the wall of them, the, the wall of them also right, come down one by one, like sister. The wall of them also come down. The wall of them also then come down one by one. We are praying God that deliver, sister. All right, all right. Me going back a class. Blessings to you, blessings to your students. This call for a celebration. This call for a celebration. Listen yes, to this. Man. Listen to this, students. All right. Listen to this. <laughs> This calls for a celebration, students. This calls for a celebration. Breaking news, breaking news. Nesta Morgan has been fired. Nesta Morgan has been fired. Breaking news. Nade! 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 Remember to tell Jackie Nade. Nade, remember to tell Jacqueline why you're punishing her. Nadi, remember to tell Jacqueline Thomas why you're punishing her. Misinformation, goodbye. Misinformation, goodbye. Student celebration time. Step up, step up, come out to vote. Make sure you're on the winning boat. Step up, step up, vote PMP. Progress to Jamaica, progress to we. Yes, my viewers and subscribers, the phone lines are open. Give me a call and tell me what you have to say. Nesta Morgan get fired. Nesta Morgan get fired, my viewers and subscribers. Sister Winnie, Sister Winnie, your big friend from Clarendon, misinformation is fired. Your big friend Winnie is fired, misinformation. My miss friend, no love. By the way, a topic I am not so feeling so well, so I'm going to... Close after this and go to bed here. Okay, well, now, I, listen. Hope, well I hope you so feel wait, better. What about, Hold on. That, um, what about split teeth? Hold on, I hope you feel better and I hope that you, you really feel better. I hope that students remember to offer some yes. prayers to Sister Winnie, all right? But Sister Winnie, we're praying yes. for you and we hope you feel better. But split teeth never did I go get fire. Devon now go fire him wife. The whole of we know that. So nobody think about that, sister. Well, um, something going to happen, the public's not going to accept it. Yes. So, um, did we, Andrew fire him wife too? What kind did of person that you ask, Winnie? Did you know Andrew go fire him wife, Winnie? You're not supposed to know better than that. Him not fire him wife, man. You're not supposed to know that, sister. Well, well you know, I got to put up your blood pressure a bit, you know what I mean? Yes. <laughs> but is that step in the right no, direction? Too. Them hoes really are tumbled yeah. down, sister Winnie. You know, see it, Winnie? The whole of them hoes are tumbled down. One, 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 one. Well, Lord Jesus, if Winnie. He, well, if he, if he fire Nigel, that's going to be it for him. He cannot fire Nigel. If he do, and you got to call election this year. Lord Jesus. So you're saying can't if, fire Nigel? Because if he fire Nigel, yes. it's going to be... And you don't fall. It's don't, and you finish anyway. Yes. He's finished because he cannot tell do the amount of money he have. I, to me, Andrew is a, is more richer than Bill Gates. No, that's not that possible. So, that's not possible at all. <laughs> so all I can say, he better call the election this year. He can't survive this year. He cannot come out. Remember the man say we are jealous of him? Yes. Of what he have? Him say a bad mind. Remember? Him say we bad mind. We bad mind him? How on earth can we bad mind someone who never, him, what he got, 
ten percent he didn't him, ninety percent he never heard. So are we gonna bad mind someone? No, Jesus. It's like a child telling another child say you bad mind me because I got on a new shoes. The man tell huh? the man tell Listen, bad mind him sister. I, Listen, do you know no one in the UK talking anything about this man? Yes. If my sisters ever call your program, they're worse than me. Yeah? So it's a then, no, them, and they live in, So it's a nobody, nobody, not, have, in England, nobody like, not have nothing good to say about them. Nobody. And I lived in the Brixton area and Birmingham area. Yes. And nobody. Well, the other area, them are, you know, like Catford, um, Wimbledon, you know, all it. And you don't have no say in the United. It's only the two little, little, little one who get something to do. Yes. With our, but the ordinary Jew, people, this is a topic. Yes. If you know the amount of people wants to come home. Yes. If, if Angie should lost the election, give Mark Golden three years. Every house in Jamaica would be taken up by people who want to buy a house to come back home. Yeah. A lot of people retired and fed up of the UK. Um, um well, America some Canadian, but the people want to come home, but they do not like Andronis. Yes. They're afraid. They're afraid he might come the little house there by, he might take it away and say it's not theirs. Yes. The man is wicked. All right. The so man you, is so wicked. So you're so well on there. So you're glad to the man from Clarendon. Well on the sister winning the program nice. So you normally line nice of the program, but me know you're not feeling so well tonight. So you're glad to the man no, from Clarendon okay. re retire. You're glad to them fire the man from Clarendon. Yeah, and I want him to fire Nigel Clark so he can call election in three months. So you think okay? him go call, you think him go fire Nigel Clark? I think so. That's why they lock them out. He get the instruction. His own the big nose can let him in. But if he fire him, election this year and the, the PNP better start working on the road. Start working with the people. Yes. You see a silent river? Your mommy ever tell you don't trouble a silent, don't go into a river that look quiet? Yes. So what the silent river? So what the silent river now? Eh? What the silent river? Mark Golden. A lie. Where's the silent river? Where's the Mark Golden and really? silent don't river? Touch, yeah, don't touch my, my, my son. That's my son, yeah? My son is older than uh, Mark Golden, yeah? Yes. I have two sons and all two older than Mark Golden. My daughter is Mark Golden age, and my baby now is 49. Yes. Yeah, so you you're understand? So you're proud of Mark Golden. So, Jesus Christ, I love Mark Golden. Jesus Christ, I love him like honey. Okay. You know when you got honey? The, yes. The, the real Jamaican honey? Yes. That's Mark Golden for me. All right, yes. Sister okay. Winnie. I hear you loud and clear. Blessings to you and thanks for calling the program. All right? Blessings to you. Blessings and to you. And if I don't call call tomorrow night, I'm not feeling well, okay? All right, Sister Winnie. We pray that you feel better. You hear my friend? All right, blessings to you, Sister Winnie. Students, I remember to pray for Sister Winnie. Remember, Sister Winnie, in your prayers. Yes, Carla, welcome to our topic, the program at What are we them fire, Nesta Morgan? Judgment, what do you have to say about that? Teacher, there's a lot more to come, teacher. You're going to hear a lot of bangarang after what, this, but say, teacher. Say remember what? Maxwell tell you? Say well, what, I, say what Mr. Remember, Maxwell? You're going to hear a lot of bangarang following these things, man. I tell you that. What do you say? What you say? Mr. Bangarang, come for them. I am telling you straight from this, man. Trust me. Remember, I told you, gamble me now. You said, no, no, no. You was afraid. Yes. I tell you, she can't go back there. She yes. She never go back there. So you say you did, I told you. So you say you did right when you tell me, say, madam, could I never go back in the seat? You did right. All right, I tell you, I yes. tell you, always, and there's a lot of bangarang that will follow. Yes. After this, just give it, give it a little while, and you see, I'm telling you what I'm telling you. This so, is so, actual facts, bro. So, who next you think they yeah. gonna fire now, Mister, 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 Mister Man? Who next you think they gonna fire? And as soon as we get, get the up, the up runnings and, and, and everything, I call back and tell you everything. But for now. Remember, a lot of bangarang will be coming on. Lord Jesus, where's a wallipa bangarang unleashed by the Labour Party now? Pure excitement. 
Lata Banga wrong. Lata Banga wrong. You think say, all right, well, okay. If if I fire you, you was going to sit down and take it easy. Answer me. So you think say them? Me know. Hello, listen to me. Me know them. I go challenge Devon. You know. Me know them. I go challenge Devon. Me know them. I go challenge Devon to rat it cup. Lord, problem Devon. Devon soul case. My brothers and subscribers. What a joke. I am giving you a warning. Lord, hey, murder in my camp. This how you call mix up and mix down. Blender. Lord, mix all over, brother Maxwell. But big up yourself. So DPP gone and Nesta Morgan gone. Who else next to go, my viewers and subscribers? And I, and I, I tell you, they would have to put a temporary one until Mark Golden and Andrew decide who they're going to put inside here. Lord Jesus, my brother. Lord Jesus. All right, my brother. The phone lines are blazing. Up. Make I take a few more calls. All right? Big up, big up, big up. All right, students, I want you to call me there. Give me a call, 876-539-6220. Come on, students, put up my number, moderators. Put up my moderators. You're wrong for trouble, Mark G. You're wrong. You're wrong for trouble, Mark G. You're wrong. Yes, Carla, welcome to Atopic. You're live on the air. Welcome yeah, man, to Atopic. Yes, sir. As far as I notice, you know, you know, look like I'm alone, you know, and then say three more other person leave, must resign or something like that, too, or say, two other. Say what, well, and there, well, and there. Say what, sir? Say them, say, like, two other person um supposed to resign because me just stay here watch CVM News. So them, do a, them a two other person supposed to resign also. Because them see I resign, that man resign, you know. Them not see a fire, them fire him, you know. Them see I resign, him resign. But we all know see a fire, him fire him. Lord Jesus, what a way. Wait, so we say fire, them fire. The fire, them fire misinformation from Clarendon. Yes, man. So too, much that... it, too much of it, too much of it, too much of it, man. Lord Jesus, so, so, so you don't think Devon should have fire himself or fire Shevan. So we say misinformation, fire, breaking news, students. Yes, of course. Them fire the man from Clarendon. Every single one of them, every single one of them should have get up and step so. Yes. Too much of them, too much of it. So you're glad for that news, yeah? Who else next you want fire yes, now? Man. Well, as far as me is concerned, no. right now, the, 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 the big news should go. So you say Big Nose big Shevan is next. She down. must go. Yes, man. And him wife. Them to go sit down too. Big Nose and him wife. Them to go sit down too. Okay. Okay, my brother. I hear you loud and clear. Well, all right. Go and pray because we pray. And God deliver. And God deliver. Yes. We pray. Yep. And we stop the misinformation and Paula. <laughs> hey, big up yourself, my brother. Yeah, Thanks for calling our topic. Big up yourself. Blessings, blessings. Students, you want to call me? Call me. 8765396220. 8765396220. Somebody said, Oma Davis resigned. Call out the name them. Terry Langton resigned yet. Somebody said, Robert Montague resigned to Lord Jesus students. You know, call me. Devon House in a problem. Students, remember, you can bless up the Zell and the Cash App. The Cash App is dollar sign Jamaica at topic. Our first lady, KP. And the Zell is 347234. Students, call me and bless up the class. Call me and create peer excitement in the class, students. Welcome to Hot Topic. You're live on Jamaica Hot Topic. Good evening. Welcome to the program. Yes, sir. You believe in prayer? We prayed and God <laughs> delivered. You know where is Andrew? You know where is Andrew when it's a final car election early in Grand Resign? What makes you say that now? Listen, Papa. Listen, Papa. Push the funny man, man. The world, yes. I watch, the world I watch the Liberate Party, you know? Yes. Tommy General. I went... Tom, man, you're on the floor, brother. You're on the floor. May I get together some information? Tom, man, you're on the floor. Remember, you know? Remember, I said, next time I'm not probably that rat again. Remember, I said, I'll be lying, come out and tell the people and tell the world, you know? Remember, I said, me, no, I'm going to run out and tell the world, I'm going to lie. I'm going to lie. I'm going to lie. When I say in Brother East Coast, Brother, false news, false news, far rapid, then I'm going to apologize right now to you, know. Yes, my brother, and, um, big excitement, big, big excitement. And I, and I, and I, and I, and I think, I think, um, Bobby Man, this week, I'm going to get fired too. I think Bobby Man, this week, I'm going to get fired. 
Because remember, you know, Bobby Matthew, lose four, three of them division, you know. Out of four, you know. And lose the Mia ship, you know. You remember? My brother, you're dead on the floor. Just continue talking. My brother, you're dead on the floor and the call. I'm not for just continue talking. Just give me, I'm just talk and talk okay, and okay, rub yeah, them out. I think, and, 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 and Dr. Chap, Dr. Chapman, Dr. The security minister have to go to. He needs to fire the security minister too. And his wife should step down. He should resign and step down too. Nigel Clark must go because he's coming be a pretty, pretty, pretty budget. And trick the people, them are and with the big friend, them are eat food. Only in big friend, them are eat food and come trick the people, them tell one bag and they come talk about red card. Red card. It must go down today, too. In Africa, go down today, 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 it must go down. Yes, a wickedness. Nigel Clark must go down. Today, Nigel Clark must go down. Talk to me now, my brother. Some information, I just said that get because several messages are coming yes. from my phone and I try to balance them one time. Nigel Clark, Nigel Clark must go down because I be a fast news, fast budget thing to the people when they read budget. Be a fast budget. Yes. Be a fast and put it put it on the web card. We are going to come with one long, 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 long receipt. We must go down today too. Go down, go down, go down. Yes. But I, I think Bobby Matthew will go and get fired too because he might lose four of him, of him, please, you know. But he guess what? He lose three of him, I'll lose the mere shit. A little whistlebird type in the comments say Bobby Matthew resigned to me. I got me. I do the fact check for find out. Listen to me. So, so I want to make him turn pan Nesta Morgan. Is it because the boy Romian from Clarendon win the seat. Remember Nesta Morgan on the screen come out and say that Romian Marissa would have never win the seat and say Romian win the seat there. That not have nothing to do with that. That not have nothing to do with it because him only make a statement. Ratigan send him a letter say most with dry and him red dry. So that is that. You understand? But differently, I believe the main it's issue... Well, it's well, it's well, it's well, it's well, it's well, big chat, bro. And no. Grandma Jim is an MP. Yes. The man, the boy can't win a speed. And the boy did win the seat at that Bon Devon, at that win, at that, at that, bon. and yes. guess what? Listen to me, what Bon him to. I have to celebrate myself and I have to celebrate my viewers and the other social media bloggers. Let me tell you why. Nesta Morgan was a spin doctor. He was the person when he was the strong arm of the JLP propaganda machinery and the PR. And he was the one where, where, where run with them PR. But from the other day, social media bloggers like myself, Andre Stevo, we alone, some has been giving them fire. Yeah. We've been giving them well, I know, well, I, my brother, just well, I know, we've been giving them fire in them skin, so they're not able to spread the message like they would want to spread the message. We have a voice, we spreading the message, we bringing the truth to people, and people realizing it, and people are pressure them. And Nesta Morgan never did that perform. You realize a long time JLP can't spread no. propaganda because everything them don't pan them. Time come, time come for a better Jamaica. Everybody talk mark type, time come, time come. <laughs> Yes. Hold on, my brother. Students, I am putting up a poll and I'm asking the question in the poll. Who next must resign from the JLP? Andrew Olness, Juliet Olness, or Dr. Chang? Who next must resign? I know you would have want all three of them for resign. I know you would have want all three of them for resign immediately. But you can't have your cake and eat it too, right? So, which one of them you want for resign the most? Please participate in the comment. Well, it's a good look for Jamaica, my brother. It is a very, very, very good look from Jamaica. Yeah, man, God, God hands a prayer, you know, man. I will have good, will have people are praying good prayer. God, God hands a prayer, you know. God hands a prayer. Yes. The liver they do too much. Yes. Too much. And Delroy Chuck must resign, too. Yes. He must resign. Delroy Chuck for two. If he carry the, the, the constitution right in a court and all over the place and the drug it all, he must resign. Delroy Chuck. Uh, and I hear the PNP, I hear Mark Golin call for Delroy Chuck's resignation. And I want my students to let us lift our voices and echo a cry that Dr. Chang must, hear me, hear the man name again, Delroy Chuck must resign. 
Somebody type Delroy Chuck. Delroy Chuck must resign. You know why? You know why? You know why? Him, him, come, him come and tell we lie. But listen to me. Nadi, oh Jacqueline still a type in the comments. When Nadi there, Nadi, oh Jacqueline still a type in the comments. Well, and the Jacqueline, we are going to beat your body over here. Jacqueline Thomas, you know, say you are the labor writer. We are low for running at the program. And talk where you want to talk. Here are they almost stay straight. Nobody not no moderator don't trouble Jacqueline Thomas and Nadi alone I go beat Jacqueline Thomas today. Nadi alone as my moderator I go beat Jacqueline Thomas. Jacqueline Thomas is a labor right. She the over Cliff Hughes program. I know she over Cliff Hughes program a while ago. I cuss out Mark Golden, you know. Jacqueline Thomas were in our comments at Chatter Farm out. Over Cliff Hughes program I cuss out Mark Golden and the PNP. And she come in our program right now. I run our farm out. And I, when me see it, me show it to the students. Say, look here. See, Jackie over mouth piece. I cuss out PNP. We know she go come in at the class, you know. See, she come in at the class. Yeah. Jacqueline, we are going to put you up on suspension again. We are going to suspend you. Yes, man. Time come, Jacqueline Thomas. Time come. My brother is a good look for Jamaica. Is a good. Nadi, which yeah, part you there? Like Nadi, no matter tell me say you know, in a class, yeah, Nadi. Yeah. Nadi, nobody me take where your moderator status, Nadi. You're supposed to in a class. Oh, you're not in a class of fix, Nadi, Jacqueline. Well, I'm going to see if Nadi. Nadi, me can't believe you're not in a class of fix, Jacqueline. No moderator not touch her. Yes, my brother, talk up the things, them. Yeah, Terry Lang, Terry Lang must resign, too. So you said Terry Langton is the next one, he must resign. Yeah, but if you say PJ and Porsche, I must resign, yeah. Yes. So you are called for them, said Terry Lang. So, so you said them, said Terry Lang must resign. Yeah, but but no other JLP, JLP leader, JLP minister, whatever, never come come to that yet. He must resign. He not no man very rude and out of order. Yes. Him out of order for two and he must resign. Guess what? Guess what? Guess what? Guess what? The egg broke and them a crumble one one. You hear me say, my brother? The egg is broken and them a crumble yeah, one man. by one by one. The egg a crumble. But thank you for calling, my brother, and big up yourself. The phone lines are blazing. Make a take some more call. You hear? Yeah, man. Blessings. Blessings. Hold on a second, student. Yes, Carla, welcome to our topic. You're live on the air. Good night, good night. What a celebration. How you feeling, Nesta Morgan? Get fire. Yes, me. Me did want, I did want, um, that Minister of National Security should have stepped aside, too. Somebody who have some new development coming. You get me? So you oh, did, so what on there? Security. So you would say you did sleep in for so you well I know so you say they want them get rid of Dr. Chang too. You did want them get rid of Orius Chang. Yes. And that man from St. Mary when he was the one they were um Robert Montague. Robert Montague. Yes. Yes. Who wants me at Yes, yes. The man was saying Uncle Obiama, well and the brother. Are you talking about the man who say my him uncle Obiaman? Robert Montague. See, man. Let me tell you, this, this meeting with them call, a whole lot good. I don't see it has been relevant. What has been God doing for them to get rid of God? If God do not get the money for clean the garbage, clean the street, how can he go ahead and do it? So what them say huh? them, them get them, hold on there. So them get rid of Mr. Mr. Garden from NSWMA? Boss. So them le so them lego them friend with the Wally Pat truck. The students so, so, so them lego them friend with the Wally Pat truck from NSW me. I want back a banga rang you know, but before you talk, Nadi, thank you for Juko, Jackie backside. Jackie, we are gonna punish you. We see you over mode piece radio station a cuss out PNP. And me tell us, Nadi will moderator. Every time she go give you one minute and make you talk, and we are going to lick you again till we block you from the class, Jacqueline. You're too out of that cause PNP. We hear you over more piece of cause Mark Golden. I see Andrea Burke said, Jacqueline Thomas cussed me off over Andrea program last week. A fear style from one program to another. Jacqueline Thomas will love you, but we are cussed out your class tonight. Yes, my brother. It's a good look for Jamaica. Good look for Jamaica. Uh, what you say, Carla? Talk up loud. The, the program is nice. Talk up, Carla. Right now, what happened? 
Well, guess what? Somebody said that Robert, somebody said that, uh, when call it Bobby Montague resigned. I don't know. I go and check the fact. Somebody said Bobby Montague resigned, the man from St. Mary. But me are watching news. Me are watching news. Yes. CVM news. But me not see Bobby Montague for that outside. Uh, 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 the, 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 um, Papa Wolo put that in and teeth. So, oh, oh, well, we will find out. Well, all right, my brother. We will take time to find out because we're going to find out the information slowly but surely. All right, my brother. But blessings to you and thanks for calling. I appreciate you. Make a take some more call. All right, brother. Blessings. I don't know how the phone sounds. I don't know if I wait name the my phone sounds. So. Students, remember you can bless up the cash up. Come on, students, bring the likes to a thousand. Remember, you can bless up the cash up and the Zell. See, I pin it here. The Zell is 347234-9320. 347234-9320. And the cash up is Jamaica at Topic Dollar Sign, our first lady, KP. Students, we pray. And God delivered. Yes, look a young, young Romeo and your career. That's why you must swear off a of people. That's why you must go like you sure off a of people, Robert Nesta Morgan. You must swear off a of people because any IOs can come down. Students, you call my man. Look how the program nice. Holy pa people supposed to call and I blaze the program now, you know. Holy pa people supposed to call me because we call in for Robert. Where name there? Where the man name? We call in for, for where the man name again? What the man name? So Paula Llewellyn stick gone down. Nesta Morgan gone down. Who else next to one gone down? Come on, students. Robert Nesta Morgan resigned as the as JLP's public relations committee. This is students. This is a win for you, and this is a win for me, and this is a win for all of us. Let me tell you why. Remember that they were the ones that controlled social media. They spread whatever message they want to spread on social media, my viewers and subscribers. But since recently, you and I, me and you have been doing our work on social media, and them can't get for spread no more lie. We over here are tell the truth and them can't get for spread no more. Students, you know, come on and call my man. Come on and call my man, students. Now the program nice. What if people supposed to call and talk the things them? Come on, man, students. I mean, what's up number there? 8765 You know, call my man, students. Let me play one of that song and create excitement again, students. This is called for a celebration. Celebration time. One more time. Come on, students. I me, I can't me alone this sweet. Me can't kill up myself. I want to call and kill up on myself. To come on, students, man. This is excitement for the whole away in the world for be happy about the whole Jamaica for proud of this. Yes, Carla. Welcome to the program. You're live on Hot Topic. Good night. How are you? I'm fine. I'm fine, teacher. Yes. Prayer working. Answer prayer. Say that again. Say that again. I Working, God answer prayer. Devon must not ramp with a praying set of people. That's right. That is uh, right. In a seven, seven, they go see how prayer work and I tell. Seven, they go see how prayer work and I tell. Yes. You understand? When they do this, now is it time for Mr. Golin to step up and take to the street. Because there is nothing going to stop him from winning. He better call the election soon, teacher. He so, better call it soon. Yeah. Because too much corruption and I'm built. So what you said, too Devan... Too much corruption and I'm built. So what you said, Devon must call the election because a peer banger is going to take him. He's going to soon go to prison. Oh, God. That is the next thing. That is the next thing. Because I'm listening on a different platform you know, where they said... It is alleged that his his wife own the, 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 the place that they kill Selvira for, you know. You understand? So then they fret. Then can't sleep comfortable. Yes. Then cannot sleep comfortable. Yes. This man is too much corruption in the party. The whole of them be stepped down. But if you know the inigo for all Nigel, Nigel, Nigel left Fred tonight. Me know that. Lord Jesus. Nigel can't sleep comfortable tonight. Nigel cannot sleep comfortable tonight. Where's the Nigel? I'm missing pants. He cannot 
to be comfortable tonight. Pussy there, as they said, they lock him out of the meeting. Yes. He go in only when Devon come. So me know I'm afraid. No. Because that mistake we make with the budget. Yes. I'm afraid what gonna happen next. And then he take away himself Ghana. A key man who wear it. Yes. I'm afraid. But I know God answering prayer for the Jamaican people. Yes. And it's full time now and high time yes. for us to open our eyes and see what this government is doing to the country. Yes. And pressure. I don't know why. Look at look at that lady with Shevan. Step down, fire, you have to actually see. You understand? Yes. And nobody come out and talk about it. That's the green. She should have been one of the, the person to come out and say something. Teacher, some banger wrong that happened in a the Labour Party. Yes. And God answering prayer. Because if God no going to sit and make Shevan and Devon run this country in a wreck. Yes. You understand? Yes. How we not stop heat of fire under them tail? Hot topic and Andre and the, the this other guy. We not stop heat of fire under them tail. Yes. They must give up. They must give up. Time come. Time come with we're go, the green. Game. We're gonna pray without season, sister. We're gonna pray in the morning and no one. Prayer, we pray, we pray in a night and we pray in a day. Yes, sister. Seven hundred, seven hundred. They use church for cover up in corruption. Yes. But him a Christian, Christian we are. Wicked sister. You would have the church to cover up all in corruption. Yes. Why they do? Eh? But continue. All of that, teacher. I tell you, God yes. answer prayer. Seven and Devon. Give them time. We are heap of fire under them till. Meanwhile, we are praying to God. Yes. Well, yeah. that, that is right, yes. my sister. Yes. Con continue praying and make the Lord hear and answer prayer. Blessings to you and thanks for calling. All right, sister? I'm going back in class. Today. All right. Blessings to you. Blessings to you. Yes. What a way the phone lines are blazing. Come on, students. 876-5396-220. Give me a call. Give me a call, students. 876 Five three nine six two two zero. This calls for a celebration. Listen to this, as students. Step up, step. Yes, Carla. Welcome to our topic. You're live on the air. Good night. How are you doing? I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm here in the UK. I listen to you. Yes, man. Myself all the way from UK, man. Blessings to the UK, massive. Yeah. I don't know if you said go to a go on down there, now, but it looked like the damn bus, you know, and is a factor that the constitution, which the majority of the Jamaican people don't seem to understand, is a thing that will the peace and sanity on the whole island. Yes. Yeah. The fact that. Your DPP come to England to challenge, what would I say, the coming into the Lions then, it was something that this country not interested in because we have our own corruption over here. Yes. And the corruption that one is experiencing down there is too much of an embarrassment yes. for even the, the British government to deal with. So the Privy Council no one has nothing to do with it. Because the Jamaican people, they need to wake up, yeah, out of their slumber and out of their sleep. Because they allow the government to frighten them down to the extent that even the lockdown no make no sense whatsoever. Because yeah. we're fighting that war over here in England. Yeah. Yeah, this and, the, and the states of emergencies and the states of emergencies have been unconstitutional, unconstitutional. But guess what? You know, sister, the whole of them plans have fallen down because guess what? The man will spread them propaganda, 
him fall. The gatekeeper, my ex-girlfriend, she were, were, were responsible for them legal business. She fall. So the two of them fall within a number of days and couple more fire. Lord Jesus, we have a prayer. We have a prayer. Lord Jesus, we have a prayer, my brother. It's a good look for Jamaica. We want Devon and Chevron resign next. And we want Mr. Mr. Delroy Chuck, we come out, come tell you false information. We want you to resign, sir. Yeah, man, we want you to resign. But on the whole of, the whole of them, because remember, you know, teeth, the life is a teeth with long back. Yeah, so it's right from the top of the river. Yeah, your leader, yeah, the unholiness, him off you go. Hello, yeah. hello, Tough hello. Standing, even himself, even close to himself, off you go. Hello, but listen to me. You understand? Because Nobody. If they, could take, if they could take the joke. Yeah, my way say, make it take the joke, I want. Yeah, he may could take, he may could take the joke, and then in the end, you will, you see him have him, him, him on, what you call it, funeral parlor. You understand? Yes. So, there's all kind of conflict of interest to wipe out the nation, yeah, of, of, of our people. Yeah, so they are the gatekeepers upholding the, the rules of where that's like the oppressors. Yes, yes, the United States yeah. are dictator, them brother. I come them come for kill out the wall of we know. Come them come for kill out the wall of we are mad we out. That's why them have the song I play a mad we are mad out a run. Wickedness span the land, we're tired of them, man. Too much separation and them turn a blind eye to the poor people. Enough is enough, my brother, man. The whole house of a yeah, tumble. Yeah, yeah. yeah, so when I ask no phone for door is to find like the drums and the amen because this is spiritual warfare yes prayer is not enough yeah we have to take a stand and yeah they will say when you're on in uh the lion mode you have to take your time take it out yes yeah so through that now we have to support mark golden yes but at the same time they said same constitution that Cause this situation, we have to look at the overall constitution that is going to liberate Jamaica. So we want a constitution that is going to serve yes. the people of Jamaica. So yes. out of all of this madness, yes, there is still salvation because yes. the bigger picture is how we rid ourselves of our oppressors. Yes. So the example of them which were going in a eighty, everything yes. is in alignment. Yes. So we have to see the bigger picture now. Yes. As a race of people that yes. is going to gain back that moral high ground which we once had that make Africa, the yes. motherland, look to we as Jamaica. Well so said. The, 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 the way that I said, the government put we, yeah, the whole of the African race in jeopardy. But at the same time, out of bad must come good. Yes. Yeah. So respect to yourself at topic yes. and all the social media platforms who has enabled this now to break the bank. Yes. And it's for us to support the likes of Wayne Lonesome, Ratigan, yes. Tavres. Yes. And all the social media platforms to make sure that we don't make. Yeah. Anything like this happen again. Yes. Yeah, everything is for a reason and out of bad must come good. Let me say something to you now, my brother. Let me say something to you. You see the man by your screen? You see that man from them was in G2K. That man no PR. That man no for put story. Hello. You see the man by your screen? He can tell us a 1 plus 1 is 17 and you believe him in our 57 or 83. Now you know that? This a man I know for spin things. And let me tell you, a them put drunk up and push a head. Ed boy talk about it say him never forgive him because Ed boy know him. Ed boy say a him put drunk up and push a head and do all kind of something and run with all kind of propaganda and PR stunt make PNP look bad at them run with clocks and bro god. A them did have control of the PR. And guess what? They've lost it to us. They've lost it to us. And I want to say that, students, you need to make sure you support your, your social media warriors. Not the one that will come and carry foolishness. Come with the one that carries substance, that show you the truth, that show you the evidence. You need to support program like that. You know, sir, Andre, we know, sir, we ain't loan some start the whole of this. We and loan some of the grandfather and I big up himself. We know say Andre Stephen are the one where bring the excitement and bring more ice to it than anybody. Andre Stephen, who don't know me myself, they are Rattigan, they are doing thing. 
uh, uh, talk with the other one in here, make we talk with Jeffrey Tavares, them. Yes, I'm big up all, all mystic sensation. Big up all social media. I'll talk your mind. Long time talk your mind. I'll talk. Big up all social media warriors. And I tell you to remember to continue to support us. Subscribe to us. Like up the videos. Call in and let your voice be heard. Listen to me, man. I we make this possible why I'm Lego. The man now go Lego him side boy. Him now go Lego him side boy unless something dangerous. Start the truth, no, my general. I'm side boy this, you know. Yeah. Yeah, but the the nano choice. The nano choice, you know, I mean, like me say, you know, we we there in our diaspora, me there you um in the UK. So it's like we have the junk of you. And being honest, I traveled down there, I wasn't down there this Christmas. But the last two years Christmas was come now, I spent three months with you know. So we have the experience to see what I go on down there. I talk with Wayne Lonesome, yeah, because at the same time, he's from out of Rockford, and yes. I like him saying, oh, he's like the wind. Yes. Yeah, over here, I beat my drum, so you will see me for most of these protests, and I can't understand how comes from Jamaican people, so coward. Yeah, I can't understand how so coward. But what is it? But hold on a second. Talk I have often, we want big up here, big up out of the press to me. I have to big up out of the press. Yes, I must big up out of the press to come over here very often. Big up yourself out of the press. Big up Mark Stewart, Prophet Mark Stewart, big up Peter Chambers, big up all of the people who are called on judgment for the Labour Party. Big up everybody who are called on judgment and a break. Listen to me, brother. I we shake up them camp and make everybody. They are talk about it, you know. And we shake up the camp. We shake up the camp. And the whole of we shake up the camp and bring it to the world. And social media take over. And our CVM do this. And our TVJ. We are going to give credit to them because sometimes them talk the things. But they don't expound. They don't give people advice like how we give people advice. So we have to big up. Everybody who was instrumental, we are going to put pressure upon him. And we're asking Delroy Chuck, do the right thing and step down. Delroy Chuck, do the right thing and step down. You tell me false information. Long tongue, Terry Lang with this Jamaica first prime minister. Long tongue, false dread, farty leg, egg, fake dread, Terry Lang. You need to step down. Chevan, oppressive, nasty, bigfoot Chevan. You need to step down. Big nose, sweet pepper nose, yeah, Devon. We are take the whole of the money and I sell we out. Step down. Mr. Chang, go and go yeah, sleep. Gone. Go on in our nursing home, Mr. Got, Chang, go sleep. Yeah, it gone further than that because right now, as always here, you say lawbreakers can't be law enforcers. So it's like the whole government now have to resign. Yes. So the people is entitled to ask for the government to call an election because the whole of them has put the constitution into disrepute. Yes. Yeah, so there's no governance running the country right now because you have to say a pure thief. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. As you talk about thief, all 1,902 people that are on this live right now I want to say something to all of you, my viewers and subscribers. You see, at 9 o'clock Jamaica time and 10 p.m. U.S. time, we are going to drop a bombshell about the water crisis. You know, hear me say, my brother? My brother, you, you hear me say, my brother? You see, all the 1,900 people upon the live at 9 o'clock Jamaica time and 10 p.m. U.S. time. Me and Andre Steve I go have a, a double program where the two are we double up. Are we going to drop a bombshell revelation about the water crisis? Students, when you hear what me say? Me say at 9 p.m. Jamaica time and 10 p.m. U.S. time, me and Andre Steve I go call, I go double up. Me I go call him program. My viewers I go hear, theme viewers I go hear. And we are going to drop a bomb, Lord Jesus. You see the water judgment here? Yeah? We have a bombshell for drop phone. Oh. People are, are going right, to drop well, down when the bombshell drop. Oh. All right. All right. Well, me have to tune in because I, I, I sent them a sneak come from. And you hear them talk about the, the water pipe that gone a town from up a ramble and the people them up there. Now no water yes. for themselves. Yes, them, them a challenge yes, sent yes, them as water. And... 
when me I go say when me I go say pan this is them feel forget you know by the joke. Yes. Yeah. So now them are gonna give them a contaminated water. water. So even those campaigners that you see them have, them have an agenda behind it because they would love to put them back into lockdown so that when the election come, yeah, and we're going with his visit to Israel, all of those things were significant insofar as their long term plan because they're my plan to keep the next election. So that's why I'm here all telling right. them we don't need to call the get them to call the election no all right you understand? because we are going with israel in the gaza yeah they're bringing intelligence you have people upon the island who are where we are said them are trained you understand so even them soldiers are things so i got his um 80 them you're gonna find yourself have your own little kind of civil all war right. All right, my on brother. the island. All right, my brother. Big yeah, up yourself. Yeah, you understand? So, we talk with Andre. Andre yes. tell myself to stay in my lane. Yeah? My tag is enough is enough. As a matter of fact, my tag is, is to R-A-S-S-S. Yes. Uh, me fed up, me vex. So, you're tired of what going on? You're tired of what you want some change? Yeah, I saw the people them feel down there right now. So now enough you need to open up on your eyes. Yes. Smell the coffee. Yeah. See what I'm going. Yeah. And I said, who feels it knows it. Well, guess you what? Understand? Well, so, listen to me. What is happening now? We are bringing the issues. We are highlighting the issues and the people are praying and the PNP are doing the paperwork. Oh, that's all. We are bringing the issues. Well, we are bringing the knowledge. People are praying and the People's National Party is doing the legal court work and the paperwork. So, sooner or later, the people are only leaving if stand up for them right. That's all that needs to be done. All right, my brother? Yeah, me not nothing against prayer, you know. But right now, it's about action. Okay, yeah. but, but, Real, but, but hold on, my brother. Listen to me, listen to me. You hear what me just said? What? You hear the order how me put it? You realize there was structure in my argument? You realize I listed out a number of things which is happening? You realize that the last thing I said, and next the people need to stand up for them, right? All right, my brother. Blessings to you, all right? Thank you so much. All right. Yeah, my nice, my nice. Yes, my yes, nice. yes, 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 yes. Yeah, yes. Jamaica. Well, on a second, student. Students at 9 p.m. Jamaica time, 10 p.m. U.S. time, and 2 a.m. U.S. time, U.K. time, we're going to have a bombshell revelation. Me and Andre Stephen, Jamaica at Topic and Partner Draw TV is going to have a link up. And we're going to be having a bombshell revelation about the water crisis at 9 p.m. Jamaica time, 10 p.m. U.S. time, and 2 a.m. U.K. time at Topic. Uh, Andre Stevens from Partner Dry is going to link up and we're going to be bringing you a bombshell. I am going to be calling Andre. I am going to be getting my special guest. I'm going to be having my special guest caller call me. And when the guest caller call me, we're going to be calling Andre Stevens. And we are going to be having a bombshell revelation on the water crisis. So then hit the like button and bring it to a thousands for me. 32 people hit the like button for me. This need crowd... This need crowd with the water business. This need crowd. This need crowd, my viewers and subscribers. When you give me a call, 30 more people hit the like button. Come on, students. 29 more people hit the like button. This need crowd, students. This need crowd. This need crowd. This need crowd. Yes, Carla. Welcome to our topic. You're live on the air. Welcome to the program. Yes, our topic. Here I you know, Andrew is a man who loves in intro. Well, my intro to him is Babylon, your kingdom is falling. That's my intro to him. Yes. Anyway, remember, I was the one who told you the other day that it is over for our DPP. It is, it, is, it is done. Yeah. I was the one who said that the, um, the, the, um, the, the what's his name, Chuck, was shame. Yeah. That's why he came out talking like that. He was ashamed. And he's the one who read the Constitution to pass. Yeah. Yeah, just see the way it is done. Because he, he was going to do a, um, he, he was going to contest it. And yes. if he contest it and put the DPV back this week, anything yes. the DPP do would be, the, if 
see he find a person guilty and lock them up. At the, when they, they when he they lost that contest, yes, anybody find him guilty would have thrown out. Yes. They would have walked free. Yes. So they could take that chance to have her on. So when it's over, it's over. Well, guess what? Split teeth protect them business. Listen to me. The caller all tell me some things. Listen to me, student. Uno no say. Mm -hmm. Listen to me now. Me I go talk in a code. I am going to talk in a some code. I'm a want to pick up the code me I talk about. Come in a want bring no excitement till the caller come. The caller coming on at 9 p.m. Jamaica time, 10 p.m. U.S. time. Listen to this. The caller all tell me say, Madam split teeth. My good up, good up, ex split teeth. Me ear say, the man when he am Chuck Norris, one justice Chuck Norris man. Me ear say, ah, how much money people pay them. Them son mix up in a bang around and forget lock up. Yeah. Them son mix up. Uh, well, listen to me now. Me ear, listen to me now. Me ear say, one big rich man out there. Somebody type rich man. Me ear say one big mm. rich man out there. Me ear say him son mix up in a bang around. And me ear say him uh. link. Mr. 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 Chuck Norris. And when Mr. Mm. Chuck Norris get called, me ear say me split teeth get called. Millions, millions, millions and no charge. Millions, millions, millions and no mm. charge. You hear me say? Millions, millions, mm. millions and no charge. Excitement, my brother. What a bangarang I'm gonna drop over mm. here nine o'clock. What mm. a bangarang nine o'clock. Oh a pure corruption are going on in the country. Pure corruption. I'm not telling the poor people, but a lot of people, like people don't know that she's supposed to defend the, 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 the people of the country, not the prime minister. And yes. Like, that's what she's there for. A lot of people don't know that. That's yes. Her, her job to defend the people of the country. So when she goes against, go up in the courthouse, she, he says, the people, the state of Jamaica against who is brought in from the court. Yes. So is the people of the state of Jamaica against who sure that they brought in for her? That that so is right. She's well not there. supposed to be there to be defend the government. Yes, big up yourself, Sophia Wellness Warrior. Long time in a see in a class. Big up yourself, Sophia. Continue talk, my brother. A big excitement in a class mm -hmm. tonight. Shining star, I beg you put up my cash up number and the Zell number. Students, if you can send a topic one $20. Remember, you get information, you get knowledge, you get excitement, you get bombshell, you get bangarang. Remember, say YouTube blocked me for 90 days. I can't get no money till May 28. No super chat, no nothing. So if you can send a topic a, to a topic a twenty dollar in the cash up or a ten dollars. If I even twenty people or ten people can send me one ten dollars, I would greatly appreciate it. Shining star, put up the cash up, put up the Zell. The Zell is three four seven two three four ninety three twenty. Come on, students, I work. We are working you know, on work. We are working on bring down London Bridge. We are working on bring down London Bridge. So if you can send a topic, a little blessing, bless up a topic, cash up on the Zell. Shining Star, put it up. Yes, my brother. That, that is right. That is right. So let me ask you a question. Who next you want to resign? Who next you want to get fire? The, the impossible one. It's it is only somebody one brother, like, but you see impossible guy man for himself. But you see the big tiny man? Yes. Trust me. I him that make the call for the rest of the cars. And we are talking the Chinese. So he's the, not going anywhere. The Chinese man will like sleep from Dong as from Dong as St. James, the one Thank who's responsible you. for crime. Thank you. Thank you. He make all the calls of the calls. I know I know the and I don't know how the Prime Minister. Yes. Remember, let me tell you that. You notice he moved under the way the door. He's a big dog. So you say, yeah, so you say, so you say, a doctor Ching Chang Chong, a him are the one, a him are the mastermind, a him are the top man, Ching Chang Chong. All right, all right. Believe me on that. You believe me on that. That's why Devon can't move, move him from. The way that. That's why you say Devon can't can move him. That's why I said Devon can't move him from Ministry of Security, Mr. Ching Chang Chong, because he's the big man. Yeah, I'm he's the man. Remember me tell you that. 
Yeah. All right then. Blessings to you, my brother. Blessings to you, my brother. You have anything yeah. to tell Jamaican people? Make a gear 30 seconds because the phone lines are blazing up. I'm going to want everybody to talk tonight. So take 30 seconds there. People. Say this is a stepping stone. We need we need to stand up and step out and support Marky G. You see how Marky G step out and act for the justice minister for resign. Yes. And the justice minister and I couldn't do nothing kind of know and I writing Marky asking for you see why not he step out immediately and said, No DPP tomorrow we're gonna put in a DPP assistant. No DPP the original got to go. Yes. All right. All right, my brother. Thank you so much for, for bringing yeah. that to us. All right. Blessings to you and thanks for calling. All Blessings. Right. Good, good. Blessings. Yes, students, remember to bless up Atapi, Cash Up and Zell. May I go play the news clip? Please remember to bless up the Cash Up and the Zell student. If you appreciate the class that you want to send at 10 or at 20, I would greatly appreciate it, students. Remember, you can bless up your teacher for all the work that teacher doing. Yes, call your life at Atapi. Talk the things them. Anything you have to talk, talk it tonight. Yo. Yeah, I know, I know Chuck Norris, the man name, you know. I know Chuck Norris, the name, you know. How name? His name is Chucky. Chucky name. What? I wish one the, I wish one the bride that Chucky are the wicked Chucky. Hey, hey. <laughs> yes, a Chucky I name. Yes. So when they address him, address him again, you just say Chucky. Everybody will know where I talk about. Yes. Chucky I name. Chucky. So, so you want Chucky to resign? Yeah, man. Yeah, man. They call him a feed Peter with bad information. Yes. And they know what they're doing, you know. You don't know, see it. But they feel like, say, back in the days when we were uh, RGR and JBC around Jamaica. Yes. You don't know, see it. They don't know the you know, see the revolution I go on right now. You don't know, see it. And the country take time and shift because people are get fit get fit, you know, come to the realization of what corruption really is. Yes. And what corruption I do, do towards the country and how cor corruption I wall about the country. Yes. And when time you look, you see the network of corruption. Everybody, you know, every kind of your people. But let me ask a question. Corruption. So all them are going to manage. All them are going to manage. Oh, them are him, no, him is still at what, what, what them say, Nesta is still Minister of Information. But where them remove him as? I think them remove him as the JLP waiting him there. Well, I'm mean, well, I mean, get the, the, the article clear. Well, on a second, them viewers and subscribers. Well, no, well, on a second, because they want to get the article clear. I want the article about Nesta Morgan. And you know, well, on a second, my viewers and subscribers. You know, be here with teacher one second. Let me get the information from my screen. Continue talking, my brother. Continue talking. Jamaica and the world listening to you. Yeah, all, yeah, all what they going to do, I just patch up, patch up. You see, what they going to do now? Yes. They're going to patch up this and put that one there, this and patch, patch up. But that now going to work. You don't see, that now going to work because the major issues are still there. Yes. The major issues are still there. So all they go patch up, patch up, patch up, patch up, and go, go, go on. That now going to work because the people are put on the pressure and the people are come real hard. And when you see the diaspora, because what you don't understand, you know, you see the diaspora them, them want to left out the diaspora them and the diaspora them whole heap of Jamaican. Yes. They are in the diaspora for how much years and then see the country are go from them. Yes. The, the man are take with the, the, the party, the GLP party are take with the country from them. Yes. Are take with the country from them. Yeah. And the diaspora, them now nah go sit down and make that happen. Yes. Now nah go sit down and make that happen because you have whole heap Jamaican in some high places in America. Yes. High places. Yes. yes. You know? Well, my brother, so, yeah, continue I, talking. I want somebody with the information. Now, nah, the way the information where you send me there. Well, on a second. All right, my brother, big up yourself and blessings to you. I'm play one CVM clip right right there. So, all right? Blessings, just take a minute. Yeah, man, then you want to run it off. Just take one 30 seconds yeah, man, and I'll finish I'll up I'll your I'll argument. Go on now, 30 seconds. Yeah, man, I'll be at you. Yeah, all me I tell you, so when Tanya address him again, just tell you, say, I choke him name. Just call him Chucky and we know exactly who you are talking about. All right just then, my brother. All right then, all right. no problem. Yeah. Make a play this a article, yeah. this a clip of phone now, students. Hang up, my brother, hang up. Let me play this a clip of phone now, students. Listen to this a excitement. We 
begin with this developing story. There's some stir in the governing Jamaica Labour Party, the JLP, following a crucial internal meeting today that sent some heads turning. Not only were there some changes in executive roles, but three resignations were tendered. Natalia Clark has the latest. Resignations new appointments and reshuffling. All highlights from the Jamaica Labour Party's first central executive meeting since the February 26th local government... All right, in the whole last two days, may I have to go play this phone today. This is too sweet. May I have to play this phone. Somebody said, Member of Parliament for North Central Clarendon, Robert Nesta Morgan has resigned. Lord Jesus. Hold on a second, my viewers and subscribers. In the whole on a second. Hold on a second. See them phone up on fire. My phone is on fire. Me can't get one second. You know all our students. Bear with teacher one second there. My phone is on fire. My phone is literally on fire. Hold on a second, students. Remember to call me. 876 Give me a WhatsApp call, students. Will you a message or come in on my phone? Will you a message? Call me, students. 876 Shining star. I'm to put up the number there. Put up the number, them viewers and subscribers. Put up the number. Remember, so we have a bombshell. I got drop at nine thirty. We have a, a nine o'clock. We have a bombshell for drop at nine o'clock. We have a bombshell revelation to drop at nine o'clock. Nine p.m. Jamaica time. Ten p.m. U.S. time. Two a.m. U.S. time. U.K. time. We have a bombshell for drop. We have an insider who is going to be telling us some inside information. Yes, Carla. Welcome to the program. You're live on a topic. Hot topic is Dolly Bless. What's going on, Dolly Bless? You tell me. I don't know. Where me buy me for tell you? You know, you're going to go the class. You know, you're the excitement. Tell me for tell you what going baby. You know, you're not supposed to I, I, I rejoice with the teacher and a dead with law. You know, see your friend where you love, <laughs> Nesta Morgan. You know, see them, them fire him or him resign. But, but, but hold on a second, hold on. I want us to, to get the clarity because people are saying that he did not resign as information minister. What did he resign as? That's why I'm going to be playing the clip from CVM to see if we can ascertain the facts. Did he resign as information yeah. minister? What did he resign as? Students, you can tell me in the comments or call me and tell me. Yes, Carla. Yes, Dolly Bless. Yes, my dear, me, 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 me waiting for nine o'clock, you know. Where say y'all wait for the excitement? Y'all wait for the excitement, nine o'clock. Y'all wait for the excitement, nine o'clock. What? Me, tonight a bangarang, me have to pay for bangarang tonight. Lord Jesus, well a big bangarang tonight, you know, because a big bombshell oh. when we get the call up on the line. When me get the call up on the line, a big bombshell on the back sure I get to the carrot juice. I will know ginger juice. Ginger with choke, you know, because this is when I go spicy. Yeah, me. No, me love. Me have me wine. All right, Dali. Big up yourself, sister, and blessings to you, and thanks for calling. You have anything else to say to and your I... people, em? Anything else you have to say to your people, em? My people, them, Jamaica people, them, they better do the thing, because they don't know the thing, go. Get the Prime Minister stepping on that shoes box, Shevan. You want Shevan come out Maybe. next? I want the whole of them. The whole of them. The whole of them are thieves. Where is it? The what? The, so they're my thief? So the Labour Party got yes. so well on there. So you mean to tell me that there are thieves inside the Jamaica Labour Party government? Hey, hey, murder! <laughs> Yes, they are thieves, a bunch of criminals. Lord Jesus. Well, guess what? One by one, the, the, the house is falling down. Because my beloved okay. sweetheart split teeth, my ex-girlfriend split teeth. I'm glad me and I left long time, Dolly Bless. Long time, I'm glad I'm me glad and I left. you left her. you glad me left her too. Yeah, her tongue too long. Hey, hey. And a do her tongue long, me left her. I too, she mix up with Devon. What a job. Somebody say he resigned as, somebody say he resigned as JLP Public Relations Committee. We don't want him really in that the public committee. We want Manesta Morgan to resign as misinformation. We want him to resign as Minister of Information. We don't want him to resign you as communication lead. Lie. Can't tell too much lie. Yeah, we don't want him resign as no communication lead. We want him resign as oh, Miss Minister of Information. We don't want him in there no more. 
No, we don't want none of them in there no more. They need to come out. Yes, but since oh, them don't, really but since them don't start pan him, we are gonna fix him business right down. We call in on the fix full it. termination of Nesta Morgan. We call in for the full termination, not as the head of the of JLP course. Public Relation. We call in for his resignation as the Minister of Information. That is what we call in for, and ditto. we want no less. Ditto. Ditto. I ditto that. Yes. All right, Sister Dali. Boy, I can't wait for later. Talk to you then. Make sure you get in the popcorn for 9 o'clock, Massa. 9 o'clock, the shit show going to start. Stone Love and Metro Media over Jamaica at Topic. Stone Love, Metro Media, BS Odyssey, beer excitement over here. Sting over Jamaica at Topic later at 9 o'clock. Jamaica at Topic link up with Partner Draw TV. 9 p.m. Jamaica time, 10 p.m. U.S. time. 2 a.m. UK time. Bangarang got explode. Welcome to Jamaica Topic. How are you doing, my dear? Yes, good evening, teacher. How are you? I'm doing fine, you know, sister. I am doing fine, but what a piece of excitement. But we're just getting some revelations <laughs> that uh, uh, Nesta yeah. Clark, Nesta Morgan resigned as the lead communication yeah. for the JLP. I will, I will want him to resign as Minister of, Ed, of, of, of Information. And that we want. We want him out of the government. We want him out. Remember, remember when I when I called a couple of weeks ago, I said to you, Pharaoh's camp is going to come down. The walls of Jericho is coming down. Yeah. I warned him. I remember. I warned him. I remember when you me see what you. Is happening now? I remember when they me. I don't like headless chickens, but we don't see nothing yet. I remember when what me. What a bangarang. I, I, hey. well, I remember when me, you, Ed girl, and sir was on the line, and we had that trio conversation. Very lovely conversation. And I remember you warning them and said, Pharaoh, the boss, I got tumble down for you. I remember you warning them for you, sister. Yes, yes, it's happening. Watch and see. What's gonna happen? Look and see what is happening. They are, they, they are, they are, they, right now, they are confused. They don't know what to do. Yes. Lies upon top of lies. Prayers are going up, and yes. God is answering our prayers. Yes. They are going down one by one. Yeah, there's a number. Too many there. atrocities. Too many things they ha are happening in the country. Too many evil. Too much. It's too much. It's too much. God has heard our cry, and we, this is just the beginning of sorrow. Yes. My grandfather would have said, this are the curry, this are the, the brush, the curry comb their back. Hey, hey. Lord <laughs> Jesus, you can imagine, sister, the defender get put out, and after the defender, the, 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 then the inf no, but we want Miss, we want Miss Amanda to resign, man. We want him to step down like Opala step down. We want him to step down and they appoint a new information minister. That is what we want. We can't make Morgan stay in there. No, he can not to stay. They must go. Yes. And after he is gone, we will be going. So let us just keep our eyes open. Yes. Let us keep praying. And I want to stay with you tonight. I'm doing some schoolwork. So yes. all the best. We, I, I'm going to join you when, when, you when you go over to Andre. Yes. I'm going to see if well, I can, guess what? I can join I, you. I'm going to be calling so 9 o'clock. I will be calling Andre at 9 o'clock. I'm going to be having a special guest on my program. At nine o'clock. Okay. And when I get the guest on I'm at nine o'clock, I will be calling Andre Stephen and we're going to be sharing the conversation because the last time Andre and Paul partner draw tv and atopic link up a lot of people were saying that they love that link up and they want some more of it so tonight my special guest is going to be calling me and i'm going to be calling andre and we're going to be creating beer excitement yes Miss it at all. So let me hurry up and do what I'm doing. Yes. And grab a cup of tea. Yes. And the crackers and sit down and wine. Sister, okay. do and do not and do not make tonight. and do not make no and no ants dropping at the tea. Cause Lord, it's sweet, bad. It's sweet. No make no ants dropping at it. Hey, hey. All right. Big up yourself, teacher. Yes, love, sir. love your teacher and blessings yes. to your all teacher. Right. Blessings, yes. blessings. All right. Students, you remember to call a topic. I want to put some on my screen. Students, we want to find out what the news article said. Well, I remember mean, bringing it to the news article. Well, our students, we're going to go over CVM and hear what CVM have to say about this. CVM, well, on there. Well, on there, my viewers and subscribers.
can discard. Well, I'm a viewer that subscribe. I'm to see what CVM have to say about this. Well, our students, we're going to go over to CVM and hear what CVM have to say. Hit the like button, students. Make we hear what CVM have to say about this. Because we don't want the propaganda. We want the truth. We hear some misinformation only resigned from the JLP communications. That, that no concern we. I want, we want them fire him. Wow, we want them fire him. We begin well, I'm a viewer that subscribe. As you hit the like button, then make we hear the news clip. Hit the like button, make we hear the news clip there, students. You know what well, I make we hear, hear the news clip? Hit the like button, students. Hit the like button, students. Let's go. Story. There's some stir in the governing Jamaica Labour Party, the JLP, following a crucial internal meeting today that sent some heads turning. Not only were there some changes in executive roles, but three resignations were tendered. Natalia Clark has the latest. Resignations new appointments and reshuffling. All highlights from the Jamaica Labour Party's first central executive meeting since the February 26th local government election. Join attention was the unexpected resignation of Robert Morgan as head of the party's public relations committee. No confirmation yet for his reasons, and it's understood the party is yet to identify a successor for this pivotal role. Alongside Morgan, the party's two deputy general secretaries have vacated their posts. We have Deputy General Secretary Audley Gordon, who would have demitted office today, as well as Homer Davis. Uh, they are replaced by Charles Sinclair, Senator Charles Sinclair, and Senator Delroy Williams. That's Dr. Andre Franklin, the party's deputy chairman. He also advised the CVM News that Darl Vaz, who already heads a ministry in charge of four portfolios and is Member of Parliament for Rural West Portland, is to head the party's treasury, replacing Senator Aubin Hill, Minister of Industry, Investment and Commerce. We made an addition to the Secretariat, uh, where we have now uh, Senator Aubin Hill that will be joining the Secretariat. The Treasury, we thanked our treasurer who worked uh, very diligently meticulously the last election, uh, Aubin Hill, uh, and he's to be replaced by, you know, um, Member of Parliament, Daryl Vaz. Dr. Franklin says members of the party as a central executive on... Sun but wait, oh, you know fire Christopher Tough Tom? See the man that we're supposed to fire? Just like, oh, see, 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 see Richard Query from St. Mary, the farmer mayor from St. Mary, where the people them vote out in backside in the middle. They need to retire him like oh they need to retire Christopher Tufton like how they retire him. Where Christopher Tufton still are doing at the ministry. That shake up here is a foolish shake up. This shake up is a foolish shake up. Because Christopher Tufton must be shaken up out of the ministry. Him first to come out of the ministry. They voted unanimously for the changes. But what exactly prompted the reorganization? Uh, the time, the time of our officers are required to be on the ground to get things done. Uh, there are some, there are some areas where the synergy, the natural synergy, um, is easier than 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 in, in other areas for other persons. So the best skill sets were put to the test today, and the meeting voted unanimously to make the necessary changes. What the general secretary, Dr. Horace Chang, sought to add is that now both his deputies sit in the nation's upper house of parliament. The meeting of the central executive lasted just a few I'll fly green him. You know the nothing for agriculture. Me know say, you see what the wall of them do? The wall of them make sure we till the camera dead there and them come out a shake hands and a boom our face. The wall of them wait till the camera dead there and a shake hands and a boom our face. We know when the party disunited. We know when the party crumble like when you crumble crackers. We know when the party mash up, mash up and bagger, bagger and sugar, sugar. We know when the party now go on good. When the party come like, like link and chain. When you connected but when you divided. Don't make them fool on the students. Ah, uh, let's see them a shake and look for one toilet feather him. Few hours. Look for wicked one toilet feather. Feather, you must resign. Just like how them kick out a case, eh, see, as mayor. As for them for kick out Flight Green and kick out Christopher Tufton. With party leader Andrew Holness arriving minutes before 1 p.m. and leaving mere minutes we'll after 2. The deputy chairman assures there is no friction in the party and labels the meeting as a good one. So today was a very uh, good, day. good day, a day that we analyzed all the factors and we are now uh, 
even, even more united, more dedicated to make the necessary changes a reality. Yes, my viewers and subscribers, I have a call on the line. Caller, welcome to Atta Picky Life on the air. Good night. How are you doing? Now, I uh, was just calling to let you know that I sent you some clips on your, on your WhatsApp. What is the clip about, sister? Just tell me right now, cause I... one one of them is is, is from um, Mark Golding. I think it's about um oh one and a half now since he made that statement. So, so tell and me what the statement is, sister. Said, what is the statement about? You have to tell me, cause I'm on the program and I don't have time to look at it. So if it's extra this important, state, this, this statement about um Palaluin, Palaluin. Well, well, we can't stay there. Well, we don't, well, we don't have a parlor, sister. We get the breaking news. I'm a sweetheart gone long time. We get the news and then put her out of office. We get that one there. I know, but this is a this is a clip that he made. All right, sister. Well, I look at it later. You hear? Okay. Thank uh, you. Yes. All right. All right. Okay. Thank you. Hit the like button, students. Hit the like button for me. Hit the like button. Hold on a second there. Lord, my phone I freeze up again. Phone, behave yourself. Let me take the people and call. Hold on a second. Yes, Carla, welcome to Atopic. You're live on the air. Good night. Welcome to Atopic. Hi. Good evening. Good evening, sir. How are you doing? Welcome to the program. I'm good. Thank you. How are you? I'm doing fine. You know, I was doing fine, but I'm not doing fine as I should. Because the whole labor right should have said, Jamaica, we're tired for Rabu, no? We are resigned. Make PNP go and go take over the government. But that not happen. How are you doing? All right, so let me start there. Yeah. So, last election, I was a liberate. I was one, I, I, say, I would say I was one of the first persons to go out and vote, right? Yes. But within a year and a half after making that decision, I began to regret it. <clears throat> and I'm going to tell you why. Yes. Andrew and his wife, in my opinion, are begin to run Jamaica like they are dealing with their personal house. Yes, right? Yes. The other day, the opposition leader arose what I thought was a perfectly good point. Whereas, your wife is the Speaker of the House and your Prime Minister, and if there's something should go on in the House where she should make an impartial decision, it's only natural she's going to make a decision that is in favor of her husband. There was nothing sexist about that comment or misogynistic or stupid terms that your people are using. It's a perfect logical point and in a self-respecting democracy across the world. The, the truth is that such an appointment could not have happened. Only in Fine, Jamaica. she was voted in as a... Yeah, go ahead. I said only in Jamaica it could have happened. Proceed on your point. She was voted in? Yeah, fine. She was voted in as a member of parliament and she's rightfully due to be in the cabinet. Sure, fine. Or, or, or in the house. But when it comes to some, certain key positions where you have both parties can align and collude and make decisions that are not necessarily in the best favor of a country, that's not a, a, an appropriate appointment and the world would know that. That's right? true. That's Next true. point. Next point. And you're running around and every day I'm going to call him man of announcements because every day he has a new thing announced and we can't see anything yet <laughs> he's running around talking about um how much road he has built and let's talk about the St. Thomas road yes and the whose administration was that road thought of the financing were actually sought out for that road it wasn't an, an GLP administration sir sir hold on it was on a PMP hold on a second my brother you see that same point that you're on about the St. Thomas road and I want to bring some students yes. up to par you are making mention about the St. Thomas Road and the Prime Minister and his so-called achievements which are just brought down PNP policies. His so-called achievements exactly. are nothing but brought down PNP policies. And you're specifically talking about the St. Thomas Highway Development. And you were asking who did that. And I showed an article from the Gleaner which made it clear that it was under Portia Lucretia Simpson Miller that the drawings were done and everything was done, the plan was done and everything was put in place for the for the for the center must start the highway. So it's PNP start that and Thief in Devon run like a him do it. PNP project and CMT with half a tree and CMT with Constant Spring Road. Yes. The only brand new road that Andrew built from scratch. 
is the one that goes to Westmoreland and one goes to Mandeville, but I'm going to talk about the Mandeville one in a minute. You mean, because well, I there, think well, in my opinion, well, that is one of the... Well, well, you mean the one where no sign no the panit, no light no the panit, and coward jump out on the people em, and, the, and the coward running a people's yes. car, and people are lick the cow on the highway, and people are dead? You mean that, that hurry that come one, up, that, that hurry come up, rush highway when they're ready for, where we should not be, be open to the public yet? That highway you're talking about? But not only that, my friend, it was a gross waste of 190 million US dollars. Let me just jump into my point here and, 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 and say what I tell you why it's a waste. Yeah. I live in the first world now. Whenever it is that you have new development coming on board, new develop development is supposed to complement and grow existing development. New development is not supposed to kill existing development because when you do that, it simply means that every time you come with something, you're starting from scratch. What am I saying here? If you drive from the end of the toll road, the original toll road that ends in Clarendon, there right at the runabout, mm -hmm. to drive to Manchester, you'll find that both sides of the road has ample space where the government could have invested and increased those existing roads to two-lane traffic. Man, they will never need a highway, you know? Yes. You could have ex in improved those roads to dual carriageway going to Mandeville and coming from Mandeville all the way to Porus. So the only place they probably need a bypass is maybe through Porus. But when you build a highway, all the business along the Clarendon, where you go to like Asburn store out there, so Tollgate, where you reach Murray's, um, Juicy Patty, through Scots, all of those businesses are killed by this highway, you know? Yes, actually, we are talking. This highway has murdered all of those businesses. So, especially all during people poor us. In especially all those poor years. us. Hold on. Right? Especially poor us. I remember so when, when you drive. Hold on, my brother. I remember when you're driving from Clarendon yeah. going into Manchester. It was a known stop, a well popular thing to stop a juicy beef and get your party. Everybody stop a juicy beef. And get your party and your cocoa you bread. Go ahead. Hello? Yes, I said the people yeah. could stop and there and get the patty and the cocoa bread. But because of the highway, little to no traffic is coming through that region. And that's such a lot of people's exactly. livelihood are being stifled. Exactly. So all them people, the employment, gone. Here's the other thing now. You keep talking about your bill highways, right? Yes. So you have Mass Jane, who is 70 years old, and Miss Joe, who is 65 years old, who live up in some bush in Clarendon probably don't want a car and maybe will never want a car for the rest of their life but them live up this all the days of their life and end up on the bad road when you build these highways it is mass jane and mass miss joe who voted for you how are these highways going to benefit them would it be better for you to invest in developing the primary road surfaces of your country people drive pan every day do business pan every day so you improve the highway the roadways to go to the simple business places you improve the highways to go to the um, the roadways rather to go to the community so you have good roadways in communities other people go to those communities and buy additional land hence develop the area hence you have more houses that are closer together so therefore when you're providing the social amenities such as the water Water, the light, um, the telephone. You don't have a key, so you have one house or so, mm -hmm. another house 10 miles down the Very road, another house 15 miles down the road, and yes. then flow, and the other people say, but me can't spend money down here, so because it takes me 200 years to make my money. Doesn't those simple, logical reasoning make sense? I agree with you, my brother, but this government is a back of the class, don't government. All they know about is to take two people money and give to them friends, and make them friends rich. And they don't spend. And listen to me. Make I drop on bombshell for you. You ready for it? Listen to me. I think you would have known yes, this. Yes. I think you would be. I think you would be aware of it. You and the rest of students. But let me bring you up to par. Listen to me now. There are allegations. Who the type allegations, students? There are allegations that the main purpose of the highway was to. Is a vote grabbing exercise to appease supporters in the strongly PNP in the strongly contested PNP parish of Manchester. You hear me say they specifically do it to benefit the rural down a Mandeville. There's a politician, a young girl in Mandeville that people have that 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 the people them all dear to them heart. There's a specific young politician girl. Down in a Manchester there. And the people um, that make decisions in the country. She's very close to them heart. And 
they do everything to appease her. That is why they went in parliament and said there was the best baby father in Jamaica. <laughs> Did you know their allegations that the main reason why the highway come in was to also benefit she and to show say the MP had do some work in the parish? Make her shut up my mouth. Continue, Carla. Nothing surprises me. And um, I'm going to add to that point. Another thing that I find, Mr. Holness and his wife and his party to be very dangerous people. Some people may disagree at this point. Some people may disagree. See, they went to parliament. They did whatever the devil they had to do and they extended the Paula Lewin's extension, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The courts of the land, the main court of Jamaica, the highest court in the land in Jamaica, not the Privy Council, in Jamaica, yes. has ruled that the decision is illegal. It does not follow the constitution. Yeah. What does the government do? The government is supposed to show the highest level of respect to the court. You know? So when the court makes a decision, if you want to get people to obey the words of the court, you must lead by example. And the court has made a decision. You talk about you're going to appeal it. it just, you're going to appeal the court. It, 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 the final court in the land. They make a decision. So you do not respect the court. So the only time you respect the decision of the court is when the decision is made in your favor. But once it's not in your favor, that's right. You it don't respect it. And guess what? He huh? must resign, you know, because this man is a justice minister, you know, sir. He's a man who should have known the laws and the constitution. Left, right, you know. and he should have there. He should be sleeping and you touch him. And as they touch him in Barlow, section 23 of the Constitution says this and this and that. And you mean to tell me that he knows that the ruling by the court is final? And you mean to tell me that he was saying... Be I made a big issue over here, you know, because he was saying that the court did not say that she must step down. And I'm saying, how can this man, knowing that it be unconstitutional, still saying that the court never said that she must step down? It is a slap in the face. To all of the citizens in Jamaica. And he's incompetent. It means that he's incompetent because being in a position like that, yes. the truth is you're not allowed to make certain mistakes. Ooh. And the moment you make a mistake, you should make you should take every step possible in the book to correct it. Let's talk about a couple more of those judicial mistakes that they made too. Mm -hmm. They are talking about they want to do constitutional reform. And if you should go through, I don't remember all of them now, but if you should go through the history of this administration and the previous period that they did after 2016, you would have found that they have made several legal mistakes. So they have to go to Parliament and correct. I remember one about the traffic ticket situation, yes. right? You have this one, you have and needs. there are two others I can't you remember have at needs. the moment, right? You have needs. Needs, yes. And There's another the, one to be going on. I'm not remembering it. And There's the, another one. And you have the undating oh. resignation letters. Right? Well, that's a party issue. The real business about them party issues still. Yeah, so yeah. that will leave that alone. Yeah. So what I'm saying to you is that this incompetent government that shows that their legal officers are grossly incompetent, in my opinion, from the justice minister to the constitutional minister, which I think is the biggest, most incompetent of them all, in my opinion, right, to even the, um, the foreign affairs minister, I hear these people are talking about they want to do constitutional reform, so they want to take the old constitution and play dirty football with it, and into their dream of and come up with them, come take it and show up with the people of Jamaica, whoever live with it, live with it. No. what is this, a dictatorship? Unacceptable, my brother, unacceptable. These people huh? have ravished and raped the constitution, they trample upon the constitution, they do everything in the book that is on towards the people, they do everything in the book that shows that their interest is not on the Jamaican people who they beg to vote for them, that's what it shows. My final point, I know you must have some callers. Mm. This point again, I think people are going to disagree with me. There's a thing about they want to extend the bail act, whereas if you are charged for murder, you cannot get bail. No, I know a lot of people are going to say, why do you have a problem with that? But Jamaica and people listening, this, this is what I'm saying to you. Yes. Not every time a person gets charged from murder, it doesn't mean that they are always guilty. I know probably 90% or 95% or 99%, I don't know, of yeah. the time they are guilty. But that 2% or 3% or 4%, it is not fair to hold a mistake because you are talking about people's lives here. Imagine if you are set up by somebody who hates you or a police who have the authority and the position and ability to set you up for murder, right? That's right. You are arrested. You are given zero opportunity to come on road, come investigate, put things together in order to defend yourself. So how are you going to prepare a case to defend yourself? I agree with you. Think about it, Fiamme. I agree with you on Think that about point. It. I agree with you on that point. Listen to me. Now, may I add to that? While you're talking about the Bill yes. Act and so forth, 
maybe they should revisit the matter. And depending on the severity, because guess what? If the court consider you are a threat to public society, they'll not give you bail. You know that. If the lawyers and the it's prosecutors deem you a threat to society, they'll not give you bail. So depending on the severity exactly. of the crime that is committed, bail should be granted. The judges have the decision in their hands so they can look at the decision and make a logical decision. Do I want to give this person, person bail or not? Why are you taking the decision out of the hands of the judges? What are the judges for? Let, let me also add so to that. you want to be... Sorry, not, go ahead. I'm not defending them, but we know that we live in a very... Uh, in, a, in a society that is plagued by crime and violence, right? And we've often known yes. where there is a, a low rate of people going to court to testify. Now, look at this now. Somebody is charged for murder and you're a witness in a case. And this person who you are a witness in their murder conviction, they've been granted bail and they pass you on a number of time or try to locate you. And the problem why I see why they do, I'm not picking up for them, you know, but I'm just trying to be realistic. The problem that we've been having in Jamaica is that there's a lot of threatening happening against witnesses and people are afraid to come to court to testify. You understand what I mean? So in a case like that, they should put the people in a witness protection. But the, 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 the person who has been charged, they have their right and they should be given bail. But we often see where people who are on bail, bail for murder, them same one come out, come kill witness and kill people. And, and, they, and they're on a murder charge and a little bit from them at them out and a, at their out and bail and murder charge and still committing the bail. So you understand? I understand why they want to make it as hard as possible for these type of people, especially violence producers, to get bail. So I understand where they're coming from. And I, and I agree with what you're saying 100%, but here's my counter argument to that. Yes. The Chief Justice, who is the supervisor of all court judges, right? Yes. He can have a meeting with his judges and say, judges, in circumstances, even though the law say innocent until proven guilty, wherever it is that you found that the evidence is strong enough and overwhelming enough, do not give bail. That's right. So the decision is, the judges don't have to give bail to nobody. If the judges don't want to give bail, there's nobody can tell the judges to give you bail. You know? That's right. The decision is up to the judge at the end of the day. So anybody the judge don't feel like they weren't bail based on the evidence that is in front of them. Yeah. They don't have to do it. So when you go and pass a law like that, basically you're saying to me, the person that you trust to carry out the executive and the judiciary actions of the country are incompetent or you don't trust them because what you have done is to take the decision out of their hands and put the decision within the parliament yes so the supervisor which is the chief justice chief justice sykes is the one who's supposed to have a meeting with his judges and urge and yeah, with his judges and advise them that this is how we proceed in situation where the evidence is strong do not give bail because bail is up to you the judge it doesn't matter what a lie present in front of you the judge don't convince you yeah. don't give it so at the end of the day, that decision has to lie within the hands of the judges, in my opinion. Yes, that is correct. Right, in my that opinion. Is that is correct. You know, you have a call, and there's, oh, is, well, there are the points I could raise, but I'll jump off now and give other people a All chance. Right. Thank you yourself. so much. Thank you so much, my brother. Blessings to you. Blessings to you. Thanks for calling. Hold on a second, students. Lord Jesus, the phone lines are blazing. Hold on a second. Eh? Hold on a second, students. Yes, I have a call on the line. Hold on. Yes, caller, welcome to our topic. You're live on the line. Good, good night. Welcome to our topic. Good night, my brethren. Good night, yes. my brethren. Yeah, man, it's a piece, I know. You see? Yeah. You see the shift, you know, for them are trying to do right now. And you will say, I am do a little stunting. I damage control, you must try. Yeah. But let me give you, tell you something. When you do that, the people, they know they all of them for who they are. Yes. They have this good story, so when you came out, have out of mud, and you wash off, you man put, put on a white shirt and let him go. He gone back in the mud. A thief is a thief, and one of them a thief. And when you move one from here, so I put him on another spot. A still thief. That is true. I, so I, then, I got them for go. Yes, them for go they must be your simple sense. Them for lift up and take themselves completely. That's how we are called for. A whole lot of them. Exactly, a whole lot of them. Lot, because when them do the little things, so you move down and put him there, so, and they want to say resign from this one. So, yeah, he ain't no sense because he's still a thief. Yes. He's still a thief. You know, 
Mohamed Mata where you put them, them are thieves and Jamaican people understand and they try to do a little, you know, a little stunting like they do a little damage control and people look at them and say, yeah man, they do good, you know, I do nothing because they are thieves. That is Who true. Them? That is true. And this doesn't make no sense. This doesn't make no sense at all with them do. This doesn't make no sense because they move Nesta Morgan from, 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 from as a JLP communication lead. Him still is Minister of, of Information. If we get removed from the police and, and that for happen, um, I'm moving for move completely. Complete of the prime minister anyway, he moved to. That's but my no prime minister. I'm but guess what? But guess what? So you see what I'm trying to say? But guess what? One, but guess what? This, uh, it will them thieves, guess so what? Everybody has dirt. Hold on, brother. Hold on, brother. Hold on. Thief, brother. Hold on, brother. Hold on. Yeah. Everybody has dirt on, on everybody. Everybody have dirt on everybody. So them can't push nobody out and make nobody feel uncomfortable. Because in the event they do, exactly. then problem are go there. Must must steal. You understand what I mean? True. True. Exactly, man. Because I'm not fool. Because I mean, look on it, you know, and that's the harsh, the harsh reality, you know. You're more what if I'm putting this up. You're changing your mind. still a thief. That is right. So we are going to be a thief, and we feel be, if we feel it, if enough is enough, brother. They go all of them. If you all set at them, not because when they, when they must say, why, if you move down, they are putting this, or move down, they are putting this, so me and some people are going to ask, why, you know, people have their own opinion still, but no man, the one that if you go there, so you know, me no self, they must thief, see them where. You all of them are thief. That is true. And guess brother. what? Guess what? We the Jamaican people need to stand up and say to them, say, we're calling for them to be removed. We don't want to reshuffle. Move them. We need exactly. to let our voices be raised loud. That's so them need to be moved. And say them put a parliament and a shake hand. Say we're bunk streets and a shake hand. Eh? But they unite, they unite. Unite what? I'm the war in this army, like me said before. I mean, still not come up. A thief is a thief. No matter how you spin it and move him and put in the same a thief. He will have them from top to bottom. He will have them a criminal wife, husband. He will have them. You know, make no sense. That shit. That, to me, you know, make no sense. You know, make no sense. I'm not going to say, I know why. Them, them, all. And they accord to what they've come out because people, Jamaican people, know them for who they are. And the man is a bad man, being prime minister. And he want to come shoot down things from people. And people are going to take it like this. A bad mistake. The worst prime minister ever. You know, 17 man, they do man, they do it, man. Look when Dutty Terrell and look when the man, Batman, the whole of them. No, Jesus. I'm going to pass this up. When they want to give you this up, when you want to give this up, you're going to be a brother. Eh? So he said, Bunny. He's not even sure. No man, if you go here, man. You won't have to pack up them bag and go, man, like Eddie and I say, pack up on those suitcases and move now, brother. Yes. Retire down, no. Well, Retire right. down, no. My team. All right, my brother. Them is a criminal. I hear you loud. Bless up here, my brother. Thank you so much, my Bless brother. Up. Thank you. Yes, students, when you call me, the phone lines are open. Remember, so now for call and make on the voice be heard, you know, people. Remember, when you have call and make on the voice be heard. Them need to hear on the voice. More a couple more people call me eight seven six five three nine six two two zero. When you call me students, are you satisfied with the man just moving from from? Are you satisfied with them just moving Nesta Morgan from communication for JLP? They should remove him altogether completely. Moderators put up the number for me. Come on, students, give me a call eight seven six five three nine six two two zero. Who else is going to call the program? Eight seven six five three nine six two two zero. Somebody said, Member of Parliament for North Clarendon, Central Manchester. Uh, um, no, no, uh, no, for Clarendon, North Central, Robert Morgan has resigned. Who else resigned? Who else resigned? Who want no, who, want, who else resigned? It says the party said, Omar Davis, Member of Parliament for South St. James. Hardly Garden, Director for Solid Waste, has also tendered their resignation letter. Their deputy general post, Lord Jesus. My brothers and subscribers, none, none, none of them have moved from the, from, from the position that they're in. None of them have, been, have stepped down from the position, the government position with them own. So many know what is this Devon come with. The people them need to stand up and say the wall I only need to come out. The people them need to stand up and say the wall I only need to come out. 
the people them need to stand up. Students remember so now for call me, you know. So much people in the call class. So no call man. So what if people in the class? Call me my viewers and subscribers. Yes, my viewers and subscribers. You know, give me a call. Eh? Give me a call. 8765396220. Give me a call, my viewers and subscribers. You know, give me a call, the student. 8765396220. Give me a call, my viewers and subscribers, and talk to me. Let me read some comments. Tashana Barnett said, pack no suitcase. They came with nothing. They leave with nothing. So when Barry said, me think him come out. No, him not come out. You know, hear them say, only take them take it from the JLP. Wait, name their communications lead. Let me play the, the, the something for you one more time. Now, no, I don't want to play it. I played the clip earlier on from CVM. Sophia said, we united, we stand divided, we fall. Yes. Yes, my viewers and subscribers. When you come on, give me a call and fire bun. Fire bun. Stop your foolishness in the class before I permanently eject you. Stop your foolishness and stop talking about Porsche. We are not talking about Porsche and no extension for Porsche. We are talking about the wicked JLP government. A wicked drunker like Uno. Make the JLP them can go and run over the country and do what they want. A people like Uno in the comments with those stand up for the rights make JLP feel like them can do whatever they want to do and get away with it. Students, give me a call 8765396220. 8765396220. Give me a WhatsApp call, my viewers and subscribers. 8765396220. When I call me, students, let's keep the conversation going till my special guests come. Come on, students. What if people in the class? So they're not dead and dead, 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 dead up the class. Come on, students. What if people in the class? So no call man and uh, make no voice be heard. I don't like when so much people in the class and they're not calling. Look how so much people in the class. When you call and share on the views. When you see, I trick the people and play with the people. Em. I trick them and play with the people. Em. I resign, we want them to resign, we want them to pack up them bag and go. Pack, we want them pack up them, 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 them go. And students are calling for call, calling for call. Me no want nobody send me no message. Call me students and tell me one after me now read out nobody message. Welcome to the program, call here live on the air. Are you happy with what going on in the country, caller? No, not at all. Be a madness every day upon the country. Every time I say, these are come like a soap on my watch. These are the days of our lives. I don't understand why they consistently moving the same old parts of the engine for every wear out. And we have a fix the circumstances that they still recognize. But at the end of the day, they're putting themselves deeper and deeper into a hole. And when the people get tired, then they will respond and they anxious way away they when they do call at the election. So get rid of them one sweep away. Then we put on this facade that everything is fine. But in reality, we now see it. Then we like say, them have a arm be successful. But they can't check away. What they're, they're doing, plus years, what they're doing, all these wonderful things, what no, they're doing, Carla, sure. for, the eight, for the eight years, this, they're not doing no wonderful thing, they're only oppressing the people, and what they're doing, you ever see a card pack yet, a card pack of 52 card ah, in it, they keep on shuffling the deck, exactly. but it's the same old cards, they're not getting rid of any of the cards and putting in any new cards, are the same old card, when you move this, or when you move them to that, we don't want that, move them out. Run it, 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 it's the same old engine that move and, 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 and the power life support, basically. Yeah. And, the, and every day, every day, I mean, come on now, then try with this JUTC business, still that not successful because people still say, they can't have the JUTC. Then try, boy, the, 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 the list is very long at the big now, sir. So let me ask you a question. Then you want to hover, then you want to what I want to see, I just, I just dash them with same way. They can't, they can't continue like this. So let me ask you a question. Significantly. So what do you think must happen? And I tell you, what do you think uh, must happen? What do you, you as a citizen, you sit down, you watch what go on, you hear everything. Because we all say I know what go on in the country. Night after night, we bring the issues. What do you think needs to happen? In your opinion. 
Well, as I mentioned earlier, the, 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 swamp, has, the, the swamp has to be drained. Yes. In, in, in the essence, that um, serious law changes if we made so that this type of corruption and level of cronyism can be so easy. You know, like, it, it feels like it was slack and it, it needs some tightening up. So, I mean, that needs to change first. And more focused on the situation where them get rid of uh, more pressure upon them and give them more power because like the, like the government has this overwhelming majority and it's still not effective, right? Them should have some stringent things in place to ensure that they never get so much power because you see them take over many of the oversight committees that belong to the opposition and I mean, I, I, they need to put it in a place where that can't be a thing, have some stringent oversight, that independent non bias are probably even some people are overseas to monitor the system there and make sure yes. that these things can't happen again. Achua, everything the prime minister, everything the prime minister put in that office. Okay, and different from no bias to any affiliation, and that is what we need some, some strong independent oversight. Because even the recent report today, I don't know how they make their advice be treasurer for the party. Now, hey, hey. And, where you say Darren Vaz a treasurer? Nonsense. Treasurer for the party. Treasurer. Oh. No, that is ridiculous in every in every sphere of life. And I don't know how that works because if I was a business person and the party come to me and say, Oh, they want money for the party, I would not give because I that don't trust that man. I'm on that and it's because he's fierce thing. They said, mm-hmm. you know work with me. So I, I want to see how that is going to work. That's a strange dynamic. Very strange to say the I mean, least. Like, Very strange. I mean, come on, out of all the persons in the world, out of all the um, majority where they have all the people they really choose Darren Vaughn. We don't feel like come back with a decision then. All right, my brother. And I even know, I even know I don't even think she should be in charge of Petra Jam, but that's another story. <laughs> Well, we're, ca- we're calling for them to resign. We're calling for them to just retire. Resign. Go on out of politics. Leave it to somebody else with more credibility. And we're, we're calling for account. Aye. Because there's no accountability in Jamaica. How can the Prime Minister put 15, 15 agencies and ministries in a theme belt? Oh, he can't put 15 agencies in a theme belt? That is, that is total madness. Micromanagement mm-hmm, mm-hmm, cannot work. And he may reassign them. And now, man, if you cut the accident, you fired, fired and done. Cut it off. Cut. If you want something to change, you cut it from the root. So come up back and that is where you get things done. But if you now cut it from the root, all of the, the results is going to be the same. And that is what I call the definition of madness. Doing the right. same thing over and over and expecting to get a different result. You yeah, change the same people them over and over. The result now gonna be different because if them corrupt anyway, them go corruption I go follow them. If them slack anyway, oh, slackness I go follow them. If them don't anyway, don't uh-huh. I go follow the ministry. So we want them out. And we call it for Del Right Chuck to resign. Go on with Paula. You and our Long time. Long time. I know this, I know this is ironic. They used to criticize the opposition that um, then they have the party of their old people and then they have old dinosaur and then need to go and they did cross half push and then cross half. But at the end of the day, look what happened now years later. Old, old dinosaur. They might have five. This is a dinosaur. I don't know what to say. This is a one mega Soros, Trans Soros. Yeah, we're so 85. It's a shame. 290. It's a shame and disgrace, my caller. But just take one minute and just make a closing argument because the phone line start blaze up again. Just take a minute and and. Oh, and right, right. good, good, good. Yes. And so I say, and I say to you guys, we have to, for us to survive in Jamaica today, but we just have to take it, take it one day at a time because when you look at the madness, what is going on? Mm-hmm. It can't continue. Yes. And I say that when the time comes, we just patiently wait for the time come to so make the real change. We send the message even stronger than, than, than the local government election in a while. And that is my departing words. All right. It's a pleasure having a conversation. Blessings, my brother. Thank family. you for calling. Blessings for you. We really appreciate your conversation. Thank you for calling. You hear? Blessings. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Blessings, blessings, blessings. Hold on a second. I have another call on the line. Yes, Carla, welcome to the program. You're live with Atta Pitch. 
Happy Aye. Sunday! Oh, happy Sunday, lad. You're excited, Carla. Good night. Happy Sunday to you. What go on? Yeah, me just stay as a boy. Class the on fire. A lie. Where's the class the on fire this evening? Yeah, I'm in time for call the fire brigade. Lord Jesus. A fire brigade, you have to go call the what? You have to go call the. I don't know where you say you have to go call. You have to go call the marine police. Hey, hey. What? Well, you know what I said? What I never saw me, I look on Devon Nose. You know what Devon Nose looked to me like? What? When Turk was on a rock. <laughs> you ever see Turk on a rock yet? Say what on there? Say what? What you say Devon Nose look like? Turk on a rock. You ever see Turk on a rock yet? Lord Jesus, where's a Devon Devon knows favorite turtle pan rock? What are we you out of that lady? How you call it? You don't even know what chat to you, but me pass the phone to give you and call Caribbean beauty call you. Me pick up, me pick up say you, man. Me start pick up say your voice. Sorry, class. Good night, student. Good night, student. Good night. I'm so excited to say hi to your teacher. All right, Caribbean beauty. Me know you're excited to talk to me. Big up yourself and blessings to you and your husband, man. Big up to both of you, man. No, I want chat to you. I want chat to you. Hold on, hold on. Blessings. Blessings, Caribbean beauty. Teacher. Blessings, my general Gideon. What a guan, my G. What a guan. Well, my dear, you know, say, two minute class, I write no comment. This class, big army, you know, but me not hide you. Yes. You know, say, what I want right now, it come like when me that Jamaica and when PNP win election, how me feel. I see how me feel like right now, you know. We say, you get a nice joy, a nice vibes, a good feeling. Yeah, man. They don't put a see victory come away, man. So you say things are turning you know, in the right direction. Right Sorry, I'm not get to the call. You say things are going in the right direction. Things are taking a right step in the right direction. Yes. For, it's right, it's right, you know, or, or me see, you know, say, a good percentage of labor right now will come over to PNP right now. If I for one election. For the embarrassment to them a face. So you, so but you. That's why I say I like Jacqueline Thomas. Nobody make no other joke him too hard. But you know what? Them coming like flying bird a pitch from limb to limb right now. <laughs> I said Jacqueline, she walk go all over the place, you know. But I had to fix our business because as a man of my word, I was over more peace one night when them a cuss out some things. And I remember I was in the comments. I'm a Sierra cuss out PNP. I'm a screenshot it and show it to my students I'm over here. And I pointed it out to Nadi, moderator Nadi. And Nadi, duty it was to juke her and tell her how we are juke her in the corner. You understand? But we still, I uh, will look a bootleg she, but she need to learn she and the rest of labor right then that them party is not going on good and a time for them call for them leader for resign and the whole of them for resign. Jamaica suffer my brother and guess what? The people them need to stand up. Just like how Paula Llewellyn stepped down and it confirmed, Delroy Chuck also need to step down. And you know who else need to step down to? Devon, Shevan, Langton, Terry Lang and the whole of them need to step down one by one. I don't want the bank to step down and I want to take him right out of the house and carry him to jail, you know. One thing I have to jail with the Prime Minister ship and it the same way. That would never happen, Gideon, unless the US are come to that. <laughs> and don't surprise the amount of things we're going with, don't surprise. Yes. And you know what, I need to teach you, I love when the labor right them carry out a topic name. Yes. For you have no a topic, no have nothing bad for you. I have nothing wrong for, for you teach. Well, and so the anything they carry a topic name about it must be something well, good and, and progressive. Go and talk to the students. Go and talk to them. Go and talk to them. Yes, class. Uh, we, we, we can't do the labor right them too hard. For remember, I talk to you already said I was a motivator. I'm not an activist. But sometimes I get really ignorant. When the labor right them can carry with him, it is better for you. But as I say, a topic no have nothing bad to preach, and a topic no have nothing bad to teach. Yes. So anything them can carry gold, as long as them carry it, it, the, the message straight. Yes. It must be a goal to be in P. Yes. I so, load give them a little time, make them fly here and there and swim here and there until they find their way back home, you know? Yes. 
I hear you loud and clear. But Jamaica is a PNP country, you know. No matter what they want to say, you know, Jamaica is a PNP country. But no matter how you see it, same brother, same different mind. Yes. But I want parents the same way. Yes. So loud they make them fly and swim around and come back home. All right, Gideon, I hear you. So you say you feel good. You feel you like the vibes. What do you mean, man? You like, you like the momentum yes, that man. is building around the PNP. You like how the labor right them have the political problem. You like how them chips just, you like how pressure mount upon them. You know, how sweet me well, maybe you say, Ligel Clark can't go in pan his own. A big finance minister can't go in pan his own. Guess what? It just goes to show Gideon that they're having an infighting. All of them are boom off fist and before the media go like everything all right. It's not all right. They have problem most you know, of right. them. I'm I, I free right now. Labor right problem can't solve for unless I want you to election. Yes. So going into election, a problem can't solve so fast. That fire, fire, it heart burning in them. Yes. I hear you, my brother. Yeah, man. I hear you, Gideon. So big up yourself, my brother, and thanks for calling. I will say you like the vibes, and we're going to continue doing the work, and we want the PNP to continue doing what they have to do. You know? And we will go and do what we have to do. Yes. Yes, and the labor, then go and fall one one see you. Yeah. That's right, my brother. That's right. Blessings to you, Gideon. Thank you so much. All right? All right. Bless us. Sir. Blessings, Gideon. Yes, yes, yes. I realize some people were trying to call me, my viewers and subscribers. Remember, the phone lines are open, 876-5396-220. I'm going to try to see if I can make sure I confirm that my guess, because we're supposed to have a bombshell coming on. We're supposed to have a bombshell coming to, to bomb up the class. Hold on a second, student. We're supposed to be having a bombshell coming on. So let me just see if that everything is intact, my viewers and subscribers. Please remember to hit the like button and talk to your classmate. Welcome to the program, Nicola. How are you doing? Good night, my teacher. How are you? I am doing fine. You know, I'm doing all right. The students, them, so them feel nice. Them like the exuberant. Them like the drama in a labor right party. What say you? <laughs> well, same here. Yes. What are we? Your voice strong. Wait, so what are we, my vice strong? Hey, hey. Yeah, chill <laughs> so vice not for strong, because my vice is strong. The program are the dead, dead, dead. Oh, Okay, okay. Um, we didn't want them to just resign straight, right through. Yes. Me, me think them for resign, but I ask you a question now. What do you think about this matter? We're there saying that Mr. Min is misinformation only a resign from JLP communication lead. We no wonder we want him to resign from Minister of Information. That is what we want. Yeah, that, that, that we say. Yeah, that, that we do want. We don't want him in there. We do want him ousted, out, mm -hmm. side. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, I don't know. I don't know. Lord G. Uh -oh. But anything Andrew does still, I mean, they can't come back, you know. I just want Mark to go and put on the pressure right now. Mark G, I mm -hmm. put on the fire on the right time. That may I try to tell you. So you like the pressure we are going on upon them? The same. Mark G, if you just go and do them right now, just go and push on the fire. Go yes. and get some lag wood from some place and just push fire. Push fire. We say just a push fire, push, fire, push fire, push fire upon them. So them push fire and pull. Yeah, we're not. And pull up. We're not letting them go. So my fire catch pull up. Who next one the fire catch baby love? All of them. But they not go up. They not go up. Yes. We do want Chevron, but we don't like to go up with Chevron. We don't know. Well, pray and move more. Never not go up. Never not go up either, so we don't know. Pray a move mountain um, because guess what? Sooner or later, one of the Charles, well, one of the, 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 the fractions them in there would have turned from Devon and tell himself to step down. So you stay there, it would have happened. Well, that's true. Later. Yeah, probably a toughie, me no know. Probably a toughie. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. probably a toughie, me no know. And me, they might, me, yeah, so they might yeah. talk about Pernell Charles Jr., me, they might call him name too. That he might, them looking at him mm. as a prospective leader. Yeah? Oh, okay, okay. Well, we go on. What's that, see? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But all right, my friend. Yes. 
So I'm big up some people here. We can go on. Yeah, man, big up who you want, big up, man. I want you, my friend. Now you're a floor man. Alright, give me a big up, Edgar, Nadi, Shining Star, Edgar, in a circle, Tashana, Tashi, 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 Big in up, big up, right. Nicola, Green. Bless, 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 bless up, bless up, bless up. Blessings to Nicola. All right, cool, cool. Mm. We want to ask you that, may I eat my little chips while may I keep the class together because I bang around. One of the viewers are subscribers, I'm going to see if I can get two more calls. One of the second viewers are subscribers. Hit the like button too then. I remember go get to the popcorn. Go and go get to the popcorn. My viewers are subscribers. Get the popcorn. Yes, Carla. Welcome to Art Topic. You're live on the program. Good night. How are you doing? I am good. Listening to the program. Yes. And enjoying it, man. Yes. But yes. I have a concern. What I have concern? so many concerns. Talk to me now. One. One. How can a man who is the leader of a party don't sign the code of conduct? Good. Mm -hmm. Can't talk the truth. And yet is the same man trying to connect, correct his party to put in people in right position. It can't work. It have to go tumble. So you said for the head dirty, the head need to wash out for the rest of the stream, wash out. Of course. It's not going to work. One. Two. Mr. Chuck make me feel shame. I feel shame. I feel shame till... I, for the whole even me can laugh. No one cry. So what because is shame, if Chuck, he now? is... Hello? Yeah, Mr. Chuck, so what make a shame, Mr. Chuck? No, when do make a shame? No. If he is... In the position he is, I am expecting him to at least know the constitution and know it well. Yes. Because he's what? The justice minister. minister. Sure. No, sure. sir? Sure. You should be well no. versed in the law. He's going to be just. He has to know the things so when when it come up, he can categorically affirm and say, okay, this is it. This is how it goes. No, 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 change on it. Yeah. Then, Paula, me think Paula figure married Mr. Chuck, and the two of them will just go off in the sunset. Hey, hey, where's the Paula for the Paula for the married dead, right, Chuck? Yes, I'm just right off in the sunset. Lord Jesus, I think she's a theme type master. She don't want him. <laughs> because... No, because it's two of a kind. Because she too, as the DPP, right? You know the importance of the DPP. The DPP have to take care of the citizens of the country, you know, and make right rulings, you know. That's a true. That's a true. A crucial role, she push a crucial position, she hold, you know. Yes. And she too should have know the constitution well and can should have said, you know, she like talk and roll it on already. Yeah. She should have be able to say, listen, uh, yes, you'd like to keep me on, but this is what the constitution says. Yes, yes I'd like to stay on, but to be right and to do the correct thing, I will leave yeah. and I leave gracefully. Me remember when Andre tell her, you know, so she must go plant our little garden and enjoy herself, you know. True, true. And that is about a year ago. Missy, somebody said if she had done that, from that time, the, the, the orchid garden would uh, grow up and big and pretty and even me could go buy some orchid from her too. Jesus, you know, easy. <laughs> Murder. Because me love flowers. Yes. <laughs> Understand? So, me not stay long, but me tell you, listen to your program, really enjoy it, and we as a people just have to stand. And one thing I've been telling some friends, myself to them, listen, we know when go on our road and go war, you know. 
Yes. Watch how we gonna move with the spirit and the energy. Me the person we always oppose grand rising. Yes. When me don't say something, me say grand rising. Yes. Me say the movement, the movement to inner this universe. Yes. Right now, every wickedness, every evil, every lie, have to go move out of the way. Yes. Right. And the energy of the people go and move it without we go out and go fight and make them get free. Then, then we'll want kill enough of us, so then we'll wait for we get up and go up and roll, go fight. That time we come, we now coming up for them, for them expectation. Yes, we are praying them out. We are Very them good out, program, man. Grand Rising. We are praying them out, man, sister. We are take time, pray them out slowly but surely. You see me? Yeah. And to all the, all the classmates, happy good evening, Grand Rising. All right, best to see you, my sister. Take care, all right? Have a good one. All right. Thank you. Yeah. Bye bye. Yes. Well, once you come over as a subscriber, well, another second, students. Well, another second. Please remember to hit the like button, students. Hit the like button. The phone lines are still open. While I'm trying to say, I can't get my guess. The phone lines are still open, students. Yes, caller, you're live on that topic. Good night. How you doing? I'm okay. Yeah, man. Welcome to the program. I was yes. calling you earlier. Yes. Yeah, I like the program, you know? So yes. I come here here. Yes. You say you like the program? Yes, man. Uh, they are enjoyed, you know? Yes. I always listen. It's still, you know? I always listen. Okay, so what can you decide to call today now? What, 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 no, what, what, what is concerning to you? Uh, you? You see, the thing is, all of these things that are taking place right now, I was, I see it coming long time. I see it coming long time. Right, what it was a long time in the making because Hold what I realize is that Hold on, Carla. People are... Hold on, Carla. Hear myself in my background. You can turn off the background and walk away from the background. Matt, you're the echo in my background. <laughs> Alright, alright, alright. Yes. Yes. Uh-huh. Yeah, man, the floor is yours. Yeah, as I was saying, the GLP party, how people vote for them. You I can't understand. You were saying, you, you were saying that Cap all of this that is about to happen, you, were see, you, you could have seen it coming. I could have seen this coming a long time because from day one, from man, you get the prime ministership. From Bruce did hand it over to him. Yes. I said this boy is an idiot. Let me consider that now. He's an idiot and everybody in can fool. I was there in Jamaica, sit down in my living room, watching my TV, watching the news. Yes. Knowing that this boy is an idiot. Yes. He is a total idiot and you find your see me as a thief mark for him. You know one other thing why what, what I don't, I don't like him certain way. From him, him refuse to shake the ombudsman hand. That's why he come and get rid of the office. I wish ombudsman and him did try. Him did never wash it. Then a Scotch Ben part, whatever she want him. That then a lady. No, 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 no. Um, the pastor man there. Blair. The part Blair, right? When some killing did go on in a, in a, in a constituency. And there was a tour. Yes. The ombudsman going to the constituency got tour. And buck him up. And him step up to him for shake him. And, and he, the boy put him on back of him. I lie, yeah, I'm saying, you know, so that boy a violence producer. I lie, me never know that. So that boy a violence. Me never know that, Carla. So you're telling me that some war go on in a different constituency. And the political Yeah, in a 2002. 2002. In a 2002, and Blair buck him up in a the constituency, step up to him to shake him on. And the boy put him on behind him. A lie, a evil boy. So why am I going to shake the pastor on? Because he know, he know what I'm doing. He know what I'm doing. I know what he's about. Mighty God. Plus, me always in a the constituency still now. Me used to, me, me, me do, me, me do, do like mobile work as a mechanic. I have no friend in my, in my constituency. Yes. I got me I gone there so for years. Yes. I mean, in there, I hear a lot of stuff. I know a lot of stuff. So what I know so the boy is nothing. 
So the nothing pe- good. So the people in a, in a Devon constituency are talk same is nothing good in my own constituency. I I I mean even the school when they supposed to do certain things, in they bring in a program you know when my education minister you know, and bring in a program you know. And come on TV I tell lie about him 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 um have a kind of tough ready for September. Nothing was ready because me have some people who work over the school. And them say them have put them and then them pack to buy enough things where 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 him should have provide. Where them think they should have provide. I see them what have, where, where they call it. I see what I primary step something like that. I was school at all. See what primary and junior high were the Power Olympic where? Right, that's same school. That's same school. Now oh, Jesus. So not even the not even the school. Right. Him, him, so what you say? Come, come tell lies. Say have everything ready and him never ready. Him never ready. Not never ready, man. Not never ready. That school I used to go there like every day, drop off and pick up, drop off and pick up. And plus, me, me have some friends in other community. See me, I've been in that community for a period of a good while. So you say all the people. No, no, enough people. So you say the place. all the people in no the constituency. No, enough people. You say all the people in the constituency have said them are wicked, him are wicked and them not like him. Him own constituency, they must say that about Devon, the prime minister. Yeah, what you mean? What you mean? What you mean? One man, they may have passed, you know, when they have some, some big thing, you know. And a lady said to me, say, don't drive this up. Because they up this up. They all fart them up this up, not drive this up. A lie. <laughs> so, him, I mean, you yes, say, him lose that constituency there already, you know. Yes, him lose that too, you know. But for some reason, them give me it, you know. But just see, me kind of blame PNP too. PNP don't talk out of them mouth. They, them, them kind of lay back and, and make them go out with big things. So what? No, me, me, no, me not, me, me not that Jamaica right now, you know. So me can't tell you enough things. Yes, see, them man, they, them man, they not ready, man. Them man, they not ready. And a PNP follow him. Oh, yeah, when sir. people, when a man can't take, the, uh, look, in the parliament, they're going to talk about your class come a parliament. Uh, uh, coming out. Which idiot and the foolish people, I can't tell you, you know, most of the people, them, them, some of them can't read and they can't write, but they make foolish decisions. So and I, I don't. Some, some people are Jamaica, they, them don'ts. Yes. And love gaga gaga and green teeth. And you could have your part in Clarks and come and tell me about Clarks for me, green my teeth, and me vote for him through that. And then in give me, in give me a um, special for drink. The people in not they have sense. The boy, them, the young boy, them licky licky, love them belly. Me no know enough of them not breathe. You know, yeah, but you know, yes, that, that them not breathe. That would have so um come here, say farm work to tag you away for, for breathe them. That that me yeah. <laughs> yeah, me tell a man. Me tell them, me tell so you want them out, they're yeah, done with them. Me go and listen to the program, you know. So you want the Labour Party out, you tell them. Time. All right, my brother, blessings to you. And thanks for calling, all right? Yeah, yeah, man, pick up yourself. Yes, Carla, welcome to the program. You're live on Hot Topic. Good night, welcome, welcome. Hot Topic. Yes. Good night, teacher. First time on your program. Oh, blessings to you. How are you doing? I'm blessed. I'm listening to you. But may I hear myself in the background? Can you turn it off? Turn on the TV or step away from it, please? I'm hearing myself. All right. We want Christopher Tufton to go. Nigel Clark and the whole of them to go. Because the whole of them are want corruption and thief. The whole of them to go. Long time we are looking for this. But it's not as bad as we see, you know, because guess what? Mr. Information, they're not moving out of the cabinet or out from, from, from Information Ministry. They're only moving from the JLP PR committee. They're moving, moving totally. No, they're not moving totally. Where totally. get that from? What if you go? We don't want him to be in that party. If you come out totally. Oh, you want him to go totally? You want him to left life. totally? Yeah, man. They tell too much. Don't tell too much lie, man. So what's the one? What's the one left? <laughs> Nigel Clark, Christopher Tufton. I hear you. You say no one seven left. You know one Devon and seven left. Oh, you mean they, 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 are 
I'm first to come out. But me ask her why you only tell me to. Me only remember some me ask her who, who you want to come out in and you only tell me say Nigel Clark and Christopher Tufton. The Prime Minister and wife, Nigel Clark, I'm the one from Antigua Bay, the whole of them figure. I hear my sister. I ah, hear. Yeah. So, so you have anything to say to Jamaican people before you go? Anything you have anything to say in the closing argument? I'm on the PNP. They do just, I know they just push out the work. Yes. When them say put out yes, the work, what do you mean? What do you mean when they when they say they must put out the work? What do, what do you mean? Come out of the comfort zone. Yes. Yeah, and do the work. Do the work that the people want for the country. Yes. All right, my sister. I hear you loud and clear. Big up yourself and thanks for calling. I appreciate you calling. All right? I listen to you every day, every night, every night. When I come off on your program, brother. I like you love a topic. Well, if you want me to laugh at night time, brother. You want me to laugh. Well, I saw it go. I'm glad you're laughing, man. I'm not, glad you're laughing. I'm not sleep. Wait, so you're not sleep. Not one night to your program. No, man, not one night to your program. No, miss me, man. They say you have to stay up and listen to your hot topic. Yes, man, I have to listen to you. You have to learn a lot. Well, I saw it go. I saw it go. You come over here to learn and get excitement, entertainment, everything. But pick yes, up yourself. Information, everything. We get everything from off of your program. All right, I'm glad you get it, my friend. Big up yourself and thanks for calling, all right? You're most welcome. Blessings to you. Yes, my viewers and subscribers, I'm a guest. It's supposed to be here from 9 o'clock. I call my guest. I'm not getting through. I don't know if my guest is on the way home or what. I wait for hear from my guest students. So I want to just go and keep the conversation flowing. For all who are telling me, say, 9 o'clock, 9 o'clock, I am waiting to hear from my guest. Once I hear from the guest, the excitement starts. Shirley Muirhead, good night to you. Blessings to you, Shirley, Shirley Muirhead. Good night to you. Head boy, head boy, somebody type head boy in the comments. Head boy, students, we are going to talk about the water crisis. We are going to be speaking about the water crisis. All right, well, I'm a viewers and subscribers. I have something when I want to read here. Yeah? So, what I'm going to read this. What well, on the, what 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 on the. Listen to this uh, comment to them. I'm going to read out one comment to somebody. Send me. Listen to the comment. The person said, a pleasant a text message somebody sent me. The person said, a pleasant good evening, Jamaica. A topic. I've listened to most of your videos. Hearing you bashing JLP in every way you can. And of course, others are joining you in what you say. I am not for any parties. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Yeah, you should say, I am not for any parties. Let me make that clear. Yeah, right. But the same energy you have to tear down JLP, the same energy you should have to call out the corruption and false of the PNP. Some of us, as Jamaicans, we hate, we are too unfair as we need to split justice. Jamaican people need to get rid of the same faces in both parties and put new people in. It's full time. We all stop talk about color and start fresh. Corruption and greed from both political parties. We both can agree to disagree. Well, my friend. You just said a while ago that you hear me bash the JLP. You hear me bash the JLP? Let me tell you why I bash the JLP. Who is making the decisions in the country, lady? Who is making decisions in the country? Who make the decision on tax? GCT. Who make, who much, who make the decision on how much money spent in health and education? It is the Jamaica Labour Party which makes the decision because their government... They are in government. And if they're in government and they're not doing what they're supposed to do, it is my duty to call them out. 
It is my duty to call him out. Somebody said Jacqueline Thomas sent me the text. Hey, hey. I don't think I Jacqueline. No, talk this to the talking student. You're saying that with the same energy, you hear me try to tear down JLP. I am not tearing down JLP. Remember that it is a political party and they must be open to criticism. Some of the very same things we criticize them about. We also come up with solutions and suggestions. And you know say, some of the solutions and suggestions where we make, them pick up the solutions. So if you hear me over here, my students, I just say, me I bring down JLP and other people are joining in. We're not bringing down the JLP. We're holding them to account. We are holding them to account, my friend. And them around the country, they decide how much GCT and everything. Large students, excitement. The guest said 10 minutes. The guest said 10 minutes, students, excitement. Lord Jesus. The guest said 10 minutes. The guest said 10 minutes. Well, on there. Okay, okay. Well, on there. Well, on there. Well, I'm a viewers and subscribers. I'm talking to the guests. Breaking news, my viewers and subscribers. The guest is about to come in. In about 10 minutes, we're going to be having the guest. In about 10 minutes, we're going to be having the guest with all the explosions. Yes, my viewers and subscribers. But back to this lady. The lady that cussed me out, my viewers and subscribers. Are you, you know how many know say that they, they, politically assigned? She said, oh, I am not for any party. Here are, oh, I am not for any party. Lie, you tell my friend. Because the Labour Party not doing good for Jamaica. Them not doing good. Even the blind can see that, my friend. Me now go cuss you. Me now go be disrespectful because I love. But if PNP come in and the foolishness, me I go call him out too. My students know say if PNP come in and the foolishness, me I go call him out. But a JLP a lead. Talk about the man who is the leader. Him can declare him statutory declaration. Six members are in party under investigation for illicit enrichment. You know what illicit enrichment mean? Them get rich and them can't say how oh, them get it. Them are rob up taxpayers' money. The education ministry are go down. The health sector in a crisis. Security in a crisis. And you have a problem if me talk about that? No, lady. You're not going good. I'm good night. I'm just coming home. I just reached home. Well, on there, student, you cannot send me any, your student, I am on the live, call me, you can't send me no voice note now, I'm on the live, if you want to talk, call me up on the live, I don't know you hear me in the background, call me, my sister, if you want to talk, alright, yes, my viewers and subscribers, I want you to call me and tell me, do you think that as somebody, tell that lady there, do you think as somebody from the JLP, tell that lady there for, for message me, my viewers and subscribers, who do you think as somebody, and as I talk about that, we are going to talk about the water issue, my viewers and subscribers. We're going to talk about water. Water is life. But apparently some people plan to get rich off of water. Students, this person who is texting me, please stop texting me and call the man. Just, just cool, 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 calm down the man. Yeah, text me now. Yeah, you're not. Yeah, you, where you record my phone? You have the number. Call the man. Jesus Christ, students. Me then I make like class, man. You can't disturb my mentality. If you do have nothing important for say, call the program. Me tell yourself for call you, I send me one whole heap of voice record. Just talk to me, man. Somebody said, tell the dunce lady. Lady, everybody I call your dunce. Everybody I call your dunce lady. Somebody said, that person get paid to send you the text. Sister, let me make it clear, JLP never pay me a dollar yet. PNP was and never pay me a dollar. You know who pay me? My students, them in here. When you see me put up the cash up and the zell, one of my moderators, shining star or calligraphy are in a circle or one. I want to put up my cash up and the zell for me. When me ask my students, them in here for send me one twenty dollar, I want ten dollar. A them pay me. Not even YouTuber pay me from the night election. YouTube say, me do something wrong or whatever. And YouTube suspend me for 90 days. 20 years. 90 days YouTube say, no money for you. You don't make no money off of the video. You don't make no money off of nothing. And my moderators, them as class, as students in here, 
send me twenty dollar and ten dollar and fifty dollar when the Lord bless them. So me not carry no PNP agenda now. No, me not carry the Jamaican agenda. And we have two parties that run the country, PNP and JLP. And if JLP are wicked, we have to get them out and put in PNP. If JLP are wicked, we have to get them out and, and, and put them in as PNP. Students, when you call me there, remember the phone lines are home, students. When you call and keep the discussion going till, till my guests come on. Call and keep the discussion going before my viewers and subscribers. I want two more people to call me. Please call me and get the discussion because the, 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 the guest is going to come on. The guest is going to come out with the revelation. Kali said 10 minutes to Jamaica a topic on PDTV dropping a revelation. Yes. When you call me students, call me. Well, I me see what I have to talk to us about students. You know what I'm with teacher there. When you call me students, the phone lines are open. When you want on a second student. Well, on a second, my students, remember to hit the like button. We're getting into the excitement, student. We're about to get into the excitement. Well, on a second, student, I think we're supposed to have that document over here. So, students, we're going to be talking about water. I want everybody to type water. The people want water. The people want water. Jamaica want water. We will we say water. 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 The people want water. No. Prime Minister Devon. Prime Minister Devon is telling us. That I put something. Lord Jesus. Students. Students. Well, I'm make a play one PNP song. Lord Jesus. Junior. Well, on the junior. All right, let me take one call. The students, the guest is waiting. The guest is waiting. Students, the guest is waiting. Well, on a second. The guest is waiting, my viewers and subscribers. Well, on my viewers and subscribers. Yes, brother junior, welcome to the program. You're live on the air, brother junior. Listen to me now, junior. You're going to have two and a half minutes to make your point. Let me tell you why. You called as I, as I have the guest about to make the grand debut, the big revelation. But I want to hear from you. So please make two minutes and give an opening argument. Or take, yeah, two minutes and give an opening argument. Two to three minutes. And then after you, I'll bring on the guest. And then possibly you could call back afterwards. Yes, Junior. Good. Um... So what did just come out a while ago just said they are, they are not aligned to either one or the two parties. Yes. But we know in Jamaica everybody have a complexion. They either green or orange. Yes. And just like how the gentleman called her earlier to say it's a good little party before. Yes. And he has made changes. Yes. That's good. Nothing yes. is wrong with that. What this term is when we put talking to somebody and they pretend that they are not green, you know them green. Because orange people don't pretend who they are. True. They tell you plain and straight, I'm orange. Yes. Orange people, people uh, support the orange party. Yes. They will tell you clearly and categorically that they are orange. But people are, that are green have a propensity to deceive. Yes. They, they like to pretend that they are not green. But well, you know, look okay, here, I don't have a problem with somebody with them green or them orange, you know. Because remember, you know, you have to learn to agree, to disagree, agreeably. Yes, true. So, if you understand that, that is the, the, the notion. You can work with it. Yes. Anyway, the, the party, the little party is imploding. Yes. Right word, imploding. Imploding, slowly but surely. Yes. So... I went to go back in my little corner and wait to hear the explosion. That's why I'm about to hear tonight. Well, all right. Well, all right. Get ready for the explosion but, because the explosion is coming. Yeah, well, I have my guests waiting all right. and I'm about to be bringing on my guests. Well, on them. Blessings to you, Junior. Thank you for calling. Yeah, man. No problem. No problem. All right, students. Please hit the like button. I'm about to bring on the guest. I am about to bring on the guest, students. Please hit the like button. Let me play one music before I bring on the guest. Let me play a music before I bring on the guest. Hold on. Step up and wave your rock. Step up, PNP, we don't come to play. 
Step up to a far a better day. Step up, step up, come out to vote. Make sure you're on the winning boat. Step up, step up, vote PMP. Progress to Jamaica, progress to we. Students, hit the like button, hit the like button, and send up some colors in the comments. Our guest is waiting, and I'm going to be getting the guest on. It is time for the revelation. You've all been waiting for it, and the time is now. Students, what is causing the water crisis in Jamaica? What is happening in the water sector where we can't get water? What plans does the government have in place? What is the government hiding? What kind of secret contract is going on with the government? Why can't the people at Jamaica get water? Why can't the people get water? Well, tonight, my viewers and subscribers, we're going to be bringing some things to your attention. We are going to be bringing some things to your attention. Students, let me play the song and I'm going to be getting on my guest right now. All right? One moment. <laughs> Stepping it together, making it right As our economy starts to see the light Step up, step up with love and caring Step up, step up with hope and sharing Step up, step up with Sister P Step up with progress for you and me Yes, 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 uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Don't come to place. Step up to a far a better day. Step up, step up, come out to vote. Make sure you're on the winning boat. Step up, step up, vote the MP. Progress to Jamaica, progress to win. The students hit the like button for me please hit the like button we're getting the caller online we're getting the guests online and we're about to drop the bombshell revelation and you know that it is something that you want to stay in tune for because when this guest comes he's going to come ready and strong and the guest is going to come with credible facts so students while i i, I get the guests and pull everything together just listen to this song one moment all right bear with me while i put it together students please hit the like button and get ready with your popcorns in your hand okay listen to this hold on a second Hold on, students. Hold on one minute. All right. Listen to this music while I do what I'm doing.
Try connect, we'll try connect. May I try get in touch with Andre Stevens? Hold on a second. Hello, 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 hello. Hello, hello, hello. All right, me wanna may I put your part here now? May I put your part here in three, two, one. You're live on the air. Good night, good night, good night, good night to you, sir. How are you, sir? How are you doing? I am good. I want I want to tell you that that song, don't stop the progress, log on to the future. Yeah, is still relevant yes. than ever before. Yes. Because we need to log on to the future. Yes. Because what we have, what we have now in terms of governance is the past. Yeah. Yes. Is the past, and we have, we know we have, um, U C D, unconstitutional Devon. Unconstitutional. Yeah. So that's a new name for him. UCD Unconstitutional Devon. That's his, mid, that's his first and middle and last name, man. Yes. If you see a man have five time him, imagine this, you know, five time him go court. Yes. And he, lo- and he lose. Five time he go court and he lose, you know. So five time him go court and him try to breach the constitution each time. Mm-hmm. Wow. Wow. So well, what I meant, yes. Yes. So greet the students, said boy, greet everybody, cause everybody greeting you, and they wishing you Good well night. and all kind of something. Greet the students there. Good night. Let me let me greet our moderators firstly. I know there's a lot of them, so I know calligraphy, sister Pat, um, Ed, our head girl of course, mm-hmm. um, brother Conroy who is, who is grieving at this moment. I extend condolences again to you, my friend and brother. Right. Um. All of our class prefect, I mean, all of our students, I greet you well. I greet you well. Because even though it's a serious moment, I want to thank you for the for the level of connection that we have created. This is a family, I say, you know, I don't know about nobody, you know. But if you hurt, I am feeling your pain. And if you are in, if you are happy, I am feeling your joy. Yes. That's how much we have connected on this program. And I want to thank the professor and teacher of this program to make a, a topic for how we have been able to connect as a family. We might be various places across the world, yes. but this program has connected us. Yeah, And I want to thank you for that, sir. All right, hold on a second there. Oh, my, Ed boy, hold on a second. Damn, 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 damn. Hold on a second. Andre just called me back on this number, not the pen I draw number. All right, hold on a second. Say, Andre, call me upon this line. Hold on a second, head boy. Head boy? No, this is Andre Stevens. All right, yes, head boy. Yes, Andre Stevens. Good night, from good night, partner. Draw. This is Jamaica. Hot topic with my guests in studio. Good night, Andre Stevens, Jamaica and the world. How are you doing tonight? Well, well, what, what, what is the development? All right, now I have my guest on the line and... Uh, I greet your audience, your audience and everybody. Now, it is in regards to something that is happening with regarding the water. You realize that Jamaica is being plagued with a water crisis? Yes, what's happening with the water crisis? Well, my guest is on the line. I'm going to allow my guest to inform you about some plans because sooner or later, there are plans afoot that the, the, the water treatment and the water system and water commission will be privatized. And sooner or later, 600,000 Jamaicans or more will be paying water to private people and all sorts of something. So my guest is here to give you the rundown of that. Good night, my guest, head boy. Welcome to the program. Good That's night, head boy. That's a surprise. I spoke about it. Mm-hmm. Give us the details. To our host and our professor, who we are very loyal to, Professor Andre Stevens, the greatest debater ever lived in Jamaica. Yes. Mm. So, so let me quickly jump to it, Professor. What is apparent is that there is a contract, and it is real. There is a contract between a company called Rear Cobre Water. Yes? Now, mm-hmm. this company, let me give it a proper name. It's called 
Rio Cobra Water Limited. Yes? Mm -hmm. And this this company's aim is to so they are doing a project in the Rio Cobra area. And you know that is the St. Catherine area. And yes, the Prime Minister launched it recently. Mm -hmm. Right. They're using that water to supply the parishes of Kingston and St. Andrew and St. Thomas. Now, in the agreement for that contract, what we see mm -hmm. is that the first of all, they obtained their funding from the IDB. And you know what the IDB means, the International Development Bank. Now, yes. the, they received the funding to the tune of $30 million. Now, what... $30 what million US. Water, and we're talking about US, right? $30 million US yes, dollars. $30 million. Ed boy, the people them mm. they must turn up your volume. Turn up your volume. Talk a little right. bit louder. So 30, 30 million US dollars. dollars. Right. 30 million US dollars. So Rio Cobra Water mm -hmm. Limited entered into a contract with the, with the government of Jamaica through their principal entity called Rio, called, um, let me give you the right name. Let me give you the actual name. But I spoke about this already, you know. Called Vinci, Vinci Construction. Yes? Vinci mm -hmm. Construction. So Vinci Construction is the principal operator of Rio Cobre Water Limited. What Rio Cobre Water Limited is supposed to do, they entered into a $30 million, a $12 million, $12 million US dollar contract with the government of Jamaica. And what they're supposed uh -huh. to do through this country contract is that they are supposed to develop the Rio Cobra water supply treatment plant and they're going to use that water to supply Kingston and St. Andrew, Portmore um, and St. Thomas and what they will do mm -hmm. is they will have over 600,000 customers and they will have a contract lasting for over 23 years and with an extension mm -hmm. of 5 years which would almost bring it close to the 30 years which most agreements would be negotiated at now, mm -hmm. my concern about this contract, Professor, is that the public was never informed. And what really is also ironical about this contract, why is the government of Jamaica supporting this private company that has been led by Vinci Construction, who, by the way, they're very good at what they do. We're not here to, to disrespect anybody. These are professionals. But we're saying, why mm. wouldn't the National Water Commission and the National, or the National Irrigation Commission act as the principal owners of the project and then Vinci Construction come in as the technical experts? Mm. And then what would happen? It would put the Water Commission in prime position to actually go back into the scale of earning. Yeah. So what you're telling us about the address, what address is this company? Because this is a private company, right? You're saying that this Vinci is a private company. What is the address of this of of this country, of this company, okay. sir? So, so under the OUR, you know, in order to, to become a utilities company, where they're doing sewage, light, water, you have to mm -hmm. get regulation from the OUR. Their application to the OUR, which occurred which occurred during the, the period of 2023, um, of February 20, 2023. Their address, their list mm -hmm. was NWC Constant Spring Water Treatment Plant, Long Lane, Kingston 9. And that sounds like a upper Stony Hill. Oh. Yeah? So what you, what you getting at about the address? I am saying, how could this private company be registered, its registered address be at a NWC treatment facility? How could it's it be? Company, you know? He's saying that their address, the company's, a private company's address, is the same address registered as the NWC treatment plant out at Upstone Hill. So we are trying to find out why is it that a private company is registered in the same address as the water treatment company? Don't you see that as a conflict of interest, Andre? If a company go and register a company, it must have a business address. 
So are you telling me that the business address of this company, which far, which, 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 which in a contract with the government, the same address is listed as the water treatment location? Something look fishy about that, Andre. Could it be that is a shell company and I cover them, I cover up some for push some money through it? I want you to think about it. Why is it that the company address is registered at the National Water Commission treatment plant and is a private company? Interesting. Yes. So I want you to press because I know you have people left, right and sent. I want you to press on the matter and dig deeper because we're trying to find out what is the relation between the people from the company. The company name is Vince. Let I just so the company's name is Vinci Construction. Yes, they're the principal right? operators of Rio Cobra Water um, Company Lim Water Limited. Rio Cobra Water Limited. Yeah. And you said they, they are the Rio Cobra Water Limited. Yes. And you see, when you research Rio Cobra Water Limited and the Vinci Construction, you're seeing the address to be up by Stony Hill at the water. Commission? Yes, because that is their application to the OUR. So I'm referring, I can actually send the application to you where they, remember the OUR has to publish companies who apply for um, utilities. Um, so your utilities argument is that this could be a shell company created? No, I would not take that, that, that stance because I'm very guarded as to this. Because it is declared that Vinci Construction owns Rio Cobra Limited. There's no, there's no anim animality where that is concerned. There's no mystery where that mm -hmm. is concerned. My concern, Professor, is that why is it that this deal is being done in such a way that the general public is not aware that a private company would be operating our water distribution channel for the next 25, 28 years? when we could have done the same through National Irrigation or the Water Commission. Because what the government of Jamaica did is that they backed this application by Vinci Construction, who is Rio Cobra Water Limited, to the IDB for 30, 30 million US dollars. We could have had that, for, that money could have been backed by, we could have backed that. Yeah, so I'm saying, who are the principal operators of this company? There's only one man me see as the principal operator. Well, I've just done my, I've just done my research quickly, and Vinci Construction is at Long Lane Post Office, 1481 Constance Spring Road. So is that yeah. where the Stony Hill operation is? That is where the, that is where the plant is. So when you come up on Stony Hill Road after you pass Stillwell Road, mm. Yeah? Uh -huh. And you come up, come up. Remember, you have the first water commission treatment plant and meet you there, so you know. Yeah? Where Between where, where, where Orange Grove be, right at the cross road of paper, still well road coming up. Right? So, that is an NWC facility. So, how it is that this private company, right? Even, mm -hmm. let, me, let me be clear now. They have a relationship with NWC. In the fact that they are, they have entered into a private arrangement with the NWC. So no one is denying the relationship they, they have. But I'm saying, how could they well, probably what is, probably what is the case is that they have an office on the compound of the NWC. Could that be the case? Well, if that's the case, no one is. Uh, I am not arguing about that, teacher. What I'm saying is that it is quite ironical, it is quite weird that a private company, right, of this nature, because we're talking about Vinci Construction, they're a worldwide company. They have operated in many countries, and so I'm not degrading what they have done over the years, but I'm saying, why is it that there is such a close relationship between this private entity called Rio Cobra Water? Remember, Rio Cobra Water Limited is different from Vinci Construction. Yeah? yeah? Even though... All right, so I think I'm looking look into this more. Well, all right. Teacher, I'm looking at it. Teacher, I'm looking at it, and then we discuss it. Anything in fine, right. you can bring it but, further but, to him. Quickly, teacher. All what right. I would say, what I would say, it worries me that 600,000 Jamaicans will be paying for water from the Rio Cobra 
for the next 23 to 28 years without any explanation from the government as to what is the arrangement between these private companies. It needs to be known. This is a private entity entering arrangement with the government of Jamaica, which is to con We have never had a private entity in involved in water distribution throughout, throughout Jamaica like that, you know. Mm. Yeah? All right, well, so we're looking well, into it. Go on, check into it. Looking. Go on, check into it, teacher. All and right. then you can discuss God it. God bless right? you. Yes. God bless you. Yes. yes. Mm. God bless you, my and all the best, yes, yes. yes, Andre. Yes, yes, uh, Ed Boy, you're still here on the, on the live. So yes. it is that is something very concerning, very, very, very concerning. And I, and I think, and I think, peep, I'm not laying any blame and I'm not casting any aspersion because I'm saying nothing is wrong with these. These are these are professional people, you know. Yes, yeah. And I, I give you, you know, I spoke to you privately and I've said these are professional people, there's nothing ill will towards their profession. I have nothing bad to say about them, but I'm saying what is scary is you are entering into a private arrangement where water is concerned. Yes. And you have not declared this to the public properly. You have had not you have not had consultations between the parishes of uh, well Portmore is not really a parish, but Portmore, um St Andrew and Kingston and St Thomas. You have not had no discussion with the residents about this. Yes. They will have they will have to pay to this private company. Remember, no NWC is owned by the government. Will this private company operate in a, in a, in a manner where if you not pay a bill this week, this month, them cut it off? Yeah, because they're now taking the water out of the hands of the state and putting it somewhere else in a private company. And they need to stop privatize and sell out all of the things, them. Because guess what? They are, and I believe, it is my firm belief that they are deliberately creating this water chaos and a little bit from this they're going to say that they're going to privatize it and to put it into somebody else who can run it more efficiently let, that is what i believe let me tell you i have spoken to friends in south africa right right now the students will know when i speak to you i educate you right now there's an election happening in south africa and i have friends in south africa yes in south africa south africa is suffering the same thing jamaica suffered in the 90s load shedding Yes. I mean, every minute the light go on, come, go on, come, go on, come. You might have electricity for six hours of the day, and then you might not have it for the, for, for, for the remaining, right? Yes. The remaining of the 24 hours. But what you see happening in Jamaica is, as I've said to you before, is a manufactured water crisis. Yes. Jamaica does not have an issue with water. What we have is a water distribution problem. And any engineer, any person who is sensible can tell you that yes. the Black River is the largest body of water in the English-speaking Caribbean. So how is it that St. Elizabeth, Southern, and, and Northern is out of water? Yes. Yeah? It, it is, we have a water distribution problem. When we in fall from the Northern Belt between Alan, Bamboo, Malvern, the problem, water, water rise up high. But on the Southern Belt, it's always dry. Yes. So I'm saying we, we, we don't have a water issue per se. What we have is a water distribution problem and a management of the, our water resources. Basil Fernandez, who's one of the greatest geologists, water geologists, marine geologists in the country who understands water, right? He, he said this. He said what we are seeing in Jamaica is because we have not allowed the backside companies to go on up into the cockpit country. Yes. They're they're going to where our aquifers are. Remember, you know, Jamaica doesn't necessarily um, like other countries where they drill deep for aquifers. Jamaica typically rely heavily upon surface water. Yes. Yeah? On the, our surface of Jamaica, we have at least 60 to 70% water that is able to supply the entire country and also lead to export. This is a report from, from the Water Resources Authority of Jamaica. Yes. Yeah? So... So we have, we have not even touched our aquifers, but if we're going to allow mining in the cockpit country, we're going to go into your natural aquifers. And people, yeah. and people for the longest while have been concerned about the same mining because we're not getting any benefit from it. There's no benefit being derived from it by yes, the people. Let me help you. Let me help you. Michael Manley, when he became, and 
I want to pick up a student. What is the name of that student that always calls you the, the gentleman that is visually impaired? I don't use the word junior. visually impaired. Junior. Junior. Yes. Junior spoke to a lot of these issues that Michael Manley addressed in the 70s. Yes. So one of the problems we had in the 70s, yes, yes. was an issue of, of we had the same water issue. Yes. Right? And, and what, what Michael Manley did was that he pushed heavily for what we call or the micro dams. Yes. So the micro dams were supposed to act similar to like how we have the Hope, the Hope River um, treatment, but the Hermitage Dam and the Mona Dam. Yes. Right? Those dams were going to be smaller dams, but they would be able, they would be in the capacity where they could support the community and support also activities relating to farming. Yes. Yeah? Edward Philip George Siaga in 1980 came and he removed all of that program. Yes. Yeah? Let me help you. In 2012, when Portia Simpson Miller was Prime Minister, um, Bobby Pickers Gill was Minister of Water and Environment Change and Climate Change. Then you then they appointed Ian Hill as his junior minister. There was a water plan draft draft up, and I think I shared this with you too. For the entire length and breadth of Jamaica, by 20, 2016, when the Jamaica Labour Party won, right, they campaigned on a promise of giving water to the people of Saint Elizabeth. Let me remind people: Clarendon, yeah, yes, Saint Thomas, Saint Mary, and Portland. To this day, and even in parts of the West as well, to this day. They have not delivered on that promise. A matter of fact, what they have set up is water shop. So what they have done, they are trucking water, which is their own trucks, by the way. Let them take me to court. Many of them own the truck. I'm not saying the government wants the truck. I'm saying there are many persons aligned to them who own these trucks. Yes. Right? They have, so what they have done, that's why I keep on talking about the manufactured water crisis. They have, instead of investing in the facilities to boost the water supply, Yes. Enhance the water supply. They have invested heavily in trucking water, which then goes back to their friends and connected few. Yes. So we don't have a pro Michael Manley address this. Michael Manley took it on. Michael Manley, in terms of the backside companies as well, because I know we we're speaking to the backside companies. Michael Manley in the in the seventies was the only prime minister said to the backside companies, "You can't operate this way. You yes. have to give us a levy." You got to give us a levy. Look I remember that. that he took over the levy. I remember he put a levy on it, and that was where the problem he, started coming. He formed a union. Michael Manley formed a union of nations yes. called the Backside Union, the Industrial Union for Backside International Aid. So countries who were Backside producing countries were part of this union. Yes. And they would then lobby to ensure that the levy was in place. The environmental practices were in keeping, right? So a lot of the dig out whole them and this way you see operating throughout the country should not have been there because it was a part of an arrangement that said you want your mine, you must recover where your mine. Yes. Yeah? Even if you're not fully covered, it, at least attempt to cover a certain amount so that at least the farmers can go back there and plant. Yeah? So when you really look look at the the, the JLP, what they have done is that they removed the backside levy and much to, to my dismay, my good friend from St. Mary, yes. uh, Brother Montague, remove the levy, saying that the companies can't afford to pay the levy and this and that, and they're going to go to a profit sharing. Now, which company are going to declare so they make a profit? And so that you can get tax from it. That they're is going true. That, they make a profit? that is no. true. The backside levy. And truly and truly, when you look at what we earn from it, and I think I am not in the position to explain it because there's this gentleman that always comes on Ratican. Um, he's, he's, from, he's formerly from the UK, but he lives here. I think his, John, his, his name is John. Yes, yes, I know who you're speaking, talking, yes. Speaking about the, the issues surrounding Bauxite, and I think one of these nights, teachers and students, we need to bring him here so that he can explain to us yes. exactly what we are getting for it. And when you look at where you get through the backside, you, you really drop down here and say, boy, but we now make no from it. Yes. So it is not profitable in the arrangement that it is now because they have moved from the levy to profit sharing. Yeah? 
and it is destroying the environment and I, and as a son of a strong maroon family yes. I want to say I, I stand with the people of the cockpit country I stand with my my, my generational families in the cockpit country from Flagstaff all the way into a compound in St. Elizabeth and then back down into Trelawney. Yeah? We stand with you and into St. And we stand with you because we know that it is our right. The Coptic country was given to, to the Maroons as a part of treaty. Yes. That was a settlement. And to, to look at what the government is attempting to do to go into there. Um, to mine, and they have started doing so at the base between St. Anne and Trelawney. It is very disrespectful. Yes. Yeah? It is very, because Baxa, we now nah make nothing from me. Let me just repeat it. We now nah make nothing from me. Yeah? All of our resources have been mined. The final product is where the price is. We have never been able to negotiate. It's the same like coffee. Yes. It's the same like coffee. We have never been able <clears throat> to negotiate a proper price to include <clears throat> us getting the final product price. Yes. Yeah? So we, we have to move away from these things. But in relation, and I don't want to stray, but in relation to this real cover water limited matter, yes. I want to assure the students I have never misled you. I have never been one to be hasty in my speech. I want to assure you that I am as as clear as there is a tomorrow and as clear as there was yesterday that this Rio Cobra Water Limited company smells of a very strong, small, foul odor of some deep-seated corruption. Yes. I didn't say the, I didn't say the company is corrupt, but I said it smells of some deep-seated, rooted corruption. And let me explain to the students here. In 2008, the Minister of Water then was not known, is not the Deputy Prime Minister, because the Deputy Prime Minister was never Deputy Prime Minister, it was Ken Ball who was Deputy Prime Minister. But he was then, that is Sleepy Chang, yes. he was now Minister of Water yeah, in 2008. He met with the farmers of Clarendon. Yes, that is why, why I thank God for my little memory on a professor. Yeah? Mm-hmm. So he met with the farmers of Teak Pen, which is between, you can take a place called Pleasant Valley between Bokna, yeah, and the racetrack. But the racetrack is the bet- better place to go. Yes. In, in Maypen, Clarendon. Yes. And you will end up into Teak Pen, property, property Pleasant Valley Teak Pen. Now he made a pledge to these farmers that what would happen, they would tap into the water that is abundant up there, by the way. And he would then send a portion of that into Ola Harbor, at least 70%, and the rest would remain to distribute between the farmers. Now, another angle that he looked at when he spoke at that meeting was he spoke about real cobre. He said that the real cobre has an, ev- an everlasting supply because five parishes dump out into the real cobre. Yeah? Yes. Remember that St. Catherine dump into the Rio Cobre, St. Mary, Clarendon, Kingston, and yes. St. Andrew. So that's five parishes that is the largest body of dumping in any water in the, in the island. Yeah? So he spoke to that. When he when he demitted office after the, the loss of the election, there was not much touting on the Rio Cobre. We had a serious water crisis, but what was happening? We were developing a water plant. Um, Ian Niels was very critical in the de- world, very instrumental, I mean, in developing that water plan. And I am glad to see Ian Niels is around now, because Bobby Pickers is not around, but at least you have somebody who understood then what needs to be done now. Yes. Yeah? Um, now, when, when, when the water plan was being developed, they looked at various aspects of the water plan. But when you really look at the whole whole um, structure of this and the whole deal you realize that it is an attempt to circumvent the master water plan for Jamaica so they read the plan and instead of implementing the plan they were going to meet with a private company 
It's yeah. a big time sellout, even with water. And as sooner or later, I don't want people think it's a joke thing, you know. Sooner or later, we not go have no water, you know. Or sooner or later, we have to go pay how much money. Them can't raise it as them want or do whatever them want. Them for stop sell out the government agencies, especially the utility companies. But remember, you know, the true minister of finance who I have absolutely no regard for, and let me tell you why, he was somebody who I respected, you know. I felt that he was a very intelligent guy, a guy who went to Oxford. I myself, would, I don't think I'd ever had the opportunity to attend Oxford. And so I must give him credit for his knowledge and for his ability to study. But then we really, you know, like when you, you want to peel onion, yeah? And then you go get to the second layer and then you realize, say, boy, but not really under this. Yeah? Yes. This, this is the Minister of Finance. He has no depth to him. He has no real understanding about to govern the finances of Jamaica. And when you look at it, it really smells of a guy who who pretends to know but really doesn't know yes yeah because if he did know we would not have been going back to parliament a week ago to correct the mistakes he made three weeks ago yeah i so agree with you when you when you really look at this entire administration what you see is 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 ministers members of administration who really don't know what they're about and who really are into the business of, um, as Bujubantan say, uh, engaging Jamaica for sale. Yes. Yeah? And this water project is a form of Jamaica for sale because why I say it is the IDB is an international monetary lending agency. Let me repeat it to, to our students and it's a, it's a multilateral agency. Multilateral means it operates within many nations. Yes. Yeah? A part of a treaty. In order for this company to access the IDB and get this private placement loan, it means the government of Jamaica had to back the loan. So it means, say, Matthew Samuda, and I'm not afraid in calling names because he's the minister who endorsed the loan. The record yes. is there to show. Yes. Yeah? So we want to ask the question, why would Minister Samuda, in his judgment, we don't know what making him make the decision there, we're not saying he did anything wrong. We're asking what would cause him to make a decision like this. Yeah? But be, the reason why we ask them question is because there's not been any consultation. If there was consultation around this, you know, you and I would not have been on our dear professor's program, partner draw talking about this water issue. Yes. Yeah? If there was consultation, we would never be talking about this. That is right. And we have to one. shed some light on it. Because anything that we see is not good. If we shed light on it, we can't stop it from early. But when all kind of things don't happen and it gets worse, there's nothing that can be done. So there has to be some so, some, so, some kind of, of light shed on the matter. That it has to be called. In, you know, we have to call it up and bring it, and bring it in, in, into question. And therein lies the problem. Therein lies the problem. Yes. Because there is no light shed on this matter. And as I'm saying, I'm not accusing anybody. I'm not accusing this company of any nefarious activity. I am saying, and I want the principal owners of this company not to be offended by this program. This program is not here to call you out. That's not our job. Our job is to say that the administration of the day who engage with you in a contract should in fact have a public dialogue so therefore we would not have been having this conversation. Yes. Simple. So people think that we don't have any ill will or malice. As a matter of fact, Matthew, I'm a friend. Same way like how me and um, Anil, you call him Comrade Delano. Or yes. Same way like how me and Delano see him right there, friends. Because they're all in the G2K. Yes. I was a member of the PNBYO. Um, we, we lived good. We never had any ill will or malice towards each other. And I'm not... In insinuating that there's anything bad on the part of Minister Samuda. Yes. But I'm saying, my friend and brother, there's, there's, there's ways and there's proper ways of doing things. And the proper way of doing something is that you come to the public and you have a discourse around this. To this day, we have not had a discourse as to why the government of Jamaica entered into this agreement with this company. What merited it? What caused us to do it? Why couldn't National Irrigation do it? And why couldn't Water Commission do it? And if they couldn't do it, 
could we have created an own company to do that ourselves? Could we have created a real company water limited? Yeah, but that is for some that is very good that we as a government would do. A government who cares about the people. This is a government that care about the people. So what you expect? No, I want to I want and I think Professor had asked some pointed questions, some pointed questions. He asked he has to understand what is relation. No, remember this is a private this is a public partnership between the NWC and this company. So it means that the NWC it means that the private company don't totally own the project. Yeah? That's one. However, you know, <laughs> let me tell you something. Even though the private company don't totally own the project, one has to ask the question, um, why couldn't it be a total public project then? Yes. Yeah? Because if the government can find means of raising a portion of the revenue to supply to supply the private company, couldn't it have gone all in and then supply this? Because with all the teeth in, the red in a petrol jam, the teeth in a nestle, the thief in the Ministry of Education, the Mumbasa Grass, the Ministry of Health, um, Colonel Regional Program, meaning moving from 4 to 8 to 12 to then 21. Yeah? Yes. Yeah. With all the thief in, couldn't the government of Jamaica come up with five, with 4.5 to 6 to 5 billion to supply, to, to do this water project and then put water commission in a position to actually go back and earn into that the case? Yes, but they don't want to do that. They don't want to do that at all and that's why we need to find out who is getting the money. But I am using this opportunity to call upon the opposition for pay more attention to this. The data and camera, the opposition no. spokesperson. Uh, what was no, opposition data spokesperson for water? water? Data is not agriculture. I think it's here and here that water. So I will, you know, teacher, I, you and I will talk about this privately because I've been doing, you know, I've been doing my research on this. Yes. And so you will, you, you can be rest assured the opposition will be speaking about this um, because you know me. When I make noise, things move. Yes. And so, so because it hurts me. What why it hurts me is that this is a project that could be beneficial to the Jamaican people. Right? This this is a project that I am not opposed to. I'm not opposed to the private partners being involved in it. What I'm opposed to is to me, because by the way, right? We have Yara Kingston and we have Yara St. Mary. Yes. Yeah? Two places. So I have my place in St. Mary and I have my place in a Kingston. So me now would be having to pay to this private company. Yeah? Me would have to pay. So I want to know why. What merits me not paying my water to my, my beloved water commission. And then we're yeah. now left at the mercy of these people. Just like all the toll people them can't raise them toll and oh you are not do nothing. JPS raise them yes. price and not do nothing. Them people can't raise I the water have... anytime and we can't do nothing about it. Exactly. Exactly, and I'm saying in the contract, what worries me is that it is issued as a 23-year contract. But I have looked at many contracts like this before. I'm not saying I'm no brilliant lawyer. I'm anybody who has worked any year or see contracts before. But I've seen contracts like this in the, in, the, in the sense of in, in the public domain. Yeah, and I have never seen a contract that issues to a company under 25 years. So there's also some nefarious activity at large because why would you issue 23 years but then give them five years extension? They go into company automatically will use the five years extension. Yes. Because they issue to them a 20 year or 30 year contract. But because they knew if a, under the law here in Jamaica, if a 30 year contract is issued, it requires a lot of pre, a lot of scrutiny. It also involves not just the OUR, but it would then have the auditor generals probe. Hello? Yes, and they're trying Hello? to fly below the radar. Okay. And this is something that the opposition needs to raise because then the auditor general needs to look at it and look at it. Why then is are we getting value for money? That's the role of the auditor general in us, yes. in simple terms. Uh, is the Jamaican people getting value for money? If they're not, if they're not getting none, that's so it be. But then whatever steps and remedy need to be take, I go take. Yes. Yeah? Simple. I agree with you. But as I said, the PNP will look into it and I want them to look into it and I'm calling the PNP to look into this matter to see the conflict of interest because this may be another worm that crawls out of the can which might turn into a long snake. But let us but move I on. Mm -hmm. 
your listeners who wanted to hear what happened at Belmont Road. Yes, we want to talk and about the Belmont Road. What happened at the JLP meeting today? Whilst, the big JLP excitement. To you, give me, if your listeners, could you play a track for me? Because you know your your head boy. I'm going to send a text message, which I was waiting on for a while. Because I told you today in a private discussion that I would have an update as to what happened. Yes. So let me send that text message. Play with some. I'm a dapper. Give me, I am requesting something. Give me forward Porsche. Because you know Porsche is my forever. Life. All right. And let me take a call. Yeah. Let me take a call in the meantime. Can I have a yes. call up on the line? Let yeah. me do that. All right. Let me have a call up on the line. Let me take a call and you just do what you have to do. Hold on a second. Hello, hold on a second. What want to my phone? My phone freeze up. Hold on a second, my viewers and subscribers. Why am I not get you? The person up on the line. Hello, hold on a second, sir. Hold on a second, my viewers and subscribers. I want to my WhatsApp. Hold on, students. Hold on a second. Yes, Carla, welcome to the program. You're live on Odd Topic. Welcome to the program, sir. Thank you, sir. Um, Odd Topic. Yes, sir. Um, I don't know. I from Friday last Friday. I'm just rejoicing. Yes. And I feel so good. And I hear everybody is calling and naming who and who, who they would like to go and who they would like to go. But two of the main person, I don't hear anybody mentioning them. Two of the snakes, the cobra snakes, which is Vaz in Portland and Roberts in Saint Thomas. So That's two dangerous guys what you say, sir? in the park. Yeah. Two dangerous guys. I don't know anybody calling, calling for them to leave. I'm thinking of them to leave. People don't understand who those two guys are. Huh? So you say, Mr. So so you say Mr. Vaz from Portland and Mr. Thomas. Yeah. What's name again? Roberts. Yeah. Roberts. Roberts. Robertson from Saint from Saint Thomas. Where say a two snake yes. them that two judgment them the massa? A two judgment them the man. A cobra snake them the man. Right, it cop. A two cobra them the man. The, the black cobra. You know the black cobra. The man say the most venomous one. Bite you one time Those and all twenty people dead. Eh? Yes, and, and you see that's why nobody don't know about them because you know snake is very cunning. Yes. And so still, they just come out and bat and go and just curl up back. And that's with those two guys. And because of that, nobody don't, don't know about them. Yes. Because they are of a near nature, two dangerous guys. You understand? I understand. Secondly, now, Paul Lewis, my God Almighty, why is celebrity like those allow themselves to be dragged in the dirt because of one big no ugly man in him and Jones? Why? I don't Why? know. I don't know hmm? because of reason of association or maybe him have some dirt panar. I don't know maybe him promise or something. But there had to be something in it also for her because she has somebody's a well learned lady. She should have known yes. that her extension would have been unconstitutional. And if she know it was unconstitutional, are you telling me that you're willing to push the constitution aside just uh, uh, in order to ensure that your tenure is extended? That means uh, if you are willing to brush the law aside as a public uh, prosecutor, you have no respect for the law. You should not be in the post, plain and simple. Yes. Okay, yet again, what about her natural moral behavior? What about that? She can't protect that. It is not wise to protect that. Huh? Well, Why should she be doing that and allow herself to be dragged in the gutter like that? You know, and I look at the song in the town and find the song again, you know, the play, you know. I don't even know a song named Yapiti Yak. <laughs> no, <laughs> what is that name? Yapiti Yak. Oh my God. It, 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 it. Pick up the paper, run the trash. Put out the dog and bring in the cat. Yapiti Yak, don't come back. Yes, yes, I you heard that you? one. I heard that one. Yapiti Yak, don't come back. In the easy, you know, my elder, you know, some long time tune, you know. Lord Jesus. <laughs> And that is that is the music that we're playing the parlor. For parlor. Now, let's go back now to, to the Mr. Sharpnick man. Yes. Mr. Sharpnick man. 
Now, you must know, so I will not help you realize. Now, Andrew Onis has been brought into power by that sharp neck man, Andre Stevens and Roda. Yes. Those were the three persons that undermine all of the shots so as to make um, Onis become leader and then become prime minister. Now, those three persons, Andre Stevens, you make a shot next Monday and order in, 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 in Monday. I remember Andre right? Stevens and said that they were mm -hmm. instrument. I remember Andre Stevens for two professors saying that he and Rhoda, the Rhoda and Amanda or whatever, was very instrumental in seeing that Andrew Oles win the election. I remember that for sure that because they were a part of his team. And the Shortneck one there. But the tables have turned. Right. Shortneck has lost right. the control. On, on, on the narrative, we are now the ones that put the control on the narrative. Me and you, when I come and I bring the facts to you, we control the narrative. Yes. When you talk, yes. we control the narrative. The Jamaica Labour Party is crumbling because guess what? There's yes. Spin Doctor, the man on your screen with the mic in his hand, yes. the man from Clarendon. Yes. He's no longer mm -hmm. able to put up any narrative and make them run with it. I hear it, boy, talk, talk it already. It's an input, drank up and push her head. And it's going make one mark yeah. for your or something. And guess what? We yeah. see them put him down as, uh, them say him resign as, as must be the lead for the JLP PR committee. We don't want that. We want him to resign as Minister of Information. That's what we're asking for. That's right. That's right. But, but listen, he is on the step now, and he's on the last thread of his step. So he's just one step out. Andrew Onis is going to finish him. Listen to me. It's not Andrew Onis I run the Jamaica Labour Party, you know. Andrew Onis' wife I run the Jamaica Labour Party, you know. What did, well, and they repeat what they just said to me, sir. What, what they just said to me, sir? I said it is not Andrew Onis running the Jamaica Labour Party. It is his wife running Jamaica Labour Party. So you are Just look at this now. So you said the Bigfoot oh, yeah. wife. You are said the Bigfoot wife around the country as she had the man in the relationship as she around Jamaica. Yes. Mighty yes. God. I can, I can bring you up here. Look when they wanted to steal the election in, 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 in the 26th of February. Who went to buy the old office? Who was, who was there? To, to overturn the whole situation. Who are there? See you, Bigfoot. Good. 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 You understand? Yes. So it's it just, it just that she did the order what she want to be done and this man just come out as a big... And you are the PR minister right now for the party, you know? Who? And you are the PR minister. PR minister. So what you say? You say Devon get a Devon get a, <laughs> you know easy you no know, me elder. You know easy. You have some weak talk in your mouth, you know. When you say Devon is now the PR, the PR person, the PR for the JLP. Yes. 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 You understand? And let me tell you another thing again. Although you see Andrew one is there. A two-year-old baby pushing right now in Japan. You know, he's as weak as a rat, physically and mentally. Remember me tell you that. And, and him going like him and bad, son. And him going like him bad and can't yeah, cuss yeah. way and make up him. You remember him make up him face and skin up him face after Mark Golding. You remember that look on him face when he favored the devil? And as, and as King King. Yes. Because like when you see some Mark on the other road and as a Mark on the other road, King 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 you're not easy, you know, man. You're not easy, you yeah, know. Man. Yeah, man. I'm not, we're talking about um, Lester Morgan. Yes. There is the only more. You laugh at boy. Yeah. Yes. Only more. At least, at least by tomorrow evening, we are going to hear two more. Two more? And you know who is going to be real? Yes. Which two? And you know who is going to be real? You know, who is going to be reinstated in, in, in a big position? Ooh. Miss Warmington. Where's a Miss Warmington? Miss Warmington. Miss Warmington. <laughs> Miss Warmington. <laughs> 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 She's going to reinstate. She's going to reinstate. Well, I know. Well, I know. Well, I know. Well, I know. Well
Where is Miss Swam Internet is going to resurface from under the water. She's now under the water in her cocoon. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And she's going to fly up like a mermaid. Mm -mm. With tall rice and tall tongue. Lord Jesus, where is it? Where is it? Warm internet is going to lift up out of the water like a mermaid and flash her tail and say, I'm a yeah. name one. So, so let me ask a question. So why is it that you believe that they can't let go warm internet? Why you think that they can't let go warm internet? Now listen to me, you know, there is, there is a set of youngsters in the party that they are untouchable. One, the security minister, that's one. A lie. Two, two, one in them. Hmm. Three, Mike Henry. So what? Yes, the pampas man, the pampas man. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> The one that sweet you. To have them cheapy yeah, places are untouchable. Those men are untouchable. They are untouchable. You know why? Tell me now. They are a part. They are a part of the dynamic and the gun trafficking and the, the money laundering and everything. They are a part of it. Mighty God. Now, I'm going, to, I'm going to bring another man to you what is a part of it. That man will do a, um, a picture job. Then him again, the MP friend on a center tree. Oh, 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 oh wheat, wheat house, the, the rice and the wheat. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mr. 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 Weekly. Yes. Let me just raise it. It's a part of the syndicate. And look at this now. When the, the, the explosion about the fraud done by Petrojan, do you remember how many months, months, and you take before Andrew say anything about weekly? Remember? I, to be honest, I never remember how long him take for tell. And I'm not going to say uh, yes. Uh, Where uh, say uh, Devon take a while for come uh, out and uh, come uh, say nothing about the Petrojan and weekly? I was three months, man. I get to get to get bad man. I said, what man? Peter to be too much to get bad and say, what? How the man can come out and say, nothing. So, let me ask a question. So, why you think, it, so why you think Devon did take so long for come out and talk about weekly? Why you think that now? Give me the reason why you think him take so long for come out come talk. Because he has to make sure him satisfy weekly. Yes. By either man or position, so as to make him keep him mouth shut. Hey, hey, say what? So what on there? Yes. So you say, so you say all that time when he was silent and everybody wanted to hear what he had to say about Wheatley. You heard saying that at that, that point in time they were doing some bargaining behind doors to give him a, a golden yeah. handshake. They were trying to appease him. Yeah. Is that what you're saying? Yeah. Yes, man. Mighty negotiation, man. Because Junior and Junior come back, man. Because Junior and Junior come back, Junior and Junior come back, Junior and Junior come back, Junior man. The man who is in a negotiation, a hard negotiation. But you But you know, sir, me here, and I think I'll Andre mention it to one time, sir, when Devon was running for the leadership of the party, he never had no money. He broke like dog. Broke. So when you hear them attack, say him come in a parliament with 47 million. I lie. Him hear say him broke like dog. Them never had no money right. for run the campaign. And me hear say, I must, it is alleged. Me hear say, it is alleged. Say, a weekly, Warmington, I must say, Shaini, put up their money. You hear me say? Shaini Robinson. Hold on, hold on, hold on, this sir. Hold on, this sir. Head boy is head boy is chipping in. Hold on a second. Head boy is chipping in. Go ahead, head boy. Cell is in fact true. When he ran for the presidential post, the business people within the party never supported him. Yes. So, so let me call out some of them. The party party man down at Clarendon. Yes. Hello. Hello. The the hardware family down at Clarendon never supported him. And these are prominent liberals. Most of the business people didn't go with him. 
it was it was Mrs. Warrington. Yes. Yeah? Sister Shahini. Yes. And the wheat and the tails shall gather. Yes. And by the way, another person by the name of the two color head man. That a that a child that 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 thousand year car and not a centre man. Thousand year car. Those four persons gave him financial donation. Yes. Everybody else was against him financially. Yes. And so 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 based on the fact that the wheat man and uh, you know, so based on the fact that the wheat man was very instrumental in funding his political career a uh, career then he then he owe him a big debt right there, so. But let me ask you a question. On between you and the elder that is on the line, head boy, I know I'm going to ask you a rhetorical question, but I want to hear what you have to say. I think I've, you and I have spoken about this, head boy. You know, think, say, the dollar greens where the weeds take out are misappropriated. Yes, yes, misappropriated. You don't think that Devon know about some of the money there. You don't think Devon know about some of the money. Because remember, I said, wheat, get put aside, you know, for Petra Jam business and money. You don't think Devon know and get some out of that Petra Jam money there. Remember, remember what wheat said. Remember what wheat said. Wheat said that loyalty. He said it in the Jamaica Cleaner a couple of months after his dismissal. That the price of loyalty has no real true meaning and value because he has always been loyal to this man and when his back was against the wall he was quick to dump him so wheat was part with the wheat and tears was pointing out to us that he was not happy with what happened to him yes but he was not remember you know, there was a sanction all of the funds between um Cruel reed wheat up Mombasa, all the things you see happened between that period. It was a sanction. It was sanctioned from the prince himself, the clerk's boss. Yes. Yeah? Because it was the funds they used to buy the 2020 election. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, a woolly papier's money pulled from the election, you know. It pulled from Petrojam. It pulled from Esmesmel. They pulled it. From <laughs> yes, well, after they gave them their donation in 2015, right? Yes. 2016, they were already, their books were not looking good. They were under review, so they couldn't let out any money. So they couldn't look to them 2020. People are mistaken what happened at SMSL. SMSL, the battle occurred during the period of 2014 to 2015 when then take out people money and issue to them money for a campaign. Yes. Mm -hmm. What a judgment. Medical proceed and I will cool out. Yes, Carla. Back to you now, my general. You were saying something about NHT was a part of it to my general. That's what you were saying? Of course. Of course. Of course. It was a part of it. And you're asking about if and you know get my money. Listen to me, man. We all of them Monday, they say, you know, man, they, we, we finance him in the time when he just entered, you know, man. It's an understanding, you know, that percentage must come back to the first prince of Bel Air, you know. Yes. Right? He has to get that percentage. You get what I mean? You know, so the man rise up fast to tell the man, okay, I'm come to a court in, in the coming with 47 million. And the man here want like a taxi, taxi thinking and he popped them and he, he, he could be paying student loan and all them sort Listen to me, Lord Jesus, huh? Wolande, 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 Hey boy, listen to this, uh, sir, listen to this, sir. Uh. I get a number of calls from students on a daily basis, call and message. Some are said, teacher, some are call me. I watch the re some I watch the repeat program and calling me still think that the program live. You understand? Some I call me, I tell me say the program was good. Some I send me new information. Some I check for me for see if me all right. Some I do all sort of something. A gentleman called me the other day and I tell me say Devon, 
When the van said come in a parliament with 47 million, a lie, Mattel. The man said, do you know that when Devon just must have left school or whatever and get him for... Anybody know Devon get him first car? Eh? Anybody know how big nose Prime Minister Devon get him first car? Well, I'm going to tell you what I hear. Ha <laughs> ha. The allegation. Hey, <laughs> is that... Students, I want to put two ears emoji in the comments. The allegations are that Eddie B, Eddie C, dead and gone. Former leader, one done. Yeah. It is alleged that there is a man down in a mobby or an over must say Negril. I don't remember. That's why I put one out of them three places there. If it's not mobby, it's must say Negril. Somebody tell me that there is a businessman down in there that involving the white diet business, the white diet coke business. And I wow. hear the person tell me, say, is Eddie B make the call because the person was aligned to, 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 to Siago and a friend with Siago. And you know me, hear the, the man tell me, the man tell me, say, a Siago call the man down there. And tell him, say, when I'm little labor right, him look a protege and him need a car. And the man take out the first car and give Devon. The man also told me that the man's wife died last year. And you know, what would the man say come at the funeral? They said diet coat man for the diet coat man, you know. Fem wife died sometime last year, the year before. You know, who would the man say come at the funeral? Sleepy, yeah. sleepy Chang and Devon. Yeah. Oh, God. Oh, my God. And listen mm -hmm. to me. The man must have died the year after because a big man, you know, a long time that enough. You hear me? I talk about from Devon just a come in a labor ride part, just a come, come out of school. Oh, yeah. The man said that the man died the other day and Devon come to the funeral. Devon, you hear me? And him say, everybody down there knows that oh. man, they a big diet coat man, big businessman, enough mm -hmm. people know about it. You hear me? I tell me, I tell you know what me hear. Let yeah. me shut up. Oh, right. the man call the name, you know, but I slip it, slip the name, slip me. The man call the name, tell, tell me the name of the man. Oh, so let me shut my mouth. All right, you see, you see, you see, him on the show? Yeah. Shiny dead and gone, you know, but on the show, have up shiny to him neck, you know. Because what? When on the show was in there as, as, um, as finance minister, and he would if you want he, in 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 Highland money from shiny you know. Cause me live me live me live, me live in a shiny constituency, you know. Right? I mean you know, say people go down a shiny at its weekly like like when um essential workers line up for collect money weekly. And when 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 Alisha channel is honest. Shiny no back Arisha. Shiny back honest. Oh. Arisha. A sentence be and cost. I am shiny. I said, look what me do for you over the years. And look what you will give me. How we are saying? Yes, me, I tell you, man. I tell you, man. It causes a split between shiny. And Ardley Shaw. But Ardley Shaw could not manage Shiny because Shiny was one of the sponsors of Homies from the one. Oh, I get what you're saying now. <laughs> so because she backed him yeah. a Holniston leader, then he couldn't right. have no judgment with her. But he was still upset with her. He was still upset with her. You understand? So I join his finance minister, Shiny still have to get the Wagga Wagga money. Still, because Onis is at the top. I hear you. I hear you loud and clear, my brother. I hear you. Good. I hear you. So all these things, some, some of the, the labor rights in the long time guys in the party, they have some bitterness against the same man who won his race today. I'm gonna believe you know. You think say so, weekly, I'll be weekly come out and I talk about the, the cost of lawyers and anything there. A fear scandal. Because in way in way paid and settled. 
So you say him get a goal in and shake him, get him, him get him partner draw and pay a big paycheck. He ain't getting big paycheck and, and on top of that he get a mean coat team and one mean jacket and mean coat team and his wife. Everything he get. Oh Jesus. I want him mean coat now, so I remember saying me you hey hey. I want him so. <laughs> you know, you know, it's like big white fur for a coat rally and film star here. Yeah. Yes. Remember God. Yeah, I didn't name someone. When I'm a, when I, 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 especially when I'm a, I, I, I didn't big party. And things like that, I didn't mean uh, it's all so warm and it, it's all so um, celebrity appearance. I hear you. That's it. You get all of those. I hear you, my brother. Yes. I hear yes, you. Man. But anyway, my brother, thank well, you so much for sharing your point with me. Just take a 30 seconds or so and make a closing arguments there. And then we move on. My closing argument is I am pleased with Mark Golden. I heard Mark Golden talk with power and clarity this is today. And it made me feel good. Yes. You understand? It made me feel good. I mean, I hear you pony, puny, puny, uptown talk. Yes. Yes, some politicians are. You know what I'm wearing? Really? Yes, with power, like, like, like with meaning, people. direction. With power. And yeah, authority. You have to resign, boy. You have to resign. So, you understand? And somebody is struggling. And, and, and uh, listen to me, man. You, you don't listen to his speech today. You listen to his speech? Uh, no, I haven't got the chance, you know, but the students send it to me. I'll, I'll play it later on. But because of the, the excitement yeah, and I was busy, on. I didn't get that chance. Maybe later on. Yes. All right, call it more than you. Call it more than that. Thank you. Blessings to you. Blessings to you. Blessings to you. Head boy, you want to chip in or you want no. me to Canada? You want to chip in? Take a, take a, take a All right, why don't I take this last caller here and give them one three minutes? Yes, caller, welcome to our topic. You're live on the air. Three minutes. Welcome to the program. Topic. Yes. The late, that gentleman was talking about Chinese, you see? Yes. The gentleman was talking about Chinese. Let him know that Chinese was involved also in cocaine in St. Anne. So what? Let him know that Chinese Robinson is involved in that was a big cocaine dealer in St. Anne. Lady, my ear is... Chinese call her money from. Well, on, let me hear that scratch, my lady. Well, on, I wonder if it's lice in my ear or my ear not ears. Well, on, let me clean out my ears. I think me... Let me, lady, stretch one Q-tip in there so let me put... Hey, <laughs> Let me a Q-tip, lady, let me That's clean out my ears. Well, That's what he and my brother make all his money from, cocaine. That's why my hand was so close. Lady, I with the breadcrumbs, I with the white rice, you tell me that we, we don't know curry gravy. I with the, I with the, I the white rice, you just say. We know shine you in and out. And you say you know what you're talking about? Ladies, shut up, cutie. Me know how shiny is all my money. We can't tell you from in to out about shiny Robinson, him brother. Bread, crumbs, and soldier crab. Lord Jesus, somebody said WikiLeaks confirmed that caller. Hey, hey. So, so you said that's why Devon love each other like crazy glue. Devon want each other and the people and come on. Hey, 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 sister. Yeah. Yes, same way, God. So, so may I ask you one question now? So you think the people I'm involved uh -huh. in it? So you think the people I'm involved in it? You are going to warm me, God. You are going to warm. You are going to warm, my God. Don't fight straight home, man. They were back him. Don't fight straight home, man. They were back him. And then I, 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 I will work with him. What is a lady? All of the straight home, man. They were back him. I will work with him. Merciful steer <laughs> tone. You mean up a, up a, up a sent and this, huh? Yes, yes, right up a sent and this, huh? Precious memories of the linger. Lord Jesus. So, so, I can't, so tell, I can't tell enough things about that family. 
Lord Jesus, sister, what a way you open the book of life. What a way you open the book of life and write up the page, them over here for way. So, do you say that's why Devon each and upon the lady say, Yes, yeah. yeah. right, that's why Devon each and upon shine so much. Couple of people in the comments are saying, True, them hear it for true. Lord Jesus, me never hear nothing, Master. I say, People in the comments are talking, Hey, my eye closed, my ears yes, shut man. up. Yeah, tell you about him and him, brother, with that. I don't know what, uh, I don't know what they tell me, but I know. Me have proof for that. Blood, fire, good evening. So, yes, lady, you, hey, <laughs> So, you say, you say, you sure say you're not talking foolish, you know what you're talking about, nobody can't tell you nothing. No, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Lord Jesus. So, that's why them could have get the money for, for help the van fund the campaign and so on, so on, like, uh, Right, yeah. Well, I mean, I tell you, one thing lead to another in the world. You can imagine, and and, and a whole heap of them involved in all kind of something, you know, a whole heap of them in a sister, Lady, lady Lou. I to tell you, man, I'm not politics from here, I'm a knee. So I know, me know enough, me know, but I don't sit down and just make the younger generation of them talk. Yes. Mighty full father, hear people still type in the comments say yes, them hear about that for true. So so me ask you one question and I may me oh me go whisper me go whisper. You hear me go whisper. Oh make a laugh. Sure. You didn't ever see me I tell you about know, a laugh, man. Cho me a whisper. So you think Shivan <laughs> I didn't think Devan <laughs> <laughs> No, enough, enough, enough cars that they were and they were going to come for the same time. No, no. Where's... Hotel Lengo, when Shiny was in, before Shiny did. So, 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 them, oh, them go hotel, go get like the AC down there. They go down to the hotel, go drink like the margarita. <laughs> I go do them put in the water. Yeah, I, 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 put, I put them put in the water. Lord Jesus, somebody said me for ask if you know one name from so, but me not ask you no question, master. Leave the lady alone, Mr. Sarah. No, no you, can, you can ask because you can ask. You know the reason why I say you can ask? Yeah. Oh, I know. My uncle was one of the dealers. Mighty God. So we say uncle used to, your uncle used to sell the, uh, sell the drinks them to the diet coke, them where people love to drink. The plastic I diet only, coke. I only, I only we know now with my information we can give, but I'm not going to give you those. I'm just going to leave that space. Leave it at that, sister. Lord, boy, I tell her, sister. We can't call only for names. Mighty God, sister. Wally, but I think the people... Ah, Shevan, brother. Ah, Shevan, brother, when they must say nothing, no nothing. Tell him, 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 from from suppliers, they 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 trust black and steel and cement. <laughs> that, that's what they says, <laughs> creditors. Lord Jesus, but you said the man is not our brother. <laughs> from when? From when he's not his brother? No. But that's such a mother. But but I don't know in a lady because Shevan come out and say the man is our brother. That people in attack and say Shevan said the man is our brother, master. So me not. not I, Shevan, it's Shevan, brother. He's the one that's following Shevan. I'm blood, brother. Lord Jesus, precious memories, all day linger, all day of my flood, my soul, in the still. Hey! <laughs> so, you say, you know where you know, lady, you know where you know, and the argument done. But, yes, man. When I say my one with them foolish, I'm not saying I laugh because it's what? It's all crumbled down upon them. And Jamaica don't know the truth about the shit house them. Mighty full father, well, all right, sister boy, me I tell her, say, you met me years ago, greetings and salutations. Precious memory, sister, good evening and thank you for calling. Do you have anything else to say to Jamaica before you go? Do you have any closing arguments? 
All right, my sister. Blessings to you and take care. Have a good night. Big up yourself. All right, that's up. Boy, I never hear nothing. My viewers and subscribers. Beg you want somebody stretch one Q-tip. Give me the head, boy. Good evening and welcome to you, sir. Welcome to Jamaica Topic. This is your first time on Jamaica Topic, sir. Welcome. Hey, hey. I don't. I don't like living under your spotlight. No, Jesus. Just because you think them might, the people them tell with them business. Boy, 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 boy. So it seems like somebody don't like living under spotlight. Lord Jesus. Here somebody say, yes, that is true. She says not her brother. She not like living under spotlight at all. Lord Jesus, I don't know about which host the lady I talk about. But you know, so it's a serious situation though, Ed Boy. With them. That's why the country can't get better, you know. That's why the country can't get better because even if you don't do no what's it not and get rich and rich in a politics. Hey, the politics. The, the little poor people, them not talk the truth, you no? Know? Let me tell you something. You do whatever you do and get in it. Who oh, no, no, who oh, no, no, no. Are you reaching a politics that have much money? Do the right thing for the poor people, them now. This is. I have less than three minutes with you. No problem, head boy. Yes. And what in, in my clothing argument, I would say, you know that you asked me what happened at Belmont Road. Yes, Belmont Road. Belmont Road. Belmont you, Road. You, Somebody you, type Belmont Road. You realize I took my time. Yes. I said nothing. I allowed the callers to speak. Because I said I would have given you the information when it was appropriate. Yes. Well, based upon my knowledge, I hear how little broke loose to the Abelman Road. Say what? Uh? I said how little broke loose. So what kind of so yes. what kind of hell broke loose now, Lord Jesus? The discussions are forthcoming at this time. That there was. A decision to remove two persons as minister. I can't say who the two persons are, but that decision has been taken. So, yeah. is that an affirmative on the matter? Is it that they're deliberating it on it, or the matter has already been concluded? The the students them say talk up Ed Boy. Them say this too nice. They sound low for two Ed Boy. Talk up a little bit more there. No, I'm saying the matter has already been concluded. You will see that in a very short time. Yeah? Lord Jesus. So, that has been deliberated. What I am told was rejected wholeheartedly was the decision to have the party leader removed. So that decision was rejected wholeheartedly? Wholeheartedly. So them decide, so them now let go and them a keep him said way. But you know, evil attract evil. Yes. Huh? And so at the end of the day, I think that, that not, not much would have come out of it. But I, my sources, and I'm never normally wrong. I want if me don't know, me don't know. But I'm telling you. The, there will be two ministers who will step down. So you're saying two ministers will step down, Lord Jesus. Two ministers will step down. I wonder which two ministers them they know. It doesn't mean that they will be fired. It could mean that they have been transferred. Yeah. But there will be movement in, in regard to two ministers. But let me ask you a question. From what I gather from this head boy, and, and while the events are unfolding, I am taking notes. This a meeting I look like is a sham or whatever because I'll do them, come and talk them. We not see nothing concrete. We not see nothing satisfactory. We don't see nothing at all for sure that so there's any structure going on in the party. We not see nobody from no major move. We not see nothing at all. So me I wonder say, if they're using this as a distraction. To, to kinda to kinda put rest on the parlor issues as well as their bad governance. Let me tell you something. 
something. They are masters of these guys. Yeah? Yes. So when you, when you look at it, the best attempt would be, remember you know, the man just lose, lose the, the local election. Yeah? Yes. So him just lose the local. So we think of the best option for him to do. Call an internal riff among his ranks. Make it look as if they are fighting among the ranks and then him come out as the victor. So then him sell a story that the party is still back sitting. Yeah? In a sense, if the party is still back in its by extension, they are trying to make it look like the entire Jamaica supports it. It's simple. That's how you do that. Yeah? But Jamaica still, but Jamaica can't support them. Jamaica can't support him, especially now with all of this issue with the DPP when I him provide the extension. At no point in time, Jamaica can be supporting him now. But I am saying to you, teacher, I agree with you with that. I know that they're only putting on a show. They have to sell the story. The, exactly. And so the, sto- the narrative, and let me tell you something. You and I and the students here who are about 1,200 might be in, if you give 100,000, you might find 1,200 out of the 100,000 who actually understand what they are doing. Yeah? They understand. That's a, that's a very, that number, that is, the gap is very wide, you know? Yeah? And so that is why it is important that each each one teach one. Yeah? Yes. There are things I don't know, there are things you don't know, there are things all of us don't know, we can impart to each other. And it has nothing to do with one believing. Because no one holds any any um any key to superior knowledge but God himself. Yes. Yeah? That's right. That's right. So, so there is that approach. So we have to take this approach where we look at um for example, we have to reintroduce civics in school. As I part that is one of the things I think we need to look at. We need to cover on this program. There was a book and I need to go back to, and I think I, I'd share it, I need to share a clip with you from Lambert, where it spoke about the book for civics in school. Until you have an understanding of what civics is, you never then know what's a true duty as a citizen. Yeah? Yes. And that is something that we need to look at, and that needs to take center place. In so, in short, teacher, with regards to the Belmont Road situation, I would say it is, I don't think it's an happy time in in in, in the endeavor's shoes, but you know, he's worried, he's not happy. Um, you know, he's, he might have survived what could have been a political storm today, but I don't think he believes he, have, he has won the, the battle. Yeah? He yes. may have won the war. Yes. But he may have lost the battle where Jamaica is concerned. Yeah? Yes. Because I think if there were any well thinking party and sensible party, and I'm not advising them, but if I wanted to win an election, I would have changed my leader if I felt that he was unpopular and if I felt that the crowd was not with him. But the, they have, it is so good that they all have swim in the cesspool of corruption that he has so much dirt on all of them. Yes. That they can't do anything against him. Yeah? That, and that's the issue, you know. Yes. None of them will, will dare move against him. But guess what? Permission. You know, the good side about this that we need to look at is the longer they keep him as the leader, the better it is for the People's National Party. Because some people have already rejected Devon. They're carrying belly for him. And they must have a perfect and fine delivery. You hear what let I tell you? you? Let me give you my parting shot. And this is where I go. My good friend from St. Mary, the man you all dub Agintai. Yeah? Yes. And I and I call him so now. I say I don't call him so. Yes. So Agintai said in twenty nineteen I believe that Peter Phillips is God's gift to the JLP because as long as Peter Phillips stay in, in leadership of the party, PNP will never win an election. I want to say that that is so true in terms of 2025, because as long as who will stay there, the JP will never win an exception. Mark my word. So you're saying 
So you're saying that uh, back then they said the JLP was saying that Peter Phillips was God's gift to the Jamaica to the P to the Jamaica Labour Party because as long as Peter Phillips was leading the PNP, Devon would always beat him and JLP would have win. But now the tables have turned and as long as JLP keep Devon as the leader of the party, it will only work out in favor of the PNP. So Devon being the leader of the party and his wickedness is now has now become a blessing to the PNP. Yes. As, as, as Montague famously said, it is a blessing in disguise. Wow. <laughs> yeah. And you can see it. I don't, I'm not making this up. It is obvious to you that it is, it is a very apparent, the same word they use at their conferences, not what they are experiencing. Yes. Wholeness, wholeness is the gift, Matthew. It is not that Peter, and, and I want to say to people, you know, because I will never indulge in in any attempt to deal, to belittle the name of Peter Phillips, yes? Yes. Peter Phillips did so much in 2012 as Minister of Finance, and even before he was a very good minister in any ministry he went. But he did so well in managing the economy that imagine it, Devon and Ligel can inherit an economy that is growing at such speed. Yes. Right? And they have given no regard to the fact of the previous efforts by Peter Phillips himself and Portia Simpson. Yes. Yeah? Peter Phillips was an ex and astute manager of the economy. And the reason why people trust him was he never had no dirt upon him. Let me tell you something. And this is where I, this is where I look at it and I see where we need to look at this program as well. A lot of people say there's no difference between the PNP and the JLP. I agree with them. I agree with them. And let me tell you, I agree with them. I agree with them not that there is no difference. I agree that the JLP is, the, is not the difference. Yeah? The JLP is the... When you look at the, the JLP, has 49 MPs on its corner. Right? Yes. Do you know, if you go through the 49 names of those MPs, you can find at least 20 of them that their names have been called and embroiled in scandal. Yes, are more, more than, more than half of them, more, more than half of them. Half. All of them names is ta are tainted over there. Look at the PNP. The PNP has 14 MPs on its side. You may be only to point to one where people can call them names. And I can say what it is. People may say they have things about Powell because Powell lost his visa. But in general, Paul will have been a very good minister when he was minister. It's Paul will make me, you know, what happened, what's up in Jamaica. Yes. Yeah? Because he introduced the technology, he pushed for technology. Um, upgrade the phone, bring digital, who deal with cable and wireless, who used to treat Jamaica and like them and shit. Yeah? Yes. So, so at the end of the day, it is Paul Wells work and effort that has led us to this technological revolution. But when you look at the 49 on the other side, including the head and the speaker, their names are being involved in corruption. Yes. Yeah? So something is, 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 is fundamentally wrong when you, when, when, you, when you look at it. But teacher, I want to say to our students, have a good night, but remember, Keep your eyes on this company called Rio Cobra Water Limited. Yes, Rio Cobra Water Limited. Rio Cobra Water Limited. We're going to be paying special attention to the Rio Cobra Water Limited. Keep your eyes on it because for the next 23 years, you and I will be paying water as long as we live. We have a house in a king from St. Andrew, St. Thomas, and Portmore. Wow. All right, we're going to try to pay some All attention to it and see if we can shed some light on the matter, all right? All the best to you, my friend. Blessings to your head boy. Thank you and take care. Yes, yes students, that was our head boy. Blessings to the head boy. Blessings to the head boy, my viewers and subscribers. Rio Cobra Water Limited. Head boy was telling us that we need to pay attention to the Rio Cobra Water Limited. When you type it in the comments... Rio Cobra Water Limited. We're going to go to the PNP now because Mark Golem attacked the things them. 
Mark Golden stir up. He may not the mood. He may talk the things them. He may stand up for the right of Jamaican people. And I am going to let you listen to Mark Golden, my viewers and subscribers, all right? Because class not done yet. We have a whole heap of things to talk about. We have a whole heap of things to talk about. I remember the phone lines are still open, my viewers and subscribers. If there's anything that you would like to, to talk about, please give me a call. 876 Somebody said that. Them I wonder if a dog pa God dog God dog pa Godfather. Somebody say them I wonder if a dog pa father in law them want to make the DPP. Somebody's asking if his dog pa father in law Tavares they want to make DPP students. Them I ask say if a Tavares. They want to make the DPP. I don't know. Welcome to the program, Carly. Your life on topic. Good night. How you doing? What's up, family? I they hear you know with all of the judgment we are going in at the country. A pure excitement, Bangarang. Give us just a second. Hold on, please. All right. Hold on a second. Sister Ines, blessings to you. Sister Ines says she go to church today. And she coming from the Lord's Supper. Blessings to Sister Ines. Blessings to Gideon. Yes, Mr. Topic. What are you doing, Papa? I'm doing all right, you know. Blessings to all the students in the live and are just coming on the live. Blessings to you. Welcome to the program, Carla. You're on the floor. Yeah, man. Why am I telling you, I'm the only people bangarang with all Miss Lowen and all these things. But, you know, let me tell you something, family. You see, if, 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 if things is not right and you have somebody out there to try to make it right, we have, we have to applause those people. You know yes. what I'm saying? And let me tell you something. I like how Mark Golden working under the, the the shadow. You know, him not up front, but him send out two men say, yo, the two messengers go out, they go execute that thing. And let me tell you what I predict right you now. It's like when I send out them two uh, messengers to execute the case with Paz and Louis. I feel say another execution I go go on with the six, you know. Mm. What is it? I feel say um, another execution I go go on with the six where them say them want uh, them not go name out of the parliament. I feel say well, undercover thing I go go on just like parallel with next um thing the excitement. Oh we yeah, are say you know yes man. Then I mean the 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 the, the opposition is very smart you know because. He realized that the man a dictatorship the situation. Yes. Now go by the book. Yes. And if you have a weak opposition, that will give him strength to disrespect the opposition. I can also disrespect the opposition and believe to say Mark Saf and them something. But him don't know say he's an intelligent man him up against. But yes. he's a man who's not too loud mouth. He's a, he's a snake, you know, just hide and lick if him, you know, decides to do something. Yes. Just hide and just doing things smartly, brother. Yes. So right now, we don't even know. No man don't even have to know if him take a flight go anywhere. To try to dig up all them six corruption they out of the seat where them now want to talk about. Yes. Just like how them are trying to hold the yeah. woman in the seat for some reason, I don't know how she so how they, like nobody else in the country not qualify for be a DPP. I don't understand how them no, are running. You have to realize, you, you see, when you look, you, you see, when you, when you realize the situation and it is extremely odd. When I say odd, because you have several other people there who can do the job, her assistant, deputy. And when there are other men that they want her to remain in the job, you have to start wondering. And the moment you start wondering is the moment you begin to put two and two together. And you realize, hey, something is wrong. But what do you think? Because everybody realizes something must be wrong. Why they're adamant? Why they want her to stay? Want her to stay? Why they give her not one but two extension? And after they give her two extension and the court said unconstitutional, they still want to take it to court to appeal. Let me ask you, what do you think, or what is the reason why you think they want to keep her up? <laughs> Them have things where them know so I'll get exposed, man. I know, I know. Let me tell you something, our family. Yes. This is just the, Whoa. the iceberg. Yes. This is just the tip of the iceberg, family. Yes. This this is just a little bruise, and it bruise gonna be turned out in a sore. And I doubt you if you know and Jamaican people if you know that. And and um and and Mark grew up gold enough to keep a, a low profile just like what I don't know. Yes. Because you never know. 
you never know you will just hear one you say assassination and no motive for the killing because them such man in power them not now go go you investigate. must say mad that so could have never happened man that jamaica them to the country that mash up you must say mad that could have right. never happened so so yeah, but when when some man back against the wall you never know when a drowned man see a straw the man will have fight you never know brother so you have to keep a low profile the country and that one dark situation and the whole world know that yes you understand so you might try to be a mr catch up you know and then we do anything right now you don't even know where i go to or in brain or where i go to the whole team because yes. that woman not supposed to be in the seat like tomorrow man and she might go in there you know, yes. know where i go go on you know what I'm saying? But them say she not so, going there. Them say tomorrow, the news coming say tomorrow they're going to appoint a deputy to go and act in the position in the meantime. So she not go going there. That is what the, the information um, that we and, receive. And what I get to understand from Andrea Laya, friend, that they cannot have no acting person. They must have a direct hit to me see the law set up. Yes. Yeah, man. They said they can't have no acting people like, like nothing. They said nothing like that. You have to put, you have to appoint somebody directly. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's the law. When I hear a talk out of the law, I'm out, brother. So I don't know this appointed for your time go. When they said that now in the Constitution, I don't know about that. Well, he said, he said those kind. Of, he said that position where where, where them are talking about now is as if the, if Paula Lewin was still in position, or she's sick, or she away for a while, then then can put a temporarily somebody in. But if I out she out, they have to find somebody in. Then can temporarily nothing. That they said the law is. Well, but at that them so, said them are do. Them said them are going to do that, so we will see. Family. Remember, said them are dictator, you know, remember, said them take one day pass law by themselves, said BP if you work 65, you know, man. I met them write a piece of paper, and you know, them want to work, you know. Me know. Them not work with the opposition. A majority, them after them just go ahead and do what them want, do without consulting of the opposition. Of course. Yes. Of course. Them not care. Them don't love Jamaican people. Because since I've lately, me, me have a friend in Westmoreland sick, you know, and he all have a kind of heat up, heat up with his sickness and, and vomiting and, and all these things. And, and I sense the water, yeah, grown, grown people start have them sickness there. My you understand? Because I don't know where they get the water from. Me tell the guy, say, yo, take a van and take your vehicle and go a spring, go catch the water where I drink. What them I sell, you know, use a wash clothes and flush toilet and wash bathroom. Simple. That's true, you are talking. People are yeah, careful and I drink the pipe water. We can listen to you. No man, you can't go drink pipe water. You can't boil it because you don't even know if you want to can't boil out. You understand? You have to I be careful you, man. I hear you, my, my brother, but you know what? Yes, and, go ahead, and, go ahead. And, and another warning. Hold on, this is a warning you know, more you send out there too. Yes. Tell the Jamaican people, them so them to try to ease off of the Chinese store them buying rice and these things because all water, no fake water and make and tile it, sewage and filter and sell and put on shelf and that they buy news but them not see it. So they have to be careful. Yes, come see one video you out there. Unless you can know, you know. go to the supermarket where a Chinese owner is better for no brother. Yes. Some look for life. Yes. Because you don't know what they, they have. You notice you can't grow enough for them private place. At all. They may have like it out. all kind of things around there. And women don't understand. Oh, oh, oh. You know, Chinese people now buy and know where for black people. You know, if black man have a little shop, you know, I say, when Chinese come in there, they're going to buy nothing, you know, brother. So we have to look in ourselves. Yeah, man, we need to start looking at ourselves. Um, me, I like me, you know, me just grow my one thing in a family because the ground did have to grow and you have to, they can't go a spring. People have to get up and do them thing now, you know. You know, wait for people until you pies and you take your own money pies yourself. All right, my brother, I hear you loud and clear. I hear you. Thanks mm -hmm. for calling and Jamaica, the world has heard your, 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 your story and they heard what you have to say. So blessings to you, my brother, and big up yourself every time, mm -hmm. all right? Yes, Papa. Well, yes, man. Hello, everyone. We are the party live. You know, man, sir, Papa. Just take it easy. Happy Sunday. Blessings to you. Same to you, my brother. Big up yourself. Yes. So, student, people are saying that they're going to appoint uh, uh, an acting DPP. I'm seeing where my, one of my moderators saying no one can be appointed. The body or the organization to choose a DPP has expired March 31st. So if the body or the organization that is to choose the DPP, if that organization has expired March 31st,
How are they going to choose a new DPP? Lord Jesus, my viewers and subscribers, what a piece of excitement this government has found way. Welcome to the program, Carly. Good night, Good night, Good night. Good night. How are you doing, sister? I am good and I am blessed. I am blessed. Yes. You remember last week I told you. Hold uh, on, sister. Hold on. 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 Hold on, sister. You have to turn off your background because you talk to me, but you listen to the TV. Turn off your background or step away from it. Turn off your TV. Yes, all right. Um, before I reach there, so. Yes. God said to Joshua to tell the children of Israel to stand still and see the salvation, don't it? Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Well, last week, you remember, I told you that, yes, some people are saying we have to take the street and what have you, what have you. But mm -hmm. if we are praying to God to take care of this situation, we need to let God work, don't it? Yeah, I remember you saying you can't must have a problem and give it to God or the back of the fight and go take it up back. I remember you were saying something like that. Good. So what God is doing now. But listen to me now, sister. Let me show you something. That is true. The Lord is working. And it shows that the Lord is working. But let me show you. Faith without works is dead. I know you had agreed with me on that one because you're a, you're a Bible believing person. You know the Bible. You know what that means? Had, had the PNP or Mr. Paul well took this to court, nothing would have happened. So even though we're praying, well, I know, even though we're praying, we pray for to, for to God to influence and change decisions and fix decisions. But we also have an integral role to play. Suppose Paul will and Mark will in me sit down and say, Lord, may I pray to God for you to take out DPP and never bring it to court. Nothing would happen. So the people equally need to be physically active some way. Is either them come out on social media and express their dissatisfaction, but let it be known while we pray. You understand? So prayer is really important. But while we pray, we need to have works. And people are being saying, sister, that we need to do some more prayer. I think I'm going to run another night of prayer again. I think I'm going to run it. Yes. But listen, you have said it well. Faith without work is dead. Yes. But they did the work. They, they took to the court. We took to the, the social media. So that is the work. Yes. The work that I am talking about is to go out there on the street, out in the devil territory after we don't give to God already. We have done the work. Because they go to the court and we are using the social media. So the work is good. The work is good. Yes. Along with the faith. Yes. So you understand what I'm saying now? Yes, I agree with you, sister. 100% I agree with you. 100% my lady friend. And people like, where you say? So where you say? People like you are prayer. Where you say? People like you are prayer. I want to not stop prayer. We're not stopping. We're not stopping. I'm mean, a no sagada here. I'm mean, a no sagada answer. He yes. said that he will not give us more than we can bear. Yes. The children of Israel turned their back on God, but God did not leave them. Yes. He stood, he stood, he stood by them, yes. and he still protect them. Yes. He bring them out of Egypt, when, when you say he keep them in Egypt for a period of time, and so till when they couldn't. Bear no more. The, the Bible said that their, their prayers go up to him night and day. Yes. And he told Moses, he said, I have heard the cry of my people. I am sending it down to Egypt to deliver my people. Yeah. We pray. We pray. I hear you singing that song. We pray and God deliver. That's right. Deliver. That's right. Well, God, we depend on you. God, we trust, you know? We don't come like the what? Wicked Labour Party. We go light Campbell and Jump Revival. And go like bro, court not and do all kind of something. Up our knee, we say, and I God, we, we, God, I, I God, we talk to. Exactly. Exactly. So let us continue to pray. Let us continue to pray. Because yes. God's ears are attentive to our cry. Yes. We will not give up. We will not stop. And we are going to see them fall, like when the ripe mango fall off the tree, yes. one by one. 
and they are going to go down. They have to go down. Yes. I tell you that, and I say, God, fill up a fire underneath them foot. Yes. And you see, you think when I hear anything yet? When I hear anything yet? So we say, will it more for come? Will it more excitement and judgment for come? Will it more? Will it more? Oh, Jesus. So well, no, God now, God now stops telling him, him join them and let him make that a sea. Mighty like she and her army. Mighty God. Where say, unless Pharaoh let the people go, he's going to lose him life and him soldiers, them feet. And a long time people are telling him, say, let the people go. And he's not here. Yeah, and then they don't go in the parliament and then start up and then shout at, 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 at people as if they are talking to their children at home. You know what? As I said that, you know what is happening to mm. Andrew Willis and Julie? They don't even realize what they are doing to their children. What they're doing? Tell they are bringing down curse upon their children. We are saying. Their attitude. Their attitude. Their attitude. Their behavior. What they are doing to the poor people. A curse. They are bringing down curse and them. They don't realize. Yes. They don't realize. Let me tell you. God no work like how we want him to work, you know. Yes. You understand? God work at his time and at his pace. So gotta work <laughs> oh God. God gotta work like, you must know, when when you got a nana or something. Yeah. Nana nana nip, you know nip, what nip, I mean? Nip 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 it done. Eat it, eat it, eat it, eat it, eat it. Then nip it till mm. it done. And so till we eat as all right. Yes. As God work. So God gotta work. And when he when the fullness of time come and when everything you don't know, it just blow up. Okay. That is God. I hear you, my friend. So it's a God that work on them slowly but surely. We must just go and pray and make God do the rest of the work. Yes, man. Go and pray. And stand still. Stand still, man. And we're going to see the salvation. Now, who blind and can see? We hear. Yes. All right, my sister. Mm-hmm. Yeah, all right, my sister. Blessings to you. And thanks for calling. I have yourself yes. a good one. All right? Good to my brother. I'm going to go old man that talk to you. It's my husband. <laughs> okay. Well, big up the little old man. All right? Blessings. That's Mr. Roy, right? Yes. Blessings to Mr. Roy, man. Big up yes. Mr. Roy, man. I respect him and love talk to him, man. Big up yourself and big up Mr. Roy. All right? No. All right, all right. Yes, yes, mm-hmm. yes, yes. Students, the phone lines are open. I'm going to be showing you Mark Golden. And I want you to tell me if you don't see the growth and development in Mark Golden. I'm going to be showing you something, students. And I want you to tell me if you don't see the growth and development in a Mark Golden. Students, my phone numbers are 876-5396-220. Give me a WhatsApp call. Yes, my friend. Welcome to the program. What are going man? Yes, me say. Earlier on, I watch you. I left and go back. We and I, Ratty God. And left Ratty God and go back and Jay. But listening to the program, where Bug Life resign now? Where is, what person resign? So far, what we hear, him, res- him resign as the communication muscle leader, director for the JLP. That's the only thing we hear is a Bug Life resign for. He no resign as Minister of Information. He no resign on time constituency. Not at all. So when we did things, say, well, they move him up. Not at all. What do you think now? What do well, you have to say? Well, me coming from work, come catch um, 10, 10.30 news. The news say he no resign from committee, committee chairman. So me never know him did have um, the post at all. So yes. him no resign from Minister of Information. The news say he resigned from a com- committee chairman. Yeah, that's the public committee, the pub the PR committee. That because I him normally push out the JLP mm-hmm. press briefing, him push out them 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 mm-hmm. propaganda and all kind of mm-hmm. something for them. The news, mm-hmm. everything, every mm-hmm. every kind of social media something that him would have be responsible for that. Mm-hmm. And maybe at least not at all for the press. Mm-hmm. Look a bit before me leave for and she, her topic was the same thing as when I tell you to. Because you know, she has a do her thing really now. Yes. At half of the press. Yes. You see it, so. They say, me make, me, me, me make sure I call you and ask you. You understand? Yes. 
But I didn't let me know. I distract them, I distract with sister, I distract them, I distract with them, I try to take my mind off of them for when I focus upon yeah. pan Paula Llewellyn and le, and for us to not be focused that because guess what? Paula Llewellyn de, get fire or she out of the job, she unconstitutional. Put it at that. Mm -hmm. Right now, Delroy exactly. Chuck says that they're going to appoint an acting DPP. But the law says that you're not supposed to appoint no acting person. That is what me hear people as the law is. People are say you're supposed to appoint exactly. a new DPP. But you're the partner, no? you're the partner, exactly. no? you're the partner. No? Mm -hmm. The committee or the organization was supposed to appoint the new DPP. Me say the community, they mash, the committee mm -hmm. mash up and done and expire a long time. So there's no community committee we're active right now for swearing. You know, like when you don't have a group or that where that them that the selection, yes. the group to do the selection, me yes. say that group they expire. So right now there is no committee to there do the no selection. The opposition so people's right. national you know, that they might do a distraction per way. I believe they might do a distraction exactly. power for take we yai half of that because they want to put in somebody yes. and listen to me. Maybe the person who they want to put in could have even worse than Paula because that person could have been them one worse. But, but listen to me now, sister. Yes, because you know, see. Yes. Mm -hmm. Remember, say so the next person where they might choose, you know, you know it has to be somebody who are going to do for them dirty work because there's no way they're not going to put in somebody exactly. who are not going to do them dirty work. Exactly. Listen because to me. I realize it. Everybody where they are put in a feeling position and who where they want to put. Yes. You yes. see the you see the clock? And who where they want to put to cover up them dirty secret. But earlier on today, you see the person where my goal in say my goal is say tomorrow morning if she ever put her foot in a the in our office tomorrow morning, a judgment. You, you, you hear that? You, you hear that post it today? I don't hear it. I wonder if I this yes. me I go play. Well, I think I yes. eat this me I go play. The students them send it to me. I think I eat okay. me I go play now. The clip with Mark okay, Golden yes. and things them. Mark Golden said if she ever put her hello, foot hello. in her in Hello, me get information, man. same listen judgment. to me, listen to me. Me get information from somebody, same listen to me last night and the night before we are robot Paula, you know. Him listen to me last night mm -hmm. and the night before. Yes. Students, did you know that Mark Golden was listening to us last night and the night before? He was listening to us. Yeah. Maybe that's why I'm come out so Mr. strong Mr. now when I talk about this, about the Paula. Mark Golden are listening Mr. to him. Mark Golden, if you're listening tonight, big up yourself. Big up the PNP. Yeah. You know, we are support Uno. You know, we want to take over Jamaica yeah. and rescue us from the hands of wicked, destructive Devon and Chevron. Yeah. And Mr. Golden, you're a man of integrity. And people respect you. And uh -huh. we are not in a no bangerang, sir. And we are ask you, when we put our trust in a you, and when we give you the chance to lead the country, do what is right for the people, sir. Yes. We believe in a you. And we want your thanks for listening to our topic quietly. And we want you to continue to listen to our suggestions. And if you come up with no good suggestions, sir, as usual, don't be afraid to bring it the next yes. day and talk about it. So, and guess yes. what? We are calling, well, I know, you notice we are mm -hmm. called for Dr. Chang for resign. And out of the blues, we realize that Mark Golden are called for Dr. Chang for resign. Big up, Pessel Marky Jan, thanks for listening mm -hmm. to us. Yes? Yes. Me say, we respect Mark Golden to the ground because me and people say Mark Golden are work, but I chat them, I chat Mark Golden are work. Yes. Teacher, you remember when they, they were the war in Ukraine? Yes. Uh, oh, you think sent to the student then? I'm not going over in. Ukraine. I'm not going when, when, when Devon lock out and said the border lock, our own city to them can't Thank come in. You. When every other country in the Thank world, you. when every other country in Thank the world you. was securing their own citizens and bringing them in, the Prime Minister and Tufton and mm -hmm. everybody locked down the country and said, we see with students them, your pitney and my pitney and your neighbor pitney them, the stu mm -hmm. the, our, our students them, what did they in Ukraine? Him said them uh -huh. can't come home because the border lock. And it was Mark Golden that lobbied to get those students home. So Mark uh -huh. Golden is a worker. Him exactly. stay behind the scene and work. Mark Golden had the general for the next prime minister of Jamaica. And let me tell you something, teacher. Yes. You see, we, you, you know where me, you know where me there, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. You know mm -hmm. where me work, and mm -hmm. you know where me there. Mm -hmm. Teacher. At three, it's a going at three months now. I'm in a walk on my yard. 
a kaya se dey in a in a in a bath i'm bucket like, even in a kitchen sink na show water come and teacher you know where me work and water did it so every right you now at this so me have to catch water and care come and me yeah me have to put the water back in my in my, in my vehicle yes. and catch water around there and come on my yard so you hear them come talk about water joe a not then, a water joe so so I've, so you're just confirming so hold on so you're just confirming that it is a manufactured water job because in the JLP areas they have water while the PNP area Thank have you. no water. Don't have any. Exactly. Exactly. And it must not be allowed Sometimes, to happen. You yeah, listen to me. If we forget the benefits in the country, then play politics with it. If farm cadre work, farm exactly. work program are run, then play politics. If road work program exactly. run, then play politics. If Part money that's I give out them play politics. Play politics. And you mean to tell me that water, water them play politics, PNP? No, it can't, it must never be allowed to happen. And a PNP, let me show you all them wicked. You know which part the water crisis start from? Mm -hmm. Anova and Westmoreland was a PNP. Yeah. Then Manchester was a yes. PNP. Then St. Mary was a yes. PNP. A four PNP. Exactly. A four PNP players that you know. Yeah. Hey, may I tell you, you know, man. Well, and the sister, listen to me. Listen to me. Say, them say, them say, them, them say, at must it 12, it 13 you have. Them say, I have 13 municipalities. Them left out Portmore. Them say, them with 7 and PNP um, win 6. But we know, say, PNP win their mom. And you mean to tell me, say, PNP exactly. have 6 parish. 6 parish where PNP win and 4 out of the 6 are the only place of water shortage um, there? No. Something is wrong. Yes, so I'm telling you, teacher. They must sabotage PMP because I said, teacher, I said, where may work? Sometimes I have to just put my clothes in my bag and just go around and my well, girlfriend to me. go around. Well, listen to me. You know, you know what I said? You know, sir, two my goal and I listen to me. So that you, you remember the other night with the over ear and we had talked on the program said Mark Golin must be more vocal and class prefect at different and said, mm -hmm. no, I saw Mark Golin stay. I remember the other person, I think Leprechaun did up on the show too. And the two of them are different Mark mm -hmm. Golin and I said that yeah. game time and I me alone did that uh -huh. for talk more. You remember that time? You know, realize yes. that oh, Mark Golin just yes. come out and talk, lip right and center and just a fire, yes. fire, fire. So well done, Mark Golin. Yes. Yeah, listen to it. Well done, sir. Miss Teacher, Miss a girl, me no miss at all for the press. And me say, you know, at all for the press topic. She ever be delivered the man big up Mark Golin. And yeah. she say, Mark Golin ever talk but through the media now put out Mark Golin speech and so. Them eyes are all about Mark Golin, Mark Golin attack. Yes. But through it though, it don't highlight most of the time. Yes. More time I utter for the press little um when my goal in speech, she play it and we can and we hear most of it some um all the time. Yes. The P all the social media them we you see all that you see G two K them. That's why we alone some call them germs to kill. Them is nothing but a germs. Nah, Jesus. And the PSO J them, you think that I'm easy. Me say the PMP here and them not no water. Me say water dash out round so teacher. You hear me say? Water dash out round there. I don't hear nobody have no water shortage round there. And that's a big labor right say? place. What me say? Big labor right place that. But, well on teacher, let me give you this one here. Yes. Me I listen at her for the press this morning. Yes. Because you know she go and do her research. Yes. I uh, thought for the press, now nah, come out and talk no, uh, if you no go so. Yes. And me, I listen uh, this morning. Me never know, say, the Prime Minister um is a privy council. Let me get to that. She said, Anjo, yeah, because she said, Anjo, I'm even a member of the privy council. And she got to do her research. And in Peter, is one hundred and twenty six thousand pounds for the year where I'm getting paid for. Cause you know I love signing, signing for everything. So he is a privy council. Me I listen at half of the press since there, and at that the topic at half of the press come with. I was so shocked when me I listen her. Yes. 
Yes. Him just a sign and sign and sign and everything in sign and put it in self. You know, remember when Julie all in this interview, more enough for school, enough everything, enough. I saw him enough for sign, sign, sign and sign till he sign out Jamaica. Yes, that's why we have to get him out. So the people need to wait and that we are asking Mr. Golden. Sign out Mr. Jamaica. Golden, we're asking you, sir. Uh, we know you're doing the work constitutionally. But we want to hear you talk on the water crisis, Mr. Golden. Big up yourself. And you do your work. Yes. And we know you take constructive yes. criticism from we. And we ask you, we say, we win saying that we other day. I did a poll over here. And on the poll I asked, do so you think that Mark Golden need to be more vocal at this time? Students, so you remember the poll when we put up enough I want to participate in the poll? I asked the question, mm -hmm. do you think that Mark Golden need to be mm -hmm. more vocal at this time? And I think about 83% says yes. So the people must say Mark Golden need to start yeah. up some more. And see my talk there. Hey. See my talk there. But Mark Golden, we want yes. you to address the water, the manufactured water crisis, Mr. Golden. We want you to talk yes. about it, sir. The wicked teacher. The water crisis, wicked teacher, because me have got you and in I four people, people. Going and, and, and guess what? Now. The water belongs uh, to Jamaicans. You know, belong to labor, right? See, the water belongs exactly to Jamaicans. Teacher, I bought me a baby now. I know you alone. 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 You know, a long time, someone will stand up and we pipe and stretch up and I make like water run power head. You know, long look water not touch with head from the pipe, from top of the pipe. May I tell you? All the years in my life, when they said, look, we have a little drought and so people, if water ever got by in the night or a morning or so. You get a little water where you can't catch up with your little after business. The election, so till rain falls, and we get and the, and the dam full, and we but, get back water. But, I first miss it this but, year. But isn't it strange, students, caller? Listen to me. Let me ask you both a question. I'm asking all 1,343 people that's on the live. 1,352, including yourself. 1,353. Mm. Yes. I want to ask you a question. Isn't it strange? You know, somebody described the word strange. Isn't it strange yes. that yes. this water crisis came about after the election that PNP supposedly have won? Listen to me again. In this election that, that PNP won the popular vote. In this election where yes. more people vote for PNP. Lord Jesus, let me shut my mouth. And that's why I'm saying, sister, the PNP people who are uh -huh. in these parishes, they need to get up and start and, and talk about it. And talk, say, say, the no, say that they're being victimized. They need to teacher, come out and talk about it. it. Yes, it's strange, teacher. And let me tell you something, teacher. Well, and me, the sister, before you tell me there, willing, students, before you right tell me there. Now, me willing. Before mm -hmm. you tell me there, students, if you think it is strange, type strange in the comments. Nicola think it is strange. It's Who else strange, think it is true. strange, type strange in the comments. Don't you think it is strange, strange. that immediately exactly. after the election, water shortage, and it began in the areas where PNP people are? Proceed, sister. You were saying that if I even you, you were about to say something. Teacher, you know what I'm saying? Me ready mm -hmm. to go protest. Any time, any minute, any hour, me ready. Me wonder why the people them of Jamaica them free to come out. Teacher, you know what I say? I think uh, two weeks ago, me decided to say, me alone, I go write a placard, say, me need water, and et cetera, et cetera. And me say, me I get up, I carry all the marker from my workplace, say, me go mark, write a piece of cardboard. And you know the reason why me don't go there the morning teacher, I'm gonna tell him the honest truth. Yes. Me look for my husband and me tell him say me, me wanna go there. And him said to me, say, don't go. Don't go for two. You I wanna have, go. Teacher, me I tell him I'm ready. If five so somebody said they're ready with me tomorrow morning, me ready. Me I tell you, because we need to go to go protest because some things where they might go on with teacher, we need to go to go protest. 
as I even 10 or 15, somebody in the program needs we get together and decide it and go go protest. Uh, Me ready. Sister, your ear, Ed Boy, break it on the program to them sooner or later, them priv priv for privatize water and a private company. I go, yeah. I go in a water distribution. The people don't realize what is coming, you know. I've said it on this program. Yeah, I born, I have said it. And several people are saying that the next war is over water and land. I want to see the water thing start coming in. So the people must get up and talk up. Jesus, merciful yes. fellowship, Let's, Savior, Phil, Phil friend, man. I the first me ever see this year in my life with politics. And guess what? Things are the worst politics gone to teach and, and the worst what? politics and guess what? gone to the guess what? Te New technologies are emerging every day. New technologies are emerging every day that are bettering people's lives. And you mean to tell me that Jamaica has not yet tapped into this new technology to benefit their people's lives? You mean to tell me that Jamaica is getting worse because Jamaica had water and train what? service and light before enough place in the world? Are you mean to tell me that we were one Teacher. of the first people to have pipe water and electricity and some of our people still not have See? light and still not have water? You don't think of back way that after 80 years, 70 years? Back with your teacher. Teacher, if we never have light in a Jamaica, we shouldn't shout at water. Not true. Water is light, teacher. We did not have the light in your house, but when you don't have no water, it works. It works. you can't light a lamp. Not you true. can't light a lamp or a candle if you don't have no, no light. True. But water, teacher, and that, and that Andrew has pipe we with. The man eh? for two. The man a spite him, a spite the people. You yeah, listen to me. You know, like the people in back them in you know, the 80s when they tell me, say, Pad used to marry to rice and bread and flour and sugar, everything yeah. you have to buy. Yes. And, and based on what mm -hmm. we've understood, it was the JLP and Siago that was sabotaging the people. So they must suffer with a starve from food because of politics. Don't you realize that? Because he, of politics. Don't you realize that Andrew Devon. Is Siago reincarnated? So Siago starved the people him by not giving them food. Yes. And Devon has starved the people him with water. When did I say that? And the people him just shut. Boy, sister, let me stop me now. Mark Golden, please, we I beg you. Please, please, bring some issue, Mr. some light to this water issue. We're begging you, sir. We are begging you on behalf of Jamaican. Please. Yes. Jesus mercy. Mr. Teacher. Teacher, mm. sometimes when you say Devon, you know the whole class and we know. Oh, and when you say Devon, we know who you talk. Yes. But no people over the world, when you say Devon, they never know who you talk. They guess what? Guess what? Wait a teacher, wait a teacher. Oh, my first stop said Devon, when I'll mode peace call him Devon too. Oh, me for stop. Mouth piece, I do an interview with somebody. A mouth piece, and listen to what Devon, <laughs> your prime minister, just said. Mo so then, to remember my plate over here, yes. one man called and joined a complaint no, no, about no, something. No, one man no, no, called, no, 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 let me tell you, teacher. one man called mouth piece, I was complaining about something. I don't know if I said man, one man called mouth piece and I complained, say me name constituency, and them have, them have what, what do you call it now? Them have, Illegal garage park up out there and him can't go time yard and all kind of something. And the man I talk about it on him program. Mm -hmm. At the end of the program, uh, Devon, that is the Prime Minister, texts Maud Peace mm -hmm. and tell him, say, Oh, I just hear about it. This is the first time I hear it. And as the Prime Minister, and as Maud Peace are finished, mm -hmm. Maud Peace said to him, say, Carla, listen what Devon just said a while ago. At that Maud Peace said, Maud Peace said, listen what Devon just said. Mm -hmm. So the no sir Devon him name. <laughs> Hear Verona say, I heard hey. it, I was on his live. You hear a more Verona say, I heard it, See? I was on his yeah. live. So me now stop See, calling teacher. Devon. Me now, me now say, if you stop calling Devon, you know, when me I try to say, sometimes we be say, hand you all this, the whole world you know, say, we're Prime Minister, we are time. Let me tell you what I do. Let me tell you. Some people let, have a clue about let me, Devon. Let you me know. Tell you, but let me tell you what I occasionally do. I will say, Devon, the Prime Minister. You realize I normally say that? I wonder if you realize oh, me now yes, when you occasionally yes, said that. Perfect. I would say Devon, right. yes. the Prime Minister. Yes. yes. 
Hey, teacher. Yes. You see me and me, I watch you. Yes. Me, I watch Andre, you know. Me yes. say over Andre, burn up since night, you know. No, nah, Jesus, what a banger. Over Andre, burn up since I have my tablet and yes. me have my phone. So me, I watch you, Panda, and as, me, I watch Andre. I my students, I'm not like when you call in, when you call in to Andre, you know, me, I listen to everything. Yes. You see, me say, over Andre, burn up since night. Yes. You see, but when you get time and can go watch it, you can go watch it. When I go do it, you know, teacher, me go throw up my little water in my bath. No, Jesus. And go hold a little water up, because I'm not too long coming from work, and I go go and listen to your program. So, yes. me go back in a class. Devon, out of order. Big up I'll yourself. Keep, big up yourself, my friend. Take care and thanks for calling. Yes. Yeah, man, really. Yes. People can get a good night water. People can get water run from them ear and them front and them back. When last summer we get water running our back? When last summer we get water running our back and in our ear right in our front? The water now reach our front and our ear. We have here bend on our stoop in a bucket. Welcome to the program, Carla. You're live on a topic. Right. Oh, I am. Hold on. Let me turn this down. Thank you. Yes. Well, on a second. Yeah, how are well, you? I'm doing fine, sister. Before you answer. Yes, calligraphy. Devon mode sleep. Hear me, mode piece, the mode piece, cliff use mode slip and ball out to the caller. Say, say, Devon, look what you look what Devon just respond. There was a caller on mode piece radio station, Cliff Hughes, who was reporting a problem. And the Prime Minister responded and text Cliff Hughes. And Cliff Hughes was the team say, Caller, the Prime Minister just responded. The Prime Minister said that so and so is going to look, look at it. So listen, Devon, listen what Devon said. As some more piece, as some more piece, I call him by name Devon. Everybody knows how Devon him name. Welcome to the program, Carly, you live on the air. Good evening, good evening yes. from the middle of the Atlantic. How are you all? I'm doing fine, my friend, from the middle of the Atlantic. Thank you for taking time to listen to Jamaica Hot Topic. Welcome to the program. Yes, thanks. Well, I mean, it's all fun and games. Yes. They have really shot themselves in the feet. Mm -mm. They are digging, 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 digging holes for themselves. Yes. I I heard this evening that such lady might not be in the chair by the end of the week. I don't know if it's true. I heard that she's out because Delroy Chuck, the justice minister, made a post, I believe, today saying that they're going to appoint an acting DPP in the week. No, I'm refer no I, I know that I'm referring to the speaker. Oh, this... What on there? Repeat what, what you say about the speaker. <laughs> ah. Well, I'm never, well, I'm never hear yes. you. My ears did hurt me a little bit. Make a, let me one of your cuties make a clean out my ears there. Let me a, a cotton swab up. <laughs> I'm up to speed, you know. What? Hold, so, hold, hold on my collar. That's what I heard. Hold on my collar. What? What did you say a while ago? My collar. Hold, hold on a second. Hold on a second. What is it that you're telling me and this and the and the students in Jamaica on topic? What did you say about the prime minister's bigfoot wife? What do you say? Oh my gosh. You said your man foot bigger than me. <laughs> <laughs> murder, murder, murder. Yes. I, <laughs> I heard um, that she may not be there by the end of the week. I heard she's to be removed. And I just want to um, remind, enlighten a few, and remind those of us that know this. Okay, they. The, and you, I'm sure you, you know, the ministers can't be removed by the prime minister because they were elected. They weren't appointed. Yes. So they will still have their ministerial seats. But if they were on boards, you know. They can be removed from they cabinet. Removed. They can be removed from cabinet and as ministers. Cabin yes. They can be removed as but ministers. But they still remain of member of parliament. They can't be removed as MP. They yes. can't be removed as minister or as member of parliament. Yes. Because the people elected them. Yes. Yes. So we, I just want to remind everybody about that. And uh, do you remember um, the letters of resignations that were written some years ago? Uh, when Devon got 
Are got you... them all to sign letters of resignation when they were planning to run out of parliament at one point. The undated resignation letters, the unconstitutional. The undated, right, the undated resignation letters. And do you remember the fight with Tufton? And yes. Devon. And another senator also. I remember that where Tufton tried yes, to get Yes, that them senator out. now, yeah, that senator now, I think he sent him to Germany. He was the author of those letters. He sent him to Germany as an ambassador. So we are saying. Yes, but something else I want to remind you. Tufton told Devon during the fight that you don't like bright people. He said, I don't want to leader. was trying to challenge him. He said, said Devon no. don't like bright Let me tell you what was happening. It was Audley Shaw who was trying to challenge him. And some were supporting Audley Shaw. Some were supporting Devon for the leadership race. Yes. And at that uh -huh. point in time, Christopher Tufton was a supporter of Audley Shaw. Audley Shaw, And right. Christopher Tufton was on a public campaign with Audley Shaw JLP supporters and delegates. Uh -huh. And Long uh -huh. Tufton went on to say, and I quote, I want a leader who is not intimidated by bright people. A leader who can okay. stimulate conversation and have people who can rate it. So I say, but wait. So if there's two people running for the leadership race, one is Ali Shah uh -huh. and I know it's not Ali Shah you're talking about. It means it must be Big Nose uh -huh. Andrew Devon you're talking about. So are, yes. so, so, are, uh -huh. so is Christopher Tufton telling us in hindsight because that was a long time ago? That yes. Devon don't like bright people, I, and bright that's why, people. and exactly. that's why the education sector is going down because Devon don't like bright people, sister. Sometimes you hear exactly. something, you know. Sometimes you hear a story, and you have to look beyond the story where you hear, you know. Yes, yes. Listen to that's me. Right. Listen to me. You will hear one plus one equal two, uh -huh. but one plus uh -huh. one what? Suppose you have one banana and one mango. That not equal two mango, it yeah. equal one mango no. and one orange. And banana. Exactly. Exactly. So Christopher Tufton yeah. was telling us in hindsight that Devon don't like bright people. Yeah. And enough of we miss yeah. it, miss it. Yeah. yeah. And look how it's played out. Look yeah. how it's playing out. Oh. If he had bright people around him, um, what's his name? Chuck would have known that. The woman can't be reinstated just like that. Sure. And even tomorrow, like you said, she can't be reinstated. No, I mean, they can't. They can't have an, uh, They can't appoint a, a substitute. They're gonna have to appoint a proper DPP. They're gonna have to go to the proper channel. And guess what? I want you to emphasize this some more. The opposition must be in agreement with the appointment of the new DPP. Lula Malula Mahala Mahula Mahala Mahai. Yeah, and that was pointed out by Mr. Mr. What's his name? Mr. Wildman the Wildman, other night. Wildman, yes, the attorney. So, so, you know the what? attorney, yes. So we are yet to see what is happening because guess what? They are about to mm -hmm. find a replacement and, and, I'm right. glad you raised that issue. I'm a one student for listen to teacher now. Me want yes. uno for listen to me. I want mm. uno to open in the ears. I want two of the students to put the, the ears emoji in the comments now. Make us see two of put two ears emoji in the comments to, so that I can see that you're listening to me and you're hearing me. Put two ears emoji right. in the comments. Let me want to know from now. I am giving you... Mm -hmm. A one in. I love no. that song. No. Yes. A new PP, DPP ought to be appointed. Must be appointed. Ought to yeah. be appointed. After, after, only after the commission, the, the, um, that board has been reinstated After because they the, don't have anybody on that board remember that's right so the board the public must be, service commissions there so, is no public service commission yes so they have to As reinstate they have to re they, they have to reappoint and they have to appoint, have to appoint, have to appoint a and new reinstate. a new slate of officers that's for right. the public service commission so they can do the arm um, selection yes but they i mean so they can do the installment but, of the dpp but 
once they appoint the new board of directors or whosoever and right it, 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 and they they select a candidate the opposition leader must be notified must and be consultation agreement. consultation must be yes. done with him and i use yes. this opportunity to warn the pnp Mark Golden, I know you're listening to the program. Are your people listening to the program? Listen to what me I say. You see, just like uh -huh. Owen, them did a pint Bigfoot Chevron to the post, I only never in agreement, but you know, make that it go on in a good fear. Again. That's not going to happen again. Do that won't happen again. Listen to me. Trust me. Listen, I, no, I, make sure, I make sure I tell them, in a sister. You might say it, but me make sure I tell them. We have them. to tell them. We have to tell them. We have and to tell me, them. And let me just repeat. Just like how when mm. they appointed Madam Bigfoot, the Prime Minister wife, Chevron, as the Speaker of the House, mm. and the PNP supported her. They did not uh, uh, voice their dissatisfaction or disapproval with her. And afterwards, everybody has mm. said only the quiet in the first place. What I'm saying to the PNP yeah. is that the very moment someone is selected and brought before mm. Mark Golding, if you no not agree with the person, say you no not agree. Agree. You hear yes. me sure telling exactly. them from early? Exactly. You hear me sure saying it from early? Let yeah, your well, I voice don't, I don't think the same color dog going to bite them twice. Mm. Well, I, I don't just think the same sure, color dog going to bite them twice. Well, I just make sure I tell them, sister. I just make sure I tell them to them do the right you thing. You may have to tell them. We have to tell them. That's right. So sooner or later, we you must tell say, them. Oh, need that right with the new DPP when the, when the DPP in a, in a, good in a the labor right packet. So we have to make sure that this mm. person is neutral. Somebody who is not in anybody's yes. pocket, nor on anybody's payroll, and not performing right. anybody's duties, nor fulfilling their agenda. And then they can, and then they can, they can um, get, um, what's his name, Patrick Bailey to books. Lord oh, gee, man, I tell my way now, my I never hear nothing. And uh, what I say, once them come in play, they must bring Patrick Bailey to books. I, I won't even Patrick Bailey exactly. again. I won't even Patrick Bailey again. Yeah, I you know who. Mm. I won't mm. the, the murder was committed in his house. Oh, murder lady. The, um, um, Devon's lawyer, Devon's former lawyer, he's disbarred now, so he can't represent nobody, not even himself. So, lady, you mean to tell me, say, man, a dead in a, in a the prime minister, former lawyer house? Man, a dead? Like, oh, that's, well, I, that's still news. That's a long time well, ago. No, man, I sick, I sick him sick and dead. Him, him died, him died of, him, him sick and died from, 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 from diabetes. Yeah, he shot himself, eh? <laughs> I shot the sheriff, but I didn't shoot the deputy. Poo, poo, poo. Lord Jesus, you know, it's, it's, it's almost two o'clock in the morning where I am. So, okay, now let me ask a question. Oh, which side of the world you are? Would you like to? Oh, which, 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 which side of the world you are? Which, which country? Get the Atlas out. I'm in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean. You're in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean. Well, all right. I'll see if I can ask no. Devon because he knows places to tell us exactly <laughs> where you are. Blessings to you, my friend. Thank you. And have a good and night. To you. Bye All bye. Right. Thank you. Bye. Yes, my viewers and subscribers, at Topic Students, them, them eloquent and nice, you see. At Topic Students, them eloquent and nice and decent, you see. But, student, I wanted to listen to your leader, Mark Golden. Listen to your leader, Mark Golden, and tell me what you think of this statement. Hold on, let me get my phone. Listen to your leader, Mark Golden, and what he's saying, and tell me if you're proud of him and, and, and what he has to say on this matter. Listen up. The Opposition People's National Party is issuing this urgent statement to the nation in light of the government's confused response to last Friday's Constitutional Court ruling, which declared that the legislation to extend the tenure of the former DPP beyond September 23 last year is unconstitutional and void. Our objective is to ensure that the nation avoids the impending constitutional crisis that could arise should there be no acting DPP in place by tomorrow morning. As our eminent legal representatives have pointed out with clarity in their urgent correspondence to the government's legal team yesterday, the continuation of Ms. Llewellyn 
in her post beyond her lawful term is not only unconstitutional, but is also a grave misstep in governance. A copy of their letter has been published with our release to the media this afternoon to underscore the severe implications of ignoring the court's ruling. If the government adamantly insists on the former DPP continuing to purport to hold that office, her actions would no longer be validated by law and it could plunge the country into an even deeper crisis. Furthermore, the current absence of a public service commission whose term was negligently allowed to expire on the 31st of March this year, without a new commission being put in place to ensure seamless public administration, is a significant oversight by the government that could hinder ongoing public services, including the critical appointment of an acting DPP. Finally, it is clear that the public statements of the Attorney General, Dr. Derek McCoy, and the Minister of Justice, Honorable Delroy Chuck, in the wake of the Constitutional Court's decision, represent either a profound misunderstanding or a deliberate obfuscation. Students, don't you realize that the government had it all up their sleeve all along? Don't you realize that the government even allowed the Public Services Commission to expire? Don't you see that the government is not on top of things? They're not a brisk on things. Just like how they make the permanent secretary have to pay back the money. They make the three years pass so she do have to pay back the money. They sat and, wa and waited for the time for the Public Services Commission to expire so that the DPP could continue. You don't realize that them do it. They had it all planned together. So this even unravel how far they went. Which government would have allow an entity or organization like that to just expire? So, if you know so the time come and it expire, reinstate it immediately. But it just goes to show how far they're going to cover the tracks. ...of the law as expressed in the judgment of the Constitutional Court. Their actions have fatally undermined their credibility as holders of those important offices. Accordingly... The People's National Party is calling for their immediate resignations as Attorney General and Minister of Justice, respectively. We urge this administration to consider the gravity of this situation and to act in the best interests of Jamaica's democratic principles and good governance. The yes, my viewers and subscribers, talk to me. Give me a phone call and tell me what you think about it. The people them wait and make the summer expire. The people them wait and make the board expire. Talk to me now, students. When you talk to me and tell me the truth. When you talk to me and tell me the truth if them people are not wicked. When you call me, students, and tell me if them are people are not wicked. Them know exactly what they are doing. You know? No, sir. Them people are love split teeth for true. Lord Jesus. Them people are love split teeth more than me. Them people that love split teeth more than me to rot it cut because me can't imagine so the mother they listen 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 to what listen to what Chuck and, and Devon tell Paula them say Paula I will cross the ocean for you DPP I will go and bring you the moon I will be your hero your strength anything you need I will be the star in the sky. I will let you wait for all time. I promise you, DPP Paula, for you I will. I'm going to appeal the case in the court. And I'm going to try to keep you in. Yes, my viewers and subscribers, that is what them said to Paula. Welcome to the program, Carly, live on a topic. Them now, Lego Paula, Paula. Yes, I was just texting you to ask you what time you ended that night because I just cannot. Um, you and um, you and Andre, I see those two program, and sometimes they mix me up. Anyhow, I wanted to ask. I want to ask you a question. You remember? You didn't know when Lambert Brown did have a program in the day. Lambert Brown. You remember? Oh, well, what was yes, it? Was? This guy, the, pro the program you say you run from the university, and and you only Scott and you only abolish it because 
we were like Lambert. So that program that day anymore. But some time ago, um, Daryl Vaz came. I write it down, you know, I have a book on my brand that I keep those notes in. Daryl Vaz came on the day. He was the first one to talk about what you call him now, what you call Mr. Ones. Devon, big Daryl Vaz Devan. was Devon. 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 You know, you know that man from Port and he was the first one query how Andrew get get so much money to build big house. You didn't know that? Well on the lady, well on the lady. Let me a cute tips make a clean up me yes. The well on the lady. <laughs> yes. lady. Push one yes, well on the well on the well on the lady. Well on the lady. Well on the lady. Well on the sister. Sister, well on the well on the well on the well on the I want you to I want you to go up on your dresser and take out one of your q tips them. Out of the little run. Now have them close to me. Now have them close to me. It's all right. I beg you push. I beg you push one three four. Me and stretch out. Give me to the phone. Make a clean up me. Yes. Um, what you all say? right. Try your own. Try your own. Try your own. Try your push more than one. Lord Jesus. Me find them. What you say? So you mean say the man from Portland. Yes. Will you say the man from yes, Portland. Yes. He was the first one. That's why the PNP was campaigning on it. And in the 2016 election. But this Peter Phillips was champion in the right way. He didn't make too much of that take it up, take up in time. Yes, this guy was first queried. You see, if you see if they wanted to lose 2016 election, then that that she will not take because they don't like him. That's why everybody wants to get the money. 2016, you would have to win that one. Merciful yes. Savior. Yes, Lambert Brown. Um, Daryl Vaz, who um, talk about it and Lambert Brown program, want to know where Andrew, Andrew gets so much money. You realize that Andrew went out name cannot in the house. People not thinking about that. You know that? Sister Wolande, Wolande, man. Chama. You better believe it. That no, was on the man. Air. Sister Wolande. Sister. Sister Wolande. Sister. Well, I know, give me a little time for eat the donut, mom. No man, and I make me choke. Remember, I don't. Well, I know, man. Remember, say donut sweet and wally pass sugar the pan of donut. Give me a little time yes. for digest the donut. Well, I know. Sister, well, sister, 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 sister. Well, I know. You just a choke me with the donut. So it's too sweet. Well, I know, man. You better clear your choke. Yes, clear man. Let me clear my choke with the donut, man. So you are telling us, well on the man, just give me a minute, yes. let me clear my throat. And my time this and no, me soon you about the floor. This give me a minute. Gossip. Give me this a minute. Sister, a sister, he sister, he sister, he sister, he sister. He hello, yes. hello. Just give me one minute. Hold your point a second, sister. <laughs> no, just hold on a second, student. Students will never understand how yes. the class work. Anytime I have a point mm -hmm. and I ask you to hold the point, hold the point and I emphasize it, make other people hear it because sometimes they don't get the point. This lady. Uh, Sister Wolan, sister man, sister nobody, sister you come with the fire, just Wolan. Wolan on the bed, I Wolan on the bed sheet, Wolan on the pillar till me let you go. Wolan. Students. So you mean to tell me, say, Daryl Vaz, according to you, was the first yes. sister, 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 don't say yes, don't say nothing, just give me 30 seconds and don't, just not respond to me. All right, just listen, just listen yes, to you, listen. okay. So you mean to tell me and my students all over the world and in Jamaica that, that students when I listen to this excitement, you know, you mean to tell me that Daryl Vaz Compan Lambert Brown, PNP Lambert Brown, you say Lambert uh -huh. Brown did have a program up by UWI. I think it was New Star 93 FM or one of them, something there. I, I remember uh -huh. the channel. I remember the station up there. I remember the station up by UWI. And you mean to tell me, say, Daryl Vaz, go up on the program, go ask, uh -huh. say, where Andrew Devon get so much money from the building big house and a little bit after... Devon lock down the program. Your time now, lady. Uh -huh. I saw the story go. Yes, after I'm coming to her, I'm, I'm lock it down. You know, you're not going to come up there again. Yes. Lady, lady, lady. That, that wicked boy, yes. Lady, I want bomb shell drop. How are the bread and butter and white rice? I, I tell Mr. Lady. A lot of people will remember because I used to make most of those important things, yes. So you say all Daryl Vaz in at the beginning, 
did a question or oh, Andrew. <laughs> Students so in the year there? When you, when you students they tell you press here, they don't like Andrew. Daryl Vance was the first one to take the out of the air. Yes. And I want to tell you now that the wife name is not in the house, it's not in Mr. and Mistress, what they want to name. It's not. And it was very easy if it was the PNP, the neighbor, right? They would require it. Why the wife name not in it? A true, why the wife name not in a it? Why the wife name not in a it for true? And that's not why the pity them name uh, alone they pan it. Why the wife name not they pan it? Oh, uh, uh, it was very easy. It's just because of the involvement with a part of the family and them have the same name. Yes. Remember all the mother did come out and say she went to some people? The mother did come out, you know? It's just brown well, mother did come out on the air and say she went to see people for you when her son named that all kind of things. Yes? Well, on there, 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 well, on there. Who for mother did come out for years? Hey! Hey! Well, on <laughs> Well, and the lady, lady, and news, they tell me, you know, me don't know them, so, lady, what, lady, who for mother, Devon mother or Shevan mother? Shevan mother, because he's the brother that's involved in that house. His money, so and he was in trouble. So you And the mother, Shevan she, she, mother said she went to sue people. She come out and the media said she went to sue people. I don't know who she can see because I know she can see the PNP then, yes? Oh, where the brother? Lady, oh, me never know them something there. So you say, all Shevan mother come out and she go sue people one time through the matter about the son. Yes, yes. I don't know if it was Peter Philip she wanted to sue her, what, but this one did take place. A lot of things used to come out, you know. A lot of things used to come out about that family. Yes, man, I'm sure of that. Lord, sister, you dumb, me. Mm -hmm. You know a sign language, a sign language, me, I go start talking to you now. Look if I can say. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Pig like me, I can't believe what they're saying, sister. So this just you brings, this just comes to confirm that they don't like him because if a such man you say I wanted the first person for bring it pan the news the person program. Who started it. That's the person who started it. And guess what? Devon That's why Peter Phillips was running with it so much. And Devon couldn't take no action against Vaz. Him go take action against Lambert Brown and lock down the program. Let me tell you what we know say Devon had a long time the man has say I'm a dictator, you know. Listen to but me. But isn't that Vaz locked down the program? I've, 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 the big news was not. The big no, yeah, me I say, but him couldn't take no him couldn't take no action against Vaz for talk. Right, right. So he mm -hmm. go lock down Lambert yes. program. But listen to me, sister. A long time the man has shown. Well, I know. A long time the man has shown. Same as a lock down dictator. I'm love lock down and mash on people. Mm -hmm. Let me show you something. Mm -hmm. You just said to us that him lock down Lambert program. Listen to me. Mm -hmm. You know, say a him put gag out upon Zara Burton. 18 degrees north program when she investigated him. And yes, said, big old. yes. That man is very vindictive. Yes. Yes, I remember Lara Burton. She used to talk some things, especially on um, the Umbrella program. So let me ask a question. So let me ask a question. So let me ask a question now. If you are a prime minister and you're running for prime minister, and people are doing their investigations. If you are clean and you know you're clean and you have nothing hiding, why are you shutting down programs and putting gag order on programs? You know, make a sister. So answer me, no sister. Students, I want to know. Students, I wanted to answer me this question. Students, if you can type, type the answer in the comments. If you are a prime <laughs> minister, Sister, I'm going to ask you to answer for me now. But since you are the ear, you can answer. But the students, I want them to type it. Let me ask everybody the question. If you are a prime minister and you're running a country and people are doing investigation into your wealth and how you, how you get your assets, if you know that you have nothing hiding, why are you shutting down radio programs that speak about it and putting gag order on TV programs that speak about it? Lady, you tell me why you think he would do that now. Tell me why, lady. Because you have something hiding. You have something hiding. And that man is just evil. So listen to me. He's just 
So, 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 we want a man for a so, 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 we want a man for a lead where have things are hide. I'm going to give him a hard time. I'm sorry for him, I'm not going. But I'm going to say, I'm not going to go to the street 2.30 during the by-election. Oh, Jesus. I'm not going to go to the man for things so you work like a dog. I still love. And still you don't win the election? Yes. Yes. 2.30 during the by-election. I'm not going to go to the street. Who could have questioned us that way? I'm not going to go to the underdog. And you have more of that to get. Yes. That man is an evil man. Anyhow, I'm listening to you. You still on the air? Yes, I'm still on the air now, sister. Oh my God. Up on the ear, yeah, right now. You. So you never know what's up on the ear, you know everybody at ear. You're up on the ear, sister, right now. You're up on the ear. Oh, you know, the first time I listened to you, I was in Florida. I used to go to bed late at night. And I remember one night I was strolling through my phone at 11 something. So I set up. I wonder if this is something that can already. And I make sure I put your number on my other phone. I just look for it and write in it. Yes. In this phone, too. In this phone, I put it. The man you're doing well, man. Continue. All right, my sister. So when I leave Andre, when I leave Andre, I just come over. All right, my sister. Because you know, I, have to, I have to go with Andre every night. All right, my sister. Every now and again. Maybe when you know, when I get me go cross, me go sometimes me get mixed up. So I say, alright, when Andre gone, because yes. you know not seeing later than ten o'clock. Yes. Yes, and I heard you and Andre things night too. Yeah, so it goes sometimes, you know, this you share students. Sometimes yeah, the students have go back you up. You guys are doing go. well. You guys are doing well. Pressure that big nose, but Mr. Graham well. Yes. <laughs> Alright, my sister. You see the picture with the two you see the picture with the two father? Lord sister, Lord Jesus, what a judgment. I don't know nothing about the man, Father, I'm also. May I wait for the DNA? You don't see the two pictures. When you get the DNA? The woman from, the woman from down the country said, no, grandma, you know, have big boys and grey eyes. Well, I'm glad you did listen to her. When you get the DNA, you send it, come give me so I can show the students them, all right? You don't know, just see how much you put them up. That's why I am telling you when you get the DNA. Andre <laughs> to get the DNA. Andre is the best one. Okay. All right, my love. So we're watching Mr. Bromley. Let him go on, man. He'll soon get caught. All right, blessing to you. We're just going to the five names now, not going to come out. Yeah, all right, my sister. Blessing to you. We'll all right, one. Good. Good night. I'm listening to you. What time end your program? We do have no specific time. Last time we went up until three oh, o'clock. Three o'clock in the morning. Oh my God! Don't night. tell me. So what time you sleep? Eh? What time you sleep? When the Lord says sleep. In the day. When the Lord says sleep. Oh my God. <laughs> No, man, you need your night rest, man. No, but listen, still have to learn. In these times, you have to entertain the students and teach them what yes. needs to be done. Some yes, because some of us sleep and wake. I tell you, some of us sleep and wake sometimes. And sometimes I wonder if you're still on the program or is recording me listening to. No recording. Sometimes I run class seven hours, eight hours. Last night at 3 43, we're in class. And at the man at 3 40, or almost 4 o'clock. So I'm still going sometimes. Just a while ago, I checked the phone and I see where you live at 11 something. So I'm still still. Still on the program then, man. Yeah, we're still up on the program now, sister. So we'll go to work. We have to do yes. our matter. So we'll work the yes, over Mr. here. Atapi, put the fire under Mr. Bramwell, man. Yes. Put the fire there. We now let it go. That evil man. We're and listen, this Louis Lini, because you want to keep Louis Lini, that should not do any prosecution against them. Yes. But you might have, he make a big mistake. Yes. All That's right. why I'm keeping her, you know, because you know, she she, she she prosecute any of them. All right, Because she's good for that. All right, my sister. All right. Blessings All right, second to you. teacher. Thank you. Blessings to you, my friend, and thanks for Bye calling. Bye. And thanks for listening. Big up yourself. Bye. Yes, my viewers and subscribers. Hey, the students are not easy now. I think my students are easy. Lord Jesus, only not easy at all. But big up the lady, the lady. I taught, taught the things, them students. Yes, Carla, welcome to the program. You're live on our topic. Good night. Trust me, man. Right now, we're just sitting there. Belmont Road. We're too dangerous, man. Where's the Belmont Road, Alanisar? Where's the Belmont Road? 
And he said, I'm going to have a bad man man. It's a dangerous man. I'll be a gimmick. I'll be a short. A long time ago, I'm going. Well, that's right. I'm not you, you say. I hear, I, you're not, you, you can talk up a little bit louder. You sound extremely low. You sound echo. You sound muffled. I'm not hear you. I know the students say I can't right. hear you good either. So that's it. You say. He hot. He damn hot. You what? see, when Andrew Owens start work on New Start 93 FM, yes. he always have this ulterior motive, you know. A lot before him going to politics. Because around the time when there was this program called Breakfast Club. Yeah. I heard about that program. But I tell you this, when I read to my backside, I'm a great boss team of you know what um master's degree in development studies. When 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 who help him get it? And I think more of you know who help him get that degree. Come on, I think same work for that. Who help him get what? Huh? Well, and I'm not here to call Who help him get what? I'm not here. So you, you, your phone has got in. A master's there. degree in development studies. Oh, master's degree. You know what I'm saying? Well, and brother, yeah, hold, my brother, hold on, hold on, brother. 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 Hold and be careful how you deal with her. Her own her. Yeah, man. What did that call her? Me never did that hear the call her good attack. I must say something about... See, there's one I've got to play that back for you. Well, I remember hearing what that call her said. I have to listen back to what that call her said. Because I never understand what the call her said. But I hear the caller, this says something about, about, about be careful how you play with Juliet. Wholeness. Students, what the caller just said a while ago? I hear the caller say something about Andrew, but I never. What land there? hear the caller no me couldn't hear the caller go the caller was saying that uh andrew have a, have a master's in a development studies well and he was saying that devon have a master's well and the students he was saying that devon had a master's in a development studies and he was saying oh devon get the master's because him don't think devon work for the master's he was also saying that Devon used to work at New Star 93 FM and he had some ulterior motives from back then. But he always said that in belief say Andrew Olness family, him saying believe said Devon family must be involved in an in a in a narcotics. That's how him say. Him say in belief so the man says so I don't know me. And him say we have to research about Juliet Olness and careful how you deal with her. I don't know what that means, Carla. I don't know. And he said Devon's relative. I don't know about you say, Carla. You just come and gone. What do you mean by Juliet Olness? I wait name there. What do you mean by Juliet Olness? I want him to call back the Carla and ask him what you mean by research about Juliet Olness and where you say wrote her or do wrong her. I wonder if I call back the Carla. But, him, but the phone quality never so good, students. The call, the call quality never so good a while ago, so I never even hear what I say. But what a bang around in the atopic class, students. Yes, Carla, welcome to atopic. You're live. Good night, Sister Hello. Welcome to the program, Sister Hello. How are you doing? Very good. Although, in between, it's annoying. And good night to you and everyone. Yes. 
I'm telling you, boy, it's pure, it's pure problems here. Remember one time you used to wear the T-shirt that said Jamaica, no problem? Yes. I mean, you all the problem is, problems is here. Because, you know, um, after the court with, um, with the DPP there, I tell you, and I, lie, I listen to everything, and I, when I lie in my bed last night, I'm telling you, tears come out of both eyes. I mean, I'm crying, you know. Trust me. When I look at the situation, I match it up with the things there, with everything. I'm telling you, man. The only thing you could see is that within yourself, the only thing you could really to say and say is that um, time, time is really coming down because. Some things that they want to bring down on us, some type of rules and regulation. I'm telling you that. I don't think Satan wants him down there. Mighty I God. don't think so. No man, no one at all cannot have been thinking that they had. Wow. And I mean to say, the, 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 the rules they want to bring down are compared, to the, are compared with, the, um, with the thing there, what I see, like the other documentary. Yes. It coming out of a Kevin thing. The documentary show you like the like the enjoyment, like we call it saying we'd have a day at the beach. Mm. Or we'd have a day at the river, like going to enjoyment place. Mm. It shows you where that the beach won't be there anymore. Mm. The river won't be there anymore. All the enjoyment chop. When I say chop, I mean to say that we cannot go there anymore. It's like say we stuck into the area where we compelled to stay and cannot move. Yes. As Kevin did, as Kevin did say that we are going to have um, martial law. Yes. Hello, I mean to say, and I will say it again. <laughs> if we Jamaican do not wake up and press against these oppression here, yes. God Almighty, the, 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 the judgment already Jamaica first before any other country. Yes, before <laughs> any other country. You know how long the man, the man have them black drum to put them out there? It's not yesterday. He have them out there a long time because they have agenda carried out. I can't believe that the man take away the pump. So if he take away the pump, when water come then? How then are you going here to pump water to the people? Eh? I, and I noticed that the people are eh, so happy getting the damn jump and then do not, some of them do not even know if they could be then dead, then grave, then grabbing up. They are so happy that they get one tank. No matter you want a tank, people are looking into things, no? Look into things and see anything you see. And a matter of fact, it is so important for the people to read some, something in the Bible. You have to read everything, you know. But what I mean to say, read little by little and get some sense. Because the Bible tells you, say, the, 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 um, tell you about the legislator. It tell you, the Bible tells you plain, you know. It tell you about the legislator, say what they're going to do. They're going to have a promote, promote spirit and a promote spirit, everything. It is opposite to the truth. It's yeah. pure fool and going to fool. So they use the truth and turn it on in the lies. And exactly that, that is what's happening. And when you read the word and when you connect with what you've seen, I'm telling you, so I give you the strength to hold on to Jesus more. Yes. So there, therefore, then being you know the words. And as the Bible says, they're going to prosecute you too. And why? Because they hang on to Jesus. But we're telling the truth, you know. I put it in myself, in my blood, that any time or if they do come across a prosecutor for Jesus, I'd rather die. I'm telling you, I'd rather die for Jesus, but so, I'm not so, going to die, so die on, because Sister Eloa. of loving so Satan. So, Sister Eloa, so listen to me now. So, you say you, you if anything yeah. you have to choose, you'd rather die, you choose Jesus and die. Yes. All right. So, let me ask you one because question now, what? Sister Eloa. So later from this now, when the mark come in and they say, Sister Hello, we are going to give you the chip. You have to take the chip into your hand. Come and give me your hand. Sister Hello, let me put the, oh, the mark. I don't like this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, because remember that, you know, the Bible say, yes. if you receive the mark of the beast, you have no... You have, you have nothing to do, him have nothing to do with you. Because you receive the mark of the beast, the 666, 
you have no peace with God. Yes. A death of your faith I go a death of your faith I go I go um prove it now. Yes. But Hello, let me tell you something. Let I tell you something. I get a dream already and that the dream what me get in a boss man. Yes. It is to show you. Don't think so when you're dead it's it dead it's finishing. I don't it just started. You know? I don't think so that don't have power, you know. And let me tell you something. You see, in our lifetime here, yeah, we're beat up in difficulties and we need someone to help us to get out of that difficulties. Yes. And you cannot find no one to get out of it, you know, or oh, nah, in that is. You're going to be like a stumbling block if you don't come out of it. Do you understand what I say? Mm-hmm. I agree with you. Right. So, therefore, when you're dead, or when a person dead, and then dead out of Christ, the same liberty what you have here in the flesh is the same way it's going to manifest in the spirit. So therefore, when you're in the spirit and when things reaches you and you need someone to take you across that bridge to reach to, for, for your desire to go wherever, you're not going to have no one because Jesus is not be with you. No, you won't, you won't be with you because that is the life that you live from in the flesh. So anything you put in the flesh, is it going to be actually call it the photocopy for later? That's what is going to be in the spirit. And if you die out of Christ, you're going to be out of Christ the same way. How can you how can you expect to get help when them in the flesh you didn't try to get the one who to cross you from difficulties? So I think so in the spirit you're going to have that? No, you're not going to have it. And that will be for you in your life to it completely eternity. You'll never find your way out because there's no forgiveness in the grave. Let me tell you something. It's a diamond we have on, on, on us here. But I must say that it is the part uh, it is a it is a part of the fulfillment of the Bible. But I mean to say we cannot give up. You have the we have the good spirit and we have the bad spirit. So therefore whichever leader is trying to lead us in the direction with, our, with, with what suit our desire, we have to follow that one. And that is the one that have love, because love is Jesus Christ. So if we to follow the one that is combustible, how we're going to find a way out? And him, uh, him is a human being like we, him in our Christ. And a matter of fact, what he's saying, it don't, it, it don't match up with what God say. So we need to see, people need to see and understand this thing. I need some prayer and then need action behind it. Because all the man I give us here is pure Radam. And the real Radam we get in, I'm telling you. No, Jesus. So and you're going to work. So, Sister Hello, I'm going to question work. Now. Suppose look a bit from this time, say so you have to take the needs to go to look help into the hospital. No, it is. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. In the name of Jesus Christ. No. No. Master God said what you want. You must ask. It shall be given to you. Hello. Master God can put on sign in there. You know that? <laughs> hey. Master God can put on sign. Me remember seven times they get going. So we hooked by the by America there in the White House. You know, some lightning they jump right at the doorway there. You never hear about it. Oh, that one they go. Repeat that one there. I'll, a lightning the drop at the White House, America, there at the doorway, somewhere there at the White House. Yes. When they when they are carrying the heap of mixing up up there and a whole heap of something up there, they turn upside down. A lightning drop up there. A lie. So, so lightning strike up Hello. at the... the well, and this, and lightning the strike up there, drop somewhere up at the White House there. When they are in a whole heap of corruption. Hello, now is the time when people for see Master God man move like in you see a normal man out there walking, you know. But we have that for see it. Hello, give me the thing. <laughs> hello, I read. Uh, hello, let me tell you. Hello, let me tell you something, man. This time, remember, they take down some notes, you know, because the man will make the chip, you know, so the man will make the chip in, 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 in convert. Because there is, there are some people, the top people, them, what I put down the pressure right now, we have the, 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 the name brand them and all of those people. And them get a man to we do designing with all of those things, to design the thing. Yes. And then call him up. Then call him up. 
And when they call him up, then give him the work to do to make the thing there. And, him, and then, then they tell him and say, do not read your relation. No? Because they know that the Bible is the truth. That's why they want to withdraw the Bible in some place that you cannot use Bible. Yes. Right? Instead of saying, man must not read revelation, because, um, in a tell him why. But anyway, the man go by the heart and he did not read revelation. And he go ahead and he make the chips. And when he make the chip and everything is finished and all of that, the man go back and the man read the Bible. It's a big rich man, they have peace over lakes and all of those things. Yeah. When the man read the Bible and when the Bible tell him, the man cry and him beg God forgive him. Yes, and in call the university in in um un, university in in America no, sorry, not the yes, the university in Boston. Yes. And when him hawks the people them if the chip can be broken, like when they put it in the hand, yes. They tell him yes. I know why you ask them because she didn't read the Bible. Because I read it and the Bible say the chip what them going to put in you is going to break. Mm. And when that break, it cannot well. And the name of that wound after it break it name malicious wound. I know some malicious when somebody vex. Yes. So quite likely must have got break break the break that that chip in your hand uh, whether in your file whether them put it it's going to break and when it break it is the evidence to show that to take the chip Mighty there's God. no forgiveness to you because you were told in the bible say anyone take up the mark of the beast will not see him but sister hello you and in this, your house now sister yeah? hello and them say you have to take the mark of the beast to get food at the supermarket. If you don't have the mark, you cannot get no rice. You can't get nothing to plant in your backyard. You can't get no seed for go plant no food. You can't get a, a loaf of bread, pound of sugar. Oh, yeah, go manage. Oh, oh we are go manage, sister. Hello. Um, but Jesus said, don't worry. Don't worry. He will take care of everything. So you say no matter what that go on, you not take too. it, sister Elo. You not take it no matter what go on. No, do not take it because Master God can fix it. He will fix it for you. He is going to fix it for you. And moreover, that's, that's when so for Elex's sake, he's going to shorten the time. So I, I, when those challenging times come, Master God not going to have him peep it down yet to suffer because of mankind. Yes. No, it's not going to have you there to suffer with mankind. And things and things is boiling up because remember that the thing there, it, 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 the, 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 um, the thing they're going to last for seven, seven years. Right? The so therefore, the time is climbing, time is going. Right? So, so I, I happy to know that Mark Gold in them stand up because those people have some breed and motive behind them. And you then get let go in the master. And the same thing they call me in the needs. Remember, so the court threw it out in that. People need to know that the court threw it out in there. Did you remember that? <laughs> in, Mark Gold in them put him a court, put him a court with and the court threw it out because the court said that says people private business and all of those things. And him still pushing the thing. But listen, all them smart people free the agenda, them, you know. Them very smart. Remember, so when they were coming with something with it, with it put in a paper body, the substance there. The joke. The people, the people, them paying people to take it, those who resisting from take it. And them say, if you never take it, you would not work. Pers- you can't work mm-hmm. in your job. Right. So, so me if, it, me if you put substance on my body because just to own the job? No, it's not going to work. They say, they, they say and, and at the same time again, paying you for go and take it. I mean, just, and the, in much of you know, the Bible, you know, the Bible says, I'm going to compel you and I'm going to demand you. It is taking away your right because doing that you, you within yourself, it's it looking suspicious. So why should I go against my will? No. That's why we have sense. We have to follow up. We have to see. So whenever time me pass them, they're taking a joke. All that come in my head is, is that, oh, they are at the slaughterhouse. So you never they take the joke? They are at the slaughterhouse and don't know. So wait a second, you never take the joke? Oh, you're mad? Hello. No, from the, first, from the first thing come out, you know. I listen to the news on the phone, you know. When, be, when the goat say that those <laughs> batch of, of, um, of injection is, is for the... It is for um, our nation. 
right? It's for our nation. So I say, wow, this looks suspicious and all of something there. Yes. And I continue to listen it and listen it and listen and listen. And when I see it match up with the Bible, with what they say about the legislator, and match up with some something there with the man we make, we then get to make cheap and all that. We put everything together. And we say, no, this don't right. I could never put that thing in there because those substance there is a magnetic thing where they want to hook you up now when they need Because when they hook you up and they need you know, that coming like when you carry a telephone go hook up at the place. You know, that, that's anywhere you is. When you ring me and I ring you, we can hear each other. You know? And everybody going to get a number. So when they touch for your number, then don't know what. When they put in your name, you jump up. Yes, and then and then was... going to monitor you anywhere you go, the more monitor you and any business or what of you because you're control under the world one other. That is that uh, anything uh, if you talk against them, them can them shut off your needs. Are you care by not and do not need a sister? You know that I monitor how much money you get. Everything I know, I know people are going to feel hungry, you know, large. Yes, but that's why myself got dead in Jesus. Come on, I got to go up to the place. Master God, I go up to the place. So. And anything the Bible say, it I go happen because it might be so, but it's gonna be sure. We are in the revelation. No. We are in the revelation. It is not about it is not about our vanity that we have right now. It is about get something to eat and love each other and spread the love of God. Because Master God say a Christian is to cultivate love. Whoever you encounter, you used to share. Share it. But it's a, but it's, it's a, hello. not going to be business but as a, usual. But a Jesus said Christian is supposed to love and share. But Devon said is a Christian and Shevan said she a Christian too. And that, that's what they're saying. But it was, if it was from their heart, it would be shown in their word and in their action. Yes. So they can say anything because Master God never come down, come all them out, you know. Yes. No, Master God word going to show in you because in say, for you have up his word and all of that, the seal of God is on your forehead, my dear. Yes. Your action can be tell on all of those things. So whatever they want to say, they can always say it. Because Master God give us the word there, what we to, to, to use as our guide. Yes, so when the evil come up and we we supposed to uh, we supposed to have up have up the word of God that we can able to counteract it. That's right, sister. That's right. It's sister. not going to be chugger. It's not going to be uh, um um every day you get up with the sun and with the what and what. It's not going to be business as usual. Kevin, yes, everything that Kevin say, it is true. Too. It's, it's true, and why I say it's true is, is because you see there's something manifest in us, in, in the face of us. Because I say, Jamaicans, your water will be taken away. Your electricity will be taken away. You're going to see um, um, what the bodies on the ground like flies. Hello? <laughs> what is it they how to do? <laughs> what is it they how to do? <laughs> what? It's not nice. And I think to, you know, uh, not really say thing, but I've seen a, a, a video there that is, I think it's in foreign weariness. So them, them, in the, 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 the people them come down, the FBI them come down for some people and make some pills. I make some pills with all type of something or make the pill for you now and building. Yes. Like pharmaceutical. Them, yes, and they say that the pills then distribute America. I think England, Canada, and all of that. So if a person feels sick and so they want X, Y, Z and go to the pharmacy and you take it, those type of things there, what going to happen? That means dead, you know? And they make a whole heap of body bags to put us in. Where they end, all country distribute to body bags. So therefore, so therefore, we have to be on our pew P on our Q because we are not sure in which way or what way things can affect us. You get them saying? Yes. 
So that's why it is nice for we to just eat what we know, so we grow our, so we have a backyard farm and all of those things, just to uh, to, to to see if we can get away from those type of uh, of, of mix up things where they have all oh, every mix up for you to eat and then little more after, as the Bible said, the fittest so are the fittest so are gonna survive. It now go pretty, not going to pretty. It is so bad to see all of those black tongues coming out and going to people. That means to say something. But we do not know what in by by, by, by listening to the news and listen what the what the what, what the news is saying, we can match it up with things. What you have here with this question. It is not about no P now. We have to follow the leader that match up with Master God word with the truth. Yes. Or if not we're going to loss. We cannot match up with what the evil is saying because one day, one day, this world here are going to end. A master God word, word is coming little by little too. And a matter of fact, too, it says the, um, because of elect seeking, when short the time, he's going to come one behind each other. And it's that man in your mark. Mark what in your Stuart, I think? Yes, Mark Stewart. That man what preach up the thing. The man said the parliament was going to be in trouble. And don't you see it is in trouble right now? We need to press Jesus upon it. We need it in God every time they are pray. Hello. <laughs> they are pray all heap of time. And I call on the Holy Spirit all heap of time. We need to do it. We do, do it. Not just say, but we need to call on the Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, and put on the name them upon it. Yes. And bow out to Jesus and call out to Jesus because Jamaica is in serious trouble. And if we do not, if we do not look into it and do what we have to do, Jamaica is going to be the first per, the first country to 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 to, to in for in the, the, the judgment. Cause they more lock with tight like when you lock up place with padlock. Yeah. <laughs> then you lock up place with padlock. Hello. So I'm telling yeah. you, we cannot wait until when time even the next about election will come. The place can turn out the most dangerous way, I mean the most dangerous way before even election come because the man is stepping into the things them. You have not think they will figure out. Yes. And yes. They have the mission. And they have dictatorship and we are needs we out. Yes. And see, taxi men, they want to give each taxi man must say $20,000 to take this. I hope, I hope Jamaica going to wake up, you know. Going to wake up. When I remember all these things, man, I see what's going on. The only thing come in my mind is John near to Christ with me and my family. John near. Because people fail to use up them understanding and try to know and make make the senses we must have God give us nav navigate us through. We know Segwain coming up. We know Segwain come. But make sure so when you come, the way you communicate with God, you don't know say so even if you die, you die in Christ. You have to die in Christ because if you not die in Christ at this so it depends on you again. Because there's no one to help you out and nothing difficult. No, no difficulties you have. You have no one will be there to help you. Yes. No? Just like a baby there and the baby need water, the baby need to move and cannot move and you have to lift up the baby and go around and then the baby stop crying and shoot. Yes. Yeah. So when you hint that difficulties, who gonna dare to take you? Who? I hear you. My God Almighty. Ah. Oh. It is here, it is here, and I tell you, the whole of the institution, government institution, is locking down. All the common people were to get the thing, the thing for cancer, it lock, it, 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 it was repair and all of those things. No curtain in the hospital. Jesus Christ of mercy on us. <laughs> oh no. Every everything it come in like when a storm come and the river come down, everything I wash out. <laughs> and when the river finish, you see everything bank up down the gully. Nothing cannot repair. Yeah. In the name of Jesus, help us. Mm -hmm. Help yeah, us, help us, Lord. Lord. I must say, uh, we all thank you for your patience and for everything you're giving out, everything. 
Yes, when I say everything, I mean to say for we to have comfort within we say, I tell you, you know, you see, any old, we, we didn't have all these little things here where we can listen to at times. Yes. I'm telling you, the brain would be all over the place. So more times we just turn it on and we listen to two and we get jokes and wherever the joke is, we get it and all of that. Yes. Mm-hmm. What I mean to say is, is buckle up time now, buckle up time. Yes. We have to buckle up with Jesus. Yes. And I thank you for your time and everything. Yes. The Lord bless and keep you, give you full strength, energy, everything. Yes. Blood of Jesus, blood of Jesus, carry you. Okay. East, west, north, and south, and protect you from all danger, all obstacle. And when you leave in your house, uh, get a prayer what you use before you leave your house every morning or every when. Yeah. When you're going out to your door to go on the street, just read up a prayer, a, a prayer. Eat Put it dwelling. over you in the blood of Jesus. Anything I go on out, they feel even grace you. But it, but it not touch you, come as a God, in that. Yes. Tell me, they tell you. You never see vehicle crash already. On the vehicle crash, not nothing to the driver. Yes. Jesus Christ, do that car from us and God touch, you know. Just a little touching and nothing can trouble you, you know. Yes. Nothing. Tell them, sister. Because I'm sitting fine already, you know, and then the lady coming from, coming from church, I think she's a preacher. And she write two kids on the back. And she reach at a certain year and something do up and things an accident with the vehicle. I had a vehicle slam into, but before I slam into it, like the children, and said, Mommy! But by then they said, Mommy, the thing some and I tell us everybody come out good. And then just cannot know how they get out of it. But from the moment Jesus just touches us, nothing, nothing can destroy you. No matter you all in the vehicle, march up, you come out there without that scratch. Yes. So you get a prayer that every day that's going to go to your door, you make sense you read that piece of prayer there. And Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit cover you yes. from all obstacles and danger. That's I'm right. telling you because right now evil is on the place. Evil is on the rampant. Because the Bible tells you too, in this time here, the evil is going to be um, rampant in the place. Because every country, a certain amount of people is supposed to be dead. Yes. A whole lot to talk about. You see, let me try to get off the line here. Well, a whole, lot, whole lot is there to talk about because the E freight revolution can tell you. Yes. There's some, there some evil street lock up down there, and I think it's two of them is on roaming the street, right? Roaming the world right now. Yes. With the Bible tell about. Yes, because it tell you about the giant up of that river and it's giant with you. Yes. <laughs> so, anyway, let me go back in the class and listen, huh? And yes, and let us give thanks to God yes. and do what we have to do. Yes. And leave the thing what not following up to Jesus. Anybody say I preach the rod, leave it and go to the one who said Jesus. Let us not wait until when things get bad. Kevin business, Kevin work nothing here yeah, and said Jamaica wake up. Hello. Hello. <laughs> it's, it's not pretty. It's not pretty. <laughs> it's not pretty. Yeah. And people are we who have been holding on to, to, to whatever we have with a horse car, what or what? Tell yourself, say, we only eat night because we are alive. But we have to go leave it. And we can't put that on we head no matter how much money or what we have in the car money now go have no use. Look at how money going to be in the street. No use. The Bible tell us about it. So we have to make up our mind. Because the time has come. Well said. Time sister. has come, my dear. Well said, my sister. Yes. yes. So I thank you. Yes, I thank you to hear me out. And big up to everybody. Yes. And same as we have been listening to you and taking all taking all what you have been saying. That is nice. And nav- let us navigate to Jesus Christ. That's yes, right. and Jesus will direct us and tell you what to do and what not to do. Communicate with God. Okay. And more time is a, a we is at home. We must have a little music there. We play some church song. We play some church song. Thus, we can more in more uh, attached God. to God and in word. And I'm the, telling you, that is a medicine. And invite the presence. Okay. Of Hello. Hello. <laughs> Pardon me? Yes, I was saying, sister, that that's right. What are you yeah, saying? So you're saying that we must play the gospel song when we're at home. And I said that is right because we have to invite the presence of God amongst us. That's why I, mean, I always start with a gospel song, you know. You realize that? 
Me always start the class with a nice cup. I tell you, I love it. Yes. I love it. I love it. Yes. And the one ar aromatic in the name. Yes. I'm doing a good job there to aromatic. Yes, yes. man. Everybody is doing some good job there. Yes. Good job, you know, guys doing. That's right. And thank you, know. And as I say, Master God, come around because I'm bringing this thing. I see, you see if this thing never come in, where we can have a different platform to talk to. Yeah. Hello, everybody down here, Madam Mashup. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but Master God uh, is so real. Master God bring this thing to reveal. That's why I say, in the, it, what were it from the wise, uh, it's going to, it going to reveal to the babe and suckling. Now, you don't see it? You, have you seen it? I agree with you. I agree with you, sister. Hello. Everything will be because the the, the 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 internet here now, everybody of the phone then can't see everything now and the Bible tell hello, there's so many to talk. I'm going back. Make somebody get a chance. Anyway, I love you everyone and thank you for your for your 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 your, your keeping up with us and all of that. Yeah. So God bless and keep us all. No? Blessings. Yes, all right, bye bye. Hello. Well before you go. You know, say every time you call, I want to tell you that I appreciate you for calling because whatever mood I'm in, whenever you call, you always make me happy, yeah. you always make me laugh. And let me explain to you, you were preaching the gospel, you were admonishing us and telling us about Christ and living a life that is pleasing to him. And I just use this opportunity to say thank you for spreading the message because you're being a, a, a disciple of Christ, which is spreading the word. And you might not even know it, but people across the world have heard this message, sister, hello. And I'm sure that the Lord is proud of you because he said that the Bible said that the gospel must be preached throughout all the nations. That's so it say. And, and a topic... I'm telling you, I'm telling you. A topic of students in China, Dubai, Spain, all over. So them are listen to you. So your little word where you just go out a while ago is reaching out to everybody in the world. So big up yourself. I remember to pray for your teacher and pray for me and big up yourself and thanks for calling. And you know, I really appreciate you. And the students in the class, love and appreciate to everybody. I send them love for your sister. Hello. Everybody. I send them love for you. I thank you very much. And I thank them too. And let us take it serious. And always call upon the Holy Spirit because it is coming to an end. Yes. Okay, good night, right. good night. Listen, sister, hello, big up, big up. Yes. Bye. Bye. Yeah. Yes, my brothers and subscribers, that was our caller, Sister Hello. And if everybody knows that Sister Hello is one of my favorite caller. If anybody know Sister Hello is one of my favorite caller because she can dare talk some serious thing and the moment she say hello, me just start laugh like my mom. <laughs> Lord, <laughs> but sister, hello, big up yourself, <laughs> big up yourself, sister, hello, and blessings to you, Lord Jesus, blessings to you, all right, well, I'm my viewers and subscribers, and everybody who is sending me a message, I will respond to you sooner or later, but just bear with me, write it up, look at this, students, student loan borrows the Andrew Olness name in a this something, it's one of the students, I go put up, hey, I say, I love my students, let me say, students, who was, you see, me did I tell you, no, Andrew only never had no money when he come out in the parliament. I go put up a document on my screen, which show you say, Andrew Olness name. Uh, Sheba, I see you say you would like to send a contribution to the class, but you're in Canada, and you do have no, no, no cash up or Zell. Sheba. Here's my WhatsApp number. I can give you a name and you can send a Western Union to that name, all right? I can give you a name, Sheba, and you can send a Western Union. If there's anybody who like to send a topic, a little transaction, a little 50, 10, 40, anything that you have, whatever, you can send a transaction, all right? I'm giving you a name, Sheba. Here is a name. You can send me a WhatsApp message to this number, Sheba. And I will tell you the name that you can send the Western Union to. All right, Sheba? So just send me a WhatsApp message, 876-539-6220. And I will give you a name and you can send a Western Union or perhaps a money grant to that name. All right? Blessings to you, uh, Sheba. So that message is for Sheba. Just send me a WhatsApp message. Students, did you know that your Prime Minister, Devon, did owe a student loan? 
All the while. All the while, I talk about it for my program. Me talk about it. Ed Boy talk about it. Wallypa people talk about it. I am going to show you, say, Andrew Oldness named it coming at the Gleaner, same old student loan. Look upon it. Who want to see it, say, show me teacher. Who want to see it, type in at the comments, say, show me teacher. Me, I go show you, say, the Prime Minister did all old student loan. You know, student loan, when you go forget a education, when you go forget a degree, a student, a, a, a degree, them get your student loan, I have to have a guarantee. Andrew Oldness. Prime Minister, our Devon, Devon borrowed student loan and did not repay student loan. And they had to publish Devon picture in the Gleaner, publish him name in the Gleaner. Who want to see it, say, show me teacher. Who want to see it, say, show me teacher. See it here, students, and look here. Look upon the name of them circle. Mark Golin, I beg you, uh, just step to the side because the big people busy is just so now. I'm going to fix the van. So then look at this. Up on the top here, you see it where it says? Somebody read up on the top, that's all. It says, Delinquent Student Loan Borrowers. Delinquent Student Borrowers. And the date was September 6, 1996. The date was September 6, 1996. I want you to look at the name that has been highlighted. I want you to look at the name in blue that has been highlighted. Hold on, students. I want you to look at the name in blue. Look at the name in blue that has been highlighted, students. So no, hold on a second. Let me see if I can put the hot topic over here. So first, I'm put the breaking news right here. So. Yes, my student, make a, make a look back in at the chat. Look at the name that is highlighted in blue. Somebody look upon the name we highlighted in blue. If you, if you can see it good, say yes, teacher. If you never see it, tell me, say, zoom it up some more. You know what, make a zoom it up some more, phone. No, sorry. I want to show you up top. Anybody see the delinquent student loan borrowers? You see up at the top of the document here, so with the man finger touch. You know, this is a delinquent student loan borrowers. All right, let me show you the, 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 the face. Let me show you the name over name that they go to. Let me put up the name there. See the name here? Look upon the name in a, a, in a blue. See me zoom up the name in a blue there. I showed you that it says delinquent borrowers in at the beginning. September 6, 1996. Social Sciences, Uwe Mona. What is this address? Some Riverdale Park and some city Spanish town. You hear that? And some city Spanish town. Devon put an him address. Dev Andrew M. Oldness. Do you see it, students? If you see if you see the name circling in a blue, tell me say you see it. What name do you see is circled in the blue? What name do you see that is circling the blue? Come on, students. When you type in at the comments, Angeli says September 6, 1996, Angelo unpaid student loan, late charge 50%. Calligraphy says, show me teacher. Angeli says, we all know student loan for college tuition. Joyce Adams says, show me. Jason Kane says, show me. That's Prova says, me wants to say, uh, Angelo never have no money. Teacher, show the proof. See there? Want to see the proof? Want to see, see the proof? I want to tell me who for name the de delinquent borrowers are student. This man should be a champion for education in the country. This man should have make sure say, every poor people pitney get opportunity for go to university. This young man, ya, this young man ya should have make student look upon the look upon the title of the article. Look upon it. Let me look upon the title. See the title? Eh? Delinquent student loan borrowers. 
delinquent student loan borrowers. Let me make sure I'm going to look up at the top so I can see the topic. Let me put it up at the top so I can see, the, see what this is all about. See it, Mark? Delinquent student loan borrowers. Delinquent student loan borrowers. And look at the names and the address. September 1996. Who for name Who for name on yesterday? Clarissa, I tap it, go to bed, Lord Jesus. You, 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 what? Oh, Clarissa, you go work, big up yourself. Apple tree say, I see the Spanish town, but where? It's a lot, something, something, Riverdale Park. And some city Spanish town, P.O. St. Catherine. And some city Spanish town, P.O. Some lot, something, something, Riverdale Park or some kind of Riversdale. Some kind of Riversdale Park, may I say. I want to see and see me not tell you over here. Jason Kane say, no, sir, this man more than corruption. Angeli say, Andrew M. Delinquent, student loan. Andrew Burke say, yes, Andrew M. Oldness. Gadarang say, seem like Daniel gone to St. James. Jason Kane say, but teacher, it should have said Bramwell. Well, I well, I that name him did I use? Joyce Adam say, yes, teacher. Juliet say, Andrew M. Oldness. Carla Bank say, I say. So, when you see the name, when you see the name for yourself, that's where they have a the delinquent student loan borrowers, Andrew M. Oldness. Carla Graf said, 1996, no money. And when they got married, 1997, they had no money. Shevan. So, oh, them get billions. This evidence can carry good students on the call, me. No, man. Moderator put up my number. Two students have to call me about this. I hey, want somebody to call me and talk to me about this. Hour. This is a revelation. Let me get. Come on, students. This is too sweet. This is too sweet. This is too sweet, my viewers and subscribers. This is too sweet. Somebody call me. Call me, students. Call me students, you know, call me. Call me and talk to me. Who have, you know, see, oh, them a lion thief. Oh, you for wait, you know, have no big business. You know, get no big, you know, get no big contract or we know about. You know, come in with a big company. You know, win the latter. Then we want to ask you a question, sir. Eh? Talk to me, no students. Talk to me, the students. We want to know where Devon. Devon never have no money. Devon never have no money. So how come Devon come for a billions of dollars now? And him owe students loan in 1996. When I say something wrong, students. Come on, when you talk to me, man. When you talk to me, students. Well, I never be as subscribers. Me, I multitask. Wanna be with me, the students. I want to call me and tell me, you know. I want you to tell me my viewers and subscribers. I want you to tell me my viewers and subscribers. Hold on, the students. Moderator, put up my number there. Put up my number there, moderators. You know, put up my number. Put up my number, make somebody call me. Because I want to know how oh, Devon did Brook like dog. Somebody said Devon have a master's degree in development studies. Lord Jesus, I'm not going to call out Juliet brother name. Lord Jesus, what a way the students are sell me all kind of something. What a way somebody tell me all kind of lad me now call out the man name. Me now call out Judith brother name students. So no call me there. Is there anybody else who would like to call and have a discussion? Anybody else who would like to call and have a discussion? From owing student loan to not having any big company to owning billions now. From owing student loan. From owing student loan to not having any money. You claim say you come in a parliament with 47 billion yet to owe student loan. Oh, that go. Welcome to the program, my friend. Yeah. 
Yes. You know, see what I will pass for your money, Tom, and NHD money, Tom, and SSS my money, Tom, and all of the money them gone. So what you expect? Sister, you know, say there needs to be a big investigation. You know, say, you know, say, you see, let me ask you a question. Let me just ask a few questions. All along, we've heard that he owed student loan, don't? Mm-hmm. You did ever see no results yet? You ever seen? You, you ever see the, the? You ever see the information or the result for sure? Same own it. Now the first time you see the result for see same name in the paper. Now the first time you see it. Yes, they are. They didn't talk about it, but I first. May I see the results? Well, they are sure they well, know. Well, thank you for coming to a topic over here. We don't know what bring the facts out. We talk the truth. Listen to me now, my friend. Yes. You mean to tell me I want you to think about it and the rest of the students to think about it. In September 1996, they published Andrew Holness' name so that he owes money to the student loan. Somebody said they married 1997 and they didn't have any money because Chevron said that a people from another community, people in the community, they might forget to for come cook the food for them. And she all did that thing about for exactly. sell. She said she was thinking about selling an invitation where them sell them send your invitation and you pay for come like whatever, a thousand so them could have got up some money. Chevron says yes. so. So it's yes. obvious by their mm-hmm. own report they did not have any money. And you mean to tell me? Mm-hmm. You mean mm-hmm. to tell me? Mm-hmm. Did you reach out up and so, mm. No, sir. Something wrong. See, me can ask a question. Yeah. How, how which big company yeah, them own? How which Grace or, or Matalan or one of them math, math, or, or, or them big pe- How which big company Devon and Chevron own me for 10 millionaires so quick, sister? Billionaires. Teacher, you know, so they don't want everything in Jamaica. You know, so they want everything in Jamaica and every money where you see I'm missing. Adam, Why? hey, this is over Angie since night. You yes. feel listen to my Angie say about the, 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 the Portland man. Say, them forget You don't feel listen to um, teacher. Cause the the the, the labor right them are definitely hungry. I saw the man down at Portland. I say, oh. for the meat, they be get to understand. Say, like him, I say, if we get that for all because of the money them the, the labor right them are definitely hungry. I was so this a teacher. Me say over Andre hot since yes. night, but you have to listen to program to you get where me I come from. Me yes. say all of a sudden the people them they broke. But me I listen to the program teacher. Me never know say they put a gagada pan panzara panzara. Yes, and they put a gagada panzara from eighteen degrees now. Just when she bust the program and I investigated him, put a gagada panzara on TVJ. Them couldn't hear the program no more. And this is the man a dictator, brother. You know, see that? Yes, because. They say, Zara, don't be nice skin, you know, because she ask the question and them, you know. Me never know, me, me say, me fright, me, me hear, 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 the, um, the, the night program say, him, they put a gagada But everybody not put gagada pan. That, that goes to show that well, he must have, 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 have something to hide. And we don't want him. We don't want him if he have something to hide. Go on, go hide where you are. Leave the country for run. Leave the country. Teacher, you know, Mark Golden, if you do, Mark Golden, just stand up back on the next thing there. Mark Golden, just stand up back on it. Yes. Because, me know, in that minute, I take no next because, see, them country, Make we take joke. I may tell the teacher. Me realize that my body is not like anymore. You hear me say, teacher? What you say? All of a sudden, my body. Teacher, for me, get the joke. October gone, make one year, my body different. Teacher, you know how much that come me go go to ultrasound? No result, no. Uh, me go to um, colon copy. What you call it? Colon copy? Colonoscopy. Me go do all that. Yes, teacher, me go do all that. Pay how much your money. Teacher, my belly just a bloat it so. Bloat it so. Bloat it so. Mighty God. Teacher, me is a, me is a girl, me go to my gym. October, I make one year. Me go to gym year before last, um, October, November. At January, me go, me go back to gym. 
And from me go January, me no go back out to gym again. Because my body no feel like that anymore. And then on top of it too, you see through me I watch program cause you know, normally me wake four thirty in the morning to get myself ready for the gym. Yes. Teacher from January, me go to gym, me no go back, you know. But when I try to tell a teacher, say, mm-hmm. from me get the joke, my yeah. body is not the same. Sometimes if my body just feel my belly I burn me, till I see it burn me now, it's about pain. So me wake up this morning, my back up, Pain me until me did it, 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 Turn on and change something where it can't change anymore. Mighty God, sister, feel it. Do me a right. Lord Jesus. Te- teacher, me have a girlfriend with me and her at the house yesterday. And she said she have three friends with her. Two just drop down some. You see that girl teacher that I drop down with her? Yes. She said she have two friends, three friends, we drop down and her. So I said to her, say, you know, then take a joke. She said, yes, then they take a joke. Mighty God, sister. Right now, teacher, right now, the girl, she have a heart, heart problem. So I said to her, say, you, you take the joke? She said, yes. I said, you have a heart problem before? She said, no. Uh, since she realized she gets the joke, she said, it, it developed a heart problem. And teacher, I'm going to tell you this. You see, when me work, yes. the lady next door me, she take the joke. And me, I tell the friend she take the joke. The woman, six, she, six, she, six, she have a problem. Lord Jesus. have a next big man friend, same place when me work. Every minute, he just drop down. Sometimes he drop down and bust him out, bust him out. I don't know when he drop, because he must admit that I have. Youth, even when I'm a youth, they are public. He must feel it for so much medication and he take the joke. You know, we should have to take the single one, the single joke. And for the man take the joke, the man has started. Sister, to sister, long. listen to me. Hold on a second. You know, let me pause for a second. You know what I was doing this afternoon today about 12 or 1 o'clock? I was scrolling through YouTube. Mm-hmm. Pulling stories together. Mm-hmm. Checking messages from the students. Mm-hmm. But... You know what uh-huh. I was watching today? I watched about uh-huh. six to seven funeral. Listen to me, sister. Uh-huh. Me said for some reason, uh-huh. Lord James said, listen to me, man. That's why I said the Lord sometimes him just work something mysteriously, you know. Sister, no, every day me get up and do this, you know. Me said this morning, uh-huh. me I watch couple Jamaican wait name there. We call it. They have one of the man them we wait name there. Jamaica sought me him name. With the man name of a Jamaica, one channel named Jamaica oh, yeah. something. Me, soon, me, me can't remember the name, but the man have a channel called Jamaica uh-huh. something. I have one other one named Carl, uh-huh. must say Lassanic Reed. I know Lassanic Reed too. I'm sure all kind of videos don't clarin down. He man uh-huh. couple of them. And his peer uh-huh. funeral, about six or seven funeral today alone. Uh, when me look a peer, big people, peer. I mean, I said, Lord Jesus, man, so much people just are dead. I mean, move from one funeral to the next. I mean, I say, Father God, because I mean, I watch the funeral, them. And sometimes I watch the funeral, and yeah, I want to run out of my yai when I watch the funeral, and so the people, them are ball for them people, you know. Yes. I mean, I tell you, so when I look on it, at six or seven, I mean, I say, Rati Cup, they not owe so much funeral just to keep to this. So, yeah, we are talking about the dead and the funeral, them. Lord Jesus, yes, sister. It's a, it's a teacher. I thank the people, them, when I take it. I'm sorry for the people, including myself, will take the joke. Well, and there, well, and there. One of our classmates, one of our classmates said, Not only you alone, lady, I'm sorry to. I said, Teacher, right there now, I lie down in my bed. And may I may tell you, say, my belly just bloated, so it just bloated. So. Hey, teacher, true, you never know, mommy. Say, if I'm not sorry, I'm not in my life. So you see the mix that them I come with? Yes. Um, B, hey, me are the last person 
where I go take that then it's the if me I take it. So me go there, me go there behind the world cause me not take no nix. Me not take it. They trick me already with the joke and not trick me no more. <laughs> you understand? Yes, my friend. Big nose, big nose joke. never not trick me no more. Eh? Where you say them trick you with the joke. Well, well I'm a sister. Just talk to the people. Let me just run guard yeah. the bathroom one minute. Talk to the people and then I'll listen yes. to you. Yes. Them trick me with the, with the joke. Student. Trick me and them don't take it. Big nose and the family them not take it. I me know right now them are come with the net. I me know none of them in the, in the parliament and them, none of them, them. Devon and them come in, come below them, not nah, take it. Not nah, take no nicks, but they want to come trade down for we. Like we are either. We should go up and protest with people. We don't forget none. Everything you come out with, they want to come trade down with you. We don't forget none. We just stand up for the right. We just stand up for the right at full time now. I'm coming in dictate herself, we didn't dictate herself like 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 him a I'm a bull cow and up in Kankara. And I tell the people them say no. You see that finger your side of the big finger? Yes. It of all the right. It's this finger side of the big finger. I eat all the damage because I hate put big nose there and I eat I will take it take it long back. And if they think them are teeth, this is one of this strip. But you say, man, wicked, wicked teacher. Hey, man, come on, big on bowl, or win the, 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 the election. So I come now and say, he ain't lose it. Huh? Mighty God, sister. That's why when you play, that's why when you play PMP song, me say, me just a dance, so teacher, me just a dance, so. Well, I say, go, you have to dance, cause PNP are happiness and them are suffering, but listen to me, sister, I just come back. Let me read some comments and let you hear what uh -huh. is happening, no? Beauty check, good night to uh -huh. you, welcome to the class, me all right. Claudette say, oh my gosh, Carla, I have a friend that from she took the joke my friend is now wearing a pacemaker that has something for your heart and she has all kind of blood clot and different black and blue spots on her body and more. Somebody else says, uh -uh. somebody else says, Atabana says it grows in Jamaica, a regular tree. Okay. Janet says, my a topic, my granddaughter take it. She left her workplace, forced her, and the same day she take it her heart Start beat fast. She run to private doctor. Huh? Somebody uh, said. Somebody uh, said. Carla, since the joke, she has been feeling bloated. You hear the setting? Bloated and headaches. So if thank you. so so if several blood make a shot my trap. Father alone will know all about it. Lord Jesus. So Teacher, so so bloating seems to be a natural thing. thing. Bloating seems to be a natural thing. Yes. Teacher. Sometimes it's like, like, it's me like in Liberia now. Yes. You know, in a blue balloon. Yes. You know, in a blue balloon. Yes. And so me feel like some of them are blue, blue, my belly just arise so. I and you God. see, this, this is my son father, I'm living at this state. And him say, friend, him take it too. Him body don't feel the same. Mighty God. The joke, mash way up, teacher. But you know, when me have a teacher. Mm. And me think we need so if we just go and drink some bitters like saucy um, um, and think a Bible. That's right, and clean and it out. Yes. Clear it. Don't go to a system already in a teacher. Yes. But you say if we feed pan, like take the single Bible and the and drink saucy tea. Yes. Me think so that will help we a little because let me tell you this in a teacher. Me day I talk to you now. But if the family take the joke, means a walking dead. Mighty God. Nobody he's a say, walking dead. Nobody says some of friend. Yes. Oh God. Nobody he's says a, some of friend. Nobody teacher, says some you, of friend. You have to say teacher because teacher me have to say because nobody not feel like that come is a woman me go gym and me work out and since this step me teacher me hardly can make it to gym. I mean, if I say, oh, me just get big, he just let me get big and like, you know, and something put on weight on you, that's all mistake. Teacher, actually, you don't even know about. 
Me say they will not trick me again. You hear me say? 2016, me vote for the big nose man. And 2020, me vote for the big nose man. Me can say, well, uh, everybody has said, give me a chance to tell young and this and that. But you see what? 26 of February, I'm going to be here. Yes. I'm going to get my bro or ex. I'm going to get it. Yes. We say, give to PNP. You hear me say? Oh, you mean? And the next one, oh, I come. Mean? And the next one, I come. Um, and PNP, I get it again. Oh, you mean? I'm with your teacher. You know how much people we make put the X beside the head? I true you don't even know. Mighty I'm a player the program, they make them listen it. I'm in a ramp for turn on the par in the ears, make them hear it. You know we be attack already. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> I'm a turn up my phone loud and when they hear it, they just are come I like uh 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 Yes. Just a listen to my program, see me and them, I hear everything where I go on. Yes. Yeah. Uh, on my phone, on my tablet. That's I'm right. I'm free to listen to anything I want to listen to me and play anything I want to play upon it. But seriously, teacher, that joke there, man, I mash up enough people. Why? You hear me say? You know, if people were me supposed say, to be honest. Boss, all my boss take it. And he's not in anymore. So me, him, and his sister, when me tell us this, when she gets to sick with her heart, yeah. every day we sit down and talk about it. Even my girlfriend, when me I tell about it, when me tell us that she can she take it, she have heart problem. She says sometimes, you know, when you know, you know, when you are, you see Negro, where you used to work with? Yes. And he says sometimes, you know, that Negro juke, they juke you. Yeah. She says sometimes, so she feel like something just a stick her in her heart. Right now, I how much doctor the girl I feel go every minute with art with a heart problem, art this, art this, art that. Mash up people, man. Mash up people and them know that they they, 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 they joke no good for me and they still and you still make it come down here in Jamaica. Come fix it, so mash we up. So mash we up. I remember the church that encouraged but, people to take the joke, the seven day church, the, the Adventist church. I tell people, say, for take the joke to her and say, God make the joke. You yeah. remember one of them say, God make the joke? When I church people, them tell us, say, God make the joke. You know? Yeah, some of them are wicked, some of them, you know. Are wicked, some of them, but I want to miss a teacher. The man took me with no nits. They took me with a joke. Then I took me with no need. So I mean, I know where I want to push down with you. What? You understand? I want everything to go in a same favor. You see, I know it's big. <laughs> when I go push, when I go push, push up, push up, push up, they juke them in a nose wall. No, Make it swing you down. Somebody said, my yeah, friend, teacher, somebody but... said, my, oh, Maya, when was your birthday, Maya? Yesterday or today, your birthday. Real, Maya, I realize somebody that said Maya birthday. Type in the comments, Maya, and tell me. When was your birthday? Yesterday or today? But Maya said, my friend... Uh, yesterday. My friend, Maya said, uh -huh. my friend take the joke and him gone to Hood Park. I don't know what they mean by Hood Park, but them same... That, teacher friend, said Hood Park, you know, no, wah, wah. Yes, we just realized, you see, you see, you see, stand up. You see, you see, stand up to rat it up. Lord Jesus. Check with the nature. Man. Take away my nature. Them, them use all kind of soot now, make that they soot me down and they come put in our, in our system. You know, mash way up. Mash it, mash way up. My friend, listen to me. You, uh, you listen to me. It's just like how we are here at a topic and you're talking about the, the changes you've noticed since you've received uh -huh. that stuff. And you're saying that your uh -huh. boss and, and somebody else and his sister Three of you who took that stuff, you're now sitting down uh -huh. and, 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 and agreeing amongst yourself that you physically, yeah, well, I know that you physically realize the change in, in your changes in your body since you took that stuff and you guys are in regret. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Do you know? Do you know? Honestly. Listen to me. Me could sit down in a mobia and over and Saint Maria. You know, see, I have a couple of other people all over in the parish. So I saw them sit down and get and say, from me take the joke. So and so and so. You know, so that you know uh -huh. that sister. You know that a whole heap of people exchange. Let me teacher. shut my chop. Me not tell you don't like teacher. I want to tell you, say, my boss, sister, 
as she as she bad. She can't walk. She can never walk from her bed to her dresser. She tired and a blow so and all kind of something. Lord Jesus, a me, serious thing, me I tell you, me teacher. Can read, me can read out some more comments there because the people them talk the things them, sister. Listen to me, let me read it up. Mm -hmm. uh, somebody said, why did Devon, um, why did Devon open um, to receive the the joke in Jamaica? You were so hungry and creature. Oh, I want different something I talk about. I realize where I talk about. Uh, that's where I say, teacher, remember, it was a Jamaican registered nurse in New York that was the first in USA to get the joke. Why them always a mix Jamaica kind of the something? Why hey, them want always draw Jamaica? Let like, me shut my mouth. Somebody else say, and she's still a big yeah. problem. I have to send her money for uh -huh. money to her to have some tests. She get a hard lump in her belly, which put her in great pain yeah. every now uh -huh. and then. Somebody say, Carla, I love your honesty. Others are hiding and suffering. Somebody else say, ah. Uh, uh -huh. Yes, pain. Somebody say, yes, I'm of pain in, a, in them hip that is giving them a warm time. Sometimes in the uh -huh. morning, when she wake up, she can't hardly move. She have to be crawling. Lord Jesus. Uh-huh. Teacher, I wonder if I eat, give me the pain in my back. And teacher, you know the next thing when I tell you? Mm. All right. You know what I say? We human beings, when we do a feces, you know that our smell. Yes. Teacher? Yes. The one, my one, it's thicker than the rest. Wow. Wow. All the time. And it never used to be like that. Wow. The only time when it don't stay that way is when I drink my sorosy. Yes. I drink my sorosy is like the sorosy. Clean out me. That's Clean right. out me. And I'll feel like few days, you yes. know, you know that, that smell. Yes. That tiny smell. Yes. It mush up people, teacher. Lord Jesus. And I it, it mush up people. And I see this. And I tap at it. Yes. Huh? And I see you something them something there, my friend. See you something there, them yes. something there, no? Yes. Teacher, you didn't take it? Me take what? Which part? Which part? Where? When? No, me never take it at all, my son. As a lad, live it. I'm glad, glad you never take it. Me thank God for the people that when I take it. I'm sorry for the people that when I take it, including What me self. did take was one. No, I never, me never take the COVID. Me 100% so I never take that. Right. I may give that thanks to ever take it, teacher, because I tell you, it mash me up. Mighty it mash me up. System. It mash me up. You see, but I say, and all of that, big nose Devon come, make it come in our country and we take it. And it finish till I kill we Hello. are. Maybe him and him pity them. And him and it him finish till I kill. I mean, eh? I mean, I'm pity them not take it in. I doubt them take it, Master. I doubt none of them take it. Them not take, them don't take it, teacher. Them don't take it. I'm going to stuff it down with, hey, Mr. Jamaica, people fool, you know. But you have to know who more said that, teacher. Because, guess what? Oh. When them interview them, the father said the pity them take it up at the yard. While the mother said them just take Die. it in a the in a the set building with them there. So lie. all the two parents and they know which part of the people lie. Them, they lie the Mattel and him lie the Mattel sister them too wicked and lie to the people. Teacher. You say Devon the take him knows it are full up in face by now. <laughs> so him not take none. Him <laughs> not take none. <laughs> Him knows that I full up in face by now if me take him not take no like how my belly are bloated. I did got you sister. See, I tell you about me there in a class here, my teacher. Are you so just going to work? Go and the bang, but me yeah. there listen. Are you just going to work in natural products, them the natural herbs and so occasionally like every yes, you make it your point of duty like once every week. You know when, what I mean? Yes. When, yeah, when me, when me do teacher, I blend up the single Bible yes. and squeeze like a live night with me and call my bed at night time and drink it. Yes. Bitter, but you know, it, it feels much better. Yes. 
you might have, my body feel much better when I take it. You understand? Yeah. So all we have to do, all of the people that we take it, I feel just want drink some pitakas and take some vitamin C in the meantime. Yes. Yeah, I understand if you just go and build your body. So you see the single Bible with the blood is up and squeeze the lime and I get detox out the body. You understand? Yes. But me doing a class teacher. Yeah. So let's go and run this, the program. All, All right. right. All right, my sister. Big up yourself and thanks for calling. Yeah, man. Yes, Lord Jesus. My brothers and subscribers, over Jamaica top, you can get the honest things them. Where people are honest with everything will happen. We talk the truth over here because we don't have nothing manufactured. We don't have nothing to hide over here. We talk the truth. I want to hear people are talk about what they have experienced. People are telling what they have experienced. My viewers are subscribers. And it is indeed a very sad case. Very, very, very sad case. Yes, Carla, welcome to the program. You're live on our topic. Yeah, bless up, teacher. How are you doing, sir? You all right? Um, I'm good in all the work, you yeah. know? Yes. Um, teacher, we did a watch it before we left out to come to work. The, the water plant where they want to, to divest, you know? Yes. You know, say it is great to see. I see you here. We just look back on our chest in the you know? Yes. The, the water the water program found good time now. And I think somebody will be behind it where I will be the owner for that technically. Yes. For a bit of fire like I see him address. Something the, strange I about address, it. Like location of a bite. Something very strange about it. Something very, very, very strange about it, Gideon. And we're going to be digging a little bit deep. Head boy, come and talk about it because Head boy was the person that brought it to my attention. And then, you know, we brought it to Andre's attention. And Andre knew a couple of people and so on, so on. Maybe can stretch him arm. You understand? So we're going to be digging a little bit more deep in it. But the biggest part that Head boy is concerned about is that they're spending how much billions of dollars and having... A private company do that when the National Irrigation Council or whatever and the Water Commission could do that, save the money, and then taxpayer would get the benefit. But they're, 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 they're contracting a private company to do all of this water business and, and the turning of, 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 of uh, the real Kobe water into drinking water. That is what they're doing, you know. They're taking the water from Rio Cobre and they're going to make it into clean water that they can drink. But it's a private company that they've selected to do this. Why may I tell you, brother, this is a government here. Prison, they will have no, no matter how no matter where them tell me, say, teacher, prison. there's a catch behind it. Prison, prison, it's prison. A, it's another form of money making for, for, for some people right here, yeah? Prison. But this government then just keep on chopping, 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 and you're busy about taxpayer. For when we look on, you know, the labor right then say, uh, Michael Marley did want to bring communists come to Jamaica. But Andrew, I, I, I dare a communist man. You more than the communist man, General. Yes, man, he's a dictator. Anything him say, it, it, it have to go. So if anything he have in his mind, for a, 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 a view, in, in, in work on a program, let me say, when he decided to put it by the table, he had to stop. Bye. So, so all, all this water thing we have gone a long time. He have a diverse mentor in his mind from way back. But he push out, he push out the water shortage. I, I, I sabotage the water from early. That's true. That's true. So that Guess it, what? So that them, look like them, them create chaos. Them create chaos. That's right. Them create oh, the water shortage. Oh, come steal money and, and, you can't, and you can't maintain the thing you have to sell it. And that them are going to tell me, you know, say, oh, it's causing them too much. Let us divest it into their friends and when them can't fix the money, they, boy, I'm tell you, brother, they don't want to do it. They don't care about we at all. They don't care about we at all. But, but you show that the big man is long be 
behind the driving seat in an archer, you know? So one of them was sitting behind the driving seat in a store and just push it out like one company. Boy, you see, when we get to find out the details, I bet I tell us that we, we're going to be a more shock. We going to be very, very, it's possible, very it's possible shocked. that by, by we to find out where one we can't even be not about it again. That is it, that's what we call it. So, we're going to look for Mark Walling could have pushed out right away and said, listen, this can't happen. Yes, that's why Ian Eels. We call in an Ian Eels, the opposition spokesperson and water, and we call in a Mark Golden. Please take a look at this as the Rio Cobra Limited. Rio Cobra Limited, please, the water limited, look at that company and see exactly what is happening in that company you now because we need to uncover and we need to trim the bushes. You understand? There's a lot of bushes hanging over it and we have to trim it. So we can't yes. see exactly what is covering the, 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 the property. Something, something, something is there, my brother. Something. But no, no, this is really, really a chopping government, I tell you. Then chop left, right, and center. A prison them for go. All of them prison. But no, no. You say for investment they go on. Sorry, few people with the water bill, you know? Dog, they must suffer because just like all the toll, we can't control the toll fee. We now can control water bill. And the O U R who is supposed to stand up for Jamaican, might as well stand up for ourselves because they're not going to give them a much raise that we can't do nothing about it. The Office of Utilities Regulation. Mm -hmm. They are the stand up for the Jamaican people. The whole of them in a one man pocket, man. The whole of them in a one man pocket. The man know which and which organization to control for early. Boy. So, more time when they chop off a piece of money, they just put in another organization and say, listen, anything you say in the work with me, you sir. And I say, it's in a run. I see somebody typing in the comments and said this. Say, teacher. The same company who got the water contract also has contracts to build the highways. So said Andre tonight. He says he needs to investigate more. So you see it? You hear what people start say? That's why I call Chinese. Um. You hear what the people them start say? Shining star, blessings to you and welcome to the program. And all the students that are just coming into the program, blessings to you. Welcome to Jamaica Topic. Somebody say, if, if OUR still exists, OUR still exists, but they're silent as a dog. No, dog make more noise. Them silent like cat. Cat no make no noise unless you trouble them. That the truth, no? Cat don't make no noise unless them hungry. So them get pay, them food are right, so them quiet. Them never say, meow. Sad statement, brother. You know what? Shining star. Shining star. Calling and blaze a fire for you, man. For I come like my voice too soft, you know. So come blaze a fire, make the people and hear you, man. I know it's a shining star. I look out to you. Know? We need some representation. We need some good representation. Strong representation. We need a better society and a better Jamaica. Because they're going to say we're having water problem and the government can't control it. And it is causing us a lot of money. And you know what? Next, they're going to say, oh, let us privatize it. Nothing wrong with the water business, you know. A them shake up the damn city, you know. Them shake it up, you know. And then I go say, oh, there's a problem. Let us divest this prison, prison, prison. Hey, man. You call me like, you know, when you spend one ten cent and you make back a dollar. Yes. So money we then use and buy a water tank and sit in. This, this divestment in I plan, long time. So you might try frightening people with water tank and this and that and the man should have to see a, 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 a two more water place divest Well, guess what? That's why we're trying to create some light on the matter from early because we're trying to do it before the damage is already done. You understand? And that's why we will continue to raise the issues over here and call on the opposition to let their voices be heard and to investigate 
and to take the necessary actions to get things done. Pamela Mancho said, teacher, you're still up. You're still on. It's 7.35 a.m. in the U.K. Big up all my U.K. students, all my students in the U.K. Yes, Pamela, I eight hours, but depending on the life, I know eight hours. Eight a work, we are work. Things like this important. So I have to spend the time and tell you, no, eight hours. Uh, Well, I mean, I know, this government has really give heart to you, head to you, belly to you, all kind of you. Yes. Well, we will see what go on, Gideon, because what we say, we want the opposition talk, and we want the people who are in these areas that is affected by the water, come out, come talk. Not the wrong phone, phone come out, come come. Say, yeah, we want water. Nobody can beat enough for water. Water on the water, water on the mean. All right. Nobody come, come, cuss about the government. This come, come, cuss about the water. That is the important thing. Come out. 50 hours, no. We don't talk. Make a, make a closing argument, like Gideon. Come realize both five calls come in a while ago. And I want to hear what those people are. Yeah, man. Take them on from me. I'm on the work, you know. So, we yeah. can't keep me stay on the phone long, you know. We're blessing stay, my brother. So, bless up your class. Yes. That was Gideon. Blessing stay, Gideon. Big up yourself, my brother. Thank you. Yes, my viewers and subscribers. What a excitement. What a bang around. What a judgment. I go on in a Jamaica land we love. What an excitement in a Jamaica land we love. Let me see if I can get back uh, I barn and see if I can get my brethren here. Let me see if I can get back I barn and see if I can get back my I Come on, students, when you call me, I call back and I not get through. Why don't you phone there? You just call me and I call him back and I not get through. You just call me and I call him back and I not get in through. Somebody said murder is a... Sharon, what is your business about, about my business, sir? Why don't you mix up in my business? Why don't you mix up in my business? Sharon, you want to come stay with me? Why don't you mix up in my business? Yes, Carla, welcome to the program. You're live on air. Good night, Ibania. What's up? Good night, you Can you call me properly? I never hear you. Repeat, you you're sound a bit low. You sound extremely low. Extremely low. You're still extremely low. You're low now? You're extremely low. Everybody else did low now the night. You, you're some extremely low with yours. I don't know what happened. Talk a little bit more. Mm, I don't know what's going on, but I'm going up and call you, but you sound extremely, extremely low. You're the first person who sounds so low up on the phone. I don't know why. Let me hang up and call back. Hello? Hello? No, you're gone out worse now. Do you have an earphone? Do you have an earpiece? No, man, take out the earphone and the earpiece. We're not hearing nothing at all. Yes. Right now, my volume turn up on my face strain for ear. Right, so the phone fell, so the speaker not working without it. Okay, okay, but try see. Alright, no problem, no problem. Hey, hold on a second, let me see if I can take this car. Yes, Carla, welcome to the program. My life on a topic. Good night, Carla. How are you doing? Good night, boss. Blessings, my general. Blessings to you. What's going on, man? Oh, so you go and you go and you go juggling there. You go and 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 Alright. That's good. But then everything I go and say yeah. That's good. That's good to hear, my brother. Very good to hear. Why are you going in there? Why are you only for things are going in, my brother, as usual, in the country? Why not for excitement? Yeah. Right now, but, but, but me, I'm 
woman out there is water. Yes, because our head boy made mention and, that. And, uh, you know, you, you remember, you remember the rapid man when he go go when he go go me Nigeria Clark and 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 Jones. Yes, Banga, Banga. I think that rapid Indian man, Banga. You know what? I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't get, I get, I get real bad and do. Let me just do that. Say what? The man dive, I don't, I don't get the M A or the real bad and do. The man dive is doing that. Me I tell you that. How would the fried rice here tell me, say? How would the fried rice here tell me not the man? Hold on, my brother. Hold on. I tell you what I'm going, brother. I tell you what I'm going, brother. I tell you what I'm going, brother. Check it out, brother, I tell you. I remember last year, I don't think it's the year before, I remember last year some Indian man came to Jamaica I think his we, name. We All right, boss. I think his name was Banga something. Banga something. If I recall clearly. And people were saying that his visit was strategic. And X and Y. And X and Y. So you're telling me now that a dem they plan to divest it to even them plan to get rid yeah, of the plan to divest I, 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 I know you Cheat term. That's the one I'm talking people with cheat term. Some of the divers. What are you talking about? 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 Some big money on and and, and the neighbor my boss they they don't get the money because the children will be party. Now nah, so much money for the people them. Yes, I'm aware of that argument. I'm very much aware of that argument that the former treasurer are not giving it them money, so they said they're giving it. I mean is that that man send you in warranty. Yes, yes, but let me tell you something now. I mean, let, me, let me tell you something now. I'm a want to listen to me. And I want the students to listen to me. You see, the Portland man, he's a good fundraiser. He keep big dance, keep big party, he have links with artists, everybody, and he have links with a few business people. You know, me I talk about top man, airport oh, man, sea oh, man. Listen to me. Yeah, me, say, me Listen. Yeah, me, yeah, me say, 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 my man, a friend, but he ain't got to be that man, he ain't got to be that man, he ain't got to But listen to me now. That man, he have airport man, friend, he have sea water friend, pan water. You see, that the man there from Portland. I want thing about him, though. Him know how to run money. You hear me say? That man yeah. from Portland, if there's nothing that we don't like about him, and we don't to acknowledge no truth about him, you see, that man, he know for run campaign and he know for run money. And that man will jump through the window to make sure whatever go on will win. I know that personally about him. The ramp on him. You hear me tell him, my brother? So if they decide to give it to him, is either two things are going to happen. Let me tell you the two likely options. One, he's going to do a good job and distribute the money and run money so people can get a little thing because he's known for being freely, especially when it suits him. You notice him and his wife yeah. are in seat. You realize everything down there, sir, down at Portland. You realize no matter what yeah. they go through, that man do anything he for do. Forget the job done. That is the first thing. So it's either I'm going to do a good yeah, job. So it's either I'm going to do a good job as a treasurer and make the party work as them get the money and everything will be all right. Or him can use the opportunity for sabotage Devon and don't run the money and make the people them have up Devon and all sort of something. Because remember, I said there's a rift between them and Devon, said we. You understand what I mean? Yes, I mean, yeah. So, 
there's two ways to look at it, and I just said it to you. I don't, I don't do the job good. Run the money on the JLP supporters. They make them skin them teeter. All right, which is known to run money and all kind of something. Or if not going to do a good job, and Devon I going to be the one to get the backlash. Right? But uh, I, I received information that more people are to resign. I'm here to say two big top people are going to get shift. People are tight-lipped about it. And I've heard two names mentioned or whispered to me. And because the person told me that they're not sure, I don't want to call those names. But I was told that two top people are supposed to demit their position or step down. But until I get to that... Man. Eh? The Clarendon man. Where he is concerned... He resigned not as the Minister of Information, but he resigned as the Communications Director for the JLP. You know, when JLP bring out them proposals, so the, the following messages from the Jamaica Labour Party and the JLP this, uh, him used to run that. They take him down from that. But he's still the information. But he's still the information minister of Jamaica. Romy and take him stride. No, no. Romy and take him stride. That's why in a life, you have to be careful what you say about people because you will flop yourself and yeah, pop no, no, no. And the rock that you will defend you, I'm going to beat him. Wicked, brother. No, he will come in the morning. I'm going to beat him. Mighty God. He deserve a beating. He deserve a beating for the fat way. I'm going to beat him. 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 I'm going to beat but me here say, me here say misinformation from Clarendon. Me here say, flight, oh, flight green. Our next one, and Nigel Clark. Me here say the top labor right them. You know who the top labor right them as? St. Thomas, mm -hmm. Portland, St. Mary. Again, time and a couple of the people said, No, no, Hitler, Jesus, let me shut my mouth. Bang, Eloy, them the united, you know, as much as them come out, boom, and fix like them united, them divided, them come like rice they, grain. They, they mash up on them, man. Eh? Yo, Marky G, Marky G, them are, 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 them just go on the way, brother, because people just a wealthy calling, brother. And they're worried about they it. They know that it, daddy. They know that it's a bucket, daddy. Right now, you know. They're worried about it. They're worried about the gatekeeper, my beautiful ex-lover, she. They're worried about my gatekeeper. To them park her like a Leland truck. They're worried about her. Because <coughs> she had the gatekeeper for charging. Because when she did it, People don't understand the importance of the DPP. Let me explain something to you. Let's say that a politician does something wrong. And the police start to do an, well, know, and the police start to do an investigation. Do you know that the police have to send the file to the DPP? And then she is the person who rule. Charge them or don't charge them. You know that? Yeah, I know that man. So if she so said, this, man, the so, next man will we'll see him think um, expire from Van Van Wen. The next big man, where is he going to expire to? Him like, what that now? Him like the fire arm? No, 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 that's the fire arm. The, 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 the next big one, like DPP, will see him think expire. And the government will find the one who replaces him all the data. Different by DPP. Are we at a Jeremy Taylor? All right. Well, the one thing I expect is my ex fire brother. And then the contract is the same as my brother. I'm bound to get it. Why? Babylon is falling, my brother. That's all I have to say. Wickedness from the land. Land and bring it falling, falling, brother. Why? Daddy, no, you can't find time to take money now, find time to make it in the same place in the country. Right? The country will come and be done by the people, yeah, man. No, of course, you can't go on tomorrow. Look, you can't go on tomorrow, brother. 
And it's all because of them. Because you can't. So listen to me. Because you can't run your friends. So guess you what? You can't run your friends. So guess what? Yeah. All of the lies. So let me tell you now. All of the poor people who are in jail, some guilty, some not. All of them were praying and said they supposed to have them day for go to court tomorrow. If they're going to get free, or if they're going to get a little bail for come road, that no, mash up. No. That mash up. All of the people who pay the lawyer, when the good have to go pay them one of that money again, forgive them one of that date. Lord Jesus, let me shut my mouth. What if I think, my general? So, no court now keep tomorrow. No court not supposed to keep tomorrow. So, court supposed to lap between now and Wednesday. The court says it's supposed to shut between now and Wednesday. No court not supposed to keep until a DPP is appointed. The government is always around with the constitution. They don't raise me, they don't raise me the constitution, I call it, brother. They don't like you, brother. Daddy, every time people come up with you, brother, every time, brother, because people know the constitution and what the country want, brother. They don't hurry for me, brother, to go on the yard, brother. All my money, all, all, they don't like to be resigned, brother. Boy, they have to resign for sure. They have to resign for sure. You know, you know, you know, you know, Look what they call us, brother. So if we roll to a thing, we benefit them. You know, I mean, the country, I want to be the country, man. You know what people think about the man, they have to put the money. To, to, to a foolish brother. I true. The government, I worry about people's life, they might hamper, they might stop, they might put them pause. Why may I tell you, brother, people, um, why may I tell us, so we in a we in a one antsness, brother. We in a one big dirty antsness. Well, that's a bite right to left, right, and center. That's a big dirty antsness, brother. It's a bite, it's a bite. I can't get a bite by that. We're going to bite every day, brother. Every day, brother. Every day, G. Family start calling for one, brother. That's every day. That's something more, brother. Every day, G. Yeah, right, that's something else, brother. Yeah, man, something oh, different. Man. Something different tomorrow, man. Something different we're going to hear about them tomorrow. And guess what? Let me tell you this. You see, this JLP executive meeting that they have, I've concluded. In a hole. I've concluded that. In a hole. I've concluded it is a distraction because guess what? Nothing of significance happened there, and they knew everybody was going to be talking about it. They want to take some light off the DPP and they want to take some light off how they allow the, the, what the council name or the commission again, I still remember the name, the office that's supposed to appoint the, the DPP. They, ens they, ens they, ens they ensured that that council was expired and terminated. And, 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 if you, and if you were keeping with... I mentioned it earlier on, you know. I talk about this earlier on. I'm just repeating what I said. Because I don't know if I did that list to the program. Yes. 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 So I was saying that they specifically, deliberately waited for the something to expire because they were adamant that they wanted to do everything to keep DPP in there. Listen to me. You see, if they, you, they, they know what they were doing, you know. You see, if it was something else and they never had a DPP issue, they would have reinstated the commission and do everything. But because, guess what? Them shut it down. So whenever DPP have to go appoint, the process got delayed. You think they don't know what they might do? They had it planned out long time ago. The Services Commission. The Services Commission. That's yes, right. Yes. The Services yes, Commission. Yes. They had it planned out a long time ago. They can't fool me. They can't fool anybody else. But it is not a coincidence. Too much things. Too much things, brother. Come on, red flag. Come on, red flag. Come on, red flag. Come on, red flag. Red flag. Red flag. Red flag. Red flag. Hello. Come on, everything I'm back for you. Everything I'm back for you, brother. Hello. Red flag. Hello. He want the wall. You see, I want... They want the wall, 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 red card out of the, out of the referee packet. The wall, red, 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 red name there, he want. Red card. Oh, yeah. Jesus. Oh, man, they are the one by one, and they, 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 they cheer them by, by, by all of them. You say, you tell, tell that? <laughs> they don't like chokes, and you live in the step down. Can you make call? <laughs> yes. No. Nah. Me hear say, Wamington a cuss out Chuck. Me hear say the argument to them a cuss out Chuck because the pressure is on Chuck for Chuck to resign. Now we're going to turn up the pressure for him. They'll write Chuck. Paula, go. Go on to my friend. 
Pala no want your pal, Yana Pala type, and me a Pala type. Pala yeah, Pala 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 like them. Paula like them intelligent but rough like myself. Yeah. She like a little roughness. She not too like too much smoothness and she 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 like a little roughness. Yes. So you is not our type, they'll right, Chuck. So she retire, you can go and go retire to my boss. Yes. Yes. Why well, I may mean, I tell you that serious is a serious issue my general, but me more you know, I go to country, brother, to and kill it, and go and kill it. The constitution, brother. Their constitution breakers. Their constitution breakers. What's your man? No, man. No, man. No, man. No, a tool, that is that is a ham for two, but guess what? It should have been organized before. I believe it is a too late to mention it, but that is true. It will be an opportune time to turn up more pressure on them because that, exactly. would, send, that would send a message to them that Jamaica is dissatisfied with your ruling and your constitution breaking, and as such, no court, no work. Yeah, man. Big old money. You know, right now, Mr. Jamaica, Jamaica, I'm mock. I, 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 I care about right now. Jamaica, I, I, I mock. I care about right now, my brother. At 80, we tell Jamaica right now, my friend. At two years, Jamaica, I'm a beer. You know what I'm trying to do? But then, better and Jamaica right now, that we know what I'm like. Big man thing. And 80, I fight your cars, brother. You hear what I'm saying? I hear loud and clear, Jamaica not fighting for nothing at all, except sitting down. Yes, you're fighting for your cars, brother. You're fighting for your freedom, brother, and better for yourself, brother. We're black people, white people, my daddy. I look what I'm going to have a country. I'm black and lady. And I put in a... You look in the worst in the hand, bro. And you go, you take a box and take a whole lot of oil, daddy. Too money, brother. Too money. You must buy, you must buy, I tell you, bro. Too much, daddy. What well, are they? Ah, you must buy, daddy. Let me tell you something. something. You know... We have not yet heard. Listen to me, brother. Students, listen to me. It is, it is, it is, it is two o'clock in the morning now. You see the late hours, my brother, we still have keep class two o'clock in the morning at Jamaica, three o'clock in the US. How do you so and so? Oh, yeah, listen to me now. What I am saying we have not yet ascertained the true number of how many people have died from the pandemic because they've hid the number from us. Yes, you have them did for tell with the true amount of people were dead during the pandemic and after. I'm sure that Jamaicans will be outraged. Yeah, yeah, my brother. Up to now, we're not yet the true oh, amount of people brother. are dead. Daddy, that's all the killer of Jamaica, Black Widow. I saw the killer of Black Widow, but look at that. We tell her, them feel like if that came like more people to the Jamaica people, I'm a strong brother. And that I think, brother, I'm not telling that. Come now, I'll tell that, brother. I'm not taking that. And the first thing I'll go to, fake the MCOV. Fake. It may take three months, Master. We see it and it look like it going and look like it not going, Master. But it look like it not going at all. Go in and 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 Uh, Mr. Andrew, 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 everybody fucking here. Andrew, Andrew do everything. Everything Andrew do right now, Andrew, 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 you see, see Andre Stevenson and you and Lonesome. You wanna be them bad daddy. You know they're confused. You know they know what they do. They're determined. Listen to me. Let me show you something. You see, the other day we talked about the needs. And I did a video. And my video was entitled, Is it true? No needs, no service. I did a live. I you know say after me do the live today, 
the next day I see them put out some something about oh there is no truth that if if you get the needs there will be no yeah. service and no service that's and, true. And, and say, that's true that's true and I say oh when I never know if I put that out the day before or last week or the day before I just as we talk yeah. about it tonight yeah. you know, on, when you can't fool away people them say everything in a Jamaica the government charge of us so all the government want give your needs to free something right massa that's all me have to say about it you know right and the government. And the government that give Yo, you. Well, we will see what happens in the coming weeks and the coming days, and hopefully, you know, as I said, one thing I I am I am proud of, and I've heard people express it, is that they realize that they. The PNP, they're working, especially constitutionally. They know the rights and the laws of the land. And, and, and they're united. Yes, and they, they're united and they're keeping them up to par. They're holding the JLP. And every and, 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 and see them, them, talk, them come with facts. They're not talk, telling them, no, what's up, where, 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 and then you wonder. They're not coming with facts, daddy. That's right. Facts. That's right. That's right, my brother. Fuck them are coming. You, 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 you see a push up. Mark when you go say go say that a team is even I look up what you hear the news. There's a DP B can go now some morning. That's right. You have to put pressure upon them, man. Pressure upon them, man. Pressure bus pipe. And the more we talk, is the more they realize and they observe. So that is all we have to say. So my brother, just take a minute and wrap up and take one more call because I kinda beat out in our way, you know what I mean? Yeah, man, yeah. You can't walk up no man, I don't know. 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 So when we hear some people, and talk, I'm when we hear some people, yeah, like talk, country, well. listen, let me make yeah, something clear. Country, well, right, let, me country, make, let me make something clear. Over, right, me like, me glad they said that. Let me make it clear. And I'm money, my love. Let me tell you why I'm money, my love. You see, YouTube, when people watch the video, watch the ads, YouTube pay your money. You know, some me used to get pay from YouTube. Me get a little, used to get a little thing, and it helped for pay one little bill, my brother. Some people, yeah. from them not getting a pay, them would have stopped. You know, say from the 28th of February, YouTube suspend me for 90 days. Me can't get no money from YouTube. Me can't get no super chap, no membership, nor nothing. And some people would have folded in and put in the towels. But do you realize that me, right. so me all I do two live for the day? Me I do eight hour live. And occasionally, well, I know, I'm going to do my thing. Even last night, I must say after three, after four classes, you know, within a history lesson, listen to me. Some people will talk and say, oh, money, and money, and topic, I like you when people ask the money. My brother, let me say something to you. The Bible says, ask and it shall be given, seek and it shall find. Let me explain to you. Some people, yeah, will spend, this listen, one. listen, people spend their money for what they enjoy. Some people will spend their money and pay for Netflix to watch this and watch this and watch that. You're getting a program that provides ex en ex excite entertainment because enough time we laugh over here till like kingdom come. We laugh like madness. We dance over here. We inform you. We educate you. And I have bills to pay too. Light bill, water bill, internet, food, and all sorts of something. So if me there, I'm going to do something on the program, I say students send a contribution. We don't pressure nobody. Sometimes I'll want to close the people. Well, let me show you something. Look, 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 I just show you, and I worry for people sometimes who send me, I say, I to pick, I want to send you one contribution. I'm going to see till all two weeks down the road. You understand what I mean? You yeah, understand what I mean? Money, money, because me I do Remember, the work. Money, money, money. So when you hear some people who talk and say, oh, a topic ask some money, occasionally we ask the students to send one twenty or whatever. Nothing wrong. Whosoever have it and can give because some people like the program and then we give a little things that teacher bless up yourself by something. Who have it can give and give. 
So if you hear me come out and say students, send a 20 or bless up the cash up or send whatever you can. Whosoever have can give if the Lord encourage you to do it and you do it, do it. If you appreciate it and you want to send something, say, I don't want nothing on nobody's head. You know what I mean? So the naysayers. No, 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 the, good man. the naysayers. You're good man. You're not joke, man. You're good man. The naysayers will yeah, always. Yeah, I'm good man. Go on, read, man. You hear that? The naysayers will always say, oh, what topic will ask the money or whatever, whatever, what? That is the least of the sum. The rest of the students appreciate the lesson because if we have an eight hour class, about three or four times I ask the students for, for bless up or send something to the super chat from night. Three or four times I ask them. I'm mean, not even check out how much people go to send. Some people send one ten, one twenty. Some will send one fifty, depending upon who. Listen to me, the work we are putting in my general. The work. The work. The work. You don't say you love money, brother. Just go out, you love a country, brother. The work. The work we are doing, my general. You see me? The work we are putting yeah, in. So big up, big up to save, man. I have a tomorrow, man. You hear that, daddy? Blessings to you, my boss. Blessings to you. I'm a kid. I'm on my shirt, brother. I'm on the shirt, daddy. I'm on the shirt, brother. And you know, say somebody else texts about the shirt that I get. It. Don't worry, my general. I soon, I soon saw out the shirt that I get. I definitely go up and running with the shirt. I swear as God live it. Don't worry. Because somebody else texts about the shirt. I'm a general. I'm a big conference, but I want an orange shirt, brother. You want an orange shirt? All right, my general. Somebody else texts about yeah, the shirt man. since night, too. All right, blessings orange more than the orange more. Blessings, blessings. I think I think Caribbean Everybody. beauty. Big up yourself. I think Caribbean beauty texts me and tell me that she want shirt too. So me go try. Say me can start yeah. out shirt for you as she. Big up yourself, my general. Blessings and thanks for calling. Yeah. Yeah, my daddy. Blessings, yes. Students, me go take my last call, and I think from Ibania. She been trying to call for the longest while. And me go call Ibania. She's been calling for the longest while. Let me see if I can get I born yeah. Hi, teacher. Yes, I born yeah. Welcome to the program. You sound very good, man. Thank you for your patience. You're my last caller for the night. Welcome to the program. Yeah, man. Teacher, thank you so much, very much for that. I don't want to keep up the time because you've been here long. But, uh, um, you. Just quick, quick points. Um, tough time. I see one little like video where one YouTube person, some person, a promoter of that, um, with some water thing. You see it? And I'm looking at it and I'm seeing Tuftan constituency doesn't have, it has a lot of natural pools up Tuftan side, if I'm, if I'm not mistaken. After you pass Linstead and go up, you know up, up them, them place there? Yes. Yeah, so if you have natural, if you have natural pools, and I mean, no, I drive through there already, and the water are, the water pretty and clean and clear as day. Plus, it has, um, we call kind a of stone there. Um, Limestone. We turn the water in a white to make it look crystal clean mm. and purified. So, why are you going to take real cobra water and give it to people to drink? Why don't you create a natural aquifer and send the water down? Better yet, create a water wheel which will cost you less than nothing and send water to your constituencies also it can generate light so you know no son i have the power to do them something that well, why not don't make it easier because they don't want to eat up the money right that's right that's all right the, fine that's their agenda uh, but yeah when they take up the money but it's still on a greedy because they don't want more so with a with us when that project here all about because you know see the same side honestly yes. Don't see the same side. You're gonna take how much millions of dollar people money and put it in our next project. How much project we're not gonna start? When you should I start them 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 project here? And at the end of it, at, at the end of the, the video, he's going to he's he's saying water in your pipes done as promised. Yeah. Roads done as promised. Sir, six years. Almost eight years. I call it eight years. I and as promised, just now. Why all of a sudden does that change? When we realize now, um, Spanish don't start up back with it with the whole heap things now. Yes. And um, as far as I'm hearing, quote unquote, it is it it is alleged 
that is the police force with them whatever squad I take out the bad man them now. So let me ask you a question. Where was this enthusiasm eight years ago? Uh, eight years ago? Yeah. Where was this enthusiasm from 2016? When you tell we can sleep with the doors and windows open. Right? All of a sudden, they start doing these things. Remember, you have a new man in the Remember, you have a new man at the police commissioner seat and him want to try to make some good impact. But I saw it today in Ibania and I don't know if you watched the beginning of my video. If you didn't, you can go ahead. I was talking about the police and knowing your rights and so forth. And... Uh, I played one video in the beginning and uh, it was showing the conduct of the police and I wanted to point out that they said the police killed a Dan from Spanish Town, then they killed some other band from Central Village and they killed some other Dan. Nothing is wrong because they a crime and violence and that is police duty. But it looks suspicious because three Different Dan police just killed, so I'm saying to myself, say, no, sir, this because you know, they know squad. them. This like because you know, know them and I work with them long time. Like I just squad. see them time up No, I just them time up No, because at times for politics play its role now. No, but it so no like, time it look, up. It looked like it's a dead squad. Them long time. It looked like it's a dead squad, and they're executing their plans and carrying it out to clean up to make the the the, the record look good at the new police commissioner and Devon. That's what they're doing. That's what I surmise. Uh, look here, teacher. Remember, me did tell you that they run some little piece of people, them, right? Mm. All right, I'm not going to remind the class about what. All right, they had that said conversation today about that kill squad, right? I know them people, they know what's going on in the team. Yes. Listen, stop, watch the cloak over people, yay. All of this could have been done from the get-go, from them stepping in the office. Absolute power corrupts absolutely, and the love of money is the root to all evil. Yeah. Listen, don't make them fool, you know, right? Yes. Election soon call. Don't make them fool, you know. Another thing, the more I get at, for the persons who took the... Um, that thing. That's right. That thing. You need to get your system cleansed. You need to get purged. You need to. The, I remember I sent you a, a, a video of cartoons. I told you guys that they put the truth in cartoons because adults do not watch cartoons that much. Yes. The majority of adults don't watch cartoons, so they put the truth in cartoons. Remember, I told you that the juke something having nanobites they having chips these things attack your blood cells and attack your dna so they change your dna they're taking time rearranging your structure and who is not compatible with it will die who whose body though that lady's body people who are suffering all these type of side effects is your body trying to keep up fighting these nanobites that are affecting you. So you need to purge your blood, cleanse your system. And the tree where everybody are cut down when you meringue on the need for have that as you know get go. You know, take that the, take the green leaf off of that tree, make it dry a little, blend it and use it for make tea. The meringue seed is good as well. Yes. No, Alright. Tell you no. To have 27 minerals um 27 minerals and vitamins you need to take that but you need a system cleanse now that you do that six month system cleanse you have to reboot your body you have somebody named dr sibi i think you guys should take a look at his website and his um teachings he um he's an herbalist um and he is trained to do these things well he's no deceased but his son has taken over the business another thing you're saying about rights let me just inform all persons who live in jamaica did you know that the toll road is a private road right yes but the, the toll road that you pay money to... on is a private road but it... 
did you know that? Go ahead, teacher. Oh, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I'm saying, did you know that an officer has a right to stop you but doesn't have a right to search you without your permission? Did you know that on the toll road, you are exempted from paying a ticket or speeding or paying whatever ticket they give you on a toll road because it's not a public road. You pay to be on that road. So by right, a police officer is not supposed to be giving you a ticket on that road. And it's in the law. It's Black Law's dictionary that they use. So they have a right to give you a ticket on public road, but not on a private road. So the toll road that you spend your money on, so that North Coast Highway Road, Centre and Highway Road, where the police they love each up underneath the bridge, only need for no rights. Yes, they can stop you. No, they can't search without your permission. And no, you don't have to take your ticket. If you want to take your ticket, fine. Don't be in any argument with the officer. Please ask him for his badge number, his rank, and which station he's attached to. When you do that, you bring that to, to traffic court and you can bring up the Black Law Dictionary that they use, that all the lawyers use. You're not supposed to be getting tickets on a toll road. That's a private road. You pay to be on that road. Nobody never did know that, right? Never know that one. Another they never confirm it. Yeah, and, um, another thing, Indicom, I see Indicom sending out a little narration about your laws and rights. I will send it to you for you to pay, um, to play it in class, yes. right? Um, they talk about searching, they talk about um, court order, and they talk about how to address the police officer, right? Um, yes, teacher, I don't want to keep up your time no, no more tomorrow. Um, if life spare, God spare life, the creator may could see another day. You know, if you're continuing on the rights and laws of Jamaica, I would love to participate again. So, good night, class. Have a wonderful night, teacher. Go get your race. All right, I bana. Big up yourself. I just call earlier tomorrow, all right? Oh, God. Big up yourself. Yeah, man, no problem. Blessings to you. Blessings to you. Well, students, we've been here for... Let me see how long I've been here for. I've been here on the live for 9 hours and 12 minutes, going 13 minutes. I know you all enjoyed the class. I know you all enjoyed the class, I must say that. We had laughter in the beginning, we had information. We had all kind of something, my viewers and subscribers. And we had the, poly, the man who called... Who said that people must respect the police? And remember that man. <laughs> the man said that the police that them said the man said that the, the, the driver was wrong for talking to the young police like that. The man said the driver was wrong for talking to the police. The man said the driver was wrong for standing up for his rights. Lord Jesus, we had Sister Elo, we had several people who call, several people who call. We have our head boy who gave us some insights. It was indeed a lovely class, and I know you all enjoyed it. Oh, Lord Jesus. Well, on this them, I have to take one call. I did promise this person I would take the call. Jesus Christ. Hold on a second. Yes, my brother. Welcome to the program. How are you doing? Let me just get up and see you still up on the line, you know? So let me just I say, you just get up. You can't imagine all I'm up on the line. I'm a tell for call. You just get up. But anyway, at nine hours, I'm up on the line. Fine, not nine hours. I'm just at end the class, but I said I'm just out for end the class. But I realized that I saw your number coming up and trying to being a person of my word. I tried to be a person of my word. I told you in our previous conversation that I would give you the permission to speak your story, and I spoke about it from the beginning. So the class is still oh, open, yeah. and I'll give you a few minutes to bring your story to them again. Students, I want you to listen to this gentleman's story regarding the FLA and his licensed firearm. I want you to listen to this man's story regarding the FLA, the Firearm Licensing Authority, and this gentleman. Sir, you're live on the air. Go ahead. You're my last caller. Yes. Good morning. Yes. 
Well, I want to say about this firearm thing. I left my firearm down there. And when I go back to receive my firearm, they're giving me a run around. So I have to do apply back. And then they took my license and start, uh, and pour a hole in it and keep the license. So and I have to pay $75,000 for storage. And I went back down there and I do the same thing. And I pay like 14000 the other year and still can't get, get it. So you're saying so once, you were in Jamaica and you were issued with a with a licensed firearm. You're a licensed firearm. I have a licensed firearm for years, yeah. For years. You left Jamaica and you went overseas on vacation. Uh, how long yeah. did you spend overseas? Can you uh you spent some time overseas. Say nothing about that to implicate yourself. You spent some time overseas, right? And when yeah. you went overseas and you came back to Jamaica, you went to FLA. When you went abroad, was FLA the person that was keeping your firearm or was it in your property? In your in Yes, property? yes. FLA. FLA. And you left your property by your licensed firearm by FLA and you went overseas and you came back. When you came back into Jamaica... You went to the firearm, list, firearm licenses authority office and you went to retrieve your licensed firearm. Now, is that correct? I am sure that because they kept the firearm for you that you would have owed them some money for storage, right? Correct. Did you pay them that money for the storage? I paid them that money. I paid them that money. Yeah. And then they called me to the office right right at the front there and took my license and bore a hole in it. That's it. So and said I have to apply. So I go back the following year, they say I have to pay for the storage same way. I pay almost $1,400,000. So you say... You understand? So you say I pay the 70000 for your storage... Then them call it to the front desk in the office at FLA and they took your license from you, that is your firearm license, and they bore the yes. hold in it. Yeah. Did they, right. did they give you a replacement? You know, like when you go to driver's license, they bore a hole in it and give you a new driver's license. Did they give you yeah, a driver's they license? Not, they, they did not. They did not. Now, when you were there and you saw that they bore your driver's license, your, sorry, your, your firearm license, were you expecting them to provide you with a replacement one immediately? Sure. I, sure, I asked them. I asked them and they said I have to reapply back for my, my firearm. I asked them to show me my firearm if my firearm is there. Have Nobody wants to show me my firearm. They only tell me my firearm is there. So so let me ask a question. So you said that upon return to the island, you went to FLA and you paid them for the storage. So they can't say that you're not allowed to see your firearm. You understand what I'm saying, students? Because the gentleman said yes, that sir. he owed them for the storage. How much was it that you paid for the storage? 70000 thereabouts? I I pay seventy five thousand so the you, first time. So the you, first. So you pay them seventy five thousand dollars for the storage. Yeah, they say my whole seventy five thousand, so I paid it. So you pay the seventy five thousand, so you don't owe them nothing for the storage now. So no. so you ask them after you realize they took your license, the the the, 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 the license, the firearms license and they bore a hole in it. You were expecting them to give you a replacement and you asked them for it. What did they say when you asked them for the replacement license? They said I have to reply. I have to apply back for, for my firearm. They said you have to reapply for your firearm. And you said, okay. Yeah. You proceeded to ask them to show you with the light, the, the firearm, your firearm, firearm that you paid money for. And they refused. That they're keeping for you. 
So you ask them to show it to you and they refuse. So up until today, you have still not seen your firearm as yet? Not, not still my firearm. So I've me... seen my firearm until now. So so what is so you find it very suspicious that Yes, I know. That they are doing this. So we're calling on the Minister of National Security and we're calling on the director of the Firearm Licensing Authority. Authority. Yes, we're calling on the director of the license, the Firearm Licensing Authority, FLA, to look into the matter and to carefully consider how firearm holders are dealt with. Because if you did not commit a crime, then with all fairness, once you paid for the storage of your firearm, your firearm should be handed over to you. Tell the truth now. Yeah, man, that's correct. I come down here in the election, last election here, I have to have somebody around me. You have to have somebody who I know have a firearm around me. So you're saying and that... that's not good. So you're saying that because they have refused to give you your, your licensed firearm and they're used to having your licensed firearm for your protection, you're saying that you feel unsafe sure. without the... the, without the Com without your... Feel uncomfortable coming to Jamaica. And if you do come, you have to secure the services of a licensed firearm to protect firearm you when you're on me. the road. So let me ask you a question now. When they took your licensed firearm, when they look, took the, the license from you upon your return to Jamaica, did, was the license expired? My license expired for like two years. And they say it's three years, so I come down before. All right, so let me ask a question. So let us say you come down in 2020. Let's just put it at that, right? Was, I'm yeah. just putting a date, was the license expired in 2020? You said it was expired like 2018, was for, expired from 2018? You know, you know, it's every year you have to license. Yes. Every year you have to license, so I took two years before. So let me just confirm, because we're trying to get the drift of the story, so anybody who, who is listening can understand the details. So I am asking this question, when... You came back and you went to FLA to retrieve your property and you paid them the, the, the storage fee. At that point in time, was the license expired? Yes or no? When you handed the license to them, yes. was it expired? Okay. How long was yes. it expired for? One Two e years? One year. One year. I came out of the license every year. So, and it's $12,000 for every year. So they put like... $24,000 plus the storage. So you're saying that the licensing fee is $12,000 per year. And based on the fact yeah, that... Yeah, it was. Well, based on the fact that your license had expired for two years, you had to pay $24,000 for the, for the license for two years. Yeah. Did you pay the $24,000? I paid... In all, I paid $75,000. So the seventy-five thousand. So let me ask a question: Wasn't the seventy-five thousand included storage, or the storage cost was different? Plus the license fee. Storage, makes it storage, storage and license. Storage and license make it seventy-five. Yeah. Okay. Now let me just point out something to to you here, and I'm going to paint a scenario to you, and I want you to tell me if you agree with me, right? Yeah. Correct. You go to the driver's license office and your license is expired, right? Correct. Do you know that once it is expired, it is their property and they have the right to hold to it? To give you a duplicate. To give you a duplicate, yes. No. what was the basis? They said because it is expired for two years, you would have to reapply. And I kind of understand because I see some students are saying that teacher, they wouldn't give him back if it's expired. So based on the, the, based on the fact that's why it was expired for two years, that is why they did not return it to you. Now, 
they tell they told you to reapply. Have you reapplied as yet? No, I'm, I don't. Are you are you totally against reapplying, or would you consider reapplying? Well, because truth be told, let me just say this now, brother. After let us just consider the day we have a saying that sometime when your hand is in the lion's mouth, you take time. No, you take and draw it out because you know. Because listen to me now, it's either two things. You're without the tool now because you didn't reapply and you're uncomfortable. You have to have people around you with it to you know, understand to feel that sort of comfort around you. I understand because you're yeah. used to it. No. It's either two things before you. It's either you're going to stay without it and don't reapply. And always have to have somebody around you, or you're going to reapply. And then hopefully they give it back to you and resolve the matter. As I said to you, sometimes your hand is in the lion's mouth. You have to take time, draw it out. And let me explain this to you, my brother. Let us let me be realistic. Do you know that there are many people in Jamaica who want a firearm? No business people in Jamaica who want a firearm and can't get it. You know That's that? correct. I was a, I was a business Unknown there, no, yes. so. so I'm saying that to say that the based on the fact that you were given it, you are one of the privileged ones. So I believe, I believe, and this is just my belief, this is not the law. You understand? I believe that Correct. in all fairness, you should reapply. Because let's look at it. If you have a visa and your visa expired and you don't do nothing wrong and you go back to the embassy, wouldn't they more than likely reinstate your visa? Wouldn't they more than likely reinstate your driver's license and give you back the pass? You understand what I'm getting at, my brother? It's true, correct. But somebody said FLA will never give him back. Why do you think FLA will never give him back? Why wouldn't they give him back if he committed no law? If he had a good substantial reason? Remember, it's not like he had the, the firearm at his home. And went abroad and, and, and came back to renew the license and still had the firearm. They had it in their possession. So he was not a threat in any way to anybody with the firearm. They had it in their possession. So it should have been an easy process for you to come and for them to give it back to you. But I really do believe that you should reapply, my brother. I really think you should consider reapplying. Or if that is the case, I would consider that you consult with an attorney to find out if you are legally required to just get the replacement. Because remember that government things like this, you know, remember they said that it is the property of the government. Remember they always said that, right? It is the property yeah, of the government. Yes. And it is like a benefit that they're giving to you. So you are left at their discretion. You understand? It was left at their discretion. Uh, and possibly they're saying that because it was left there for too long, then you would have not had need for it. But... If you were to apply either on your own or with the assistance of a well-learned attorney at law who could make representation on your behalf to say that this person, Mr. John Tom, had to be away for this part, so let me ask a question. If your wife was bedridden, your wife did that for you live at Jamaica, your wife live a foreign and you go and come to she. And when you die Jamaica, you keep your tool. And your wife sick a foreign and she gets a stroke or whatever and she sick, God forbid. And you have to take care of her. That should not stop them from giving you back your, your firearm because it was an emergency. And anybody would recommend that you be with your loved one in their time of need. So if you have an attorney at law who is able to make the representation, then I believe that you would get it back, my brother. So I really do believe that you should consider seeking the services of an attorney. You know what I mean? Or somebody well yeah. to learn in this field. And well, uh, I think about next month... I'll try and apply back, come down and apply back for it. Yes, but before... I'm going straight but, over there. But before reapplying, you know? but before reapplying, you ought to ensure you get advice from an attorney. Let me tell you why. 
the lawyer might guide you in a certain way. You might go there and they ask you why you take so long. You say, oh, because one, two, three, I did busy. I did have business up there. I couldn't come back. A lot too much crime. I go to Jamaica. I can't bother. And they say, oh, no, that doesn't qualify you. But your lawyer might guide you to say, this is yeah. the reason. Plus, and to ensure, that's what I want to do. You know, just get a, a lawyer. Yes. And to ensure. To represent me. Yes. Yes. That is the right. Because a lawyer can say, this is the reason why. My client was away for so long, and the lawyer perhaps could ask you to provide evidence to prove to them that if you were away for business, this is the reason you were bound and you could not come back because of either an illness of someone close to you that you had personal care of. And when you are personal care of your wife, you couldn't have left come to Jamaica because your wife until death do us part. Yes. So in that notion... I am sure that in that regard, they may would consider. You understand? And, 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 and give it back to you. So all hope is not lost. I would suggest... Well, the thing about it, I asked them to show me the gun. Because, you understand me? Yes. Because I hear that they're selling guns out there. They say, my, my friend guns out there. Yes, well, guess what? You understand me? Well, listen to me. If they sell your firearm and they ask you to pay the storage... You seem to have a case because if you pay a storage and you're not able to get your property, what sense in asking you to, to pay the storage then? You understand what I'm saying? So there are several cases, yeah. there are several things around this case which makes it, you know, somewhat compromising. You know, it it, it is it 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 depends on how you look at it because truth be told, it. It, it, it's compromising in your situation to know that you stayed away from it so long. That might compromise you reapplying on your own. But if you get the services of an attorney who is well learned, especially in, in this regard, they can advise you. And as I said, there might be a certain clause that you and I don't know about that the lawyer might say, but according to section so and so, if it is an emergency, then you'll be born to, to, to stand by your wife or your child who needs your help? You understand what I'm saying? So get an attorney, my brother. Yeah. Don't go there on your own. Get an attorney. Okay. Son. Get an attorney, my brother. All right. Thank, thank you. Make sure you get an attorney, you know. And go there for your own, you know. You hear me? No, man. No, man. I have a lot of attorneys. You can, can get you. Know? Thank you. Do the right thing, my brother. And I hope that everything be fine for you. You hear? Okay. I'll call you tomorrow. And you can update me on the matter. Blessings to you, my brother. Take care. Okay. All thank right. You. Bless you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Take care. Yes, students, so that was my final call for the night. Andrew Burke said he has to consult a lawyer. Gene Royalty said every year he has to reapply on his birthday. Okay, you're the people who might tell us something. Gene Royalty said she should have kept in touch with them. Thanks to all the students who are, you know, giving their idea and providing some information on the matter. Andrew Burke said, nowadays, they don't want to give persons living overseas any firearm. Pizza renew license. Gene Royalty said, all he has to do is to renew. Then if he doesn't get the firearm, take it further. That's right. That's right. Well, students, Lord Jesus. How old am I over here for? Nine hours and 33 minutes. Lord Jesus. Students, it is my pleasure having you over here. It is my pleasure having you over here on my one-man band. Yes? I am everything to myself. Producer, director, I am host, I am guest, I am everything. I am everything on this program. That's how it goes, and I am really glad that I am able to multitask. And even though I am on, even though I am on my own, I am still able to provide a production and present it to you guys that you are able to learn something and to get some sort of enjoyment and entertainment on this matter. With that being said, Lily Allison Pages, Jean Royalty, Andrea Burke, Evelyn Meekle, all of my students that are in the class, Rosemary Robinson, I thank you so much for being, being here with me on Jamaica a Topic. It has been my pleasure to all those who liked the video, shared the video, to all those who called, to all those who sent a contribution. If you sent any, I thank you so much and I really appreciate your support. 
let me make it clear, I really appreciate your support. If anybody decides to support our topic in any way, I really appreciate your support and may the Lord continue to bless you. I know you all enjoyed the program and I thank you for listening. So take care and have yourself a very good day and the Lord be with you. All right? Yes. Andrea Burke's a good class teacher. Get some rest. Shining star. Say, teacher, you're the best. Big up yourself, shining star. Now this time I say, a topic you I forget. Uh, what is that? A national award. Me sleep, me sleep, me sleep, and dance till I keep. Yes, Nadi. You sleep and wake, sleep and wake. I saw a topic work. A national baby. Me realize a national award. Well, uh, Uno are my national award, you know. From Uno are listen to me. I only love a topic. I only appreciate a topic. I only appreciate the work. Uno are my national award. Let me just tell him that. Uno are my national award. Big up yourself, Pete, Jason, and everybody. Everybody. Hey, Barney, big up yourself. Carla, hey, Banks, big up yourself. Beauty Chess, big up yourself. Remember, Uno are my award, yeah? Hey? Thank you so much, students. Big up on yourself. This is your host. Tuning in, PJ said 342 here in New York. Big up yourself, PJ. Big up everybody in New York, Canada, England. And big up all my Jamaican family. Big up all of us in Jamaica. Blessings to you all. Gene Royalty said, You need a massage. I'm on my way. Yes, Gene Royalty, come. <laughs> Lord Jesus, big up yourself, student. Love and peace and honor to you all. Take care. It's my pleasure.